I'm ready. We've got some intro here. This wasn't in the demo, so this is new to me. Forward, back, skip. Okay. All right, I got you. Okay, so we're in space, right? We got like a burger restaurant in space. Because why wouldn't you put it in space so you could have awesome aliens joining, right? And eating at your restaurant? What is that? It's like a planet filled with junk. What is going on? Oh no. I don't know what happened here. Okay, hello. Who's in there? Some dude. Reading a magazine or something cool tattoos but he looks like he's seen better days like his t-shirt's got holes in he's got mess down his t-shirt and his bed look it's got a hole in his bed he's poor he needs money right I, I think that's what they're going for here and he's like looking at all his old memories how like how simple and how good times were back then man if only it could be like that again so it looks like he got um, fired from his job, right? He was like, I guess that alien was his, like, boss or something. Um, so what was he? Uh, did he perform at the circus? And then nobody liked him or something? What, and he did some experiments? What is going on here? And then he became homeless. I don't really know. I don't 100% fully understand this, but okay. Now he's crying. Sad times. You poor dude. It's okay. We'll kill people for burgers. <laughs> <laughs> that's your calling in life <laughs> like <laughs> who goes through that they're like oh man I just like my life's at its worst I'm miserable I got no job I know I'll kill my customers for burgers <laughs> everybody goes through that at one point in their life right <laughs> it makes total sense good burger there it is very nice best grand oh look at that and my gran used to make the best burgers in town, man. And she used to do the same thing. She used to kill aliens for her burgers too, see? Beautiful, look at that. Look at that beautiful burger. I really want a burger now. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> burgers are great. <laughs> They're awesome. Oh, look at all those aliens ready to eat their own alien bodies. You don't know where that patty came from, man. <laughs> I'm telling you. <laughs> oh my god. Wait, somebody died? Who just died? And then they closed up. Wait, oh, that was the granny. The granny died, and then they closed up Burger Shop. Right, that makes sense. And then he got the keys for her shop. And this is how this all started. Now he's determined, and he's ready to go. What happened to his leg? I don't know what happened to his leg. Dang. Dang, man. <laughs> he's the best boss. Oh, yeah, he is. Look at those mushrooms sprouting from that cup as well. So gross. Oh my god, what have you done? That looks gross. That looks really gross. Welcome, guys, to my amazing restaurant. That's so totally gonna be disgusting. <laughs> Look at that gross burger. Ugh, so gross. Wow, this is a long intro, I have to say. I wasn't expecting it to be so long. What is going on? Okay, so it made really bad burgers. People complained, and then he, he gave them the middle finger. I see. I don't know what, wow, like the designs for the aliens are interesting, <laughs> very interesting. What happened to him? Um, he gained some kind of crazy power from the burger. I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea. Wait a second. I don't know what's happening here. Oh my god, they want to murder me because I'm making bad burgers? They say, you make good burgers or you die. <laughs> There's no in the middle. Good burgers or death. That's how it goes. Oh my gosh. What's he gonna do? <laughs> Look, he's got a halo. He's secretly God. You just don't know it yet. <laughs> That's what's going on, I swear. Oh my gosh. How crazy. Look at that poor alien over there. Error. What happened to your machine? Oh no. Look at all my bills. Oh no. How am I gonna survive? I don't know. All those bodies are piling up. What am I going to do? I can't afford the meat. I'll just kill the customers. <laughs> it's fine. Everything's good. There he goes. His first descent into madness. Ha 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 ha. Take that. It's nearly burger o'clock, guys. It's nearly burger o'clock. All right, that's it. That's the intro. All right, we're ready. Now we know what happened to this poor guy and how he got into this situation and why he's running this burger joint and why he kills his customers for burgers. Right. <laughs> Welcome to the Good Burger Restaurant. Want to be the chef of this place? Then a couple of lessons will sure to become in handy. Okay. 
If during this tutorial you can't remember what to do, press the pause button. Look, your first customer has already made his order and is currently waiting for it. This is a much better tutorial than the demo. <laughs> the demo's tutorial was like non-existent. You had to like read through tons of stuff. I mean, you have to read here, but it was, you had to look for it. You had to search. <laughs> you can find the queue item on the top left corner of the screen. All customers are added to the queue list. All right, cool. This indicates that you are near the customer. Customer's order number. Health suspicious annoyance levels. Right, you're not allowed to get seen killing the enemies. Um, like if you get spotted killing customers, the police come and arrest you. So you have to be careful. It's kind of like stealthy in a way. Time the customer, the time the customer is willing to wait for the order. Okay, so you have a patience level, ingredients you need to put in the burger, the activity. Okay, have you sorted it out? Good. Let's not make the customer wait. You can make your first burger go to the kitchen. Right, let's go make your, your first burger, my friend. I am ready and raring to go. What would you like? In the kitchen, you can find everything in the fridge. Right, right. I kind of remember mostly how to how this goes. Um, so, right, let's see what he wants. First, start with the raw meat. Okay, let's put the raw meat on the frying pan and then it will cook and then you have to wait for the progress bar to like fill up until you're like ready it looks like I can't I have to wait until like this is done before I can do anything can you smell it the patty is fried take the cooked meat off the stove before it gets burnt or you need the trash can to get rid of it okay so here's our meat place the cooked meat on the hot table and keep it warm until you serve the burger warm can be served cold cannot be served you can keep it warm here I didn't know that Cool, now it's time to go back to the fridge and get the ingredients. Okay, so now we can serve the, we got the, the like, the bun here. And we got the, the tomatoes. So we'll get, grab both of those. And then we just combine it with the, the patty. The table module suddenly broke. What? Unfortunate, but any kitchen supply may break during a day of work. Hit that thing a couple of times, maybe that'll get it working again. <laughs> what? Oh no. My restaurant is just that bad, right? That things are breaking already. We haven't even done anything yet. Dear Lord, can't even make one burger without things breaking. Great, now when the burger is assembled, you can serve it. Okay, take your masterpiece to the order handler. Yeah, it is a masterpiece, isn't it? I know. Look at this. Oh no, it's gone cold already. Wait, what? Oh, I was meant to put it over. Oh no, I was meant to put it over there. Oh no, we got a cold burger. Oh no, I'm sorry. Oh no. Do I start again? What do I do? Oh no. I don't know what to do. Oh, I can warm it back up. Oh, the hot plate warms it back up too. I didn't know that. <laughs> okay, sweet. I thought once it was cold, that was it. But no, that's that's it. Okay, to serve the burger, simply attach it to the order number. All right, there you go. And there's our first customer served. And that's the, the basis of this game. All right, and now we get our money. Sweet. Now having his order, the customer will go sit somewhere and start eating in case you want to speed up the process. You can increase the, the speed as well. So that's cool. Wait, how do I how do I do that? So that's how you can increase the speed. So that's cool. You can speed it up or not. Look at him enjoying his burger. He's having a great time. He's loving it. He's having an awesome time. One thing I remember about this game as well is there were like really cool descriptions on like, I think it was this game. I had really cool descriptions on like the, the creatures. And, like I really enjoyed looking at all the different creatures. So we got like a rat creature here and he's called a tower rat. He's a homeless creature and he's populated most of civilized space. Once upon a time, a human ship crashed, but part of the crew decided to flee, leaving the rest to perish. The escapees survived, but the cosmic radiation did not spare them. Humans turned into monsters, and the fluffy guys never managed to find a new home. Since then, these giant rats have been wandering from planet to planet in search of food and profit, and believe me, there is little pleasure in such guests. They have neither money nor manners to speak of. So, this is the first alien species, but there are many more... Um, that we will come across as we like play through right we have some quests here as well just another space hole for criminals several customers so it looks like there's different like planets and like different places to go from what i'm seeing and there's all different like little quests and stuff like that that you can tackle at least i think so anyway this is interesting. Serve all customers of the race tarot who visit within one day of awesome burgers. Kill 10 customers of the tarot race is like the quest for those. All right, interesting. Maybe you just get rewards or something. I don't know. Customer has finished eating. Now he will rate your service. Decide whether to tip or not. Okay, so 
If you are awesome and made no mistakes, he will leave you a tip. If you're bad, two or more mistakes, you picked the wrong meat, the customer won't give any tips. If it's satisfactory, the customer still won't tip you. And if it's awful, the customer wasn't served his order at all. So only if you're like super awesome do you get tips. So you have to like be perfection, I guess. It's about time to take a look at one useful device called the guidebook. Okay, let's open the guidebook, I guess. Um, not sure what he wants me to look at this thing. The guidebook contains information about each customer species. I literally just read this. Some data is pre-filled. Some needs to be discovered on your own. Now let's talk about each field in detail. These elements show the customer name and appearance. Okay, here you can find which body parts and meat customers will drop after the meat processor has processed a dead body. Lovely, that's beautiful. Health, the number of health points, karma describes how aggressive this race is and damage, race damage level. Tips, how much the customer will leave. Okay, and here you can mark the meat type the customer would like to eat. Each race can be satisfied of up to four different types of meat. If you serve a wrong meat type, the respective customer will give you a bad rating. Okay, and this is what they're immune to. Like different damage sources and traps and stuff like that. Okay, and this is the activities that they like to do. Okay, it helps you to understand their behavior. Now, when you are familiar with the guidebook, you can fill out some information and close it when you are ready to complete the tutorial. So we don't really know anything about um, this species just yet, but I'm sure we will. Let's brighten the mood a bit. Go to the radio and tune in to a funky station. The radio. The radio is over this way. All right, let's turn it on. We're on landfill sense right now. Golden cold. Let's go with this one. It looks like the customer is going to leave the restaurant. You can either wait or speed up time. All right, my little dude is, is off on an adventure. So I think with activities, like um, some of the customers will go and like play on arcade machines and stuff like that. And you can like find out like what they like doing and stuff. And I think that kind of like, you know, um, helps you to see where they are so you can like kind of kill them like when they're doing their hobbies which is really evil <laughs> imagine dying doing your hobby I mean I guess it's the best way to die really I guess each time a customer is leaving the restaurant you will either gain or lose prestige it depends on the quality of the burger and the service however only those customers who left the restaurant alive affect the scale okay Prestige scale points affect the amount of customers which will come to the restaurant and allows you to travel to new planets. I like that. Okay. And here's a good example, by the way. New wave. Higher prestige scale means more guests. Okay. We're on a new wave now, right? For each planet, the influence of prestige scale on the number of customers will be different, but they will always come from the teleporters in the parking lot. So this is where the customers come from. All customers in the restaurant are doing something. Smoking, dancing, ordering. They choose their own activities at random, but each race has its own preferences you should study them and find the perfect moment to kill let's wait until all customers enter and decide what they want to do okay so that's what we're gonna do i'm gonna wait for these guys to enter see what kind of activities they do and we'll learn about them okay it looks like they're going straight for the order i think from the looks of it you can see on the left you can see what they're doing right some of them are not going straight to it though interesting Let's see, it looks like we have a freeloader. One of the customers did not even order anything and just watching a strip show, what? <laughs> Move to the VIP room and get rid of that parasite. A strip show? <laughs> what is this room? There's the, there's the horrible blighter. It's time to teach him a lesson. Get closer to him and use the following input to kick his butt. A. Eh? After the customer has been kicked, he will immediately change his current activity. Also, his annoyance scale will increase. Now, let's kick him until annoyance scale is completely full. Okay, he's got enough for now. Look, his annoyance scale has filled completely, which means he will leave the restaurant. The annoyance level can also be affected by poor service, restaurant malfunctions, etc. Upon reaching 100%, he will leave the restaurant. Okay, annoyed customers will decrease your prestige scale. But right now, let's focus on the rest of the customer orders. And we're, okay, we're gonna go start making burgers. So he's gonna leave, cause I like, I just like went up to him and just like was physically violent to him, as you do, <laughs> right? Okay, let's make some burgers. As you may have noticed, new customers have ordered burgers with sauce. It's good that we have a couple lying around in the fridge. So the squiggly line indicates that a burger should contain sauce. Okay, there is no difference with exact sauce you will use. Just put one on there that you think would work best. You can use any sauce, doesn't matter. Okay, good to know. But as usual, you need to fry some meat first. So put some raw meat on the stove. Okay, so we got two of these like 
rat things. Put them both on. So that seems good. And we're going to get some of these. You want tomato? You want sauce? Okay. All right. I got you. I got you. All right. We just need to wait for these. I don't want to like burn them. So I'm just going to do... I just put one burger in there for now. All right. Let's put that on there. Let's put that one. I put two in the... I put two in the same one. Oh no. Oh god. Oh, I've messed up already. <laughs> this guy's got double patties. <laughs> is there a way? <laughs> There's no way to get patties out of that, is there? Oh, God. Well, this guy's going to have a great time with his with his patties. Here you go. You forgot to put some ingredients in the customer's orders. Let's try again. Uh, I didn't. I gave him extra ingredients. <laughs> he, he was a happy customer because he got more than he bargained for, right? At least you would think so, <laughs> right? apparently it doesn't work like that i gotta do it again sadly <laughs> i go i gotta like do what the tutorial tells me i suppose do i have to do that kicking part again i guess i don't i'm not really sure all right well we got our burgers let's not like you have to be very careful it's really easy to do that all right we got our burger our tomato we want to get some sauce in here and that should be everything so this would be number four yeah number four and then we want patty cheese some sauce and a burger and there is your burger there you go my friends enjoy your meals and have a fantastic like time in my restaurant there you go look at that look how happy they are the burger's like bigger than the, the actual like rat itself <laughs> I've never seen rats just be fed so well. When burgers with sauce are eaten by customers, a sauce timer will start ticking. Each sauce timer contains a sauce icon and progress bar telling when this sauce effect will be applied. Okay, let's wait until the sauce effect kicks in and see what terrible consequences our poor customers going to suffer. Wait, what did I give them? I think one of them had like a toilet sign on, so one of them will make them go toilet, I'm pretty sure. I don't know about the other one. So I'm not sure. Sauce eaten. This one will make him go toilet, I can guarantee you. It's like diarrhea or something, I think. You have annoyed the wrong customer. Oh, sorry. Sorry. My bad. I didn't mean to. Yeah, he, he going. He going toilet. Oh, the other one makes him smoke. So one makes him go to the toilet and one makes him smoke. Okay. Okay. The sauce timer has finished and the effect will start showing on the customers. You have used these sauces. Yeah. Forces them to smoke. Forces them to use the toilet. Okay. First, let's visit the customer who is eating laxative. You can find him on the toilet as you have guessed. Yes. I'm right here. It looks like there are no witnesses, so it's time to kill. <laughs> but, before the but before the fight, let's take a look at the main stats of the chef. Okay, your health value. Each customer has damage, which can be found in the guidebook. You can see how much damage will be dealt to you. Some customers won't fight back at all. Stamina is the value you are spending on each cleaver, swing, and kick. Keep in mind, when starting a fight, stamina restores over time. So now you can start a fight with the customer. So I gotta swing my cleaver with the right trigger. Okay, here we go, like that. And there we go. My first customer is dead. <laughs> Cool, and now he is dead. <laughs> Yay! But you are covered in blood and there is a corpse nearby. That can be bad. Let's take a deep breath and talk about this situation. Okay. So we gotta cover up our evidence. Oh no. As you can see, you are still covered in blood and there is a corpse near you. Now let's see what will happen when another customer notices that. Yeah, they'll they'll not like it. A blood-drenched chef or a corpse in the room continuously increases the witness's suspicion. After the suspicion is 100%, the customer will run away in a panic or become aggressive. Right, depending on the alien. And then you get caught by the cops, I'm pretty sure. That guy has run away. Of course, he will report you to the police. Um, for that, you will receive one police badge. Oh, okay. Okay, so there's like five badges there. This one looks tougher and more aggressive than the previous guest. Let's observe what will happen after his suspicion scale reaches 100. All right, so we're learning all the things here. Look how many arms he's got, man. He became aggressive. A red circle indicates the danger zone. Reaching that threshold means a fight will start. Also, aggressive customers will call the police rather than run away. Okay, here he goes. You're gonna call the cops on me and I'm gonna get busted. It's not gonna be good. After a customer has called the cops, you will get max police badges. Soon after that, the restaurant will be subjected to a police raid. Oh, God. Okay, that's going to be bad. 
Oh no. When the police patrol arrives, you will see a police progress bar. This bar indicates how long the police patrol is going to search your restaurant. Each cop in the patrol will start investigating different rooms looking for anything suspicious. Okay, if any cops from the police patrol will notice anything suspicious, he will immediately become aggressive and he will definitely call his fellow officers and then you're most likely dead, right? They got alien policemen! Ah, and now I'm dead. <laughs> if that happens, the chef will most likely be killed. And after death, all meat, money, prestige, and quest progress will be lost. So, yeah. Like, everything gets lost, pretty much, if you die in this game. So, it's a pretty hardcore, like, you know, <laughs> simulation, like, cooking simulation, sort of, like, management game it's pretty hardcore i would say uh let's remove the corpse so no one will find it okay so we're back here we're removing our corpse all right are you are you gone a removed body does not immediately become a cutlet first it goes to the meat processor you can see the processing progress in the queue line when the meat processor finishes raw meats and other body parts will automatically go to the fridge okay next is to wash all the blood the bl <laughs> blood off even i was gonna say all right so here we go wash all the blood off there we go. And no one will be the wiser. Everything will be great. I'm covered in lots of bubbles. Like this, uh, like imagine how much of a chore this would be to do this all the time. Wash the blood off. You might as well just go on a rampage and then wash off after, <laughs> you know? Nice one. Moving on to the second customer who had a nicotine sauce. He's hanging around the backyard. Go and demonstrate how smoking may have a negative impact on your health. <laughs> okay, let's go and traumatize him. We will deal with this one differently. In order to kill customers unnoticed and without blood, ah, it's better to use traps. Okay, I feel like traps would be really good to use actually. All right, how do we do that? Um, we press X here and we activate this and dang, okay, bang, the customer is dead. We got like a secret little shotgun on the bin. <laughs> because why not? After an activation, traps are on cooldown before they can be used again, and since there is no blood on our clothes, all that's left to do is get rid of the body. That's so much easier. All right, there we go. Seems like we have cleaned everything up, and that's enough since the day will end. So that's our first day completed. Basically the tutorial completed. You have completed your first day. Upon completing each day, you will receive statistics displaying how well you did. Now it's time to check out the basement. The basement, eh? Okay, I got a B rank. Is that bad? I don't know what I did. Like, what What did I do wrong? I don't know. Four deaths. Three. Okay. I must have done something wrong. Maybe it was when I messed up the burgers that one time. Maybe. I'm not sure. <laughs> I have no idea. But yeah, I think this is a really interesting game, actually. It's really, like, unique. I love this unique flair that they gave it. It's cool. Welcome to the basement. This is the operation center. Let's see what you can find here. First, let's go to the office. This is where you, like, upgrade stuff, I think. So, you can find the quest pad, you can find the quest pad, newspaper, book of complaints, safe, and computer. Each of these objects has its own function. The safe will save some of the money even after death, but right now we need the computer. Okay, so computer is this one. All right. Using the computer, you can buy ingredients, kitchen upgrades, chef upgrades, guidebook info, sorts, recipes, and these purchases, unlike money and meats, remain with the chef even after death. So these carry over. Wow, an avocado bun. That is interesting. Black buns, cucumbers, tomatoes, onions, cheese, lots and lots of stuff going on here. So many, like, um, things. Pineapple in burger? <laughs> It'd be kind of, kind of weird, but okay, so we've got ingredients. Over here, we've got kitchen stuff. Reduces the chance of breakdowns. We got meat processor slots, yin yang, increasing the waiting time, increasing the cooking speed, and stuff like that. Chef, we got like extra health, washing speed, stamina, that kind of stuff. Great. Guidebook. Unlock all information about, oh, you can unlock inf information about the races. That's handy. We got sauce recipes here as well. Make them go toilet and stuff like that. Poison, just straight up kill them. I see. Cool stuff, cool stuff. And then over here, what have we got? This is, here you can find list of tasks tied to different ta to planets. Right, I actually did see, see this. Like, briefly. Also, you can open the quest pad inside both restaurant. And, yep, yep. Okay, take a look at the quest pad and then you'll need to... You'll need to talk more about traveling to new planets. For that, you need to go to the cabin. Okay, so like these are these are all the quests you do on the planets, I see. Okay, and we can put our money in here. So then if we, like, die, we don't, like, lose anything, right? It looks like there might be an interest on this. 
from what I'm seeing. So you might lose a bit. I don't know. I want to learn all about the tarots. So I'm going to buy that. And do you think I should, I should probably buy some ingredients, right? Like we don't, if we don't have ingredients, how am I going to do anything? I don't really know. I feel like I should though, right? Isn't this a bit much to like, I have to manage all of this. This is a bit much to manage, don't you think? Obviously there's no like, um meat to buy or anything so yeah i should probably get health next time probably but i don't think there's too much there for me to do right now how much money i got i got 72 i don't know if there's anything i want to spend that on right now what's this last time the meat was different it was better have you changed the recipe what is what is this i don't know what that is <laughs> i have no idea do you think i should buy a few more buns should we just like buy loads of buns Got loads of buns now. <laughs> I don't know if that was a good idea or not. I have no idea. I guess like we'll see. What's this? Nicotine makes a cuff. And okay. I don't think I got enough money for this. Do I? Oh, I can craft them with um parts. Oh, okay. Cool. I didn't know that. And we got something here. These are recipes that we like the ingredients and stuff we got right now. Restart current session so you can like reset everything you've done if you want to. I guess. Make yourself comfortable inside the cabin. There are three panels, trap sync schematics, planet navigation, phone. Let's talk about each one, but start with the planet navigation in the middle. Okay. This panel contains all information about all of the planets you can visit. Besides completing all of the planet's required quests, you also need to have enough prestige and money for the fuel to fly to the planet. Okay, so like you can't just go there. Why even fly to another planet, you ask? There are several reasons. All places have different inhabitants, wealth levels, operating expensive and police attention. For example, if you break the law in one place, you can lie low in another until the number of badges decreases. Oh, cool. Okay. Check out which planets are ready for your arrival and then let's move on to the phone panel. Okay, so we are on Junkamiria right now, and this is like the first starting planet, and it's only really the rats here. And then if you go to Rivadonia, you get to have all these different species as well, and there's like all different quests and stuff like that. So that's cool, there's quite a few planets, I have to say, so I guess the objective of this game would be like to complete the quests on like all the planets, I suppose. I guess you wouldn't have to do like um, the quest on like every single quest, I suppose, but... I guess like that would be like the, the main objective, I suppose. All right, and then we got something over here too. What's this? Um, this is the phone panel. Allows you to pay your bills. Oh no, I didn't pay, I didn't. <laughs> I used all my money. Another great thing about the phone panel is that you can bribe the police. You should do that if your police attention on certain planets gets too high. Once again, check the panel yourself and let's move on to the schematics. I can't pay my bills. I didn't realize. Oh no, <laughs> when does this have to be paid by? I hope it doesn't have to be paid like now because I didn't realize and I brought all, I paid for buns and stuff. Okay, this is the traps panel. You can buy and upgrade traps here. These purchases similar to the computer store will persist after death. There's so much here. There's so much stuff here. Wow. You may want to grab some warmer clothes because after this panel, we're going to visit the freezer room. Okay, so these are all the stuff you can upgrade. Like, I see. Um, so... There's a tentacle toilet, there's a ghost mirror. It's kind of hard to see where your cursor is, but my cursor is like when it goes yellow, you can kind of tell where you are. But yeah, it looks like these are all the, like the traps and stuff. Interesting, okay. Like we don't have money, so there's not too much to look out there. Inside the freezer room, you can find the following de devices. The Cairo capsule, the freezer and the blender. The capsule will enable you to restart the session. The freezer shows you which ingredients are left in the restaurant. For now, we're interested in the blender. Okay, what is the- okay, this allows you to prepare sources. I've already- I already did click it. You can craft stuff there. Now we checked out all the essentials. You can explore the rest by yourself. Okay, all right, that's it. And now I think it lets me do what I want. And we can start the day by clicking the stairs, I think. All right, let's do our first day. Let's do it. I got, um, oh, it looks like you can get like different skins and stuff. Complete 99 days. You got to complete days. The more days you complete, the more like skills and like more <laughs> skills and um, outfits you get. So that's interesting. Okay, so our first day on the Junkamiria planet with the, the little rat peoples. There they are trying to look for their, their junk or something. Intriguing, I see. 
They look like they're having a great time. Mushrooms sprouting out of your head. He's got a Rubik's cube. Very cool. My man has seen the rats and he's seen profit. He's like, cha-ching, profit, baby. Let's get these rats in here eating my burgers. <laughs> All right, day one. Let's go, man. Let's go. Give me, show me where the rats are. Where you at, little guys? All right, here he comes. My little rat buddy is incoming. So what did we find out by spending that money on this guy? Like, I spent money to find out information on this guy. Don't know what it gave me, though, because I don't, I don't seem to have, like, any information. So I'm not sure what that entirely meant. I don't really know. Maybe we'll find out as we go. I don't know. All right, this guy is ordering. He wants... Um, burger. He wants cheese. Do I even have any meat? I do have meat. Okay, good. He wants, um, burger, cheese, and yeah, we'll just make some meat. I don't think it matters what meat. Why is my visitor stunned? Exactly. What does that mean? I don't know. I have no idea. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. All right, let's get some, some meat on the go here cooking some rat we're gonna feed rat to rat because <laughs> why not all right we've got some tomato let's put that in there as well all right i don't know what these guys are doing right now they're on the toilet i could actually murder him on the toilet but no i'm gonna be kind oh no my fridge broke don't break fridge don't do that <laughs> it's gonna be real bad if that if that happens all right we got some lovely lovely stuff going on here let's put this in this one too all right our first orders this is the one with cheese, so this is for, for, oh no, it's gone cold. I'll do this one. This is the one with tomato. This goes to number two. There you go, and this goes to number one. There you go, my friends. So be nice and happy. All right, we, we got to like try and kill some people, right? But we got to wait for the right moment, for sure. All right, let's see what they all like do. Oh no, this thing's broken as well. <laughs> there you go, I fixed it. Someone's on a smoke break out here. Oh, but there's multiple of them coming out. Like, if only it was just, like, one person. I don't know if we've got any traps out here, actually. Let's have a look. I'm sure there's some, like, traps or something that we can do. I'm sure. All right, I'm going to murder this guy. Kill him. Murder him. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. All right, we're going to need to... We're going to need to, like, clean up without being, like, spotted right i'm leaving footprints behind me and everything oh no don't spot me i didn't do anything untoward i swear it nothing bad happened nothing bad happened at all all right all right uh, let's get back to making some burgers like everything is fine i'm sure um let's have a look i actually think i got a few things to make here let's have a look um yeah Let's let's cook this one. This guy wants onions and burger. All right, we'll put that there. That one broke, but that's okay. So they said it goes into like the meat processor, right? Did it process like, did I get it? Like, I don't know. This is order number five. Don't think I got this one going, have I? I don't know. I got the ones with the, the onions going right now. I don't know what I just got out some buns by accident did not mean to do that this is the one with the onions I don't know who this was. oh wait what happened to them did they did they walk out oh man this is harder than I thought <laughs> it's not going too well oh is it oh no okay wait what happened oh my my thing's broken this is this is chaotic already oh no I had to put one in the bin okay wait um we're gonna cook another one up here yeah, it's not going as well as I was hoping. All right, we're going to do number five. He's getting a bit impatient at the moment, but it's fine. And we're going to do this one as well. Um, number five and number six. We're going to do those ones. And someone's in the toilet. I could murder those if I wanted. But we're, we're going we're gonna to just be good at the moment anyway. Like, at the moment. Okay, let's put this in. This is one with the tomato, so this is number five. We're gonna do this one as well. All right, let's put this one in. All right, number five, your order is done. Come down and get your order. And this is number six. And we're going to put some more in here with some onions and some burger buns. All right, cool, we got some broken stuff. Let's fix those. All right, we're good, we're good. At least I think so. This is the onion one. Um, 
Yes, we just got the onion one going. The other guy hasn't made an order yet. I think he's coming to make an order though. Yeah, I think he's making an order now. At least I think so. All right, this is the onion one. So this is number seven. Yep, that guy's made an order as well. Okay, let's get, I'm gonna get some, some more stuff in here as well. Okay, we're on a roll. I'm getting the hang of this, though I feel like I probably like need to, um, probably need to like kill some more people, probably. <laughs> I don't know. I'm not really sure just yet. I'm getting some tips. It's good stuff. It's good stuff. Okay, wait. I thought somebody wanted cheese. What's going on with like my orders here? I keep like messing up and I don't know why. I swear somebody wanted cheese, but I don't know. All right. Oh, what is going on? What's going on? Okay, wait. Okay, this guy wants onions. Onions. Oh, no, no, no. Don't burn. Don't... Oh, I burnt it. Oh, no. I burnt it. I'm going bad. It's going bad. Okay, I think we need to murder some peoples. Number 10. This Number 10 hasn't been served. We'll get, we'll get rid of number 10. All right. Because, like, I kind of wasted a bit of meat here for sure. All right, let's clean up a sec. All right, there we go. Oh, no, someone's coming. Someone's coming. Run. They're going to see me. Who are you? Number nine. Have I done number nine? Um, I, I burnt his, I burnt his stuff. We're just going to kill him as well. All right, there we go. Let's uh, send his meat off as well. Perfect. <laughs> there we go. Everything's fine. Everything's great. You know, there's nothing weird happening here at all. I swear it. Okay, so that guy's like satisfied. I don't think we've got any more customers. I think like we're done for the day. Okay, this is definitely going to take some practice, I have to say. Because, um, yeah, it was actually harder than I was expecting. But I think that I'll get the hang of it like as we go, I think. So it'll be fine. Okay, there we go. We did it. I received some parts, quest complete. I got an A, really? I feel like I messed up in a lot of ways, but okay, I don't know how I managed to get an A, but sure, like, <laughs> I'm not complaining. And now we're back here, like that was the, the first day, so that's cool. All right, so I served all of the customers. Okay, so I need to kill 10 customers of the tarot race to get a little bit of money there as well. So that'll be really cool. I got 12 buns. I'm gonna like buy a couple more buns. Maybe like, so I got 15. Let's see what else we got here that we can buy that will like help us out. I feel like I want to, I really thought I brought that, that 100G that unlocks all the information. I swear I brought that. Oh, we should probably like buy our, like do our bills, right? We should pay our bills off. There we go. Bills have been paid. So like we don't need to worry about that at the very least. So that's good. All right. What else? What else is there? Do you think that we need to get? Let's have a look. Let's see here. Uh, reduces chance of breakdowns. Full upgrade removes all breakdowns. Let's let's get rid of the chance of breakdowns. They're kind of annoying when that happens and they happen so often. So I would really like to do that. I was going to buy some health as well. Apparently I can't. Maybe I'm full health or something. I don't know why. I got 51, but it won't let me buy it. It's 50. So that's a bit weird. <laughs> I'm not entirely sure why that is. Buy some, some tomatoes. I got eight of them. I've got 10 now. All right, cool. All right, buy some more onions. I'm running a bit low on those as well. So we got quite a few eggs there as well. We get bacon. I mean, think you get some like ingredients after like every day or something. So like that's pretty awesome, I have to say. And we can make another nicotine thing here if we want to. So that's cool. What's in here? This just shows you your stuff right now so like that's cool i'm glad i paid my bills because i was like worried it doesn't seem that like you have to pay it like every day or something so like yeah that's um interesting i'm ready to start a new day let's start serving customers welcome to my humble abode oh we got like some story here i wasn't expecting anything to be honest <laughs> so that's really cool so we got two little rats on a date so how romantic look at them little do they know they're about to either be murdered or they might be eating one of their buddies you know what I mean so like I don't know you don't know what's in that wine you don't know what's in that patty they don't know what's happening I don't know oh okay there's a protest they're like no rats allowed we're taking over this restaurant <laughs> like what okay I wasn't expecting it to actually 
do this. So this is really interesting. Okay, so a different different aliens are coming over to take over the restaurant or something by the looks of it. That's exciting. Okay, I'm looking forward to seeing what they do here actually. All right, today's special is not burger. <laughs> what? Those wacky protesters. I heard it on the grapevine that om om nomni om nomni. I like that. <laughs> Wow, activists are planning to stop by Good Burger today with another demonstration against meat. Oh no, they're, they're, they're like vegetarians. No, they can't be vegetarians in my establishment. How dare they? <laughs> this is a meat establishment. We could just make vegetarian meat or something to stop the pro protesters, right? Wouldn't they be happy with that? I don't know. We advise the chef to kick them out as soon as he sees them. No, not kill, of course. We don't need any martyrs. But a couple of kicks would ju be just right. These morons have already given everyone such a headache. I'm sure the general public would appreciate such a show made by the best chef of our universe. Uh, is it like... Do I really just kick them out? Can't I just kill them? <laughs> Wouldn't that just like solve all our problems a lot easier? <laughs> we wouldn't have to deal with them then. Hello, my friend. Welcome to my humble abode. Come in, come in. Make yourself comfortable. Come and make an order over here and I will serve your every needs. Don't worry. This machete is just for chopping meat in the kitchen. It is not for you. I swear it. <laughs> I swear. You just need to be calm and collected and everything will be a-okay all right let's put this over here all right this is for order number one we have our first order already and this is gonna be for order number two there we go look at that like i don't even know what that is like some kind of weird octopus thing in there it looks weird doesn't it like when it's cooking very strange indeed all right we got some cheese over here very nice all right are those two fighting up there hey no fighting in my store what do you think you're doing all right stop it <laughs> my plan hopefully is to serve the customers get their tips and then kill them after they've eaten what do you think i reckon that's like the best way to do it because then like you get the money from them eating the food and um you also get the meat from killing them. Isn't that the best way to go about this? I feel like it would be. All right, here we go. What do you think you're doing? Get out of here, you. Get out. What do you think you're doing, you darn protesters? What what, what are they like, hey? What are they like? Can't, can't take them anywhere. All right, I got another rat here. Very nice. Okay, so, okay. That one's finished eating. I wanna I wanna go murder him. He's going, he's going toilet. I'm gonna have to go get him in a minute. I'm definitely gonna have to go get him. All right, so this is the tomato. This is for number three. Right, let's see here. We just got normal, just normal pack here so we'll definitely do that one in a second I'm gonna start murdering after hopefully this one's cooked I just don't want to leave this unsupervised because otherwise I'm not gonna be able to get this done right okay so number four I think yes okay let's get these darn protesters out of it what do you think get out get out of here you horrid things all oh, right can I murder them? Don't, I'm out. I'm out of energy. Yeah, I'm out of energy. <laughs> Cause of course you like can't just keep doing that all the time. Get out of here! Oh no! I've run out of energy. Ah! <laughs> Leave me alone! Ah! Oh no! I died! Oh no! Game over. <laughs> that wasn't meant to happen. <laughs> I got too like. I got too into it. I thought that I could like do something. <laughs> I was silly. Oh no. So this is what happens when you die. I mean, I wasn't expecting this to happen quite so soon, but okay. So I've gone to heaven because I'm now dead. <laughs> and someone found my shoe. Oh, oh, okay. I'm being pulled back down. Okay. <laughs> We gotta keep making burgers to make this guy happy, you know? So there is that. So I lost all my money. I don't know like what else you lose, like if you die. I'm just kind of curious it does look like i still got quite a lot of like ingredients and stuff like that so that's cool okay i'll try again and maybe try not to mess up this time <laughs> that would be good okay what i'm gonna do i'm gonna start cooking already like we don't even really have anybody in here but like they come in quite quick and people always want meat so i'm gonna do that i guess i just got a little bit like too confident because i saw like two process to protesters out there I should have just like waited until there was just one but like I don't know I just like went a bit crazy didn't I so that was my fault <laughs> shouldn't have done it but never mind it's okay it's all good all right let's get our meats over here there we go perfect we got meat already 
all ready and waiting, so that's perfect. So that's for customer number one. See, I'm like, I'm, I'm, on, a, I'm on a roll. It's going, it's grow, going great right now, I would say. Super cool. All right, we've got some more on the go as well. Super awesome. Yeah, so I'm going to try and like kill them after after they've eaten, right? That would be a good idea. All right, this guy wants some some cheese. So I can give him that. There you go. Oh God. All right, take that. <laughs> awesome. Good stuff. All right, some, some of my meat is nearly done. We've already ser served the first two customers. See, I'm on a roll right now. It's going super awesome. So that's cool. Look at this, like fast food service. <laughs> I'm so fast. I'm so fast. <laughs> it's awesome. We'll wait till they finish eating first, of course, before we do anything. Oh no, this is this is cold. We don't want that to go cold. Definitely not. That would be bad. It's still cold. Okay, this is this is good. This is fine. All right, what we got? You got tomato. All right, you can have tomato. There you go. Look at this super fast service, man. It's brilliant. All right, this guy's going toilet and he's already eaten and he's already given me a tip, right? So we're gonna murder him. That would be perfect. All right, there you go. Take that. We'll just wash up like nothing happened. <laughs> At least I'm pretty sure he's already given the tip anyway. So yeah, it's all, it's all good. I think that would be uh, definitely helpful. So that's good. We've got another Another customer, another satisfied customer here. I don't know what they're doing right now. Just sitting around on the table, so can't really do anything with them right now. <laughs> At least I don't think so. All right, what orders do we have? This is just a normal burger. We can just give this out here right now. That's fine. We got two very satisfied customers over there, so that's good. I'm thinking I should maybe wait for them to like go to a spot, like a secluded spot. That would be good. Where are all the protesters? They haven't arrived yet, surprisingly. I'm not getting very many opportunities here to take out, um, you know, the satisfied customers might take this one out there we go take this guy out it was just on the way home but it was not meant to be you know it's not meant to be <laughs> so yeah i'm just gonna wait around a little bit all right i think we should put some like meat on the go actually i'm actually really starting to run out of meat here so it's getting a bit um it's getting a bit serious right for sure okay we're gonna need to wash up that guy is just like you know he's more interested in his video games right now so we're we're fine to do this at least i think so so that's good why is there a thing around like what did i do why are they like so alert did i do something i actually have no idea what i did but okay that's fine okay all right i just feel a bit nervous at the moment actually i don't know what's going on what's happening i have no idea all right this guy wants onions there's order number five we're gonna have some cheese there we go there's order number six that's all done and dealt with i think i'm getting the hang of this now i think i sort of know what i'm doing i just don't know why this guy is suspicious i don't know what i did to deserve this treatment <laughs> did they see me or something like i don't know oh my gosh why are you after me oh fine you wanna you wanna die oh no oh no oh no i got no stamina oh no this game is hard i died again <laughs> oh god Oh no, what's happening now? What's going on? I like how there's like a different scene, like, um, if you die, it looks like, like something different's happening. You can see all my body parts, it looks like that guy's putting me back together. Oh no, he put me all back all wrong. <laughs> That's not good. <laughs> That's bad. Oh god. Oh no, I'm failing so badly. <laughs> I thought I was doing well, but I obviously messed up somewhere. I don't know how. I don't know what I did wrong, but like someone must have seen me. I must not have done it like properly. It's kind of annoying that like if you just like make one little mistake and they're all like alert, then it's like really hard to just like get out of that, if that makes sense. Like I kind of just like lost the whole day. <laughs> okay, I'm not gonna die, okay? I'm not gonna die. I'm not gonna die three times because that's just embarrassing. So we're not we're not gonna let that happen, alright? <laughs> I'll do my best. I, I apologize for my mistakes, but I'm only human after all, right? <laughs> okay, um, I made this cheese one, so that's for number one, and we also have tomatoes. 
over here for the other customer. There we are. Perfect. All right. Let's put some more on the go as well. We're definitely going to need to kill some more people as though they're really running out here. So, yeah, um, it's really interesting, like, how you have to just, like, sort of, like, you know... <laughs> It's like you keep killing the customers and stuff and it's interesting that you get to like decide who dies and who gets to eat a good patty <laughs> it's uh definitely an interesting like take on a cooking simulator game i like it actually it's pretty fun it's pretty awesome all right there we go we got some burgers over here perfect how many have I... I don't think I got anybody right now. Okay, this guy is done. He's been fed and he's satisfied. And he's going up here. And we are going to use this to murder him. Because then I don't have to clean the blood off either. So it's a win-win situation, right? There's nobody in here. This guy is also satisfied. I'm just going to... I'm just gonna take it. Oh no, I spotted. Oh, I've been spotted. I've been spotted. This is not good. Oh no, he's gonna find the body. What does this mean? Oh no. I don't know. I keep messing up. Oh god. Oh god. Clear the body. There's there's nothing here, I swear. He saw it and now... Oh no, he's calling the police. He's calling the police. I need to stop him. I need to stop him. What do I do? Oh god, the police are coming. <laughs> It's not good. Oh no, you nasty. A police patrol arrived and now there's a new record. What does this mean? Oh no, look at all the police. What do I do? Um, nothing's happening. This is a fine establish establishment, sir. There's nothing untowards happening here. I swear, I'm just making burgers. That's it. I'm not doing anything. Nothing at all. I'm just in the kitchen here, minding my own business. There's nothing weird happening. I swear, I'm just doing my thing. I'm just doing my thing. Like, I don't know why you're here, sir. You like that person who rang you? They pranked you. It, it's not. It's not real. Okay, it's not real. <laughs> oh my god. Wait, I got five stars as well. I got five cops. Oh no. <laughs> This is really bad. I'm literally not going to be able to do anything. Like, I'm just going to have to just, like, behave right now. <laughs> oh, my God. So bad. Oh, God. It's okay. Two patties received. Oh, good. I need some more patties, actually. So that'll be good. They'll go away eventually. It will be fine. <laughs> Everything will be good. I'm really like, I'm not very good at this, am I? <laughs> I need some practice, <laughs> but it's okay. You gotta learn sometime, so it's all good. All right, let's put some more patties on. I got a couple more patties here, so that's good. All right, we got a burger over here. Cheeseburger incoming, all right? Cheeseburger. Would you like a burger, sir? I can give you a burger if you like. I mean, you've come all this way out, my dear police officer. I, I don't mind giving you burgers. <laughs> Free burgers for you just to get them out of my hair. That would be nice. Wow, you really have to wait like a really long time for the police to leave. I feel like I'm just like constantly being watched and I can't do anything. It's frustrating. All right, number, number, no, not normal burgers. Um, hold on, let me see. This is a cheese one. This goes to number five. Okay, all good. That's all good. I'm gonna put another patty on here. All right, so number six wants tomato. Put a little bit of tomato in there for number six. And we got um, one that wants onions. So we'll do that as well. That'll be good. I'm just going to put the bun there for a second. Like, I noticed that there's sometimes that the customers seem to change their orders. I swear I've noticed them doing that. And it's, like, really annoying. So I'm just going to keep the patty there for a minute. Just in case, like, something, something happens. Or maybe they die or something. I don't know. Anything could happen in this game. So you just got to be cautious. All right, there you go. There's your order, my friend. Are the police gone yet? Oh, man, are they going to be here all day? <laughs> I'm not going to be able to kill anybody, am I? I think they're going to be... Oh, I think they're leaving, look. I think they're going. <laughs> I think we're in the clear. I just had to behave for a little while, but I think they're gone now. So, thank God for that. We're still on four stars. So, I'm thinking that we should maybe just, like, still be careful, but I don't know. <laughs> we'll have to see how it goes. Um, Like, we got enough for, for now to, like, see us through. 
So like, I think we're okay. So like, that's good. Okay, um, what are we doing? So number eight just wants a normal burger. So there you go, my friend. Have a nice burger over there. Okay, we've got quite a lot of customers right now, I have to say. So that's pretty awesome. Um, so that's cool. What just happened? I just like glowed. Oh, I got some prestige. That's what it was. Yeah, it was prestige. Okay, so we want tomatoes for this one here for order number nine. We got another one over here. So let's cook up some more of these things. They're really running out now. Definitely gonna have to start murdering people again. It's just like so, um, just <laughs> I get like so nervous thinking I'm gonna like mess up again. <laughs> That did not go well. Just like, I feel like every time I've tried to so far, it's just like it's gone really badly. So yeah, I need to like sort of be careful, I think. It's okay though. It's all good. All right, let's put these burgers away. That guy up there is teasing me. He's like in like such a good position for me to murder him. I'm gonna have to do it. I can't, I can't hold out here. Let's activate this one. We'll, we'll get his body. All right, there you go. All right, this guy's processing. I actually, like, um, I think he was already served as well. So, like, yeah, we already got the money from him, I believe. So that was perfect. This is number 10. There we go. So that's that order done. We got somebody who's satisfied and is in the toilet. I think we should go and get them, actually. So let's do that. There we go. Visitor aggressive. It's okay though. It's okay. I'm just gonna wash this off. Everything's gonna be fine. I think I got away with that one. So <laughs> we're good. <laughs> we're on the last wave actually. Um, we've done a lot better on this attempt, I would say. So that's good actually. Do I want to do this guy? Do I want to murder him? He's not actually standing in the right position, but it's too tempting, isn't it? What is he? Is he satisfied? I don't think I've served him. No, I don't think he's been served. I'm just gonna let him live for now, I think. <laughs> just because I think it might be a good idea. I don't think he's like eaten at my restaurant yet. I don't even know what he's doing exactly, to be honest with you. I don't know. Let's go check out. See what Oh, he's slacking off in my VIP room. Wow, if that's the case. Let's murder him after all. All right, there you go. Been murdered in the VIP room. Oh, oh, my day finished. I didn't even get the parts, I don't think. I'm a bit sad about that. At least I don't think so. I got E rank. I, I didn't do very well. Like, that, let's be honest here. But sometimes we're gonna have days like that. Sometimes, you know, it's gonna we're gonna have days where they're not as good as some other days. <laughs> But that's okay. We managed it in the end, so that's good. I got 500 money right now. Um, how do I... I need to bribe them. Clear all the police uh, attention. Let's do that. Let's get rid of all of it. <laughs> I think that would be a good idea. We still got leftover money, so we are still going to be able to unlock this one. At least I think. Quest incomplete. Oh, I got to do the quests first. Info... Let's see, um, Rividonia. So we have to do the Rividonia quest. Oh, they've changed. Serve all customers of the race tower who visit within one day of awesome burgers. So I got 50% of the customers, so I can't actually go anywhere until I've actually completed that. I was actually really hoping that I'd just be able to unlock it if I had the money. I also need 500 prestige as well. So there's a couple of requirements for us before we're able to like move to a different planet. So... Yeah, we'll just have to see how it goes, I guess. Um, I think we should buy some more ingredients. Like, definitely. Definitely some more buns. Let's go for, like, that many. Yeah, 20 is good. All right, let's see. Tomato. We definitely need some more of these. Let's go for 15. Go for a couple of these as well. 15 of those. Cheese, for sure. We definitely need a few cheeses. That would be great. I don't think there's anything else they really ask for. So like, I'm thinking this should be enough, but it's just like everything, everything like all my money's gone already. Like my God, but it's, it's all right. At least I think so. I don't know if there's anything else. I might just save the rest of my money for now. It's only £50 anyway, so if I do mess up, we're not losing much, so it's fine. Do I have... Oh, i got to do four more days for this one. Okay, let's go and do another day and hope it is successful. All right, what's happening now? Okay, oh, we got some, like, really posh alien visitors. Look at him, like, brushing his, like, moustache. <laughs> He's very, very, um... Oh, is he, like, a, um... 
Like an investigator, like, you know, like a health visitor or something. Is that what he is? Oh no, I'm a bit worried now, actually. I love how they just keep putting things in like, in the days, like there's always something happening. And I think that's really cool to keep it like interesting. So that's really awesome, actually. Okay, let's see, today's special. Yeah, so today's special is the posh guys. Okay, time to panic. Critics have begun paying attention to the Good Burger restaurant. And in addition to ordinary customers, newspaper hacks will also also be visiting today in disguise in disguise of course should the chef serve any bad burgers the critic will lower the prestige of our favorite restaurant to the very bottom oh no however if the chef does everything right the article may draw some attention to his eatery this is hardcore so even if I serve just one burger that's bad I'm gonna lose all of my prestige from what I can see. That's really savage. That's really hardcore, I have to say. <laughs> I'm gonna have to be super careful. Oh my god. Okay, a critic is arriving. I am over here sweating buckets. <laughs> I just hope he likes my burgers. Don't don't hate on me, man. If they say I've got a bad burger, can I just murder them? <laughs> Is that something that I can do? I don't, I don't know, but I'm worried. I'm very worried that I'm gonna mess up. So it said the critic is arriving, but I don't actually see it just yet. So I don't know if they're like here at the moment. I think we're okay at the moment. Okay, number one has been served. Next one wants tomato. So let's do that. There you go. Got some nice tomato on the go for you, my friend. Let's put some more burgers on the go here. Let's just make sure we got a constant supply here. That would be great. Some more burgers over there. All right, I can't go too far, of course, because um, we got burgers cooking, so we can't go too far here. Oh yeah, look, the critic, I can see, I can tell with that one down there. That one's a critic, right? He's got a mustache. <laughs> you can tell the difference. So number four, he He's a critic, so gonna have to be careful with that guy for sure. All right, we got some of these things going here. All right, so we got some cheese. Let's give this guy cheese. This is the order for the critic, the one with the cheese. The one with, um, they got a one just normal patty burger here. So there is that as well. All right, we got some people eating. Critic is arriving, another critic. Oh boy, oh God. Okay, so who do we have here? So, um. This guy is a VIP. Oh, he's just he's just leaving. Do I do I get him? Let's get him. Let's just get him quick before he goes. Oh, I killed the critic, I think. Does that matter? I don't know. The critic never returned. <laughs> Maybe he would have given me a bad rating. I don't know. It's probably he probably wouldn't have but I don't know I saw an opportunity and I took it and I think it was worth it. So yeah, it was it was a good call I would I would say all right. Is there anybody else I can murder right now? Let's have a look somebody is smoking um, There's a bit too many people out here to be honest with you. I kind of wanted to murder some of those but not worth the risk, I would say. So, <laughs> gonna have to wait a little bit. Look at them all queuing up for the video game, like, little corner over there. All right, I can't find an opportunity, so I'm just gonna, wait, what, a visitor was robbed? People are robbing each other in here. Oh my God, that's bad for business, isn't it? I don't know, <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> I have no clue. Um, I didn't mean to take this out. What do I, what do I do with this thing? I guess I'll have to put it in the bin, that's annoying. Why isn't there a way to just like put it back in the fridge or something if you like accidentally take the wrong ingredient? I like totally wasted that. So like that's super annoying actually. Okay, let's put these burger buns over here. All right, there we go, what have we got here? So number six, you just want the, the burger bun. So that's gonna be really easy to solve. What else we got? We got tomato here, so that's for you, number five. All right, we got a patty um, on the go over here. Okay, I think we should put another patty on the go there. That would be perfect. All right, so I think we got some critics waiting. We got a lot of customers waiting, actually. I really need to do something about that because that's not good, right? It's definitely not good. All right, this one's done. All right, what have we got? This is, um, we need onions, onions for this guy. I'm feeling the pressure. <laughs> the pressure is real. Why is there so many orders all at once? All right, this is for number eight. All right, cool stuff, cool stuff. Okay, let's see, we got some, it's getting really busy. It's getting really busy. I don't know if I can keep up with demand. What's going on? Oh no, I think people might be leaving or something. I'm not sure. Um, 
Yeah, some people left. <laughs> okay, okay, all right, it's fine, it's fine. Let's put some more things on. All right, what have we got here? We got a burger here. Number 10, let's go for number 10. I'm just, I'm panicking a little bit here. All right, this is for number 10. There you go. All right, who's number nine? Okay, number nine's that one. All right, that's fine. Okay, let's do this. I think I just got a bit of prestige there, so that was good. I hope I haven't made any of these, like, critics mad or anything. Here's hoping. All right, we're gonna need some cheese. Let's put some cheese in here. Perfect, there's that one. Okay, this is for number nine. Yes, um, okay, that's good, that's good. We're, we're, we're like getting through them slowly. Number 11, we're gonna need some cheese. So let's do that. There we go, that's for number 11. Perfect, let's put another burger down here. All right, I think we need, we need to cook some more things, right? I need to cook some more things, I'm running out. I'm running out of stuff. Oh no, ha, oh, I just wasted a burger as well. So I clicked the wrong thing by accident, <laughs> but that's okay. All right, what are we doing? Number 12, he just wants normal burger. So number 12, there you go. That was easy to deal with, so that's good. All right, what else we got? Number 13 wants tomato in their burger, so that's good. We got two more to go, two, like, well, we got like one more order to go after this one. This is the tomato one, this is number 13. All right, good, we're, we're, on, a, we're on a roll at the moment, so that's good. All right, we've got another one here. What have we got, um, number 16? I think we should do 14, because they've been waiting longer. So we're gonna do number 14, there you go. All right, good. Um, God, I'm running out, I'm running out. This is like all the like normal meat that I've got now. It's getting a bit getting a bit like spicy over here isn't it we got two more orders to do number 16 and number 15 so hopefully it will like calm down a little bit after this because then then i can go around murdering and hopefully getting some more meat um for sure because uh, it's been a bit crazy i've definitely racked up my prestige quite a lot though i have to say i do think that i need to do some more murdering though <laughs> so there is that as well okay okay let's put that in all right what have we got so tomato in one of these so here you are this is for number 16 and we got onion in this one for number 15 oh phew all my orders are taken care of and i can finally leave the kitchen and like just sort of think about trying to murder people <laughs> hopefully anyway th the only thing is is that all the like people are together right now so i don't know if like I don't think this guy would spot it. Oh, actually, I think he might have. Oh God, oh God. Let's just quickly get rid of the body and go. Are you going to the police? I, I hope you're not. <laughs> I don't know where he's going. I don't think he saw anything. I think we're fine. Everything's good. He saw nothing. <laughs> We're fine. We're fine. <laughs> I thought he saw but I don't think he did so like we're we're good right now So I reckon we could probably get this guy as well on the way out like I think we could get this guy too Yes, there we go extra extra like one right there. So that was awesome Let's wash ourselves off, but I think the day is pretty much done. Yeah, the day is done. I got an S rank Oh my god, that's the best I've ever done on a level <laughs> That was really good. It's taking a little bit of practice, but I think I think I'm kind of getting there. So yeah, that's really cool. I, I really like that. I think we could maybe unlock the next planet now. Hopefully. Can I unlock it? Oh, I really want to unlock it. <laughs> so close. So I've done that one. I just need to kill like a couple more customers. So I reckon we can get it next time for sure. Okay. We definitely need some more ingredients like really badly. <laughs> so let's do that. All right. I'm going to buy one more actually. All right. Let's see. Get some more of these. That'll be great. Oops. Okay. I kind of just like going with like like a rounded number because I don't know it's just what I like to do <laughs> it's just how I roll I guess we still got quite a lot of money um should we pay our bills what are our bills on bills are looking a little high let's pay our bills actually oh I actually have two bills right now at least I think so it says one out of two how do I how do I see the next bill I don't know how to pay the other one Oh, there you go. That's how you do it. Okay, all my bills are paid and we still got like 400 left over. So we might be able to buy something. All right, let's see. What do we want to do here? Ignore customers waiting time. That's quite a lot of money, I have to say. Extra health, extra stamina. Extra stamina would be really good, actually. I kind of, I did buy this before, but it didn't do anything. I'm going to buy it one more time and see if it does anything. Because um, I really want the information on the 
the, the like the things. Okay, there's actually stuff here now. So like that's really cool. Let's see. They're immune to poison and whatever that is. Let's see. Poison and what is that? A med kit. They're immune to a med kit. Okay, we can see the activities now. They like dancing. They like what is this one? They like the slot machine. They like going toilet. They like burgling and they like pickpocketing. Ah, okay, maybe they are the ones that keep stealing from other people or something. I don't know. Like you like wait, activities zombie? You turn into zombies? <laughs> is that a thing? I don't know. Critics as well. They like to eat um Tarot, they like to eat each other. Cannibalism, perfect. Uh, they like to eat whatever this thing is. Don't actually know what all of these are. I don't think it like lets you know what all of them are. I don't know anywhere, I don't think so. We got these, these are on my thing. I think I only saw them like once though. Um, but yeah, we don't know anything about these guys just yet, but that's interesting, very interesting indeed. Um, what should we go for? I'm kind of like curious actually. Should I do the... Should I do either the processor or the breakdowns? I'm going to go for the breakdowns again. The breakdowns are really annoying, so <laughs> I'm going to go for that, actually. That would be good, so that would be awesome, actually. Can I craft anything here? Let's have a look. We can craft some of these, like, nicotine things to, like, make them go toilet. Um, make them smoke, um, I should say. There is a toilet one, but that one's not for the toilet, I don't think. Oh, we're really, like, we're going to be low on meat when we start this new day, so that's going to be a little bit sad, I have to say, but that's all right. It's okay. All right, let's go. Let's go. A new day. We got three more days to unlock a costume, so we're getting there slowly. All right, let's see what we got today. What's today's special? Oh, we got the critics again, I think. Oh, the protesters. That's what it is. Protesters today. So it looks like it's just gonna like, I don't know, alternate between like the different like things that pop up on the day. So sometimes it's gonna be critics, sometimes it's gonna be like something else. It's just gonna like depend, right? So yeah, that's interesting. Oh, you can carry like two stacks of meat. I didn't know you could do that. You can't carry two buns. I don't know why, but you can carry two like meat um, things if you want to. So like that's kind of interesting as well. We definitely need to do some more murdering today. I'm gonna wait for my opportunity though. <laughs> I'm not gonna just jump straight into it right now because that would be a bad idea. Someone is going to the toilet. It's very tempting, isn't it? Very tempting. <laughs> we'll see though. Okay, so number two just wants that. Uh, we got some cheese for you. This is for number one. Yep, so that's good. All right, put some more of these on the go. That would be perfect. All right, there we go. Oh my, hello. What is this guy doing? Oh, he's protesting. Should I murder him? Murder him. Get him out. Oh no, I can't. I haven't got the stamina to murder him. Ah! Oh god, oh god, oh god, he's running, he's running. Oh no, he's running away. What do I do? <laughs> he's screaming. Get out. Oh no, oh no. I got a police thing. Okay, let's not destroy those for now. Um, hello, can you get out of here, please? Ow! What are you doing? Why did you kill me? What? This game is brutal. I don't know what happened. Everything just went so terribly wrong. <laughs> It went so terribly bad. It was a mistake. Everything was a mistake. So I'm dead on the floor and um, don't know what's happening. There's stuff all over the floor or something. I don't really know what that was trying to say, but that was a very quick day. It didn't last very long at all, did it? <laughs> oh God. Okay. All right. Let's do this again, I guess. Am I back on day one? And all my quests, are all my quests reset too? serve two customers while being covered in blood. I got different quests this time. Kill five already stuffed customers. I see, I see, okay. Yeah, I think I might be on day one and I've lost all my prestige and everything. This game is like really hard <laughs> for sure. It's like uh, definitely got some very dire consequences for messing up in this game. I've already died so many times. <laughs> oh God. It's just like one of those kind of games, right? Uh, someone's gone to the toilet. I might just take them down to be fair. Just try and get like a nice dose of like uh, meat and stuff like that going on. I think that would be a good idea. We want to serve some customers while covered in blood for one of our quests. So I'm just going to like keep my, um, I'm just going to stay in the kitchen and just keep this up like for now. I'm hoping that that like counted. Yeah, I did. It did. Okay. So if I just stay in the kitchen and just serve them whilst covered 
covered in blood that should do our quest so i'm gonna focus on the quest and i'm just gonna like try and be careful <laughs> Hopefully I keep saying that and I keep like ending up like getting myself killed <laughs> Don't mean to at least that day was quick and I didn't like do the whole day and then die at the end So like I guess there's a silver lining there I suppose in a way I guess um so like it's better I suppose Okay, let's uh get some meat over here on the go as well. Why are you suspicious? What? What did I do? Maybe it's, do you taste the blood on the burger or something? <laughs> What's going on? I don't know. I have no idea. I'm not doing anything. I swear. Not doing anything at all. God, what's your problem? <laughs> God, I got fast service in this joint, okay? Just take the good service. All right, what, what are you doing? Get away. Ah, no, stop attacking me. Leave me alone. What's wrong with you? How did you see me from over there? I don't even know. I burnt my burger because of you. Oh man, look at all my burnt burgers. You ruined everything. I was like cooking some nice burgers and you just like had to ruin everything, didn't you? Oh my God, I picked up a wrong, I wasted a bun just then as well. <laughs> what a pain in the butt. Oh, that wasn't what I was expecting to happen. I'm just gonna hide over here a second. It's a bit of a pain serving people while being covered in blood. Or I have to be um, uh, for real here. Okay, we're definitely gonna like um, wipe this off as soon as possible. I think, cause yeah, it's getting a bit annoying now. <laughs> it's really frustrating. I did my quest anyway, so like that was good. Okay, let's get the onions in here. There you go. That's number four. Perfect. All right. Okay, I just need to be a little sneakier about this whole situation, right? So that's what we're gonna try and do. Okay, all right. I need to get to the, the sink, man. Everyone just like hovering around the sink and I can't do a thing. <laughs> it's a real pain in the butt. I can't even be in the kitchen right now. <laughs> what annoying, it's like what a pain in the butt. All right, okay guys, can you please just let me get to the sink? Like that would be fantastic, like please. Oh my God. All right, there we go. Thank God for that. Now they won't like be seeing me too much there. So like, that'll be good. I might actually take that guy out just like whilst I'm here. All right, there you go. <laughs> no one saw anything. Everything's fine after wash up again, but it's all good. I got some more like extra meat there. So that was awesome. All right, there you go. We're fine. Why are they still suspicious, man? I don't even have blood on me anymore. My God, they're suspicious all the time. Oh, my buns, I forgot, my buns. Ah, <laughs> my management is just not going well here, is it? <laughs> like, I'm not managing my stuff too well. So I keep putting stuff on and it keeps burning, but it's fine. All right, so we got onions. I got onion one for you. All right, I'm gonna put this in here. Why are they still suspicious? <laughs> Stop being suspicious all the time. I didn't do anything. <laughs> You meanies, the god. All right, hopefully they'll just like calm down in a second. Maybe they just like saw something they wasn't meant to see. I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea. All right, cheese bun for number six. There you go. What else we got? Some tomatoes here. Oh god, oh god, oh god, the line's coming closer. I don't want to be anywhere near that thing. All right, here we go. This is for number seven. Let's go and do that one. That would be great. I don't know if I want to put any more on right now, actually. Let's just leave it for a second. We're going to activate this and yes, get some more meat. That'd be great. There you go. Perfect. Good stuff. Good stuff. <laughs> I don't know if I served that guy or not. I have no idea. I got to kill stuffed customers. So that's what I've got to do for my quest. So like that's what I'm going to try and attempt. So we need people who have already eaten. Like this guy, he's going toilet. He's suspicious though. So he's probably just going to like straight attack me. So like that's not going to be great, but it's just like what I'm gonna have to deal with <laughs> so it's fine all right there we go oh god oh god oh god you didn't see anything are you coming in here oh no he's coming in here of course you are of course you are oh my god well at least I got two people at once I guess <laughs> I wasn't expecting him to come into this exact like bathroom he could have gone into any bathroom but he just chose to go into this one why are they all coming in here go away Oh my god, I'm gonna have to kill you as well. You've seen too much. You know too much <laughs> They all know too much. Why is everyone coming in here? I got nowhere to hide. All right, that guy's going in the bathroom So I got a second to just like chill out. I just killed like four people. I got like four people processing <laughs> I got enough meat to last for days. <laughs> What's going on here? I don't even know. 
<laughs> it's getting a little bit crazy over here. Like, it's getting a bit wild, for sure. There's another guy up there as well, and it's so tempting because he's right next to the trap, and I'm just... I'm gonna have to go for it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, man. You were just too tempting for me, so I just had to put you out of your misery. <laughs> Alright, what have we got? We, di we did both quests. Okay, good, good. That is actually awesome. I'm very happy with that, actually. Okay, we're definitely gonna feed these two customers. I've been killing a lot, so <laughs> we should definitely do some feeding now, I would say. But this is going well, I would say. So that's good. That's good. All right, one of them wants tomato. So let's put tomato in this one. This is for num... I gave that to the wrong one. Oh, God, I gave that to the wrong one. I totally did. I just totally messed that up. Oopsie. I'm sorry. Okay, number 10. That will be good. All right, cool. Where is number eight? Number eight is the one I messed up. That's number 10. I actually did his order fine. But I'm just wondering, maybe I should kill number eight because... I messed him up anyway. Like, I messed up his order. So, like, I'm just gonna murder him. He's- I don't want bad reviews. <laughs> Get away with those bad reviews. No, thank you. Are you coming out? Are you just- you just chilling in there? Okay, he just- he just chilling in there. I don't want him to see me, right? But that- that guy's, like, gonna be satisfied. So, yeah. <laughs> We're gonna let him be satisfied. <laughs> I think that would be good- a good idea. Alright, there we go. There's that all done. My burger is sold. Alright, enjoy your burger. I'm just gonna watch you. Just make you feel uncomfortable while still eating your burger. Do you mind? <laughs> I'm sure he- he's, like, having a great time. He is- he's enjoying himself. Is that good? Is that good? rat burger that you got there my friend i hope you're enjoying it he gave me a tip as well and i'm going to take that i'm just going to take everything you have haha <laughs> take that haha <laughs> there you go i got an s for that day so we're improving we're improving i'm learning as i go <laughs> it's getting better <laughs> it definitely is i'm just gonna have to watch myself right okay let's pay that one there we go. Okay, we got a bit of like extra cash here though. I am gonna have to buy some ingredients. So not too sure how much I'm gonna be able to do here. Buy a couple more of those actually. Let's buy some of those. One more of those I think would be good. Okay, I think we're good there, but we only got like 97 left. So it's not too much. It's not too much at all, sadly. Okay, let's keep like going. I'm gonna go as far as I can go. All right, what do we got? Actually, oh yeah, we got the critics today. So the critics are arriving. So let's try and make those guys happy. That would be great. So how much meat have I got? 25. That's probably like the most I've had all at once because we killed a lot of customers yesterday. Like a lot of them. So like, yeah, that's super cool actually. <laughs> We did, we were on a roll. We did really well. What's my quest today? I still have the same quest, so I don't, like, have, like, anything to work towards, like, sadly. So that's kind of a, a pain. I guess it's just, like, getting money and getting prestige and just, like, upgrades and stuff like that now. So, yeah, that's what I'm gonna hopefully do. Okay, this is one of the onions. So this is number two. This is for you. This is the cheeseburger one. Okay, perfect. Let's put some more on. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna keep an eye on it as well because I don't want to to burn it so that's what we're gonna keep an eye on that'll be great all right guys you having a good time all right there they go having a nice burger why is my restaurant so messy i wish i could like clean it up or something it looks so dirty everywhere and I, I don't like it it's bad hygiene <laughs> my my restaurant needs a good cleaning a good spring cleaning i would say all right there you go there's your tomato burger nice and served they're all happy, which is good. <laughs> Very good. All right, where's this guy going? We got some people going to the toilet. Like this guy over here is going to the toilet. Could be a good opportunity, I would say. We gotta keep up the supply and the demand after all, right? So I can't be slacking on killing my customers. He already ate anyway, so he didn't, he didn't need the toilet. He's fine. <laughs> he didn't need his life, so it's fine. It's all good. Okay, so what, what do we have? Um, onions. Serve you some onions. Did I not buy onion? Oh no, I don't think I brought any more onions. I must have forgot to buy the onions actually. So that's annoying, but it is what it is, I guess. All right, we got some more of those on the go, so I can't do, go too far. There is somebody in the, the bathroom, but it does look like there's a lot of people coming into this sort of like general area at the moment. I'm just gonna like, I'm just gonna leave it be for now. Actually, I might get that one at the top because he's right by the trap. And that would just be like an easy one to like just get. 
super easy. Number five, I haven't even served him either. So yeah, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna take him down. Take the body. There we go. Perfect. <laughs> Good stuff. All right. Well, if we got some onions here, let's put the onions in. And that's going to be order number. Oh, that one's already done. Oh, God. I messed that one up. We're just going to leave that one there. I'm, so, I'm sure someone will want onion at like some point. So that, that will be good. This is for number six. So, yeah, that one's just like a burger for another day, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. I don't need it right now, but it's fine. Okay, there we go. Let's leave those guys to it for now. I think that would be good. Some people are going home. There's somebody going on to the game machine. It's getting a little bit crowded and like a little bit hard to kind of, I don't know, maintain, I guess. I don't know. All right, so we got some dude who wants just a normal burger here. Uh, my customers are like beating each other up. <laughs> it's getting a bit dicey, isn't it? Okay, this one wants tomato. Oh, sadly not not the one that I was like after I got onion but not not that one no one's gonna come up with like an onion now are they <laughs> it's just gonna be annoying all right this is for number eight gonna put some more on here all right there we go put that one on perfect got another burger down there all right so you want cheese I can arrange that for you can arrange some cheese burgers that would be fantastic all right what is going on over here this is number nine i'm actually already cooking his burger so i think i'm just gonna like leave him to it like for a minute anyway so like that would be good all right come on more burgers we got some more burgers that need to be processed that was number nine Let's put that one over there all right awesome is there anybody else no we've served everyone so now it's just a case of just like sort of finding people to kill i guess i don't really know there's somebody stunned but i don't know exactly where they are it's a little bit too many too many people around here at the moment i would say but that's okay all right come in for your order number nine come get your order number 10 is ready i have that for you there you go number 10 just got instantly served good stuff very nice nobody wants onion oh we finally got someone who wanted onion i'm glad because i was a bit worried that no one was gonna want onion and it was just like gonna go to waste and that was gonna be like really sad but <laughs> yeah we're good we're good so that's awesome all right i'm gonna keep those going for now i think um do we have any satisfied customers just like doing whatever yeah like this guy let's get rid of this guy all right there we go perfect i got some prestige as well i don't know like what i did but it must have been something good right so that's good this guy's already eaten we don't need this one either so yeah, let's like do something about that. You didn't see anything. You didn't see nothing. Nothing's happening. Okay, we're fine. <laughs> I thought he was gonna notice me. Oh god, it's like so stressful like when that happens. <laughs> I always get so stressed out. All right, we got some more like meat processing. So we got, oh no, my burgers. I forgot my burgers were on the go. I'm so bad with that, man. <laughs> I keep forgetting. I'm just like, I'll just step away for two seconds and then it's like everything's burnt. <laughs> like, it's so bad. I need to stop doing that. So yeah, that's annoying. Um, okay. I could kill that guy in the VIP room, but it's just like, he hasn't actually like been served or anything so i don't know i kind of like like murdering people that have already like eaten and are already like satisfied like this guy so i prefer it to do it that way to be fair how are my burgers looking actually let's check okay i'm glad i checked because like they were about to burn so that would have been really bad okay so we got some onion for one of them number 12 and cheese for the other one let's go and do that one as well it's number 13 all right good good um of course we need to wash up because people are very suspicious right now so i need to do something about that hopefully that would be great i think we're just about to process a little bit more meat so that's great as well all right is there somebody in vip oh perfect hello friend get rid of you <laughs> yay good stuff all right process some more meat over there that would be great actually that would be so good got 700 prestige already so that's good i'm happy about that we're all like you know all freshened up and everything so that's good i think people are going home i think that's the end of the day now so yeah that's done we're on day two i keep dying and getting reset so hopefully we actually like make it past like you know i want to get to like day three or four <laughs> or something that would be great 
but it's just gonna depend, right? So there you go. End of day two. Perfect. Okay, good. We got a nice bit of money as well. So that's really good. Pay our bills first and foremost. I got 700 left. We, we need some more buns. Let's buy some buns. Buy one more. Just like, I like keeping on stock of it. Like just maybe like 20 of everything or around that would be great. I don't know, like 21, that's fine. A couple of bits of cheese. Let's see, anything else that we're like low on? I think that's okay, we got 500 to spare. That's actually really good. What shall we buy? Let's have a look, extra health or extra, I want extra stamina. I feel like stamina is more important than the health to be fair. So yeah, that's gonna be really cool. Um, is there something else I want to buy? I still got quite a bit of money. It's only like a hundred, but it's a nice amount, I would say. Let's have a look. I might just buy some extra info. Let's have a look. Uh, this is the police, I think. Yeah, that's the police, guys. Uh, we don't really... I guess I could buy it. Why not? <laughs> I don't know what else to do with the money right now. I don't know exactly what I unlocked from this guy, but let's have a look. We, we do have some information on like some of the species here. Like some of them. I think this is what I unlocked, right? Yeah, I think so. We know what he wants to eat and like what he's immune to and stuff like that. So like, that's really good. That would be useful for when like I get a customer, like, you know, when we get a customer of some kind for this guy at the very least. Oh, my quests are completed. Oh, we just need the money. Oh, if only I'd have just kept a bit of money back, we could have like unlocked it. I didn't realize. It's okay though. It's fine. Um, I'll just do one more day and then we'll be able to like do that. So this is day number three. So let's go ahead and tackle day number three. That would be great. Uh, we got protesters today, so we need to sort of watch out for, for protesters, but I'm sure we'll be okay as long as I like don't attack them. As I think attacking them was a bad idea. It's like I learned that the hard way. <laughs> For sure, because, uh, yeah, they, they're really, like, they got a lot of health, and when they're low, they run away, and then it just puts me in a lot of trouble, so I just think that we're not, like, strong enough to deal with them, like, I don't know if we've, like, got enough stamina or anything like that, I don't know, I just, I just don't think it's a good idea right now, so I'm just gonna, like, I'm just gonna, like, kick them and annoy them, and just, like, get them, get them out of the, get them out of my restaurant, sort of, like, that way, hopefully. <laughs> So that will be good. Are you leaving? I hope you're leaving. I think they're leaving. So like that's good. We got another dude here. Get out. Get out. Go away. Go away, you nasties. All right, there we go. We just want our lovely rat people and that's it. Nobody else is allowed in my restaurant. Just rat peoples. Okay, that's all. All right, here you go. Number one, we got some onion for this one as well. So let's do that. Let's see, onion for you. All right, perfect. Put some more things on the go. Number one, you've been served, but like they're in like a very good spot where I could kill them, but... It would be a waste of burger because I've already served them. It's already gone off. So, yeah, I don't want to waste it. So, it's just going to have to be how it goes. It's kind of annoying that I don't have any, like, quests or anything like that. It's kind of annoying, actually. But it's fine. It's okay. Oh, we got another protester. Let me through. Let me through. I need to get rid of this darn protester. Like, get out of here, you annoying little dude. Get out of here. So many of these guys. They just, like, just can't control themselves. <laughs> They're super duper annoying, right? Okay, okay. Oh, no. My patties. Did I really step away for that long? I didn't realize I stepped away for that long. Damn, they got wasted. That sucks. It's all right. We actually have a good supply at the moment. So, like, we're, we're doing all right. We're doing okay. Just need to be a bit more careful. That's all. All right. We've got someone going to the toilet. We're going to get rid of you. There you go, because I need a bit more meat, I think, so that would be good. All right, I'm just going to just leave these guys to it for the moment. Oh, okay, we got another protester up here. Let's get rid of you. All right, he's going, he's going. Okay, good, we got some meat here. Um, Yeah, my... I got some very unsatisfied people at the moment. Quick, give this to number four. I'm being too slow. I'm being very slow and it's not good. Um, number five. Right, there you are. Let's put some more on. There we go. Let's put some more burgers down here as well. That would be great. I need to wash up as well. So, like, we'll do that just, like, as soon as I can. I think that would be a good idea. Oi, get out. 
Get out of here, you little pest. <laughs> I think I'm learning to manage this a little bit better now. Someone's coming, someone's coming. Oh boy, um, you're coming into this room, aren't you? Oh no, I'm not doing anything weird in this corner, I swear. <laughs> I'm not doing anything strange. I swear it. Oh, my burgers, my burgers. Go see the burgers. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh god, it's not going too well, is it? Okay, it's fine, it's fine. Okay, I, I lost my burgers again. I'm really just messing up really badly here. All right, hopefully this will be okay. Um, <laughs> we'll see. We got some very unhappy people here because I'm just being really slow. Um, so yeah, it's not it's not going so well. I'm gonna have people. Oh, there's people just all after me. Just go away. God. Jeez, can't do anything. And like, I feel like, yeah, my burgers, my burgers. I gotta watch my burgers. I don't want these to get ruined again. So no thanks. All right, what are we doing? We got two very unhappy customers. I think they're leaving. Oh no. Okay, okay. We got this one. This is for number nine. Okay, we got tomato for this one. Let's do this one as well. Number 10. All right, we actually served a couple there. So that's good. Get out, get out, get out. It's hard managing so many different things. I'm actually struggling. It's actually really cool because it reminds me of like Dyna Dash and like I, I really loved Dyna Dash so yeah it's like uh, definitely reminding me a lot of that which is super cool I wish there was like another sink like so I had a little bit more of an opportunity to like you know um, wash up a little bit but it's like kind of tough because I totally don't oh my gosh oh no don't burn don't burn don't burn okay we're fine wait the police are after me what did I what did I do? I don't know what I did. We got some, 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 someone suspicious anyway. So that's bad. Okay, we got Tommaso here. It's just getting a little crazy here. I don't, I don't know what's happening. Leave me alone. Oh God. Oh my God. Did somebody call the police on me? I don't know. I don't know. Okay, okay. We really need to get rid of this. Like, I need to wash really badly. I hope this guy doesn't move. Oh God. Oh no. Seriously, I can't do anything. It's just getting so bad. I just can't even do anything. Oh my God. There's just too many suspicious people around right now and I can't even get to the sink. <laughs> it's awful. I need to wait for them all to leave this building so I can do something here. What about my burger situation? Is it bad? I don't even have some on, so we're fine. Okay, good. All right, let's clean up. Let's clean up. I think this is something we really need to do. <laughs> They're just after me so much, and it's just getting, like, really bad. Get out of here, man. So annoying. This, they might still be suspicious of me for, like, a little while, but I don't I don't know. We'll, we'll have to see, I guess. All right, let's put these in. Okay. We're good. We're good. Let's start cooking some burgers and getting some satisfied customers. I think I lost a bit of prestige there as well. And I'm going to have to wipe that like, you know, police badge stuff as well. As long as I don't fail and like die, then like I'm somewhat happy. <laughs> it's not going like really well or anything. But I think like the worst thing to happen would be you die and have to restart the whole thing, right? So as long as that doesn't happen... <laughs> then I'm somewhat happy so yeah we'll see okay it's number 16 all right off they go we got some protesters that we really could do with getting rid of because I think they do affect like my prestige or something so let's get rid of those all right those two are going so that's good I got a suspicious customer here and I just like if I go up to him he's gonna attack me and it's not gonna be great so yeah I don't know if I want to do that or not <laughs> right now oh my god all the suspicious customers i think i can go round actually let's go round that would be great uh we'll wait for this guy to get like his food and then <laughs> we'll be okay everybody's so suspicious <laughs> what did i do <laughs> i don't know oh we got another protester incoming i gotta try and get rid of him without like being spotted so like yeah let's do that all right he's going he's going all right good stuff but we're fine at the moment, I think the day is about to end. Like, thank God I really actually want this day to end because everybody is just so suspicious of me right now. And I want to get rid of, like, these police badges too because they are a nightmare, I have to say. <laughs> so, yeah, I think we're done for the day. Let's have a look. I got 19, like, um, meat there and I'm still processing too. So that'll probably, it'll probably give me that once, like, the day is officially over, right? So that'll be good. I don't know what, like, my max was. I think I did get to, like, day three before... Mm -hmm. 
So um, yeah, I got an E. It wasn't great. I know I I know I like I knew it wasn't a good day. I knew I didn't perform that well. Like I panicked a lot. So I was expecting that. So like that's fine. Um, what we're gonna do now is I think the priority is definitely to get rid of the police attention. Definitely want to get rid of that. And then I definitely want to unlock the next planet. So we've unlocked the next planet now. So we got Riviadonia. So now we're on this planet. I think we start back at day one again so there is that but it's okay looks like there's maybe different skins for each planet but i don't know i have no idea okay well let's go on a voyage to the next planet i'm looking forward to it actually all right and here we go are these the new customers oh my gosh look at them hanging upside down how did you get in that predicament i wonder i don't know oh we got bullies we got like thug alien types oh my gosh my dude is like, how am I going to deal with this? What am I going to do? I don't even know. Oh my gosh, look how worried he looks. Oh gosh, what are we going to do here? It's going to be interesting. I'm sure it's going to like throw another challenge at me, right? <laughs> but I'm looking forward to trying to tackle it. I'm looking forward to tackling it for sure. All right, day. Oh, we're on day four. Oh, it does carry on. I thought it was going to restart me because we're on a different planet, but I guess I was wrong. So yeah, I wonder how long we will last. Who knows? Who knows? Wait, what does this alien like? Does he even like this meat? I actually don't even know what he likes. We don't know what he likes, to be fair. So no idea. We're just gonna cook the the like the rats and then just like see what happens. Um, I think that would be a good idea. I don't know. I don't know where I stand here. These are completely different customers. They're gonna give completely different like alien parts. So yeah, it's gonna be really interesting actually. All right, let's just like put the meat in the buns for now. We don't know what the orders are, so we're just gonna have to wait for a minute. But yeah, this is gonna be interesting all these different like types of customers is very cool i have to say come on get an order in already what's taking you so long these guys take forever to order i've like been open for a while stop being so picky god all right finally and he wants a cheese okay i can work with that number two there you go i hope you like this like um kind of meat but we'll see this guy wants tomato and cheese this guy is greedy i have to say all right here you go this is for order number one there you are all right these guys are talking let's hope they don't get into some weird conflict yes they are stunned him fantastic i kind of thought that was gonna happen wait this guy wants like pickles or something yeah yeah i think no i think it's cucumber yeah that's the first time anybody's actually ordered that so like that's really interesting we're just gonna keep going with the racks it doesn't look like they dislike it at least i don't i don't think they do it doesn't say that they want a specific type of meat so it should be fine okay onions um in one of them and we got like the some um, cucumber stuff as well so like that's cool that's very cool indeed what are they doing he's got like a clapping icon what does that mean <laughs> i don't even know to be honest all right there's those done okay we got your pickles surprise there you go this guy wants a sauce okay i only got like this nicotine sauce thing so i'm gonna have to like give you that i guess all right so you got sauce you got the meat we got the tomato and hopefully like that's gonna make him happy i don't really know but we'll have to see what's this clown symbol oh my gosh they're all in the vip room at the moment what's wrong with this guy i don't know like i don't know why he's got like a green star next to him like did i did i do something wrong does, that, did, does he not like that meat like i'm not sure I'm not actually sure. He doesn't look very satisfied. I'm thinking he might not like it, but I don't actually know. It's hard to tell. I don't know. I'm going to have to buy some info on all these different aliens because I have no idea like what they like and it doesn't look like they like it. They don't look very satisfied, do they? So I don't know. I think I might have to try a different type of meat. I'm thinking that might be a thing that we should try i need to get them alone so i can try and like actually murder them like this guy here this actually might be the best opportunity are they stronger that they are a bit stronger than the other like types as well so there is that as well um actually so i need to be careful of that but we're getting a different type of meat here so that's cool okay we got um this guy over here we're gonna take this opportunity and he did not die and now oh no oh no oh no oh no oh no i'm dead that did not go well he just happened to come in at just like the wrong time. Oh no, man, I am gutted. 
<laughs> this is hard. I died. I always, I think it's just going to be a thing where I'm just going to end up dying like at least once every episode. <laughs> at least. This game is hard. <laughs> just like, it's such a, such a learning curve. But I'm determined, so I'm just going to like, I'm going to keep trying. Wait, I have to start all over again and I lost the whole planet? Is that for real? Oh my god. I'm not even on the same planet anymore. Oh my god. That's just brutal. That's really brutal. Okay, I'm just gonna like play around a little bit and get back to the planet that we were on because like I want us to actually make pro progress so <laughs> that's what I'm gonna do. Okay, so I'm on like day three of Junkameria so we are on the first planet but something different is happening so I thought maybe it would be cool to like you know do this like day together. We're probably gonna go back to the next planet like like soon probably just after this day most likely so yeah I think it's okay something is happening with the toilet like I don't know what is happening here some rats are coming out the toilet like what <laughs> what does this mean and I've turned into a plumber I don't I don't know I've never seen this happening so I thought it might be interesting but let's have a look um okay so we got clogged toilets ah here we go again sewage backups are common throughout the system and good burger alas is no exception if the chef does not want to lose twice the prestige points as usual he should monitor the status of the toilets and clean them as necessary if he is successful the prestige points for each action will be doubled after all in this situation not many restaurants would be able to get away clean ha huh. okay yeah so i'm on day three so i've done a couple of days already like um for this planet so like yeah <laughs> i just thought you know we're just constantly just like redoing like the same kind of days um so i didn't really like want to bore you guys too much with that and also it's like I do want to make progress as well so it can be a bit of a pain when you die and lose everything definitely it really like hinders progress a lot I guess like that's the point though they probably just like want to make the game seem longer by let you know making you like redo it if you fail I guess that's what it is it's for replayability I suppose it's quite addicting though so like I'm not like super mad about like having to redo it but I I know it's gonna get annoying like later down in the line i know it's gonna just be like such a pain in the butt dying is really a, like a huge consequence in this game and you want to try avoid it at all costs i mean at least you do get to get upgrades kind of like every time you die it's kind of like a roguelite in that kind of way whereas like if you die you like still get to keep your upgrades and stuff so i actually did buy one more health so you can see i've got four health now i think i only had three last time and i also have three stamina which we of course brought the stamina together but I did do the health when I was just sort of going up the um the levels here okay we got the tomato and cheese in this one I have a thing for don't serve cheese the whole day but I've already done one haven't I I think I did I think yeah I think I did <laughs> it's so like easy to do it <laughs> I don't really like that quest to be honest it's a bit annoying I think I actually didn't put cheese in that one just now so I'm probably not gonna get max satisfaction out of that one but never mind it's okay everyone's eating and stuff at the moment I think I'm just gonna put a couple more patties on actually that would be a good idea I think so that would be awesome I just want to kind of look actually because I brought some information for the other things I wanted to see what they like to eat so yes I was trying to feed this guy rat and yeah he doesn't like rat so yeah for the second planet it looks like we're gonna have to kill some different kind of aliens because they don't like the same food so, so <laughs> gonna have to like watch out for that I suppose it's gonna be a bit of a pain trying to keep track of all that for sure so I'll try my best at the very least so yeah we'll just have to see how it goes right it'll be good though it'll be good okay my burgers are done it's kind of like what I was waiting for let's see we need one with tomato so we'll do that one that's number seven and this one is number six everybody is like fed and stuff so like they're fine we actually did we have two people in the VIP? No? Where are those? It says they're on the sofa. Maybe they're like down. Oh, there's a lot of people like in here. Oh my god. They're noisy as well. <laughs> All I can hear is them making weird rat sounds. <laughs> it's so crazy noisy down here. <laughs> I don't even know what to think. My god. Okay, this guy's going up here and looks like a perfect opportunity for me to use my trap. So we're gonna definitely do that. Get some, get some more meat here. Perfect. I don't know if he finished eating, but he 
wasn't actually that satisfied, so I don't know, it's fine. Someone's going to the toilet. I'm probably going to kill that guy. Maybe both of them? I don't know. Not sure if I got enough stamina for both. Oh, the toilets! The toilets are bad as well. Actually, I kind of forgot to do the toilets. <laughs> and I don't think they're very happy about that at all. So that's a pain. This guy's going in the other one because that one didn't work. So yeah, that makes sense, I guess. I got I got both of them. I managed to kill both of them though. So like, that's kind of cool, I guess. All right, I'm going to clean up. I actually re just realized that you can actually like... Um, clean up in front of the customers. I didn't think that they like liked it when you did that But I don't think they actually care that much. So that's okay. Yeah, I need to keep an eye on those toilets because um, yeah <laughs> They are not looking so great right now, right? So need to be careful of that number 11. I haven't served him I think I'm just gonna murder this guy that way. That would be good there we go get some extra meat i got a cut like quite a bit of like meat on the go now so that's pretty good actually i would say oh i got some angry crust customers i'm taking too long with my orders here so yeah that sucks a little bit i don't think i can kill him on the way out because probably like they'll probably notice me so probably not a good idea <laughs> at the very least okay let's see what we got let's see number 12 speed number 12 and number 10, number 10 really needs feeding. Like, really? Is, oh, he left. Yep, he's gone. He gone, sadly. Um. Okay, all right, we'll do number 13. Let's do number 13. He's a bit low, actually. So let's do that, number 13. There you go. And we need some more, more stuff here as well. That would be good. I actually don't really have, like that much food i got quite a lot of processing but i just like don't really have that much to be honest with you i'm losing prestige really badly because people keep leaving it's really hard this game is hard like really hard actually i'm actually surprised on the difficulty for this it's um quite um difficult but i kind of like it though it's um interesting to see like how far we can get all right let's put that in i'm just gonna put that on the cheese i think let's see what do we want what do we want we want onions yes onions let's put onions in this one so this is for number 15 number 14 just wants a patty with just like nothing in and we do have a cheese one actually yes we do have cheese one so we can give this to number 16 so let's do that that worked out I suppose I don't know who this guy is up here but he's being murdered because he's just perfect just right there for the taking so I'm gonna take him <laughs> all right easy peasy that was great actually that was awesome and my burgers are just finishing perfect all right let's see is anybody just like really mad let's see number 18 I think I just got somebody else that just left sadly <laughs> it's just too much to keep up with all right number 18 Number 17's at the bottom. We need tomato for this guy. Let's see, that's number 19. Yeah, number 19. All right, and gonna put some more in here. <laughs> really running out of stuff. No, it's bad. It's very bad, but I'll try my best. Okay, I'm gonna at least hopefully feed that guy down there. I actually think there might not be any more customers for today. I don't think so anyway, but I don't know. There's somebody in the bathroom and it's really tempting. Oh, both of my toilets are busted. I keep forgetting about doing the toilets. That guy will probably go into the bottom toilet. I'm assuming, but I don't really know. All right, so onions for this guy, number 17. That's all my orders done, I think. So now I probably should just like focus on collecting some meat before the level ends. That would be absolutely fantastic, actually. So yeah, I'm gonna definitely do that. All right, I'm gonna get rid of this guy too. Oh God, someone's coming in, someone's coming in, quick. All right, we're fine. He saw nothing. <laughs> Everything is great. Everything is fantastic. <laughs> no one is any the wiser, so we are fine. <laughs> Everything's great. Okay, once this guy leaves and there's no chance of like being spotted, we are going to get rid of this one so that when the level ends we'll have another body to to have as well so that'll be really good I don't know where this guy is going we're gonna murder this guy as well quickly before the level ends that would be good all right come on get the body get the body get the body ah <laughs> sad times I didn't manage to get it <laughs> that sucked but yeah we had an issue with the toilets like that was uh, some crazy like stuff that was 
going on there, right? So yeah, I'll have to like be aware of that, um, like be wary of it. Okay, we're just gonna like buy some ingredients. I got my buns. Let's get the, let's get a couple of tomatoes, not too many. I think we just need a few, just like a little top up would be great. I'm thinking maybe a couple of cucumbers because I noticed that they were buying that or like asking for it in like the last like time like we went to this level. So like that would be good. I have brought out some information about these guys. I got like all of these. So, so we should be good with those. Um, I don't know what else I want to be honest with you. Let's have a look. Washing speed, it does take a really long time to wash. I think I might go for that actually. That's a good one to go for. 200 left, let's have a look. Maybe the processor speed. Let's go with the speed because it does take a really long time, like super long. I'm just gonna use the rest of my money on just like burgers. It's always a good idea to use them like just in case you do die. Because otherwise it's just gonna go to waste anyway, right? So I do think it's a good idea to just use everything you got. So that's the plan. Um, so, oh yeah, I forgot I needed the money to, like, travel. That's okay. We'll do one more day on Junkamiria then, and then we'll go over to the next planet. That's okay. This planet is easier. So, like, just another level in this might be a good idea. It's just a protester level today, so nothing, like, too crazy with this one, but that's okay. It's nice and easy, so, like, that's what we're gonna, we're gonna go with. We're gonna go to the next planet on after this level's done, <laughs> I think. It's okay. It's addicting, so I don't mind too much, actually. All right, come on. Cook up some nice patties for my customers. They are going to be loving it. They're going to have a grand time, I assure you. It's going to be fantastic. All right, here we go. We got some orders. All righty. Let's send these out. Number one. Got some tomato. If I can maybe not do cheese as well, that would be really good. I actually find these protesters really annoying. Like, they're just, like, here all the time. Just really frustrating. <laughs> they're super annoying. So, yeah, I'm going to try not to surf cheese for the other quest as well. I really hate this quest a lot. It's definitely one of the worst ones. Really don't like it, but it is the way it is. All right, um, I don't think anybody's eaten or anything just yet. So, I don't, I'm not really, like, going to go around killing anybody at the moment anyway. This is also going to get us a nice supply of this rat meat for when we go to the next planet as well. Not that they like... They don't all like rat meat, but, you know, it's always just handy to have some just in case, like, something does happen. You know, it's, um... I just think it's a good idea. All right, I don't know if I'm going to have time to kick these guys out my burgers are like basically like done so need to keep an eye on those as well i know i've got a protester so i'm on the way to getting rid of that guy get out of here you annoying dude <laughs> all right there we go okay i'm just gonna try and keep on top of everything so like just don't get completely overwhelmed so this is for number let's have a look Number five, let's give it to number five. This one is for number three. Okay, that's good, that's good. All right, let's keep going with this. Let's keep this up. We got a lot of orders and yeah, just like not too many burgers or anything. Get out of here, stupid protesters. Get out of my restaurant, you're so annoying. I think there's some more down here or something. Are you going? Okay, I think I got rid of them all. I think we're good for now <laughs> anyway so that's awesome all right we got some customers that are they've been waiting a while let's say that one's cheese i don't want to give him cheese so i'm just going to give him one without cheese it's not going to be as good number six as well wanted cheese but i'm sorry we're on a no cheese diet today for the quest <laughs> it's just the way it goes um I got some more protesters here somewhere. I don't know where. There you are, down there. You think you can hide from me? I don't think so. <laughs> There's no hiding from me. Like, I can see you with my eyes closed. <laughs> okay, what else we got going on here? So we got normal burger. We got an onion burger. I see. Okay, we're gonna definitely, like, deal with that. All right, here we go. Let's see. So number seven wants a normal burger. We got an onion burger here. So this goes to number eight. And we got one more order to fulfill. I don't know if we're going to get any more, like, coming through. I don't know. We got some more protesters, so I'm going to deal with those. Get oh, sorry. I didn't mean to hit you. I was trying to get the protester. <laughs> They hit the wrong person. <laughs> that was an accident. Oops. It's okay though. It's getting a bit chaotic over here, isn't it? Like it really is like kind of 
kind of chaotic. Um, okay, we need to put another one of these on. This one's done, so that's good. This is for... Let's do the Tommaso one, because he's getting kind of impatient. So let's get rid of you. Let's get you out of here. Oh my god, there's so many orders. Like, <laughs> I don't know how to keep up with all these orders, man. It's, like, really crazy to try and keep up with all of these. <laughs> oh god. Okay, uh, you're not very satisfied. I'm just gonna get rid of you, I think. Did somebody just see me? I'm not sure if they just saw me. I got, I think they got suspicious, but I don't think they actually saw me. Oh, maybe they did. Oh, okay, never mind. They did see me. Okay. <laughs> I just kind of need to be careful then, I suppose. All right, get out of here, please. Oh, God. Totally ruined that, didn't I? Yes, I did. Oh, God. Okay, what's going on? All right, let's give this to number 10. We got so many orders. Oh, no. So many orders, man. I don't know how I'm going to keep up with all of these, to be honest, but I'll try my best. <laughs> it's getting a little crazy, for sure. Um, okay, I'll try. <laughs> it's just going to, like, we're just going to have to be careful, I suppose. Is there another, there's another protester, like, up here. Let's get rid of you. All right, the protesters are gone, at the very least, so, like, that's good. But, yeah, I don't have as much meat as I would like, because I messed up a few times here. Let's see. Okay, so we've got a lot of impatient people right now. Let's do number 13. That would be great. Um, let's see. We need, there's somebody who wants cheese, but I'm not giving you cheese. It's a no cheese day. I'm sorry. It's just the way it goes. All right, let's put these on put some more burgers on i'm really struggling to keep up here this is actually like quite quite crazy management can you let me pass it please there's too many protesters to deal with it's too crazy too crazy this level my god i wasn't expecting it to be like just like this like chaotic i really wasn't i just got a customer he just walked out no yeah, I'm not keeping up with demand here. Um, there's someone who wants onion and they're about to leave. Let's quickly do that. Number 15. Look at all these orders. It's insane. <laughs> there's so many. Okay, this is number 17. Oh my god. All right, keep going, keep going. Keep cooking. Keep doing the things. Keep doing the things. All right. Okay. Is there anybody who is open for murdering? You. I'm going to murder you. I feel like some of these customers are going to leave anyway. I've got way too many orders to deal with. So, yes. I'm going to have to take some of them down, I think. His order's done, so I'm going to leave him. Because, like, he's already sorted. So, we don't have to worry too much about that. Security, you. Get out of here. All right. Let's put some of these away. And we're going to go clean up. Because, yeah, I think they're going to get suspicious otherwise. <laughs> So let's make sure to do that. I've got some protesters as well. I've got two police badges too, so that's that's not great, but it's it's all right. It's okay for the moment, I think. We got some more protesters as Ken. Okay, what have we got? Um, someone needs something number eighteen, and we're gonna go with onion as well for you. This is number twenty. Okay, I think that's most people done there. We got some protesters to kick out. Um, there's one more somewhere, somewhere down here. Okay, got you as well. All right, that's good. Someone's in the toilet. All right, I'm just gonna leave you for now, actually. I think that would be good. Oh my God, what a chaotic day. I'm actually surprised that I like pulled through. I thought that I was gonna gonna die for sure. A crowd of protesters, are you joking? Oh my God, there's just like so many. Get out, leave me alone. What's wrong with you? Okay, all right, we're good for now, at the very least. I might kill this guy on the way out just to get a bit of meat because I'm actually quite low. I didn't have many chances in this level. So yeah, I want to try and get some extra stuff here. That would be great. All right, there's that one. Sweet. We still got somebody who's eating. This guy's coming out and he's going to leave as well. So I'm going to pounce on this guy too just before he like goes home, hopefully. Oh God, Um. oops. Oh no, I messed that up really bad. Leave me alone, leave me alone, leave me alone. Oh my God. I I wasn't expecting him to see me he's following me he won't leave me alone can i can i like i don't know if i can do the trap or not i don't know oh one more hit and i could get him one more hit and i could kill him but i think he's gonna i think he's gonna get away no I wanted to kill him. Didn't work out. I managed to make it through the day. I don't know how, but I made it. That's what matters. Oh, God, that got a bit chaotic towards the end there, didn't it? Oh, God. Okay, um... 
We need to clear our police rating because that was really high, like super high. Um, I'm gonna put some money towards the next planet. We definitely wanna fly to the next planet. So that's what I'm gonna do. And we need to stock up on our resources as well. We're probably not gonna be able to buy much, to be honest. So that sucks a little bit, but it's okay. All right, let's put some stuff in here. I think like we're kind of good from here. Buy some, a couple, couple more buns or something. That would be good. So did I do the quest? I did, I did the quest as well. So that's super cool um yeah i'm really happy about that actually okay then um what shall we buy we definitely yeah we should buy some med kits get that health back because <laughs> we definitely it got a little chaotic there <laughs> i don't want that to happen again <laughs> that was very chaotic we're just gonna go all out on our buns that would be good actually the more the merrier after all okay let's go to the next day then do we get our oh, one more day for a skin Sweet, I am looking forward to that. All right, so we're on the next planet now. So I'm looking forward to this for sure. This is day number five. Okay, um, so the species on this planet like di like different um, food. So like this guy here won't take rats. So like I'm gonna have to like, I think I'm just gonna kill him to be honest. Cause like, oh God, I got spotted straight away. What do I do here? That was a really bad idea. Um, oh no. What am I gonna do? I think I'm busted. I don't... I don't think you can kill police in this game. I'm dead. I've messed up already. I can't believe it. I messed up so fast. Oh, it took me ages to get to that point as well. It's super annoying. This game's hard. <laughs> oh my god. Oh no. That sucks. Oh, I'm gonna have to try and get all the way back up to that point again. <laughs> I'm so glad I used all my money at the very least. Like, because, yeah, this is annoying. I'm all the way back at Junk Mirror again. <laughs> uh, Alright, we're going to the next planet again. <laughs> Let's see if we last this time. I actually have quite a lot of like resources and stuff. I'm gonna buy like a couple of extra like little bits and pieces, but I don't really think we need that much. And I actually have quite a lot of money left over, so I'm probably gonna buy something. I don't really know what, to be honest. Maybe let's just buy the meat processor slots. Let's go with that. I don't really know what to spend my money on. I think I'll just use the rest of my money for just like supplies, just so like we actually use up like our money we actually got quite like a healthy supply of like stuff right now so that's super cool okay let's do it i'll try my best not to get like spotted this time i'm literally doing so bad with this i just i can't get the hang of it you know i think it's a bad idea to just like attack stuff um like if they're not like safe like in a spot like maybe not out about in the open like this that's actually a police officer can you even kill those guys i feel like it's gonna be super hard to kill those guys i don't even know how you would go about it to be honest with you he wants egg interesting okay i don't even know what quests i have i don't think i have any i don't really know um but yeah like those guys that guy actually does eat this meat so we could actually give that police officer the rat because he actually does eat that so like we can at least do that at the very least the other guy though let's have a look uh this guy here does not eat meat so i can't feed him so i'm gonna have to kill him because i can't feed him anyway he's actually in the bathroom which is a perfect opportunity for us so we should just go for it oh my god he's got a lot of life he's got so much health how are you supposed to kill those guys i just can't do this level i just can't get anywhere it's super annoying it's so frustrating so many times i've died on this like i don't those guys are so bulky i think maybe the only way to do it is like put traps in or something because yeah that guy is so strong i think i'm gonna have to rely on like traps and upgrading traps so i'm gonna work on that next because i haven't actually done that yet so that would be a really good idea okay so these are the uh, traps i'm thinking of getting the puddle it makes the victim slip over in the bathroom and then it gives you like a chance to attack them like you know once they're in the bathroom it's not really something that we need for like the rats the tarots but the other races i think we need something like some trap to like help us kill them they're just far too strong so yeah there's definitely something i've got to do here with traps this is probably like why they're like they're probably really important in this game right definitely so i've not been able to do too much i think like getting traps in the main room is probably not a good idea because like there's so many like you know 
there's so many like creatures that like stay in the like the main the main kind of like area so i don't think i want to do that but i'm just gonna get the puddle for now that would be a good idea i don't think i can get much else but i'm not too sure here stuns the victim ghost mirror will they actually go up to it i've never seen them go up to that we could get the game machine because we could use that because then it could like stun the victim as well they, they do use that quite a lot and it's quite a secluded area as well so that'll be a super cool idea i only have eight um money left i have to do one more day before i can go back to that planet but we're going to go into this day and we're going to just like test it out and see like how it works because i actually don't really know how it works right now so like that could be a really cool idea actually so yeah i'm gonna try and test it out so we got a trap here where we can stun them we have a puddle here where we can like they can trip over and um get hurt by that as well i think that's all i got for now so i got those two extra traps to help us out which is really awesome i have to say definitely very cool um i also have to like kind of keep in mind like that i need to let customers go home for the prestige as well because like you actually do need the prestige that's why i can't go to the next level is because because I actually like I can't go to the next planet because I'm not like high enough on the prestige so like that's why I can't do that so this is my new trap let's activate it and it like stuns him and you can basically I basically killed him and he wasn't able to do anything so like yeah it's really good I think that's gonna help us take down the like more beefier like, sort of like aliens because those really are difficult ones to take down these aliens here are so easy that I don't really have to worry about them they don't retaliate and it's so easy to like kill them them, so it's not like a big deal or anything but the aliens on the second planet are um, definitely a lot harder oh we got toilets that don't work I see let me let me like fix the toilet man I'll do that <laughs> all right there you go I gotta do the top one as well right so let's fix those I didn't realize it was uh, a plumbing day today but I guess it is I suppose that's all right though uh we got another dude who wants uh we'll do this one there you go just set that off for perfect and we'll start cooking some more burgers that's cool but yeah i think the traps are going to help us a lot actually i'm looking forward to kind of testing it with the beefier aliens because yeah i think it's going to help us a lot with that so that's going to be super cool actually all right this guy here i don't even think he's ordered i'm just going to take him out just because just because I can, just because free meat, easy meat, right? So yeah, that's really cool. There's another dude going to the bathroom. I might take him down too, because he hasn't ordered either. So I might just, might just take him down. There we go, easy peasy. He was killed in the bathroom and the weapon was a cleaver. <laughs> it's like Cluedo, right? <laughs> I like it. <laughs> a visitor was robbed. Oh boy. Okay, Um, let's get rid of this nasty toilet problem because it's not good. Oh God, my burgers. I forgot. <laughs> Got too distracted with just like other stuff. It's just so easy to get distracted with that, right? Oh, I should have taken the thing off and I'm just like, oh, I have to put it. Oh, so annoying. I hate that that's the thing and you can't just like swap them but like yeah it was my fault i picked it up too too early i picked it up too fast so yeah my fault <laughs> never mind though okay we're gonna serve the rest of these customers we're gonna get that last bit of prestige i think it's like 500 prestige you need for the first planet so yeah we're gonna let some people go home so we can get that prestige up a little bit that would be great so go get some more like burgers on the go here that would be great and then we can just have them ready for whenever these guys are ready to order or whatever so yeah that would be good okay so let's get some cheese we need some cheese for this one number six perfect that's what i like to see all right there you go let's put those on as well guess i'll put an extra one it's like this one's going anyway so it's fine there's that one i'm keeping up with the orders good stuff good stuff all right so i got 450 prestige i just need like yeah i just need a tiny bit more so i can leave this planet so yeah that's gonna be really good oops i put it a little bit too slow there the actual speeding up and slowing down is really useful and i've been using it a little bit more recently to just like make things a little faster or a little slower depending on like you know what's going on so yeah there is that as well all right we fed a lot of like customers here 
do I want to kill any? Let's see. Oh, there's somebody just like perfect. Perfectly just in the VIP room. I think we have enough prestige anyway. Just like, I don't know, just good opportunity right there. So I took it because why wouldn't you, right? Uh, we need to do something about these bathrooms. So let's do that because the plumbing is awful today. What terrible plumbing. <laughs> but we're going to need a lot more prestige for, to like, for like the, the next levels and stuff, I'm sure. So yep, we're going to keep on track of this that would be great okay more burgers on the go um i think maybe these these could be the last orders actually maybe i don't know <laughs> we'll have to see how it goes i'm just gonna speed it up at just a tiny bit my quest for this for this planet for like this this time around are really awful so i don't know if i want to do it the quest i've got is to do, is to stay in the kitchen all day and like that's just it's kind of boring <laughs> i don't like that i don't like that like i don't know it's just a really bad quest in my opinion so yeah, it's a bit of a pain in the butt. I think I'm just gonna stay here for a minute. I'm just gonna like let some people go home. I think that would be good. Get some extra prestige. That would be fantastic. All right, loads of people just went home then. So we definitely got a fair bit there. So like that was great. Okay, let's see what we got. Tomato. Yeah, we got tomato one here. This is number 13. Send that off. And also another tomato here. Just quickly send this off before he gets mad. <laughs> All right, there he goes. Awesome. We got someone in the bathroom. I'm going to take you actually just for extra meat and that kind of stuff. Off, send this guy off. Can I get this guy too? Oh, I don't know if he saw me. It looked like he almost did. I don't. I don't know. I have no idea. I wanted the meat. Like I wanted the extra meat. I haven't done that much killing to be honest. I wanted to just like. I don't know, calm down a little bit, I guess. <laughs> Let's see. I did the kill 10 customers, but yeah, the quest where you don't leave the kitchen for a day. Yeah, not not a fan of that, to be honest. I'm going to let these guys leave whenever they feel they're ready. I think the day is pretty much over. We just have to, like, wait for them to go now. So, yeah, we're done. We're done. Everything is good and awesome. And we got lots of prestige. I got S rank, so I did really well on that one of course so that was really cool all right firstly we're gonna buy our ticket quest and complete do i have to do that quest don't leave the kit oh that's an annoying quest i guess i'll do it and then like we'll come back i guess i don't know okay something's happening i don't know what so there's a really gross burger or something <laughs> Um, all right, I don't know what's happening and our chefs are crying. Is it because of my prestige? I just lost my prestige in the last level. So maybe that was why I'm not really sure. Oh, there's something else happening. Okay, rivals visit. What a scoop. We're hearing reports that Leravis or something are pea brained business executives are up to their old tricks again. This time they want to learn good burgers trade secrets. Watch out, these little guys are gonna steal ingredients and even our mouth watering juicy burgers. Oh god. I'm sure the chef will do anything he everything he can to protect your food from these tiny tiny guys, so don't forget to tip. Oh my god. Those guys are gonna be so annoying. I'm not looking forward to those at all. This is gonna be a nightmare isn't it oh my god there's so many different things that this game like throws at you it's really interesting actually i do like how they do try to keep it interesting like even if you're like you know maybe messing up a little bit like i am <laughs> but that's all right okay all right let's see what we got going on here the little blighter is coming for my ingredients and i do not like that all right quick put it in put it in get out of here did he steal anything? I don't know. All right, they always come over to the fridge by the looks of it. I just need to keep an eye on the fridge from what I can see. So, like, that's okay. Of course, there were some people in there. I could have got him with the trap, but... I, w I need the prestige as well, so yeah, I need to <laughs> make sure to do that too. There's something on the floor. Did I put that there or did the thing just kind of like try to steal it and then it like was just on the floor? I'm not really sure to be honest. I have no idea. All right, another guy is coming, but I'm here. I'm raring and waiting for him. <laughs> there you go. Oh God. Oh God. Oh no. Oh, that was close. That nearly, nearly burnt actually. I think... I think we're okay though so like we're good that horrible guy is coming back again he's so annoying they really are annoying i don't like those aliens <laughs> they're just trying to steal all my stuff all the time all right let's see we need some onions all right there you go put that in there so let them go off how much have i got i got five it's not like 
great to be fair it's not the best but it will have to do for now get out you nasty thing all right let's keep cooking let's keep going we need 500 prestige <laughs> it's quite a lot of prestige honestly but i'm gonna try all right that guy's coming back again at least they always come from like the same direction so it's really easy to like deal with them so it's not it's not a big deal honestly i think i can handle it so we're fine okay let's see what we doing we need tomato let's put some tomato in there as well okay cool yeah i'm just gonna let them go through we need we can't like really murder too much at the moment though i only got three left so it's not great i'm gonna have to start murdering them soon at least i think so all right where are you there you are <laughs> waiting for him to pop his ugly head around the corner <laughs> i knew he was coming it was just a matter of time so be number six quickly grab this off okay good do we have a thing coming all right we're fine um a cheese put cheese in ah uh, no don't you even think about it you horrid thing okay it's number eight we need some onions let's put that in this is number seven yes okay cool maybe i should kill number nine oh, i got a stupid thing coming again get rid of that guy first all right maybe let's kill this guy actually all right there you go that one's gone let's get him quick okay i think i got him in time that was actually pretty close actually <laughs> I nearly didn't have time to get him, so that would have been super bad. Um, number nine, actually, yeah, I think I'll kill number nine as well, actually. Get rid of him. That would be great. Okay. Oh, my God. Such a nightmare, isn't it? Oh, I got a thing coming again. Where is he? There he is. Out of here. I don't think so. No way, Jose, my friend. Well, you're not my friend, to be fair. Was there another one? No, no, I just, like, I'm just getting a bit freaked out thinking that there's more coming, but <laughs> we're all right, we're okay. I might get some more traps um, from, like, on the next one, actually. I think that would be a really good idea, too. We're gonna grab this guy, too. All right, there you go. Okay, we got another nasty alien coming. I don't know where he is. I'm hoping I've got time to do this um, before he gets over there. Uh, no, stop it. You're horrible. You're a horrible little alien. I don't even know if there are more people coming. Maybe I shouldn't have put those on the stove. Probably wasn't a good idea, to be honest. I don't even think there are any more things coming. So yeah, that was probably not a good idea. I think the day's pretty much over. But never mind. I didn't realise. It's okay. All right, yeah, we're not we're not high enough to move on because I don't have enough prestige. We're like halfway, so I need to do like another level, but. We're gonna get some more traps though. So like that's gonna be great. Okay. Um, let me see. What do I let's see, is there anything I immediately need? Like is if you don't have buns, I found out the hard way that like uh yeah, you can't make burgers or do anything. That's how I lost all my prestige, because like I had more prestige. I actually had enough and then I had I ran out of buns, I forgot to buy some, and then like everything just fell apart. I lost everything. So like all my prestige was was gone so it's very annoying you have to be careful of that i still got quite a lot of money i'm gonna purchase the tentacle toilets actually that would be really cool i definitely want that it would help a lot um is there anything else let's see see what we got here maybe something over here like maybe this or something just buy some of these things the speaker maybe that would be cool all right i got one like dollar left just so not bad we got lots of new traps now it's all gonna help us we're all preparing like for when we have to deal with the harder aliens so that is like the whole plan um for it of course okay we got this little tarot guy coming into our restaurant of course so to deal with him i'm sure we'll be fine though so yeah this day is mostly about just getting prestige together because i really do need a lot uh, i got protesters on this level yeah i got protesters so i might have to deal with those but it's fine okay there's number two okay ah protester <laughs> go away you horrid thing all right, got some burgers here, fantastic. Okay, we got some more um, protesters around here, so I need to deal with those. If I could get past, these guys didn't want me to get past, <laughs> being a pain in the butt. Okay, so we got tomato in this one. This is 
for oh wait I was looking at the wrong one yes I was looking at the wrong one. <laughs> oh, oh no I gave it to the wrong person oh god I messed up a little bit there we need some more meat so we really do need some more meat um so that's gonna be a bit of a pain in the butt uh we got protester in here okay okay I think I might kill that guy who's going in there actually we're gonna use the trap and get this guy down we actually desperately need some meat, so yeah, I can't really be too picky there. I don't know what I've got. Tomato? Who needs tomato? Number five? Oh, it burned. I didn't have I didn't have time. Just the way it goes, so it's fine. Get out, this stupid thing. Alright, so what have we got? What what do we need to Okay, let's quickly give this. Oh, he went. Yeah, he went. Oh, I like losing customers here. Okay, onions. Let's go with onions and we'll give that to number seven. Okay, good. Yeah, I definitely lost a bit of prestige there. That's a bit of a pain. Okay, um, we I don't think I got this one. No, I haven't got this trap. I'm just gonna kill this guy. I do really need prestige as well. So um, I need like, you know, <laughs> meat as well. So everything is just getting a little haywire here. <laughs> everything is just not going as well as I would like. Let's just say that. Okay, what do we have? Another protester somewhere. Where actually are you? I actually don't know where you are. Oh, you're down there. Got you. Okay, all the protesters are leaving. At least I think so, so that's good. All right, we got two of those, which is great. The meat is just really low, which is annoying. Um, so I have to do something about that, <laughs> definitely. Okay, we're gonna get some prestige though, and that guy goes, so that's gonna be good. We got another protester somewhere down here. Let's get rid of you. All right, good stuff, good stuff. Okay, let's see if we can finish up these burgers, or at least some of them anyway. That would be great. Okay, so we got some onion in this one. This is number nine. We got, who do I wanna do? I think I'll do the cheese one. Let's do the cheese one. Actually, that's number 12. There we go. So number 11 has just gone to the perfect spot for us. So we're gonna get rid of him because we do need the, the meat as well. Okay, we've got a few protesters to get rid of. I think the protesters do get rid of your prestige just so you don't want to leave them hanging around. <laughs> Definitely not. Um, is there any more? I think I got all the protesters. Yeah, I think they're all leaving, so that's good. That's good. Alright, so I just saw one over here. I think he just left, <laughs> actually, so that's good. Okay, Um, I don't know. I might have to kill number 10, whatever they are, because... They kind of are gonna leave anyway and mess up my prestige, just so I need to get rid of them. Where is number 10? I don't even know where number 10 is. I don't know. I'm gonna be able to get rid of it. I actually have no idea where they are. Oh, you're up here. You're up here. Wait, if we can just kill him. I'm hoping that it won't mess up my prestige. <laughs> Hopefully. I don't know. I have no idea. We'll, we'll have to like see. Can you stop? Like why are you... Stop moving me out the way. Are you kidding? Super annoying. I'm like trying to clean myself up. <laughs> and you're just like in the way. So annoying. Okay. Um, That's done. Alright. Let's get some like stuff on the go. La that would be like really good <laughs> actually. Because yeah we got some kind of hungry customers here right we need to feed them up we need to feed them up for sure this is gonna be kind of a close one I feel like I think it's gonna be kind of close for sure so yeah we'll just have to see what happens I got some people that are almost ready to leave which sucks let's see number 14 number 13 I'm gonna get rid of I can't I can't get rid of both of those that sucks that sucks a lot. This guy, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to get rid of you because you are just going to give me bad rep. We don't want that. I don't know if anyone saw that. Okay, they did. No good. I had to, I had to deal with them. Oh man. It's just the way it is, you know. Oh man, I got some more people leaving. No. I don't want the bad rep. Get out, get out. Okay, wait. All right, let's, um, kill this guy as well. I'm just gonna get bad rep from you anyway. I only got a C so not fantastic but I was really struggling with like the meat and stuff so yeah it wasn't as great as I would 
like actually <laughs> super annoying okay let's see is there any upgrades for us to like grab that's gonna like help us out um i don't know i obviously can't go so i need 500 prestige so still can't go just yet uh we're gonna need some more ingredients so like, let's get some more ingredients as well that would be really good there we go some more ingredients there as well yay all right let's see let's buy some upgrades what have we got here i don't actually know <laughs> i don't know what i want to upgrade to be fair so let's have a look maybe the jukebox let's get the jukebox like why not just gonna unlock like most things i think that's it i don't think i got enough money to do anything else sadly can do like a little let's do some just like little random upgrades something like that just to like use up our money that'd be great i want to i want to get this one why can't i move oh i haven't purchased it that's why i was like why can't i do that one but that's okay just increasing the cooldown a little bit for some of these things i'm gonna stick with a halloween outfit for now i'm kind of nervous we're going into the second planet and i'm hoping that we're going to actually survive a while but we will see <laughs> so first things first i'm going to turn on the motion sensor for the toilet because that thing's always really useful and also for the vip thing at the bottom i usually always turn those on as soon as the level starts because um yeah you have to turn them on every time like you start a new level so it's a bit annoying um so let's see this guy likes that meat the other guy that walked in okay we need to cook different types of meat this time so i need to cook this thing i do have a couple of them but like not not much at all i suppose um I need to figure out a way of like murdering some of these creatures as well of course i can't kill this guy with physical attacks so that guy there is going to be really tough to take down for sure so let me have a look a second so yeah that guy i probably won't kill so we're going to actually make his meal because he's going to be a tough cookie to take down i'm going to have to like get him in a trap or something if he goes near my vending machine it might be possible to take him down I don't know I don't know I don't think he's gonna come over here though no I don't what is he doing <laughs> I have no idea what he's doing <laughs> but okay but yeah I don't think like don't think that's gonna happen what are they doing he's like performing tricks for them or something it's very bizarre very very strange indeed yeah I think I'm gonna have a hard time getting rid of him somehow all right we got some nicotine stuff in here and i'm gonna give it to him i'm gonna feed that to him he should like it but i don't 100 know this is all just a learning curve because i've never played on this planet so it's just gonna be like it's gonna be interesting i think okay we're gonna cook this one up for the other guy right let's see where is everyone at i need to find a good opportunity here right i can't get rid of number one okay i need them like secluded but i want them like near a trap as well i feel like i'm gonna have a hard time if this guy is not near a trap what do you think should we try it i feel a bit nervous i want to but i don't want to <laughs> i'm like really nervous to like take them down you know so i don't know i have no idea okay this is finished okay so you want tomato and cheese and this okay this goes to number three all right okay i just killed something or i annoyed someone yeah i annoyed someone oh no they're annoyed they're really low health though because of that I'm wondering maybe i should one of them's going home let's go let's let's fight him i think he's basically dead so i think we yeah there you go he was basically dead the toilet doesn't quite do enough damage to fully kill it but it definitely hurt it enough so i'm gonna like keep an eye on that toilet it, like for that like because i'm sure that's gonna happen again those guys are really tough to take down on your own but if i can get them into the bathroom and then just finish them off myself afterwards i think that we definitely have a strategy down here for those guys thank god <laughs> so i'm really happy about that that's super cool Okay, because these guys are definitely a little bit harder to take down. I think the blobby guys are fine. They're not that bad. But this is definitely a lot more challenging than like the other level for sure. It's so much harder to take these guys down. I might be okay with this. So if 
I do this, we might have enough stamina to just finish him. There you go. See, we can do it with the stun as well. If he's stunned, then it looks like we're okay to take those da guys down as well. Although it took literally my whole stamina bar. So yes, it's um, it's a bit spicy. It's definitely a bit spicy for sure. It's going to take me a little while to like get the hang of like taking down these aliens because they are just not easy aliens to deal with. <laughs> so there is that as well. Okay, um, I need meat for this guy here. Let me see. And I'm still like not accustomed to like their likes and like what they want to eat and stuff so I'm sort of like learning that as well okay we're gonna put two of those on this is for the pink blobby thing so we're gonna feed both of those pink blob things and the big tough one likes um he likes this this meat here these I actually managed to kill a few of those by accident with one of my traps <laughs> with the vending machine traps so I know my vending machine does kill them and possibly if we made them smoke maybe if they went to the top I'd probably have a good chance to take them down there as well so there is that too okay so we want tomato and we want lettuce I'm gonna put that in and that oh he left no I was too slow that sucks so bad he wants cheese quick 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 oh he left no oh my god everybody's just leaving I've just I failed so badly this sucks I don't know if anyone else is gonna come in I'm just gonna leave that there because like maybe I'll get the chance to I don't know do something about it but right now no I'm not doing too well I've only served like one customer <laughs> it's hard it's like quite challenging for sure there's like a lot that they want this guy's annoyed okay what what is going on here I wish I could just lure these like dudes over here <laughs> they're just like clapping for each other <laughs> craziness crazy stuff for sure but yeah, um, we'll have to see how this goes. Let's have a look. I wish I could just like take stuff out of this. But yeah, we're not going to get like perfect satisfaction here. I'm just going to give it to number nine anyway. It's not the burger he like really wants. But I'm just going to give it to him because it's like all I've really got to work with right now. <laughs> so sadly, that's just like the way it goes. Okay, what else do you like? You like the, the pink guys. All right, the pink guys. We'll put that in, and we're gonna feed you the the cheese. I'm gonna feed you the cheese. All right, this is yeah, this is hard, but I'm gonna I'm gonna try. I reckon we just need a bit of practice with this world, and then I'm sure we'll get the hang of taking down these critters. So <laughs> yeah, that would be great. That would be awesome. Yeah, I don't think this pink guy is gonna be too pleased with what I've made him. No, he's not pleased. <laughs> of course he's not. But it could have been worse. I might kill him when he goes into when he goes into this room. He's pretty annoyed as well, so I think he's gonna like leave soon too. Alright, so we're gonna stun him just to make things easier. They're not too bad though. They only take three hits, so they're really not that bad to take down and we're gonna get some nice meat for that as well so that's perfect it's just all these aliens require just so like different meat compared to like what I have been like kind of using if that makes sense okay so this is for number 10 okay number 12 let me check out number 12. Number 11 is going up here. Oh, this could be a good opportunity. Let's try it out. See if this kills it. Perfect. Okay, we got one of these. We actually have a quest to kill three of those as well. And once we get that quest, um, see, as you can see here, it says I need to kill 10 customers of the race Mechanian, which was what we just killed. And we need... Um, yeah, we need a lot of them. 10 of them's gonna be hard. Considering you can't attack them with physical attacks, you have to kill them with traps. So it can be quite hard to take those ones down, definitely. Uh, okay, that guy down there is annoyed and he's leaving. Fair enough. I'm still just adjusting to this planet and all the different things that we have to do to um, make these guys like happy, I suppose. But yeah, I think... The way to get these micid, micid, whatever they're called. What are they called again? I forgot. 
<laughs> uh, Mikanians or whatever they're called. Yeah, it's definitely like going to be traps and maybe sources to make them go like where I want them to go so I can finish them off. You have to do it within three days as well. So we're going to have to like get a good strategy down here for sure. But this was just my first like proper day with this planet. I actually managed to get through a day <laughs> for the first time <laughs> because every time I went onto this planet in the last episode, I just kept dying like over and over but I kind of like I think I know how to do it it's just like putting it into practice mostly so we'll see how it goes <laughs> we'll see <laughs> okay I managed to kill a couple of aliens here and get a couple of parts so I would say that's progress definitely so that's super cool yeah I'm happy with that actually all right he was satisfied as well yay a very satisfied customer over here <laughs> very nice indeed he's having the time of his life look at him dancing look at him go you're welcome sir you're welcome I'm glad I made you so happy <laughs> okay we're gonna put these burgers away I'm just gonna put them in here like I don't think there's gonna be any more customers I think that was the last wave so <laughs> yes we don't need to worry too much about that but yeah I'm gonna try and like feed sources and stuff to the customers too that would be a good idea might help me out a little bit but there we go I might have lost a little bit of prestige from like messing up some of the orders and stuff but it's okay yeah I lost 325 prestige which is not it's not great but it was just my first attempt I'm sure we'll get better as we play through some more of these like levels <laughs> at least I hope so <laughs> we'll have to see how it goes of course all right, let's buy a couple of lettuces, I guess. I'm basically just using this time to replenish a little bit of my stock, but I don't really know if there's anything else here that I really want to do. I'm not sure. Wait, what was that last page? Uh, just, okay, it's just sources. Right, let's see if we can do anything of upgrades. Oh, I might have bills. I might need to, I think the bills will be okay for a little bit. Not too long though, but a little bit at the very least. I've noticed that they keep going down to the bottom. I don't know if there's a way to sort of like get them with that. I don't really know. Hmm. I'm trying to work out like a good way of getting those, those like uh, Mikadanian aliens. Because they really are a pain. What's their hobbies? Let's find out what their hobbies are. They like gaming, smoking, dancing, washing their hands. Okay, if they like washing their hands, we could go for the ghost mirror. It's, oh, but it only stuns them. We need to actually do damage with them. Poisons the victim. Do you think they would use it? Shall we try? I'm going to buy it and like hope that they like use it or something. I guess I'll do the cooldown for it. It's not got motion sensor on it, so I'll have to go over and activate it myself. But let's like try it out it might be useful I don't know <laughs> we'll have to see how it goes for sure okay let's go to the next day and see what we can do here all right today's special all right we got those horrible rivals again those rivals suck <laughs> I hate those rivals so much they're annoying okay we got this dude here I'm gonna put the note motion sensor on and hopefully it's gonna kill it as it yes perfect you didn't see that I'm gonna turn it back off now because we don't want to get caught with that but that was perfect perfect <laughs> that was a perfect way to like open the level very happy with that okay so we got the pink blobby things which like those and those okay so we're gonna cook this guy and we're gonna cook I'm so bad with my memory here I need to like learn learn the the things that they like here so we're gonna cook these two up here I think that they will enjoy this, hopefully. <laughs> but we'll see. Where are you going? Oh, 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 just turn that on. Oh my god, yes. I think we should. Yes, we got him, we got him. Okay, so we didn't kill him, but it was like it was a good bit of damage. So those guys go down to the VIP section and they go up to the like the little pole dancing thing, which I didn't know that they did actually. Oh, I just got I just got police after me there. So that sucks. Oh, looks like this dude's gonna go in again. Maybe that will reset in time. I don't really know. I can't even clean like clean myself. 
<laughs> can't even clean myself right now. So annoying. Oh, I was robbed. That's why I got the police thing because that's stupid. We got a rival and the rival just stole some of my goods and that's why the police um, are after me because they found out what I'm, what I'm serving the customers, right? From that rival taking it back home, right? So it makes sense. Okay, uh, I'm really slow with this, I know. So forgotten even what they even look like I think it's this one this one here we want tomato lettuce and this is to number one okay I've got my first order here go away who do you think you are god okay do you think we'll be able to do this with this dude I'm gonna try it see how much that does okay not bad not bad managed to do a bit there been hurt a little bit but that's okay all right we got the oh man I, that guy's going up there I wish I wish that I like could get him with the gun with that like up there as well but I don't really know like we're gonna have to we're gonna have to see 30 seconds on it so I'm not sure I'm not sure if we'd have time for it I don't know um go away go away all right what, what have we got so do I do do I do the pink one or the other one let's have a look I think what did I put on don't remember the tentacle thing I got okay I know what I put on okay <laughs> I'm just confusing myself a little bit the the big guy but I killed him so that's what that meat was for so that didn't quite work out <laughs> it's fine though so I got these dudes left and these dudes left I got pink dude left I might do the pink dudes actually I think the pink dude would accept this meat actually I don't think they would I don't know <laughs> it's so confusing yeah I'm not gonna get that guy and I think I think they're gonna like leave um yeah I'm not gonna get them in time I messed up I like I'm just not accustomed to all this so right now <laughs> it's okay though they're gonna leave unhappy but it's fine it's fine I got like a bit of meat from them so like I'm happy about that actually this dude oh cool okay I'm really glad that we're getting some stuff with the like with the actual VIP thing down there so like that's super cool but yeah I'm sort of panicking a little bit because I'm just not used to this <laughs> but I'm gonna try okay we're gonna serve this guy and he's gonna be happy all right what else we got this guy likes um yeah he likes likes these we're gonna serve those as well all right okay I'm gonna try <laughs> I'm gonna try this. I'm just gonna whack this on the floor a second so there's no room for it and I can heat it back up if I want to. So you can actually do that which is quite handy I have to say. This dude is in the perfect position for me to kill him so I'm definitely gonna take advantage of that. Super cool. Alright make sure we take the body as well. <laughs> that would be great. Okay that dude's going up there. Um, So what I've got on the go here is the pink stuff and the other stuff okay so the pink stuff that goes to you so we want cheese and a bun and this goes to number seven we also have number six order number six he likes this meat here There's so many different meats now that I gotta like keep track of that it's just a little bit overwhelming for me right now I know I'll get used to it but yeah it's overwhelming so this is number six I got 18 seconds on that I don't think I'm gonna get that guy Okay, I just killed somebody down here, I think. So that's pretty awesome. Should we get this guy? I'm gonna get this guy too. Let's let's murder this dude. That'll be great. We need some more meat. Like we're desperate for meat from these aliens because we just don't have that much. So we need to try and get as much as possible. I need to stop that guy before he steals my meat and goes back to the police and then I get, you know, um, a police thing up there. That would be really bad. <laughs> so yeah, we don't want that that would be annoying how quick are they coming to my fridge jeez there's another one already this is ridiculous oh no he's gone okay he was leaving that's fine okay what have we got left number nine he likes the yes uh these dudes here so we'll cook that up oh i had one on the floor didn't i yeah i did oh i could have used that one wait i might be able to like stick it back in oh no you can't i think it's i think it's like done for good but it's fine we can heat this one up here and he likes pickles and lettuce all right I'm definitely like getting the hang of this now and this goes to number nine so I fed him so that's great I don't know if we're gonna get any more orders for like 
this meat here hopefully we do but I'm just gonna like leave it there just like in case we do so we'll have to see we'll have to see what happens definitely <laughs> but oh my god <laughs> this world and like this planet is a little stressful I'm getting the hang of it slowly though look I got some satisfied customers so it's going well at least I would say so we're getting some meat together here so what is the alien that we need the most of fire like meat so the pink guys and the big bulky guys okay good to know that's what we need like mostly so I'll have to pay special attention to those guys definitely okay we got a pink dude incoming I think I might kill him with my motion sensor there we go perfect I don't think that guy saw thank god so <laughs> we're fine gonna take that motion sensor off now Okay, we got a big bulky dude coming in right now, uh, which is perfect because I can use this meat up. So I'm gonna do that because I'm pretty sure he was the one that likes this meat. I'm sorry I have checking every time. It's just, I just not, don't know the meats that they like uh, right now. So I wish it showed it like on the side. That would be so much easier. So this is number 10. So that's that order done as well. Let's get rid of you. Alrighty, perfect. Where, where are you going, number 11? Oh, perfect. We're gonna be able to take this dude down as well so that's great take him down there we go get the the body dispose of the body before anybody notices right <laughs> we need more of these pink dudes so i'm kind of just stalking this dude in the hopes that i'll get an opportunity to uh, take him down hopefully because <laughs> we do really need those guys so that would be so good all right get out of here Okay, we also do need the big guys as well, the big bulky guys. Is he going to the VIP room? I hope he is. Oh, good, good, good. We're going to get a free kill. There he goes. Oh, no, he didn't die. We'll finish him off, though. So there you go. Just need to keep an eye on those traps for sure because it doesn't quite finish it. I'm going to see if I can upgrade the damage on that so that it kills them and I don't have to worry about, like, going in there or anything. I'm going to hopefully do something here. Did, I don't know if that... I don't know if that hit him. I actually have no idea if that hit him or not. I don't know. Okay, shall I go for it? I don't know if I should. He probably would take some damage from me and I only got two hearts. I need to wait for an opportunity to like stun them. I don't think I'm gonna get that chance. Um, I think he's gonna leave because he's gonna get mad because I haven't like fed him anything. Wait, oh, the dude, oh, they stole my thing. <laughs> I keep forgetting about those guys. Um, okay, so I got that dude. This is probably not going to cook in time, so I probably wasted that, to be honest with you. I don't think I'm going to get that guy. Let's see. Is he out here on his own? I'm going to try and just take him down. I don't know if this is a good idea. I'm just going to go for it anyway. I need the meat, so <laughs> I needed to go for it. Okay, we got that dude in there. He's in the toilet. Okay, and we got this dude at the bottom. I don't think I can actually get rid of that that um like blue guy i don't think that's gonna happen sadly i need to keep an eye on these rivals it's really hard to keep an eye on these guys and they're so annoying because they of course like you know they give you the police rating which is why i got two badges because they stole my meat and they're like like snitching on me <laughs> they're like this person's it's like killing their customers and like charging money for it <laughs> so it's like they know oh this would have been so good if only that guy wasn't there if he wasn't there i could have definitely have killed that guy with the with the vending machine but he would have spotted me and got suspicious and then i would have had two guys on me and i probably would have died so not good idea better to be safe than sorry <laughs> after all so yeah that's annoying it's just you always gotta be wary of like what's going on around you but we finished another day and i couldn't be happier so that's super cool i'm really happy about that actually we're we're doing it <laughs> we're getting there slowly okay we're gonna need to get our health back that would be really a, a really good idea. I feel like I'm not really getting that much money at the moment. I'm going to have to pay off my bills as well. Pay off that. And I also have police ratings too, which is not great. I'm going to clear that off as well. And now I'm left with basically no money. So yeah, we might not be like really getting that much money together really. But I'm learning as I'm like going through this planet so <laughs> it's going okay i would say it's going all right to get to the next planet we need to have a thousand and also there's a quest we gotta do the quest we gotta do is killing these mikanean creatures the blue guys we're, we're halfway so we've done like five of them already which is not bad but i think there's only like one more day left to get like another five of them so <laughs> i'm not sure if that's gonna happen or not i don't know 
So I'm gonna start by just cooking just one of just like anything. Wait, did I cook both of the same? I think I cooked both of the same by accident there. So that sucks. I wish I had to another hot plate. Like that would be super useful to be honest with you, but never mind. I wish it kind of told you. I think I'm cooking two of the pink things. Yes, I'm cooking the pink things. <laughs> so that's good to know. Who likes to eat the pink things? The the blue guys. They like to eat the pink things. Okay, that's good to know. We've got two blue guys as well. So I guess that's good. Look at them with the critic thing on their on their face. It's quite funny, <laughs> actually. All right, let's put our motion sensors on over here. All right, good. There's so much that I gotta like look out for at the moment, so it's kind of nerve wracking. We're gonna take down this pink thing here. I think that would be a good idea. All right, there we go. Pink thing has been destroyed. Perfect. Let's clean up. Make sure we wash up here. I'm so glad I got that thing where that doesn't like burn my meat because that would just be another thing for me to worry about. So like, I'm glad I don't have to worry about that. Okay, we're still waiting for that bottom one to order. This guy just wants cheese. So that's order number one taken care of. We need some egg. Yes, egg, egg and this one. And this is for order number five. So that's those two taken care of, I think. Wait, what just happened? Okay, okay, this guy got attacked. Oh no, oh no, oh no, this is bad. This is really bad. I'm wondering if I can, oh no, he's, he's a, nope. <laughs> I got a police badge for that. <laughs> that did not go so well. <laughs> oh God, okay, I'm gonna clean up. And they're all suspicious of me now too, which is really bad. So I guess if I get spotted by those guys, I'm gonna have a really hard time because they are impervious to physical attacks. So, so yes, that's gonna be tough. This guy might get attacked by this and, oh, he dies. Okay, so the toilet is strong enough to take those guys down instantly, which I didn't realize actually. At least these blue guys are eating and they're gonna leave after they're done. So like, <laughs> there's kind of a silver lining here. <laughs> so we're kind of okay. Once they leave, I'm not gonna have anything to worry about. I won't have anyone that's like suspicious suspicious of me or anything so that's gonna be good I can't wait for them to go to be honest with you <laughs> just like making me ultra paranoid so <laughs> I hope that they like leave or something that'd be great okay all right Ooh. oh I got some of that gold stuff so we can make the laxatives that's gonna be super useful as well actually going forward because the toilet is a really good like trap I would say so yeah that's super awesome so yeah we need more of those pink guys I need to get an opportunity with those dudes for sure okay so we got we got the we got the pink dudes and we got I'm gonna kill the pink dudes because we need them we really need them I would really love to kill the blue dude as well but it's just all about if I get the opportunity to because I don't always where's he going are you smoking no, you're not. That's just a stun up there, so that's not going to help me at all. I wish he did a, like, I wish he smoked or something. That would be great, but maybe I'll put in a thing that makes him smoke. So if I cook up the pink thing for him, let's see, how many of those? I only got one. I'm going to cook two of those pink things because we got two of those guys incoming. So we're going to sort those guys out first. I'm going to hopefully put a nicotine sauce in because, like, I'm hoping if I do that, then hopefully oh no that guy's suspicious as well. oh he's leaving though yeah that guy's leaving so we should be okay <laughs> thank god but yeah i want to put in a nicotine sauce so then i can get one of them smoking at the top and i can get them with the trap that would be great okay so this guy wants smart he actually does want a sauce as well i'm gonna do this one what was that what was it? Oh God, it was that thing. Um, I'm gonna get him to follow me up here and then I'm gonna take him out because he got hit by the, by the pole dancing thing at the bottom. I really, really need to upgrade that. Like seriously need to upgrade that. <laughs> so it kills them and I don't have to like worry about it. So it's super annoying actually. All right, so there's that. Um, this was meant to be for number seven. It's got a nice nicotine sauce in it so it should make him smoke as well. All right, we got um, the pink guy. I don't think I got an opportunity to kill him though, sadly. So I'm gonna, I don't know if I'm gonna have time to cook this. I'm not sure. I don't know, I'll try, but it's gonna depend. Um, so we're gonna cook two of these up. Yeah, we're gonna cook two of these. Let me just throw that a sec. I don't know why I got two of these. Oh, it was probably for the other one, wasn't it? Yeah, it was for the other one. Um, so for the other one, we're gonna have egg. Yes, egg and nicotine sauce. 
in here and that's gonna be for number 11 okay got you so many things to remember you know <laughs> it's getting like so hectic here I'm glad there's not that many customers at the moment thank god for that okay so we got this these are for what were those for again let me see what was I cooking I don't even remember. Oh god. I don't know what I just cooked. I think it was for the pink guy. I think. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was for the pink guy. Uh, so this one, this one in here. And I think this is for number 12. Number 10 is gonna leave. Like, yeah, I, I didn't cook enough for that guy. He's just gonna go. Nothing I can do about that. It's only a bit of prestige. It's fine. It's, it's all good. But yeah, I think I like missed a bit there oh i was wondering where the cooked dishes were going you actually can keep the cooked dishes in here i didn't know that oh wow that's super cool so i actually got some cooked stuff right off the bat here so i've been putting it back in the fridge and i didn't realize it actually did stuff that's really awesome so you could like prepare if you wanted to okay so this guy okay what do i want to do here that's the question let's see where they go first this guy's going to the toilet. Which one? The bottom one? If he goes to the bottom one, I think he's just gonna he's just gonna die. Oh perfect. He's going up to the trap. This is perfect. Take him down and we can get a body. Because we need this guy for the quest so we can move planets. So so always get excited about that. Okay. This dude, I'm just gonna take him down. We're just gonna No no no, don't run! Don't run! No, 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 no! Don't run away! What are you doing? Oh god! I didn't manage to Dang it! Oh no, it's all falling to pieces. Oh no, oh no, what do I do? What do I do? I got this dude following me too. Stun him. Oh, I'm scared. I'm scared. What do I do? The police are going to be here as well. I can't hurt that guy with physical attacks. I don't know what he'll do once he gains, regains the consciousness. I don't know. Will he just come after me still? Okay, he's still after me. Fantastic, fantastic. Um, I don't really know what to do about this because I can't hurt him. So this is a problem. This is a big problem. I'm trying to get him with this trap all right there we go oh my god that was scary <laughs> that was really scary i thought i was gonna die for sure that like it just goes to show how easy things can fall to pieces in this game like you have to be on your toes like at all times like oh my god that was scary stuff it was super scary oh god and they're all suspicious of me now too what does that guy down there like again okay so i i kind of i know what's to put on so we're gonna put this one on and for the the blue guy we got the the pink stuff i actually don't have any pink stuff done oh no i might not be able able to like do anything about that I don't know I don't know we'll just we'll have to see if I hope this guy I would like this guy to come over here if I attacked him do you think I don't know if it's worth it I don't know if I want to like risk it you know maybe let's not risk it it's not probably not a good idea <laughs> no thank you okay so uh, one's gone hungry yep one's leaving so the other guy likes this one so I can at least do this guy who likes the lettuce Oh, he got attacked. He got attacked by something. Yes, he did. Okay, we're gonna have to take him down. Are the doors in the way? That's not fair. Did you see that? The door was in the way. Like, that was so unfair. Okay, I think <laughs> I just managed to get through that day, but that was spicy, man. That was really spicy. <laughs> I thought I was gonna die. I thought, like, everything was over, <laughs> but I can't believe we actually managed it. Um... Let's just clear all the police uh, um, attention, 350. It's like, I don't think there's any other way to go about it, sadly. <laughs> oh my god, that was so chaotic. Okay, I sadly can't pay off my bills and I really am struggling with money here. I think if I want money, I might just go back to the first planet because it's a lot easier. I got 70% with this one. I don't know if it's going to reset this. I swear I've done three days already, but I'm not 100% sure here. So I don't know. I guess we're like we're gonna have to we're gonna have to see how it goes right but man these aliens are so tough they really are tough cookies to take down right they really are like <laughs> they are just nightmare inducing one of them likes eggs i'm gonna buy a couple of eggs because they keep ordering eggs as well so that's that's um that's good i suppose i got like a hundred pounds but not really sure what to spend it on i have to say that we were really lucky to survive that so i did not think that we were going to i want to increase the damage for this one so 200 pound for that hopefully we can get that 
like next day or something. I don't know. What day are we on now? Shall we find out? I'm curious. Oh, something's happening. It's been a while since something happened. Okay. It's gonna mix things up a bit, I suppose. What's happening here? Should I be scared? What's, what's that? Is there, oh God, is there like meteors falling in my kitchen? Oh my God. <laughs> you need to get that roof fixed, man. Oh no, really? Why? <laughs> Just to make things worse, of course. Okay, so we're on day 13, not bad. And it's meteor shower day, fantastic. Another day, another disaster. The Good Burger Diner is currently pummeled by a meteor shower. If you were planning on getting some elite burgers, it is better to postpone these plans until tomorrow. But if you're hunger is unbearable. Don't forget to tip generously. It's extremely difficult to cook in such weather. Oh my god, it just gets worse. They just want to make it harder. Isn't this hard enough as it is? I'm already like struggling to get through the days. <laughs> god. Oh dear lord. Let's um let's try this though. I'll try my best and see how far we get here. Oh, is that where the meteors are hitting? It's going to hit the dudes. It's going to hit my customers. Oh my god. Oh wow, maybe this is actually helpful <laughs> in some weird way, I don't know. All right, it's funny how they all get hit by meteors and they just walk into my establishment like nothing happened. Like that's pretty, pretty amusing, I have to say. What happens if there's just like dead bodies on the floor though? Like do I, do I get punished for that? Like that's what I wanna know. Okay, we should start cooking stuff. Uh, oh my God. It's getting spicy for sure. Okay, we definitely want to finish this dude off so that we can, you know, did that, oh, that dude died. Oh, cause he got hit by the meteors. So it kind of helped me a bit. This is actually kind of good in a weird way. <laughs> I never thought that I would see the day where I'm actually happy about one of these things that they put on. It's like, usually they're always super bad. I mean, you can get hit by it, which is super bad, of course, but it's easy enough to avoid. All right, we're gonna make this guy smoke as well, so I want him to smoke. So this is for number one. Okay, we actually have a police officer in here, and like, I don't know if you're able to attack him or not, but we're just, we're gonna feed him because I don't want to, like, test my luck. So yes, I'm gonna feed him. Oh my god, oh my god, okay. <laughs> Let's just wait for the meteors to hit first because I don't want to get hit by that. Okay, so this thing here, we just heat this up. This is going to be for the policeman. Um, and what he wants bacon as well. So we'll put bacon in there as well um, for this dude. So let's do that. Do you think maybe if we make him smoke, we might be able to get his meat as well? That would be cool. So number four. Um, I think some people just died and I have no idea where. Um, should I be concerned here? Is this gonna be like dead bodies in my place? I don't know what happened to them, but I'm pretty sure some people just died there. <laughs> so that's kind of crazy. Um, let's see. I don't think I got any spare meat for that. No, I don't. That guy's gonna leave because he's unhappy. I'm taking too long. Okay, we need a pink guy. We need a pink guy. I've only got one, so sadly, that's all we're gonna be uh, doing right here and I'm gonna give you a nicotine thing to make you smoke once that's done as well so hopefully he goes up to the top area but we'll see that dude is gonna die he's eating his burger and <laughs> meteor just falls on his face <laughs> come on I didn't do that are you kidding I didn't do that I did nothing are you kidding I'm just gonna I'm gonna have to kill you like what was I meant to do? Like, you got ki Oh my god, this is so chaotic. What am I meant to do here? I'm dead. I'm so dead. There's not gonna be anything that I can do about this. There's so- Oh my god, I'm dead. That was so unfair. Those meteors, I thought they were good at first, but they're really not. They're really, really not. Okay, so we had the, um... We had the second chance, so we get to try this level again because of that. But- <laughs> Oh my god. Well, there goes my 3,500 that I put into that. When the meteors go off, I think that we should just kind of just not stay there. <laughs> just, we should just pretend that we don't exist and that we, we're not here or something. I don't know. I don't like being around when those things go off. Like, oh my god. If you kill someone and they're in the middle, yeah, that's, um, that's really bad. Really bad. Okay, we're gonna get this out and oh, this guy's going in the perfect location for us. Let's take this dude out, that'd be great. 
All right, there we go. Let's put on our like uh, stuff, like our motion sensors actually, so we can, of course, get a couple of free easy kills there. That would be a fantastic. I really need these dudes. So, oh no, I should have stunned him. I'm an idiot. <laughs> Why didn't I stun him? Well, that's a police badge on me right there, but we should be able to take this one down at the very least. So yeah, I got a police like warning for that, of course, because I didn't stun him. I should have stunned him because I forget that they run away. So I need to be careful of that, definitely. Okay, I wonder if I could get this dude up here. He's not got that much life. I think we could. I think we could. Oh, the meteor's gonna get him. Maybe. I don't know. Is he dead? Okay, he's dead. He's dead. All right. I panicked a little bit there, but we're fine. We're fine. Everything is fine, at least at the moment. <laughs> oh my god, so chaotic. I've already down by two health, like already. So yeah, that um, it's not going too well. All right. So what does this dude like? We should feed someone. So we've got the pink stuff. I actually do have some of the pink stuff here. So we're gonna do that. Tomato bun. All right. He doesn't want any sauce, so I'm just gonna I'm just gonna give him gonna give him that. That's fine. Okay. Um, I might just put this back in my fridge for a second. Maybe let's just like start like cooking up some meat, and then we can just like store it. Like that would be really good because you can do that. You can just cook it and then store it in your fridge for like when your customers actually get there. So that would be cool. What it just what just happened? I don't know. <laughs> I just heard like a big thud and it just like scared me. <laughs> oh my god. This game is so stressful. It really is. It's so much fun. It's so addicting. I actually love this game like quite more than I thought I would to be honest. But my god is it stressful. <laughs> it's really challenging. It really is. Um, are you okay sir? Okay my, pat my, my patrons is, is fine. <laughs> like my, my customers are fine. <laughs> He's good. He's just eating his burger down there. He's having a great time. Oh, the meteor one is just... I'm going to dread that every time it comes up. Look at that. That's so many in a row as well. That's insane. That's so crazy. I'm surprised that guy didn't get hit by that. Like, Jesus. <laughs> That's so crazy. All right. So, uh, I got these. I'm just going to store these in here for when someone needs it. So, I think that would be the best way to, to tackle this one. Okay. So, this dude likes this. So, we're going to heat that one up because that is for the, the pink guy. So, whenever he decides to order, we got something for him right there. And then, this dude likes this. So, we got this for him when he decides to order. I might just kill him, actually since he's going up here seems like a good idea all right okay he got a hit there so that wasn't great okay I need to really lay low now because my health is extremely low so I can't like I can't like mess up I can't like you know do something silly because if we do die we're gonna start all over again so that's not gonna be great okay what are we what are we doing here all right let's see I'm just gonna put these away a sec I don't know what I was doing with these to be honest okay um the pink guy so we need we need this one for the pink guy oh no he just died so I can't even can't even do that is his body on the floor no no we're fine we're fine at least I think so okay the pink guy died we got this dude here so we need some pink cooked pink stuff oh god oh god oh god oh god move 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 oh, I'm gonna die and that's gonna be really bad Okay, okay, we're fine. <laughs> we're fine. Okay, so um, what was I doing? The pink ones. We need to cook up some pink ones. Let's cook those up. Um, and we also need uh, these ones here. Uh, actually, just one of these. Actually, for the pink dude itself. Yes, yes, for the pink dude. Okay, so we're going to need to put tomato and cheese in there once these meteors go off. I think there might be a couple. Is that it? Are we good? All right, we're good. We're good. I was cooking for that guy and now he's dead. <laughs> oh my god, I was literally about to serve him and then he just died. Um, okay, I'm doing the blue one. So I got the pink meat for him. It's just I can't get to my fridge right now. Why are you calling the police? What did I do? I didn't do anything. Wait, why are you calling the police? I didn't do anything. Oh no, they're coming for me again. I didn't even do anything. Like, what? What's happening? Oh my god, oh my god, I'm gonna die. There's nothing I can do about it. This isn't fair. This is so unfair. Seriously, that meteor shower is the worst. I don't know how to 
like I don't know how to like go about that because the police just keep coming after me and there's like nothing I can do. Oh, now I have to start all the way back at the beginning. Oh no. You know, we could have, I think we like pretty much did the quest as well, but like now I'm gonna have to all the quests reset and everything and we're back to the first planet again. To be honest, we haven't actually looked at the info for these characters. Why not? Let's do it. So these are the breed breed digs. Apparently they're space hippies. <laughs> they do not eat anything, but live by feeding off the energy of space. They only come to the restaurant to have fun or to go to the toilet, which does not bring in money, but is still useful for business because their meat is quite tasty and rare. However, anyone who wants to do something wrong under their noses should be careful. Hippies are able to hear through walls, say what, <laughs> and will rush to help anyone who may fall. Moreover, their most amazing talent is to revive the dead. I didn't know they could do that. The origins of the Breedig's supernatural abilities is still widely discussed in the scientific community. Some believe that they have a connection with the creator himself, others that they are ordinary charlatans with an addiction to drugs. There are also those who combine both versions. It has happened more than once that the resurgence found mysterious leaves under their tongues that disappeared within seconds. Okay, intriguing. I didn't know they could like revive people and like hear through walls like what <laughs> what is this i don't know what a weird alien so very bizarre looking intriguing we'll probably just like read through these just like just a little bit at a time maybe we'll do another one in like the next episode or something just slowly learn about them as we go i think that would be a cool idea actually okay so today's goal Kill people with pole killer trap and kill every Rudeus that appears. Let's see if we can do that. I'm quite far into the days here. Can't remember what day I'm on, but quite far, I think. Let's see, day 19. I think this is probably the best I have done. Dare I say it? <laughs> I feel like it is, but I don't know. All right, we're just gonna cook up just like anything that I've got right now, that would be good. Okay, so. We're of course going to go put our motion sensors on this one and this one and do I want to put this one on? I'm just going to leave it for now but we'll activate it if like I get the chance to. I will definitely do that. So this is a Rudeus here, right? So we need to kill all of those. Yes, this is a Rudeus. We need to kill this guy. All of these that appear must face my wrath. I think he's going to get himself killed anyways. Yeah, he did. <laughs> Didn't have to do anything there so <laughs> that was easy enough for to sort out. So that was good. I'm just going to store all the things that I'm cooking in here that would be great we're just gonna cook everything up and then we're just gonna take out the fridge as we need it so right now we have we need the pink meat right now don't have any I think I'm cooking some though and we also need the rudius meat which we do have we have the rudius meat so we can do this one and some pickles put this here to warm it up and that will be for the pink guy so we'll do that in a second I could really do with killing one of these pink dudes, to be honest. Maybe just one of them. Maybe it would be good. I don't know. I think that would be... Okay, well, that worked out. I didn't even have to do anything, so that was great. Well, we'll feed the second one then. I was not going to feed the second one. This kind of didn't go according to plan. Right, we'll put it back in and do this again. So now we're going to need lettuce because it's a different order. I was going to feed the other one, but he got himself killed. So rip. <laughs> that wasn't meant to be what happened, but okay. And then we need the pink meat for the other guy, which I have done. Uh, Hold on, just chuck that a sec. So this is for number two. And this one is for the one that's just about to leave because he's very mad right now don't know if I'm gonna get that in time no I didn't get that in time dang that sucks never mind I'll just put that back in the fridge for now I'm sure like we'll you know find another another time to you know use it or something I don't know all right where did that other guy go I was kind of hoping to like kill him on the way out but didn't quite work out did it <laughs> never mind but um so yeah, that other quest won't update until the day's over. Probably would be best to do it on the first day because there won't be as many customers. So it'll probably be really easy because when you first like change planets, they start you off slow and then you get like more customers as you go. So I feel like it would be 
probably the best day to do it would be today. So <laughs> here's hoping that we manage to get all of them, but we will see how it goes. All right, what else we got? We got some more of these ones. Okay, let's cook these up. We got another Rudus coming in, so I gotta kill him as well when we get the chance to. All right, he's going to play some games. All right, fair enough. Uh, let's see, what does he like again? He likes the pink stuff. So we got the pink stuff. We got the cheese and the bun. I need sauce as well. I think that would be everything. That's for number four, hopefully. And where's that Rudius? Okay, he's over there. I need to find a good like chance to get him. But this is order number four. There you go. And I'm gonna put all this cooked meat away as well that would be good what else we got cook up something else cook up this as well i actually don't know what the other species was i didn't really know okay so this guy is in here uh i missed my opportunity i was going to stun him but i missed him which really sucks so i'm gonna have to find another chance to get him i'm sure there will be another chance to get him i just i just gotta be a bit patient i suppose but yeah that's fine okay so let's do order number five so we're gonna need the pink one we're going to need a bun and the tomato we're gonna warm that up that will be good and yeah we'll see where we can go from there so where's number seven going now he is going for a smoke up there with that guy. Okay, I might be able to hit both of them, which I did. Awesome. And there we go. Managed to get both of them. So that was pretty good because we need some meat from, from them as well. So that was great. I don't know if that was the one I served. I think it was. So it would have been better if it was one that I hadn't have served. But like, never mind. It's just the way it goes. So we got this one for number five. So we'll send that one off. And this guy here wants the, yeah, this one here, and he wants the bun, tomato, and cheese. We're going to warm that up for him. Perfect. I don't know if I trap activated. Somebody just died. Okay. Uh, not what I was expecting, but sure. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> we need all the meat we can get anyway, so it's fine. In that case, the burger that I put out here, we're just going to put back in the fridge because he died. I was going to serve him, but never mind. Okay, we got another one of these Rudus guys. So we need to, of course, take this guy down as well. So here's hoping we get a chance to do that too. So <laughs> we will see. We will see how it goes. God, this like this game is so nerve-wracking. <laughs> okay, we got two Rudiuses to take down. Oh God, okay. I, I think stunning them would be great. He's going into the VIP room, which is perfect because we'll just get him straight away. He's just going to go straight down. Perfect. That was really good. Really good, I have to say. Should I get... I'm going to get this guy because he's like right here. Perfect opportunity. Can't even hurt me. So that was perfect. There you go. Because I used my stun trap on him. So it was super easy to get him down as well. So that was great. All right, where's he going? He's going toilet. Which one? The top one one okay so we're gonna stun him when he gets in there we go and then we're just gonna hopefully take him down just hope that i got enough stamina for this okay i did thank god i was worried i wouldn't for a second okay that guy outside is suspicious of me so i, got, I gotta like wait here <laughs> for him to go i really hope he does go because otherwise i'm gonna have a hard time because i can't hurt him he does not like react to physical attacks so, so you you can't hurt those guys with your cleaver it doesn't it doesn't work so yes we need to be kind of careful about those guys definitely all right let's wash up here all right perfect okay let's see what we can do with these dudes here that guy's going home he's already been served so we just got the other dude who likes the pink meat so we'll get the pink stuff the burger bun an egg and this should be this dude happy. Just gonna like warm up this meat here. See if there's anything else. Is he even my last customer? Yeah, I think this guy's my last customer actually. So I don't think I have to worry about anything else. I might be able, might have time to cook up some meat. I don't know. I'm not sure if I wasted that or not. I don't, <laughs> I'm not sure. I guess only time will tell, but I don't think anybody else is gonna come into my shop now. All right, cool. We had time to heat that up as well. So that was good. All right, yeah, we're basically done with this day. Went really well actually. So that was good. And I think we would have had that one for killing all the rudest customers. 
customers at the very least so that would be one of the quests done but we still need to kill a couple more people with that pole trap which i think will just happen over time at least hopefully anyway right it just came up saying quest complete so that one should be done yes so all we need to do is kill people with the pole killer and then we'll be able to move on to the next planet which i am looking forward to actually that's gonna be a, a lot of fun, actually. That's gonna be great. Okay, let's buy a couple of ingredients here, just like, just in case, might need some. I think people are like buying a lot, a lot of egg on this like planet as well, so we're gonna do that. We should definitely get a med kit. So we have like that um, already. That would be so, so good. I don't know if there's anything else I wanna get right now. Increase their waiting time. It could be useful, maybe. Or should I save? I might have a bill to pay. I do. Let's pay my bills. We'll do that instead, actually. Okay, I'm ready to, to go again. <laughs> Let's keep this up. We're doing really well, really well. Okay, what we got? Today's special. We got rivals coming in. So the rivals are going to come in and they're going to try and steal all my food from the fridge. <laughs> and I realized that the reason you get caught by the police is because you're obviously not meant to be cooking like your customers, right? So when the rivals come home with like the meat and like, you know, they show the police what you've been, what you've been cooking, you obviously get in trouble. So <laughs> I think that's what like the intention is. I didn't realize at first that that was what was happening, but <laughs> I think that's like what's going on here. Okay. Yeah. So all we need to do is just get people killed by this little pole dancing thing at the bottom. Awesome. So we just have to do a normal day, really. We don't really have to worry about it because it like auto puts the the stuff away. So it's um it's fine actually. So yeah, it's good. Okay, so we'll start with the first uh like customer. So we got this pink one. Oh, I should have brought some more sauce. I keep forgetting about the sauce actually. Since he's up here right next to a trap, we're definitely gonna take him down easy pickings that was really easy i'm gonna take that for 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 like the meat and stuff that'd be great get out my fridge damn you <laughs> so annoying okay what orders have we got lots of orders okay so we're gonna start with number i'm gonna do number five so bun we're gonna do this one and this one heat it up over there perfect okay and we're gonna do this one here as well let's just put that away a second and we're gonna do a bun onion and pickles and i think that's all so this was number five so let's send off number five there we go perfect oh got a rival coming in again <laughs> how dare you okay and this one here is number two someone just died okay it's fine it's not the one i was doing so <laughs> that's fine okay no i don't know what this guy likes what's this guy's the policeman okay the policeman likes this meat and he wants a bun, he wants cheese and bacon. So we're gonna warm that one up over there. And we also have, let's see, this one, and he likes the pink meat. So we're gonna go for the pink meat, the bun, and the tomato. It's so much easier doing it like this, in my opinion. I really love just heating it up like this, uh, having it already cooked is so handy for me. So this is number three, and this is number four. So there's those um, done, so I'm just gonna cook up some more meat and stuff just whatever I've got it doesn't really matter <laughs> just as long as I'm cooking and doing something right like that's the that's the plan okay good we're making a little bit of money so that's super awesome I'm happy about that actually it's going really well so far just <clears throat> wait until the meteors coming though <laughs> Like, that's when things start getting so hectic and I start panicking and I don't know what to do with myself. That's when things get super hairy and get very difficult as well. Like, that was so chaotic last time. Oh god, I'm dreading that happening again, to be honest. Okay, do we have a little guy coming? I thought I had, oh, I thought I had a rival. I guess not, I don't know. Okay, so we got the pink guy. How much pink meat have we got? only got two left not much if i'm being honest is nobody going into the poll room today like nobody going in there or what <laughs> can you guys just get yourself killed by the poll please oh this guy's going this guy's going here he goes 
Hey, what are we on now? Let's have a look. See what we're on. 60%. Not bad. At least some people are going in there. So like, that's good. <laughs> I'm glad about that. Oh, pink guy is going up here. This is perfect opportunity for us. I'm just gonna take him down and we won't take any damage either. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. This was bad. Did you see that? You didn't see anything. No, nah, no, nah, you didn't see nothing. <laughs> oh my god. I think he was close to like... I think he's getting kind of, I think he's suspicious, but he didn't see. I don't know how he didn't see, but he didn't see. <laughs> so we're fine. <laughs> I literally killed him like right in front of it. So I, I don't know how he didn't notice me, <laughs> but I'm not complaining. I don't know why that guy's super suspicious, but I, I'm just going to avoid him, I think. Um, so what are we doing? Let's go back to our orders. So we need a pink guy. So we got some of that. We need a bun. Um, we need, oh, he's not going to... He doesn't have, I don't have a sauce, so that's going to be a bit annoying. It's not going to be a perfect meal. I might just leave him, I might just let him leave or something. It's only going to be a bit of prestige anyway. Let's just let him leave because it's going to waste my stuff otherwise. I'm going to do this one instead. We're going to do uh, this meat here. This is cooked, right? What's happening? What's going on? I don't know. People are dying left, right and center and I have no idea what's happening. I don't know. <laughs> Okay, then that's weird. Very weird. Um, all right. What's what's going on? Okay, that guy's leaving All right, we got number 10 over here. Are they suspicious of me or are we good? Okay, I think we're good actually that guy's annoyed. I don't know why he's so annoyed I don't know. I'm going to activate the trap up here this one here because hopefully he'll walk past it and he'll get killed by it. That's my hope anyway. There you go. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> that's just what I wanted to happen. Turn that motion sensor off now. So that's good. There's not going to be a way to kill this one because it's going to be on cooldown still. But still we got some like extra meat there. So that was great. I would say I need to remember to get some sauces. We really need some sauces actually. If only that had a smaller cooldown, right? <laughs> that would have made things like a lot easier. But it's okay. It's all right. Oh, this little dude's back. Out you go, you little nasty critter. <laughs> okay, let's see what we managed to get done this time. I'm looking forward to seeing what orders they put in. Okay, so the pink one, you like the rudest meat. So we'll get you some of that. A bun, tomato, and lettuce. So there's basically your order, like ready and raring to go. We need to get some of these rudest guys cooked up as well that would be good okay so this is number 13 let's put your order in i feel like it's been a while since i actually put an order in <laughs> to be honest um okay so i don't have any more of those cooked right now number 14 you are in just the perfect position for me to murder so that's what i'm totally gonna do i saw my opportunity and i i took it <laughs> so great good stuff good stuff and that wasn't the one i served either that was a different one I'm hoping that a couple more people like go in here. Oh, hold on. What am I on now? 90% just one more person. One more death down here and we'll unlock the next planet, which I'm really looking forward to actually. That would be so, so good. That would be awesome. Okay, this meat is done. So we'll put this in the fridge for later and I'm gonna cook up some more of these pink dudes. Okay, we got some orders here. Let's see, we got uh, pink dudes to do. So burger, cheese, and warm that up. And then we also got the rudest guy and they like the, the weird little blue things. So that with lettuce and we'll warm that up. So this is number 16. We're gonna send that one off. And this one's number 17 when it's finished warming up. So send off number 17. And we also have number 15 over there as well. All right, let's put these away. So number 15, um, you you are the, yeah, the blue dude and he likes the pink meat. So pink meat and we got this one and the egg and we'll just let that warm up. And then once that's done, we'll have another order and that'll be like the only order I've got left really. <laughs> I don't have much else going on. Oh, you're going down to the pole. Oh, this is gonna be our last kill for the, for the like next planet. Yay! And there we go. That's probably gonna be it, right? Yeah, quest completed just popped up. <laughs> Yay, awesome. Um, what was this for again? Oh, I, th I don't know, but I think they either got bored of waiting or I don't know what happened, but their order's gone anyway. So yeah, can't do anything there. Oh, 
Oh, did that guy manage to steal some food? Oh, I got a police rating there. I think he managed to actually steal something while I was distracted. <laughs> so that sucks. It happens. Never mind. It's okay. <laughs> we're doing great. Like, we're doing good though. So I'm, I'm pretty happy, like, at the moment anyway. Alrighty. <laughs> Everything could change very quickly though. So look at this dude just dancing, having a great time. He's just chilling. <laughs> he got the moves. Look at him go. <laughs> He's having a great time. Look at him. <laughs> just doing the moves. Oh, well, fun's over. <laughs> Sorry, mate. <laughs> you got a little bit too close to the death trap that was just waiting for you, you know? <laughs> I don't know what to tell you, man. It just is a very... I got a very dangerous settlement here, you know? It's like... It's very dangerous indeed. <laughs> so, I'm sorry. It's just the way things go, you know? Oh, I had meat on as well. It's probably gonna go to waste. Dang it! That sucks. Never mind. It's okay though. <laughs> it's fine. Yay! We have enough to unlock the next planet. Let's go. So we're going to go to San Glacia. Very nice. And we have lots of new residents on this area as well. And to unlock the next planet after that, we have to kill three customers for one trap activation. Oh man, three times as well. That looks quite hard. That's going to be really challenging, I have to say. I don't know how I'm going to pull that one off. I don't know. And then we need to apply a toxin sauce to three customers to kill them. So we should definitely buy that toxin sauce. It's 300, so we're going to buy that. That would be a really good idea. Not going to be able to get past this like planet without that so yeah it'd be a good idea to grab that too okay i think we're good on sort of like resources at the moment so like that's good let's pay our bills off and i think that's about it should i put a couple a little bits and pieces on maybe i don't know the cooldown for this that will do just in case i don't know what this next planet is going to be like it could be disastrous i have no idea i suppose only time will tell right but i'm raring to go let's go and see what chaos ensues on this level <laughs> okay so these are the new alien types right they look like they're crying or something oh god what's happening here I have no idea there's an evil mastermind. Look at him. <laughs> They're all trying to go to this planet, right? And they pushed a red button, which could only be bad. Wait, they're firing something at it. Oh God, <laughs> I don't like the looks of this. <laughs> I don't know what was going on there entirely, but it didn't look good to me. So <laughs> yeah, I don't know. All right, we're on day 21. Not bad. There's not anything happening. So it's just a normal, whoa, what's that dude? He's like hovering. Oh my god, I don't know anything about these alien types, like nothing at all. I don't know what he likes, I don't know like what he's immune to, I, I know nothing, so I don't even know what I'm supposed to feed him. <laughs> I have no idea. Um, he's ordering weird stuff, I don't know what he's ordering, he's ordering some crazy things. Let's put this motion sensor on. Do you think it will attack him? Do you think it will kill him? Like, I really don't know what's gonna happen here we also have those um those like types in here as well you know the protester types they're in here we also have the rats too so we have um at least those are easy to serve so i'm gonna focus on those right now the other guys i don't know i'm just gonna kind of like observe and just sort of see what happens what just died oh it was the rat it was the the, the tarot died okay that like plant guy did you see him he like transformed into something else i know that these guys are immune to guns so, so i can't hurt them with guns there's nothing i can i can do there sadly okay i'm gonna put that one away did both rats die both rats died oh i didn't realize both of them died actually i don't know what to feed that, <laughs> that guy up there i literally have no idea like what is that now nah, boot i have no idea we need to do some research on these guys right so I've got no clue. That guy wants a, he wants a different colored bun that I don't even have. I think what we should do is probably just like try and kill them because I can't serve them. I don't know like what they like, what kind of meat they like. So I think we should probably just like try to murder them somehow. I think that would be the best course of action here to be fair. <laughs> so that's what I'm going to attempt to do, but I'm gonna have to try and find like the best time to do that, definitely. So 
We'll see. We'll see. Let's try and get them alone or something. See if I can do that. Maybe shall we try and stun him and attack him and see what happens? I don't know if this is a good idea. Okay, that went well. That went better than I expected. I thought it was going to go really bad, but it didn't. It was fine. So at least I know I can kill those because some customers can't be hurt by physical attacks. But that one was actually fine. So that's good. Okay, so uh, we got just a normal rat thing here. So I'm going to serve that one because they're really easy to serve. And I don't have to worry too much about those. So there is that. These plant guys, I think you can physically attack them. So we should be okay to do that. As long, I just, It's just going to like try and get them like alone or something and then try and do that i think that would be good so i'm gonna attempt i'm gonna maybe uh, i probably want to stun him because they might run away so that might be a thing that they try to do so yeah i should probably uh do that uh so number three i got your order there sadly i don't have like a black bun right now i you can buy them i have seen them i just like can't buy them right now so let's activate this and see if we can kill these they do have quite a bit of health but as long as they are stunned i think that will be fine to take them down so like that's good okay good to know good to know i really hope that i'll be able to buy some information off these guys after this is over though i don't have that much like uh money or anything but you only, you usually only need a hundred to like actually you know, buy the information for these aliens. So hopefully we can do that. All right, I got a bit of money off that tarot guy. So that's kind of cool, I would say. But here we are on San Glacia, day 21. <laughs> it's been a ride. It's been a hard journey, but I'm getting there <laughs> slowly. All right, are we done? Or is there more customers? more customers coming. Okay, here we go. We got this weird flying thing. Sweet. I'm going to try and murder him, like, when I can get him alone. That would be good. Because we need their meat as well, right? So that would be cool. We got some weird parts and stuff. But look at these weird creations. I don't even know what these are but I'm gonna cook them up so that we can just like start storing them for the next level like hopefully anyway is this gonna go off or what I didn't even it didn't even go off I don't know why okay that was weird shall we try the gun on this guy okay the gun doesn't affect them okay good to know well I didn't know <laughs> now I do so that makes sense okay okay let's put these in here and we're gonna cook some more of these I think that would be great actually I've got some more of this stuff here as well okay we can do the the rat one so this is an easy order this is just order number seven i'll just heat that up first though so that would be great okay where's this dude going okay he's going into a secluded area does this not this does not affect him okay i'm gonna need to get them in a situation where i can like stun them oh oh that was one okay i thought that was a rat but it wasn't <laughs> okay wait we're gonna try use the vending machine on this guy maybe oh maybe not there's a lot of people around here might not be a good idea we'll just let him go home and <laughs> i don't think that would be a good idea i don't wanna i don't wanna push my luck you know uh this is for number seven there you go i actually put an order in <laughs> so that's nice let's see if we can find an opportunity to kill this like plant dude that might be an idea actually i'll just put the cooked foods that I've got away and we're gonna start cooking up some of this stuff as well no idea what it is but I'm gonna I'm gonna cook it regardless so that would be good okay I think do I did I buy this no I've only got the thing next to it the thing next to it's a jukebox which comes down um, customers so if you have like a customer that's trying to attack you you can play this and it will calm them down and they'll stop attacking you. I've actually used it once. There was one time that it came in real handy, actually. So it's pretty good sometimes. So it depends on the situation. But everything is situational. All right, this should kill it, hopefully. There you go. Perfect. <laughs> that thing is really useful sometimes, for sure. Okay, I managed to definitely do quite a bit there. So that was good. That was good. For the next one, we, we didn't really do anything for the next one. I did complete some kind of quest though so that was good don't know what it was but i did something <laughs> so that's good okay we need some info on these guys i don't have enough money oh no i don't know what they like to eat or anything i'm just gonna have to keep killing them for now until i get that money to uh 
find out like more about them because honestly I know nothing about them at this point in time so I don't know but you don't get money like if you don't serve them maybe I'll just experiment I don't know we'll have to see okay we got protesters today so we're gonna have to deal with those guys as well so that's gonna be a pain oh I should have brought some of that like that like um you know I should have brought some black buns that would have been good but then again I don't have that much money so <laughs> there is that as well I suppose all right we should put our traps on put them all on and set them all up that would be great there you go I've only I only really used those two because they're just super useful definitely okay now that this is done let's put these away in the fridge and I'm gonna keep cooking this stuff up that would be good Okay, we got our orders in. There's no way I can satisfy what they want though. It's impossible. <laughs> so they're gonna they're gonna go home like annoyed regardless. So there is that. Alright, let's get this protester out of here. You silly protester. It's gonna be hard to like work out which one is a protester and which one isn't because they all just like look the same now. <laughs> so that's gonna be a challenge, I would say. So yeah, that's gonna be a pain in the butt actually. I don't really know what to do with myself because I just got so many orders that I just can't fulfill. So I'm just sort of a little bit at a loss here to be fair. Um, but we'll work something out. I'll find a way to like murder them. I need to get them into a situation where they can be stunned. Like maybe if they go toilet or something, like that would be really good. Are you going home? I need to, I need to kick this, this protester. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> I needed to get rid of you. All right, cool. I accidentally kicked one of my customers by accident. But yeah, I think some of them are definitely just gonna like, just go home. It's fine, I got so much prestige, so it's not really like that big of a deal. I don't think if we have some going home, like it's fine, better to be safe than sorry, I think. <laughs> so that would be good. I wish I could use some of my traps, but it's just like a little bit, just a little bit um, dangerous, I guess. Okay, let's see. I'm going to put some of these away. We're gonna cook up some rats, actually, because I can serve the tarots, so that's what we're going to sort of do. Although he's asking for stuff I'm not sure I've got. I don't think I have the stuff he's got. They're asking for such, like, different, like, things that I, I don't even have them. Oh my god, it's like, it's gonna be a challenge to even serve anyone at this point. <laughs> I'm struggling to even serve anyone. It's gonna be a pain in the butt. Shall we just kill some peoples here? Just kill some extra peoples. That wasn't even a tarot. I thought it was, but it wasn't. It was something completely different. How crazy, but that's okay. All right, we're gonna get rid of this protester. Out you go. So yeah, I'm just gonna focus on like killing a couple of things. I think that would be a, a good idea at this point. All right, we got a really easy order. He just wants just a normal burger. Super easy, I can do number seven. So I finally have one that's super easy. <laughs> so that's nice. All right, get out of here. All right, there we go. Very nice indeed. Are you going in here? I think this might hurt him. It might kill him, actually. If he actually gets close enough to it, that is. Don't know if he will. No, I don't, I don't think he will. He's just dancing and having a great time in there. <laughs> fair enough, fair enough. Like, why wouldn't you? Okay, so we got number seven's order here. Perfect. I can also do this one as well. So it just requires some very normal ingredients there. So that one's easy. The rest of them, though, I don't think I can do the rest of them. The rest of them I'm going to have, have a very hard time with. Let's just... Uh, Let's just say that, at least right now. I need to buy some more ingredients and stuff. I was not prepared. I was not prepared for this planet. <laughs> I'm thinking maybe I should go back to the previous planet for a while, but at least it's like nice because we got to see what this planet is like. So I think it's good in that way. So yeah, I'm gonna like slowly learn about the creatures on this planet. So what order was this? This is order number 10. So I got this one to put in. So like that's good. All right, I'm just gonna deposit some of these. That will be great. Actually, um, let's see. I wanna murder some peoples, but 
it's just a little bit hard because they don't seem to want to go to secluded areas at the moment <laughs> so I'm having a hard time all right I might be able to get this guy maybe I was kind of hoping he would get a bit closer there we go oh no um you didn't see nothing <laughs> nothing happened nothing happened everything is fine <laughs> He saw nothing. Everything's great. Oh, I was hoping that guy was gonna go into the bathroom, but apparently not, so that sucks a little bit. But yeah, we lost a little bit of prestige here. Where are you going? You're a protester, aren't you? No, you don't. You can tell because they're just running like maniacs. <laughs> they're trying to run to like the best place to protest, I guess. I don't even know. I have no idea, but they're crazy little guys for sure. All right, we got more protesters here. We don't want the protesters because they're just gonna make me lose even more prestige and I am not here for that, so no thank you. That's just not cool. Oh, I might be able to do the policeman. Yeah, I can do the policeman. I can feed him, sweet. Okay, a bun, we can do bacon and I think that's all he wants, right? Bacon, oh, the cheese, I missed the cheese. Put the cheese in there as well. There we go, so we can do that one, so that's cool. Oh, I can do the, the rat as well. So this one and this one, this is an easy one to do too. So that's awesome, just gonna cook some random stuff here so this is um let's see this is number 15 so we're gonna feed number 15 and this one is number 16 so we're gonna give that one over as well i don't think i can do the other ones because i don't know what meat they like so oh we can do number 14 as well so we'll do that one too so this one is just onion just gonna wait for that one to heat up actually so that will be good that will be awesome hey some people are actually eating in my establishment happy times number 14 as well happy times all right let's put some stuff in there perfect let's see i'm gonna cook up some more of this just in case we get any more of those yeah we do number 18 i think i can do that one too um what just happened what's going on down there i think that like rat thing saw something <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. Oh my god. I didn't mean to. Oh god. What do I do? Um, I might be able to calm him down. Wait, 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 wait. Let's not. Let's not be hasty. Let's not be hasty, guys. Let's not be hasty. Here, listen to some music. Oh no, they're not gonna let me go. They're not gonna let me go. What do I do? I'm so dead. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Evade everyone. <laughs> I don't know how I'm still alive, but I'm not going to be alive much longer. That's for sure. See if we can kind of... I hit both, I hit a lot of them, but no, it was not meant to be. Well, I knew this was going to happen at some point, but we managed to... Like, I got a second chance, so we, we, we still get to play, but man like just one simple mistake and it just costs you everything doesn't it i didn't even know what i did to be honest but i clearly did something bad <laughs> that did not go well at all oh my god <laughs> That was so terrible. That sucked a lot. I'm gonna have to try and be a little bit more careful this time. Okay, so our first order is easy. We can tackle this one. Easy peasy. It's just a tarot, so we should be fine. I'm gonna try and like experiment a little bit with the meat that they like though. It's gonna be a bit hard because there's other ingredients as well that they asked for that I'm not gonna be able to like give them. So uh, those orders are gonna be a bit more hard. Gonna be a bit more challenging challenging to take care of I should say it's late over here it's like it's like one o'clock in the morning when I'm um, recording this right now I've been playing this game for hours <laughs> so yeah I've been kind of addicted to be fair let's see we need to do this one and I don't know if I got anything else to do actually okay so this one here is well apart from the no actually that one's fine no we just need we just need tomato yeah we just need tomato in this one so this one goes to number four so we're gonna send that one off and wait I might be able to do that bottom one number seven I don't know what meat he likes so we're just gonna be guessing here to be honest I'm gonna try this meat I'm gonna try this like see-through kind of meat stuff see if he likes it I can't do number six I don't think I can do number five either so I don't I think that's pineapple I don't have it I don't have pineapple can't do three or two because I don't have the ingredients but I might be able to do seven if I can guess what meat he likes the rest is a no-go unfortunately though <laughs> so they are not gonna be happy chaps sadly but um, that's just the way it goes sometimes I guess all right 
see what we can we can do here oh yeah i haven't put my motion sensors on or anything so of course nobody is getting murdered at the moment so that's sad <laughs> but that's okay all right so let's try this so egg um we're gonna try this so hopefully warm up warm up he's gonna leave oh i didn't have time he, he literally just left i didn't have time to like do it i was gonna give him this but yeah i didn't i didn't, didn't, didn't do it fast enough <laughs> so that's annoying but sometimes these things just happened a visitor died oh god oh no oh no oh no oh no he's mad he's mad activate activate why didn't you activate okay oh god <laughs> i thought he was gonna just like get me for good get me good there i thought i was a goner but we're okay if we die this time we're not coming back we have to start all the way at the be like all the way from the beginning again so i have to be super careful definitely okay let's put this away let's put this one away as well okay what have we got here we got an easy rat one i got no i got no stuff on though i'm gonna have to cook up some some tarot so we'll do that get a bit of money from that that would be great actually it's gonna be number eight gonna be able to do that one <laughs> so much like my queue looks massive doesn't it <laughs> it looks so big <laughs> some of them are protesters though so i have to like kick those guys out like first um it's kind of hard to work out which ones are which but i'm guessing there at least i think so <laughs> so that's good okay so this is number eight let's send that off okay let's see i'm gonna do that one as well so we got the tarot and some cheese I'm gonna heat that one up as well so should be able to do this one all right we're gonna cook some more of those up so i'm gonna be able to do number 10 i don't think i'm gonna be able to do uh some other ones i'm gonna get rid of you because you're just gonna oh <laughs> i thought you were a tarot <laughs> It's so confusing. They all look like tarots, but they're all in like disguise. <laughs> it's so confusing. It really is confusing, but okay. All right, let's clean up. There we go. Let's get rid of you. All right, so what have we got here? This is for number 10. Yeah, this was for number 10. All right, good stuff. I can also do number, uh, let's see, 14 as well. We can do that one. He's up there right now. He's in the perfect position for, for the trap, but I'm not going to kill him because he's probably he's like one of the only customers I can actually serve at the moment. So yeah, I'm just going to leave him to it for now, I think. Is there a pro protester? There's a protester up here. Let's get rid of you. All right, I think that's all the protesters sorted at the moment. So this is for number 14. Yes, for number 14. There you go perfect just gonna cook up something random here that would be good looks like we have a protester somewhere is it you it's you okay there's that one there's another one somewhere so i'm gonna have to hunt that one down too i think it's over this way we got 35 seconds left if i can just survive for 35 seconds that'd be great and then hopefully we'll get some information on these guys and it'll make it a little bit easier going forward with some of the levels it definitely will help a lot so that will be really good. Ah, oh, my one of my one of the dudes died. I think that was the one I served as well, wasn't it? I'm not sure. It might have been. Oh god. <laughs> I was hoping he would survive, but I guess not. I don't know. People are dying and I don't know what they're dying from. I'm just going to stay here where it's nice and safe and people don't suspect me. <laughs> I'm not doing anything. I swear it. Okay, let's go get rid of the protesters real quick. See, look, they're suspicious. See? There's some of them saw something. So yeah, like it can can get kind of bad sometimes. <laughs> okay, another protester down here as well. I'm just gonna kick these out and then I'm just gonna be nice and safe in here. I think that would be a really good idea actually. <laughs> okay, what else we got? We got one of these, so we're going to warm that one up as well. That would be good actually so many orders that i'm not able to fulfill right now but we will be able to we will be able to soon just not right now <laughs> okay so this one's number 16 so we can put that one through and we can also put through number 19 as well so yeah that would be good but i think after this episode i might go back like and see if I, see about getting a bit more money so we can get some more ingredients together that they're asking for and just some stuff like that that will help us get through these days a little bit easier because this is quite challenging with the way it is at the moment so yeah i think that would be great actually okay so gonna cook up these as well we're nearly done when we nearly made it through the day like if we can make it through the day then i'm happy so i can go 
go back and get that second second wind as well second chance thing so like we have a, another chance to survive <laughs> so i don't want to lose my progress you know i'm like super like trying to be super careful with it so like my plan is to hopefully go back to a previous planet an easier planet like after this get some money so we can get second chance and maybe get some upgrades some ingredients some information on these aliens so next time when we play like in the next episode it'll be so much easier for us it'll be it'll be good we'll be we'll be killing it we'll be ready to move on to the the, the fourth planet so that would be cool I'm actually really happy that we got to the third one like that's really good progress like you have no idea how hard this game is <laughs> this game is so difficult you know like you really have to like spend a lot of time getting money and upgrades and stuff like that for this kind of game because it's it's tough without it very tough number 20 I can't serve number 20 so I'm just gonna I'm just gonna take you down. I actually thought you were a tower, but clearly you weren't. <laughs> That's okay though. That just saved us a little bit of prestige uh, because I'm kind of losing my reputation and my prestige at the moment. It's not too great, but I got a lot, so it's not it's not like that bad. As long as we survive, I think that's more important to me anyway. So that's good. All right, what's left? We just got there's like a dude down here or something. Yeah, there's a dude down there. We're nearly done. The day is nearly over. Thank God, so I can sort things out for the next time. Get out of here. You stupid protesters. Okay, we made it through the day. So like, <laughs> that's really good. I'm really happy that we actually made it through the day. <laughs> Thank God for that. We are currently on the second planet. So we got our dude and he's chopping something. It looks like some kind of, I don't know, pickle or cucumber or something. I don't know. And it looks like, yeah, something's happening here, but I'm curious. So, so there's always these like different little things that like mix up the, the like days on the planets and this is one of the ones we haven't seen so we have some kind of ant I don't know cockroaches of course okay so we have an infestation and this is of course going to affect our day in some shape or form okay well I'm ready and I'm prepared let's do this I'm currently on day 37 so <laughs> we've lasted a long time right now I've also got second chance as well so if we do die we have a backup plan we should be fine though we should be okay all right invasion of cockroaches killed cockroaches equals money reward oh okay alarm space cockroaches have been spotted these mustachioed guys can eat all of the meat in the fridge they're also disgusting to be honest the chef needs to stop them by the way there is one scientist here who is ready to pay a lot of money for cockroach carcasses Ooh. so this is just like an extra way to make money right so I'm like totally here for that because money is something that is very coveted in this game <laughs> you know money is a very important thing for sure you can see here that I've got I've got quite a lot of resources and stuff like that now so we're fully prepared and we're ready for like whatever this game chucks at me because I wasn't really prepared last time but I feel like I am very prepared for whatever this game has to uh, to throw at me so yeah that's gonna be cool you may notice that my outfit is different we have the lumberjack outfit now just because of all the days that we've managed to get through so I've managed to unlock like a couple of skins and stuff like that so that's really cool I don't know where these like cockroaches are I guess they just like randomly appear or something I'm not entirely sure I guess we'll have to find out my trap definitely kills them straight away now so that's super awesome I like that very handy indeed um I'm gonna see if I can get some meat I don't have like oh hello wait how do I get rid of these wait what do I do I don't know I just have to okay I just have to kill them they actually hurt you as well oh god he did two lots of damage to me my god I wasn't expecting it to be able to actually hurt me just like as much as that did so yeah I'm gonna have to be careful of those things they just come out of nowhere as well just like it's just like surprise <laughs> here I am so yeah that's kind of terrifying for sure okay so we're working with um I got the pink thing. What am I doing? I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> okay, so I need a tomato. We need a sauce over here as well. We're gonna heat that one up and I'm gonna do the pink guy as well. So we need a Rudeus. So uh, someone just died. 
Yes, someone just died. Uh, the person I was doing just died. I got order number one ready though. Yeah, order number one is here. So let's do that. What just happened? A police siren. Why is there a police siren? I don't know. Should I be concerned? I don't know. Okay, I got the hang of these cockroaches now, at the very least, so that's good. <laughs> okay, so yeah, I got a police siren. I don't know why. I don't know what I did, but yeah, I did something bad, clearly. I don't know. All right, we're going to heat this one up, and I also have uh, the pink one to do as well. I've got a lot of stuff cooked up right now, so like, it's kind of like making my life a bit easier, so that's good someone just died okay that one died okay so I'll put this one back because he just died so can't do anything with that at the moment but we got this one for order number six not very many people in my restaurant right now right <laughs> my god but it's okay it's all right we got this sauce eaten good stuff that's what I like to see oh there's more cockroaches okay 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 I just need to like prepare this like I don't want to like let them attack me if that makes sense so I'm trying to like get a good angle on these but we got some like different parts for this as well so yeah that could be good I'm just gonna keep cooking up just like stuff that I've got so we're gonna keep up with the cooking that would be great there we go awesome but yeah I'm pretty sure like I feel very confident with this planet now I think we've seen all of the effects after this as well like there's the new effects for this planet is the cockroaches and the meteor showers I'm not too confident with the meteor showers so yeah that one's a bit of a pain but other than that we have seen like pretty much everything that this planet has to offer so after this one if I've got enough money I might move on to the next planet possibly because I don't know it's not really much point of hanging around I'd really like don't really want to see the meteor showers either if I'm being quite honest with you but I think that the next planet also has a chance of meteor showers as well so probably like can't get away from it even if I wanted to but hey it's just how it goes sometimes I guess okay so for these we need the, the these ones over here okay this is for the Rudius guy so this one goes here all right we got this one for order number nine so I'm gonna send this one off and this one is for the other order as well let's just put the in here a second someone just died okay it was just the bottom one that's fine this is for number seven gonna send that off and cook up this all right number 12 we're gonna do this one and this is gonna be the pink guy and he just wants some cheese so we got that there for you then the pink guy wants a rudus so we just need some cheese in that one perfect all right these are nearly ready to go so this is number 12 so i'm going to send off number 12. this one's number eight when it finishes reheating so we're going to send that one off right we just got number 10 and that is our last order to serve at the moment anyway all right get rid of these darn cockroaches okay we've got another one incoming all right oh it's kind of nerve-wracking i don't like them because they just like they hurt you a lot and i don't like that someone just died you can tell when someone dies um it makes my controller vibrate because i got my my ps4 controller i plugged it in so yeah it kind of like gives me some really handy cues so i know when somebody dies because my controller like vibrates and lets me know so it's actually really handy so yeah it's cool i think it might vibrate when someone gets damaged as well so it's pretty awesome I kind of want to do this it does six damage this guy only has it should automatically kill him let's do it I've never used it before so I wanted to try it out yeah it's pretty pretty handy I have to say it does six damage is there anybody that has higher than six I don't think there is so I think I should probably just keep this on actually because it will kill anyone that comes in so super handy for sure actually I'm gonna keep both of those on in future I just didn't realize that it was strong enough to kill everyone there's two at once oh, I don't like this I do not like this at all I'm gonna get hurt I'm gonna get hurt he's after me oh god there was nothing I could do because they were so close to each other so like that really sucked a lot I don't know if it's a good idea to leave them like I don't know what they would do I think they eat all your stuff don't they so it's like yeah I don't know <laughs> I don't like the idea of leaving them anyway so that was painful I only got one heart left now so it sucks a lot let's just hope that we don't get into any trouble because I really don't want to use that second chance this early I was hoping that like I wouldn't be using it already so like we'll have to see how it goes I guess 
There's a lot of people in that VIP room. I kind of hope that like one of them doesn't trigger it and like make the other one suspicious or something because that would be a kind of bad. Oh no, 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 they're both by the fridge. I can't do anything because like, uh, it's gonna be bad. They're gonna both attack me and it's gonna be awful. I wonder if I can like use traps on them or something. I don't know what to do about them. Like, how much are they gonna eat? <laughs> like, I don't know. Shall I just... Can I trigger just one? Okay, I just managed to trigger just one. Okay, perfect. All right, we'll get this one to follow us as well. Okay, that's good, that's good. All right, I was just really worried because I didn't want both of them after me at the same time. So I was a bit like worried about how that was gonna go down, but we're okay, we're all right. Okay, at least I know now, at least I know that I can handle them. So that's good. Okay, so what have we got here? We, um, people are leaving because they're mad. We're doing the one with the egg. So we got the egg. We got the, what meat was it again? I've forgotten. It's the pink one, the pink one, the pink one. Okay, whoa, I put loads in there. That was a bit too much. Okay, we got cockroaches to deal with again. Let's deal with these guys first. All right, there we go. Okay, so we got the pink one. Um, we need egg. Okay, we're gonna heat this up here. And I got number 17, which is a rudus. It is lettuce. Put that here as soon as this is done this is going to 14 before he leaves this one's going to 17 once it's finished i'm just going to put these away a second cook up some more stuff here perfect okay this is for number 17 send that one off and what else have we got going on here okay i feel like a i feel like a real chef right now <laughs> it's great <laughs> calling out all these orders i'm actually calling them out for myself because it helps me to like remember when i'm taking these orders but i imagine if this was a real kitchen that would be how it would work they would like call out all the orders let everybody in the kitchen know like what's happening and stuff so yeah pretty cool pretty cool okay this is number 18 quick Whew, that was close they nearly left they nearly got mad and left <laughs> that would have been really bad but it's okay we we got it we got this in the bag so that is awesome okay everybody is happy everybody in my restaurant is happy which makes me happy I just need to be wary of that last bit of health, right? So it's not too great. Hopefully these guys leave soon because I don't want to have any more encounters with cockroaches. So I'm hoping that they leave soon. <laughs> really hoping. Because yeah, um, I made a few mistakes there. But I didn't know what to expect. I had never seen cockroaches before. Like I've never had an infestation before. So I had no idea what was going on. But now I do. So if I bump into this again, I will be prepared. I will know what's happening. Okay, this guy's going home. I shouldn't have to deal with cockroaches. All right, here he goes. What's he doing? Oh, he's going to smoke. No, I wish you didn't. <laughs> I don't want you to. Should I just kill him? I think I'm just going to kill him just to like end the level. So if he like comes over here, we'll just kill him. And there you go. The level should end now. There is cockroaches over there. I don't want to deal with them. Okay, we're fine. Okay, we did it. Yay. Good stuff. All righty. So first things first, we're going to need to get some health back. There we go. Oh, I feel so much better knowing that I've got a full health bar now. You know, it's just like so nerve-wracking. Look at that, 999. You need a thousand to go to the next planet, but don't worry. I have some hidden funds that I have kept back. So we're gonna I'm gonna take that out. So that will be good. So we can go to the next planet because I don't believe there's anything else here. So yeah, I put some funds in here because I was like scared I was gonna die. So we just need Let's see, we need about a hundred and something. 106. We need 106. So that's what we're going to take out. And that should be the exact amount we need to fly to the next planet, I think. Wait, I put money. No, I didn't mean to put money. I wanted to take money out. <laughs> it would be 206 now because I just... <laughs> dull. <laughs> That was a mistake. I did not mean to do that. Oh, I needed a few more. Yes, I miscounted or something. I don't know. I need a thousand. That's that's what that's like as much as I need. Okay, so if we go into the planets now, you can see at the top, you can see in Junkameria, you can see that we got like you can see all the different things that affects the days on the planets. So you got the plumbing problem, the critics, the protesters, and the rivals. So we have seen everything there is to see on the first planet. The second planet has the plumbing, the critics, the protesters the uh, cockroach infestation, the meteor showers, and the rivals. So we've now seen all of the different effects that can happen on Rivia Donia as well. So I would say that these two planets are conquered and there's not like any 
more point in me really doing any more episodes on these planets. If I can help it, I'll try to move on to future planets. So this one. So on San Glacia, there are two new effects that we have not seen. So we have like, I think that's a zombie effect. I don't entirely know what that means. And there's like a blue symbol, like a blue circle. I don't know what that means either yet, but we will find out. Now, when I was on this planet last time, the aliens were giving me orders that I just could not fulfill. So I'm hoping today that we will be able to fulfill most of these orders and sort of wrap our head around this planet and maybe even get enough to move on and maybe hopefully see these different like status effects that affects your days as well. So that'll be really cool. We're not ready to move on to the fourth planet just yet but I don't think it will be much longer. So I'm looking forward to that as well. So yes, we're going to be dealing with these critters, Tartolas, and they are impervious to physical attacks. So it's another one of those types of creatures. Actually, they're impervious to a lot, like quite a lot actually. The toilet though, the toilet would be the best way to kill them or the vending machine is probably the best thing I've got right now or the poison gas in the VIP room would work as well. So any of those would work. The Naboot is, uh, we could use the toilet on this guy as well. We could also attack him physically as well. So like that's good to know. So yeah, we got um, a couple of new aliens here. Oh yeah, let's read up on another alien. So I've read up on the Tarots. I've read up on the breed eggs. Let's read up on the Mykonians. Okay, so this is a race that is memorable for the fact there is absolutely nothing worth remembering about them. What? <laughs> they These boring nerds get out of the swamp, which they themselves proudly call the oceanic planet Mikano, and immediately began to bother everyone else with their theories about the imperfect structure of the world. Despite extraordinary intelligence, they are rather clumsy. There are rumors throughout the galaxy that the last king of Mikano died, entangled in seaweed during one of his walks. In general, Mikanians are quite pleasant, so one should not expect any problems from them. Just for God's sake, don't start talking about politics, religion, or social issues with them. Oh God, one of those types. I guess. <laughs> they look kind of smug, actually, <laughs> if you ask me. We're going to read up on the new aliens as well that we're dealing with in this planet, just because I'm really curious about them. We'll go back and read the other ones another time. But these ones, uh, these are Tartolas, so this is new to this planet, a new creature. The unusual appearance of these ancient space dwellers is quite deceiving. Wearing goggles and a rocket pack strapped to their back, these creatures are capable of reaching insane speeds. Keeping, keeping up with their train of thought is quite a task. It is believed that time passes differently for Tartolas, and therefore they move faster, age earlier, and are disqualified for life from all sports disciplines throughout the galaxy. Legend has it that thousands of years ago, the creator himself cursed the entire race after they were late for the decisive battle of the gods with the titans. <laughs> what? Okay, this is getting very far-fetched. <laughs> the Tartolas doomed most of their allies to death with their sluggishness and themselves to short lives and internal attempts to make at least something in time. So basically, they... Um, they were late for a decisive battle and like doomed all their friends and because of that they decided to put jetpacks on and just like reach insane speeds, right? I guess that makes sense. <laughs> okay, and then we got the Naboot race. Representatives of this race have been known for centuries as great crooks and rogues. Their ability to transform into anyone, I've seen them do that, helped them pull great cons, at least until the Mykonanians exposed them and held the great... Kringorum Court, whatever that is. Since then, the Naboots have been trying to adapt to society in every possible way and live regular lives, although they have not gotten rid of the habit of transforming into others. This is probably due to their natural modesty and aloofness. The latter, however, did not pre prevent them from becoming the top requested actors of this century. The ability to change characters turned out to be surprisingly useful on the stage of the great theatre of Damnundoria, or something interesting okay 
it's really cool to read up on like the different aliens as you come across them and I think these ones are actually quite interesting I really like the Naboots because they can transform into different creatures and I didn't know what was going on at first if I'm being honest so I thought it was quite interesting for sure um so we're able to make a couple of laxatives make a couple of those I still can't make toxins yet I got one of the materials but not the other so hopefully we'll find that today as we like continue on this planet three more days and we'll get the zombie skin looking forward to seeing that as well so that's going to be super cool okay let's get this started so we have cockroaches invasion again to deal with great <laughs> Not really what I wanted, honestly, but, you know, it's just the way it goes. Okay, so we got our first customer, and it is one of these. They actually eat rats, which is going to be really easy to do. I got 44 cooked rats, so, like, that's super easy for me to deal with. Now, they are impervious to physicals. I think they're impervious to this as well, honestly. So, yeah, it's a bit, it's going to be a bit of a challenge to take those guys down. So I'm just going to try and feed as many as I can. And like, if they go into my traps, then that's fantastic. But yeah, it's just going to be like, um, if I get lucky, I guess. I don't really know. We'll have to see. All right, people are putting their orders in. Right, good stuff. Okay, so here, I just got a rat thing here. So, um, oh, should I take this guy down? This is, let me see, he's not... Actually, he's impervious to that, I think, so there's be no point, actually. Oh, here comes the cockroaches. Fantastic. Let's get rid of those nasty things. Okay, good. We don't want to deal with those, right? Okay, what are we doing? What orders are we doing? I'm going to do the, the bird thing. So, they want pineapple, actually. I think that's pineapple, anyway. I'm pretty sure it's pineapple. Yeah, it's pineapple. So, that's to number two. So, that's that one done. We're going to do... Um, it looks like a rat, but I think it's a Naboot. I'm pretty sure it's a Naboot. I don't know whether I should feed them rats or not. To be honest with you, I really don't know. <laughs> I don't know, like, how does that work? If somebody's transformed, what meat do you give them? I don't know. I'm just gonna go... I'm gonna try and give them the just normal like rat stuff and just see how they react to it so i'm like really curious about how that works to be honest with you uh, we could actually kill it this isn't actually a tarot it's not a rat it's this you see it's something transformed so it wasn't even it wasn't even what you would think it is <laughs> so yeah let's just say that um let's see i still got this one i'm still gonna test this because i'm curious about whether it will eat that or not so yeah that's gonna be quite interesting actually all right I got another bird thing they also take a uh, rat so we're gonna do that it also he also wants um I think that's chorizo and also fries so we're gonna heat that up as well actually that would be good that would be great um this was for number three I think that's a transformed thing I'm pretty sure I don't know how this is gonna go down to be fair I'm curious to see if like these characters will be satisfied or not he is okay that's good to know because that was I thought that was a transformed dude so that really surprises me actually okay it's gonna make things easier though because it takes like it's really simple and easy meat to obtain so I'm, I don't think I'm gonna like have a hard time with that like at all so like that's gonna be pretty awesome haha <laughs> got another one down yay I'm getting lots of like people killed I think that might have been the first time I had killed one of those turtle things it's like eagle turtle looking things actually so that's cool gonna get some like extra parts there what was this for um, I think I might have made, like, somebody went hungry because I didn't give them the, the thing in time. Oops. <laughs> I got distracted by something, I think. So, my bad. <laughs> Did not mean to do that, but that's okay. All right, what are we working with now? Let's have a look. I got an order, number nine. It's, I think we should be able to just use some rat for that. So, it would be very easy, but... Yeah, I think I'm getting along really well with um, this planet so far. Actually, it's not not bad. I'm surviving and I think I'm doing okay. So that's good. Is that bacon or is that... I can't tell exactly what that is. I'm not entirely sure. Get rid of those nasty things. Okay, I'm just going to do this one because I know what this one wants from me. So that one will be pretty easy. I'm just going to cook up some stuff here. So, yeah, we got a different bun this time. Oh, wait, but it might not be 
It might not be this me, actually. I don't know. Everything's like going so com it's so confusing. <laughs> Wait, I don't know what these guys like to eat. I thought I did. Oh, we don't. I don't know what they like. Oh, do I try normal meat with them or what? Do I just kill them? Maybe I'll just kill them so I don't know too much about them, to be honest. Number 10. I don't know what to do with order number 10. I'm not sure. I don't know. Um, I think I can do this order here. It just takes some egg. This is for order number 13. Yes, so we can do that, actually. That'll be good. Number 10 is actually a thing disguised. Okay, oh, here comes the cockroaches. Let's get rid of the cockroaches. They're really annoying. <laughs> Super annoying. But yeah, is that bacon or... It looks like bacon. I think it's bacon. I'm pretty sure it is. And it is a bird. So I think that they would just take uh, this over here. So that's good. This one here was for number 13. So we'll give that one over. And this one here is for number 10. They're about to leave. So I need to, need to hurry up with this order. All right, there's that one. Number 14, it looks like a just like a, a rat but I have a feeling it's probably not <laughs> but hey we're just gonna oh he just died never mind I was gonna feed him but he literally just died so rest in peace <laughs> I guess <laughs> I don't know it's all good though okay we still have like another two effects to find from this like planet so I'm hoping that we'll find those we also probably should start working towards the next like our uh, quest as well we need some quests as well the quest that we need is to kill three customers for one trap and add and apply toxin sauce i don't exactly know how we're going to get toxin just yet so i don't seem to be able to like make it so i don't know look at that burger like it's so weird just seeing a burger that color you know so very bizarre to me but interesting at the same time <laughs> very interesting for sure okay what's going on here got some traps activate i think that one down there died good because he was suspicious so i'm kind of glad oh that one went home hung um not hungry but not satisfied interesting i messed up there by the looks of it so that's a bit sad i must have given him the wrong thing it's probably because he was transformed as a tarot if i'm being honest with you so that was probably it okay we got some more orders here we got that guy again i don't know what to feed that guy like i have no idea all right we got some cockroaches let's get rid of those okay what am i gonna feed him that's the question i might just try anything let's try a pink one Let's try pink one for him. Wait, what happened to his order? His order's gone. Did he transform? I'm so confused. This is like messing with my head like so much because there's a like a thing that like transforms into other things and I'm like, what? well, what does he like to eat then? <laughs> so confusing, it's so confusing. Okay, I think that this is probably a Naboot, right? I'm guessing this is a Naboot. Okay, if you're a Naboot, wait, wait, wait. I could feed you Eva. Either the bird thing or what was the other thing I saw on there? The other thing was the pink thing. The pink thing or this thing. So we could try either of those and tomato. Okay, so this one here was for order number... No, I put the wrong bun. I put the wrong bun in there, actually. Oh, I got got a suspicious guy over there, too. Okay, so chorizo and rats. Yeah, I put the wrong, like, colour bun there. Oh, here comes the cockroaches again. All right, got those guys down. Okay, so this is for number 16. And this one here is for number 15. All right, we've got some orders going there, so that's good. Number 18, I don't know. I don't know what to feed number 18 right now. I don't know. I'm assuming that number 19 is probably a... Yeah, it's probably the pink thing. So let's go for some onion as well. We're going to try that. Yeah, number 18 is not, not, a, not a thing. It's not a rat. It's all a ruse. It's all a disguise. So that's number 19. Just um, 18. Okay, 18 is a Naboot as well. So we're going to need... I think it's going to leave though. I don't think I'm going to get this in time. But I'm going to try. So we'll see. It needs to heat up. So it's probably not going to get there in time, sadly. But we'll still attempt it. Okay, still still try. Yeah, he, he's gone. He's gone. I didn't get that in time. Oh, cockroaches again. Get rid of those nasty things. Okay, what are we doing here? Um, I, I wanted mushrooms in here. 
and bacon in here and I don't know I don't think I've got time no they they disappeared again I'm too slow <laughs> I need to be faster I might need to get that upgrade to increase waiting time because recently I have been struggling to like actually get it in time so yeah that's a bit of a, a pain in the butt I lost a bit of prestige it's not a big deal though it's fine it's fine we're doing much better than we did when we first got to this planet so it's progress so, so it's good like <laughs> We're definitely getting better, so that's what matters, right? I'm really happy about that, actually. Okay, are these done? Are we finished with these? Let's put these away for later. There we go. The day is basically done now, so that's cool. I'm curious to see what we're going to get, like, on the next day, actually. I got a D. Not great, but it's okay. We survived, so it's not too bad. All right, now to stock up on ingredients. That would be great. A couple of ingredients down here. Very nice. Some French fries. Lovely. Very nice. Get some chorizo, some pineapple. All right, we're basically, like, stocked up here, so that's good. Okay, do I want to? I really want to buy an extra stove. I feel like that would be really, really handy for us at this point, actually. I think I might buy one of those. Let's buy an extra stove. That would be great because we got some a little bit of money there, actually. My bills should get paid next time. At least, uh, yeah, that would be a good idea to do it next time. So, yeah, we're still looking for these two status effects. So I'm going to keep going a little bit, see if we can bump into those. That would be really cool. So let's see what we can do here oh here we go okay so this is gonna be um one of the like varied days like one of the variations that they throw at you I'm a bit nervous about what it is actually okay some guy's eating a burger looks like he's having a great time okay okay we got zombie it's the zombie effect so okay we got like zombie rats interesting does that mean they all start attacking each other oh god this is brutal isn't it oh no <laughs> how am i gonna survive this one i feel very nervous okay all right so zombie epidemic zombies are attacking beware there may be brain eating zombies among the guests and they can turn everyone else into their own kind the chef must protect the restaurant and his customers from this scourge oh boy okay <laughs> i'll try my best okay i don't know if i've ever had these i don't think i've ever cooked this no i don't think so let's cook that up i'm sure that'll be useful for us as well all right we got some customers incoming are you infected are you zombie i don't know they probably wouldn't tell me even if i asked <laughs> if only they they did <laughs> that would be great but sadly it's not not the case all right let's put our motion sensors on all right we got a naboot number one is a naboot don't know if number two is not sure just gotta keep an eye on them so since that one i know is a naboot we can feed them the pink one or i can also do the turtle okay let's see so wait what 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 whoa what's going on oh god um wait time out those things they're not immune to that are they um how am i gonna get rid of these guys i'm gonna have to lure them down here i wasn't expecting this to happen okay okay all right we'll lure them down here and hopefully this will like kill them okay we're good we're good all right the zombie virus has already begun Oh my god, there's so many zombies. What do I... How do I go about this? They're all following me as well. This is just absolutely terrifying. Okay, we're going to put this... Um, This might actually kill this one too. But you know what? I'm going to do it. Hopefully it will take some of them down or something. It went around it. Like what? Oh no, they're all, they're all coming this way. Stand here. Activate. Did it kill any? I don't... I don't know. I have no idea. Oh no, I'm stuck. Oh my god, I died already. No way, the zombie virus is awful. Oh no, I don't like the zombie epidemic. This is another really awful one. I do not like this at all. <laughs> I died already, they all start coming after you and some of them are like, some of them you can't kill. Like, this is gonna be really tough, really, really tough. I don't know how I'm gonna get around this one. I'm gonna have to really pay attention to like the creatures here. All right, we got a zombie here. We're gonna take him out. Come on, little zombie, come follow me. Let's get rid of him. All right, there's that one. Are you a zombie too? I don't know if you are. 
All right, I don't know if you are, but like we've dealt with the, the problem. We've dealt with the problem, so that's good. They really infect people so quickly. Like, oh my God, like how are you supposed to, how are you supposed to deal with this? Like, I actually have no idea. This is, this is really hard. This is really hard. Um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know how to like go about this. I think I'm gonna stun them up here. Uh, so let's let's do that. Let's stun them. Okay, I can take down this one. I don't know if I can attack this one. Oh, I can. Okay. All right, there we go. That's those dealt with. All right, good. So I don't think we have any more zombies in here. So like we're fine now for a second. Oh my god, this is this is terrifying. All right, we got a Naboot here. So we need to give them. We're gonna give you this. We need this and mushrooms. Let's see if we can actually serve some customers here. I just need to keep an eye on what comes through. If there's a zombie, I'm just gonna go and try and kill it as soon as possible. I think that's like the only way to deal with this. I don't know how else to deal with it. So yeah, like that's the plan. Oh, so many corpses, like so many dead bodies. Like it's insane. Are you a zombie? Number four? Number four? You look like you've got green stuff coming out of you. I don't like that. <laughs> I don't know if you're a zombie or not, but I don't like this. I don't like where this is going. Number four, are you a zombie? I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill you because I'm scared. So like, yeah, like come out and then like, we, we can deal with this like, functional adults you know <laughs> just just to be just to be safe i didn't like where this was going hello excuse me I, I don't he looked like he was about to attack me and then he like gave up midway like what i don't know what happened there but okay i think we're safe from the zombie virus for a second thank god <laughs> okay number five let's deal with some orders all right what have we got here Okay, let's feed you this and some fries and some chorizos. Okay, good. We got that order going, so that's nice. All right, let's cook up some more of these bird things. I keep forgetting I've got an extra stove now, but yes, we do. All right, this is for number five. Oh, we got a zombie. We got a zombie. Where are you? Where's the zombie? We don't want this to spread. We don't want to spread this zombie virus. So we're going to lure him over here and hopefully we're gonna stun you did that work it didn't work it didn't work okay abort abort let's send them down here oh no he's infected that guy as well oh no he's gone the opposite direction this is bad this is really bad where's this guy going he's going up here okay can i like can i get this guy to come over here okay okay we just need to stun him we stun him and then we can we can deal with this are you a zombie too oh god there's more zombies than I realized. Oh no, I'm dead. Oh god. Yeah, the zombie virus is painful. Oh my god. Well, it didn't quite go according to plan. Definitely not. I got a bit of money like stashed away here. So I just need to earn like a thousand um, to get my second chance back. Um, but yeah, I'm really shocked at that. We are back on planet three and I am raring to go. Something new is happening as well. So we have a brand new like effect, you know, one of those variation things that pop up on the planets. We've not seen this one. So I am looking forward. I don't know if I should be looking forward to it because sometimes they are really nasty and really hard to deal with. So. <laughs> I'm not sure if I should be excited, but I am excited because I absolutely love this game. So I'm looking forward to seeing what challenges that this game throws at me and just like how we can like deal with them. So we'll see. Hopefully I don't end up losing my second chance because I've worked hard to build up my funds again from the last time that we died. So we'll see what happens. Okay, so my dude is like getting a coat out or something and there's like, I don't know what those are, like ghosts or something. I'm not sure. Oh, Oh, they like electrocute you okay so you don't want to touch them because they fry you they fry your brains and they're gonna hurt you a lot okay is it like instant death when you touch them or does it just like take away like one of your health bars or something it's gonna be really brutal if it's like complete dead just from like that one like touch I really hope that isn't the case but I don't know like we're gonna have to find out you know <laughs> So we'll see, I'm on day 25, so not as much as before. We were on like day 34. I think that might be my record actually, day 34 so far. So yeah, that's definitely as, as high as I have gotten so far. Hopefully though, we will get like back on that level and we will, 
you know, go past that, like, one of these days. <laughs> it all just depends, really, on what the game chucks at you, because, like, I find that when I'm, like, first experiencing one of these effects, for example, I, like, panic and I don't know how to, like, deal with it. So, like, it takes me, like, you know, just a little bit of practice before I'm able to actually, like, you know, know what to do and know how to get past it. So it can be, like, really annoying in that way. <laughs> it's just like, oh, if only I knew. <laughs> if only I knew, then I wouldn't have to, like, redo everything all over again. So it takes a couple of hours to build up your funds and get back to, like, a good place in this game. So it really is time consuming. Um, but we have mysterious orbs. Killed customer equals money reward. So you get extra money in this, like, on the, when this effect is active, you get extra money when you kill customers. So that's pretty sweet. The secret of the century. Mysterious orbs have appeared inside the Good Burger restaurant. Do not touch them under any circumstances. They inflict serious burns. And beware, mad scientists have already put a bounty on everyone who has been around these things. Where are these scientists? Why are there so many scientists that are putting bounties out on people? Like, <laughs> this is a thing that's been mentioned multiple times now. <laughs> but okay, alright, let's get started here. What do, what do I do? I guess I'll just start by just cooking some stuff up here. The orbs are just going to, of course, just randomly pop up here. So I just gotta, like, be wary, I guess. All right, there we go. All my traps are on and everything. So that's cool. Are you a Naboot? Like, what, what are you? I have to watch out for creatures that decide to transform in this level as well. But I'm pretty sure that that is just a normal... A normal rat actually so yeah we're starting off really easy here so that's good oh mysterious orbs have appeared here they are oh my god there's loads of them there's loads of them they're all honing in on me as well oh no what do i do what do i do ah leave me alone leave me alone i have a feeling that these things probably would just like kill you in one hit if they like managed to get on you okay they're gone oh my god that is terrifying i do not like that at all but it's okay i managed to like survive so i feel like we'd be okay but yeah it's gonna be hard to manage everything here <laughs> i'm really gonna have to watch out for when that like pops up that that rat is it a now boot like what is it i don't know i have a feeling that that might be a now boot but i don't know for sure what are you over there are you in camouflage? <laughs> Are you in disguise, <laughs> sir? Yes, they're in disguise. I just saw them transform. Okay, <laughs> good to know. I was trying to like, you know, wait for a, an opportunity. Oh God, they're back. The orbs are back. Oh no, no, no. Oh no, it stuns you as well. Oh God. Oh no, I've been attacked by all of them. Oh my God, <laughs> that scared me. Okay, they don't actually deal damage to you. Okay, that's good to know. It's just a stun. That's not as bad as what I was expecting. I was expecting to just like get KO'd the moment I touched one. Oh my God, they gave me a heart attack. This game <laughs> is like really, really, it's really scary sometimes. <laughs> okay, what am I doing? Right, let's get back to the task at hand. This is not a bad effect. The zombie one is still the worst one that I have experienced so far. That effect is just awful. I think that if I encounter the zombie one again, I feel like I will be able to tackle, tackle it a little bit better, like the second time around, because like I kind of realized that like in order to get past that zombie virus thing, you just really have to like, you know, um, sort of yeah, it's fine to be hit by this. They're actually not that bad. But yeah, it's to get through the zombie virus one, you basically just need to just get the aliens quick. So just murder every infected thing that you see as soon as possible. And I think that is the best way to tackle it. So I feel quite confident that if we ran into that again, that I would be able to succeed and I would be able to get past it. So I'm feeling oddly confident there. <laughs> I don't know if that's misplaced, but that's that's how I feel. All right, so chorizo, we got a lovely, this is order number six. We're also gonna do the policeman over here. So we got a Rudus, uh, I just clicked the wrong one, but that's okay. You can see I got like a really good amount of supplies here, right? My supplies are looking really decent, which is like what I really like to do when I play this game. I really just like to just be prepared when I play. These orbs are annoying, but they're not that bad actually it could be so much worse like trust me it could be worse <laughs> definitely I've, I've seen worse all right we got number eight which would be a naboot because those are always naboots i'm pretty sure so we just need 
fries, chorizos, warm that up. And we also got the bird as well. So let's take the bird's order. Wait, does the bird take rat as well? The bird takes rats? Okay, we should really feed the rats. We got a lot of rat actually. So yeah, I would prefer to use that up instead actually. So this one was, wait, what? Why have I got two? Did somebody die? Yeah, somebody died, I'm pretty sure. Okay, I'm just gonna give this one... Oh, no, never mind, that one died as well. It's so annoying when you, like, get all their orders ready and then they just, like, die. <laughs> You're, like, you've prepared everything and then they just get murdered and it's like, dull. <laughs> what's going on? Um, I should really be, like, killing customers, but then, like, I am, I am killing them with traps, so, so I think I am getting the money reward for that. I don't think you have to kill them with the orbs, like, necessarily. At least I don't think so. I, I think that these orbs could be really dangerous like can you imagine you're in like a really bad spot and then those orbs just like start spawning in and just like get you at just the wrong time I just feel like that, that it would be dangerous like in that regard like if that like happened but you know it's very situational if you're careful then I think it's I think it's fine I think it's all good and right now like none like nobody is suspicious or anything oh now they are but that probably that little guy over there he'll probably die by the poison like by the time he walks over to the the other side most likely i would be surprised if he didn't die from the poison to be fair but i guess we'll just have to see how it goes all right i got some more orders here we got we're gonna do some some like um tarot here gosh my burger just went flying because that stupid orb <laughs> Oh my god, at least I can like sort of rest easy on this one, like on this effect. I'm really glad that it's kind of like a chill effect compared to like what I could have had. So like, yeah, I'm super happy about that. Okay, so we got the rat, so we need salmon, and we need, yeah, okay, that guy up there is suspicious for some reason. Okay, I'll need to be careful about that. And I know that I can't take that down with the, the gun either. I'm not sure if I should go up there and kill them just to like be safe but I don't I don't really know this is for number 12 I got a lot of orders I need to get cracking on my orders don't I there's a lot <laughs> there's definitely a lot of these things the orbs are coming no the orbs are coming I'm stunned but it's okay I don't I think I'm safe here anyway I'm like behind the door so that thing is not gonna see me so we are fine <laughs> thankfully okay let's put some more stuff on the go here all right cool so number 13 are you a I don't know if you're a rat or like what you are I have no idea do these guys transform I'm just gonna watch them just for a second just to see if any of them transform but they do look like they are rats so I feel like they would have transformed by now right I'm pretty sure they are so let's just go with the assumption that they're rats because I haven't seen anything to say that they are not so <laughs> that's what we're going to go for right now okay okay just put this in quick oh that was close like that guy was about to leave because you know he'd been waiting for a while so <laughs> I think I got a bit lucky there so that's good my prestige is kind of on the low side like I remember like last time on like the last run that I did I had a lot of prestige but I haven't been able to get as much prestige and I think the reason is because I spent most of my time like when I was getting money on this run most of my time was actually spent on planet 2 I don't really spend time on planet 1 anymore because planet 2 gives more money so you can get money faster so I just generally just stay on planet 2 but it's a bit harder to get prestige because like customers die I find like customers go into the VIP a lot more so like you don't get that prestige because you only get the prestige if they actually like go home happy and in a lot of like cases they're not they're not going home at all they're just like dying in my in my like store so yeah it's harder to get prestige takes a while so that's why that's low but my money's really healthy so I think that is good like it's a good like payoff I would say so I don't mind too much actually I think I was correct in that these were tarots so that's good actually I'm quite happy about that so I was wondering I didn't know if I was like doing the right thing or something but I'm so glad 
I'm so glad that this is a nice effect or an, as nice as it could be for an effect so yeah I'm very happy about that that was good that went super smoothly I was a bit worried about what that was gonna be but yeah I, I definitely would take that effect again I would take that any day over the the zombie effect <laughs> I don't like the zombie effect it is awful it is horrendous okay so we're going to replenish our stock that would be great just make sure that we're all topped up and everything and I think I need to pay my bills today as well I don't think I paid my bills like yesterday so yeah I probably need to do that as well all right there's that all stocked up and everything so that's great okay yeah we've got bills here all right so so for the like next day what I want to do is I want to work on going to the next planet now so I think that we're there on prestige I think yeah you need 3,000 I'm just over the threshold for that we do need the money so we need 1,500 money before we're able to go over and I have got a quest to do as well it's just I was focusing on the effect with the orb so I wasn't really like thinking about doing quests but I will this time the quest I actually have is really easy all I have to do is use flavoring sauce five times and yeah that's pretty easy I actually do have flavoring sauce right here and you can make a, a bad burger taste better by putting flavoring sauce on it I've never actually used it but it sounds really really useful and that's literally all that is required to go to planet four so yeah nice and easy I would just lucked out and got some easy quests this time because they're randomized when you die the quests reset and you actually get different quests as well so yeah I just lucked out and got some like pretty easy ones there so the next planet is actually called Ramagenia apparently it's got like plant life on it and stuff looks very unique <laughs> and interesting I'm looking forward to it actually I reckon we'll get to go to that planet today so that's gonna be a lot of fun we're gonna spend a little bit more time on planet 3 first though all right what's happening just rivals rivals is fine perfect we can deal with that easy peasy this is gonna be a really easy level we should be able to get through this no problems rivals are not bad I've dealt with rivals so much at this point that they just they're not really really a threat so yeah it's fine okay the question is is are these rats really rats they are not that is not a rat okay what about the other one that's coming in that one looks like it actually is a rat because he would have transformed at this point so yeah I'm pretty sure that, that one is so, so we're just gonna put this one in for number two we have a rival incoming let's just kick him out there we go <laughs> don't have to worry about this anymore okay so we got um, I actually think these guys do use uh, the rat meat as well so we got this and we got jalapenos I actually thought that this was sauce at first but it's not did you just die oh the order just went I was about to serve you and now you're gone <laughs> no so annoying okay it's fine it's fine oh I clicked the wrong meat we want this one we want burger and cheese this is for the rat I'm pretty sure that is a rat as well so we're gonna go for another rat and hello do you mind my god, <laughs> I was trying to serve a customer and now I got like meat and stuff all over the floor like dude <laughs> That's not cool. Okay. Okay. Just gonna put this in number four. There you go There's that customer served. So yeah, we need the money. I should probably start using the sauce as well Usually there's usually a customer that comes up saying that they want sauces that usually boosts you a little bit so I'm like kind of waiting for that opportunity but I don't know how many of them will I suppose it doesn't really matter though because if it makes a good burger uh, if it makes a bad burger, burger good even then it probably doesn't matter too much I don't think that like it will affect their rating so it'll make their burger good anyway so <laughs> I suppose it doesn't matter too much it's just that I usually only put sauces in if they ask for it but I think in this instant I think I think it will be okay like this time around actually so <laughs> I'm going to try and do that as well as soon as I actually get a customer I'm just gonna speed it up a little bit by the fridge is usually a little safe zone for suspicious people as well you'll notice that even when they come up to get orders right here by the by the fridge is actually a nice little safe spot and usually you don't get spotted here I'm not saying that it ha works like all the time but in most cases it has worked for me so yeah it's pretty it's pretty awesome okay so we're gonna do this order here and you want rats I'm gonna put the flavoring sauce in as well it doesn't need it but I'm gonna do it anyway 
Um, did you just die? Oh my god, they keep dying. They keep, they keep like moving. It's so annoying. So anno stop dying, guys. So stop dying. I mean, it's my fault because I obviously have left like all my traps up and stuff. I want the meat, obviously. I want like a supply of meat to like keep rolling in. So then I just like never have to worry about it. But sometimes when you're like, you know, trying to put orders in and stuff, it's just really frustrating <laughs> when you're like trying to, when you like got this order already and everything and then like, you know, something just comes over to like murder it. I actually think I messed up that order, but you know what? It's got the sauce in it, so it's probably fine. <laughs> I don't think I have to worry as long as the sauce is in there, so yeah, it's good. It's all good. I could probably just give this to any customer because it's got the sauce in, so like, yeah, you don't need to worry. See, this- oh, okay, the suspicious customer's not coming over. I don't know why you're suspicious. I guess you just saw something bad, I guess. I don't know, I'm just gonna give this number 10. All right, yeah, some people are getting a bit hungry. I'm being, being a little bit too slow here. Need to keep up with demand. <laughs> demand is high in my restaurant. I run a fine establishment here and everyone wants my burgers. So <laughs> I need to step up my game, you know? <laughs> so that's what we need to do for sure. Okay, you guys all happy? Sauce eaten, sauce activated. Let's see if that counted. It did. So that's 20% on that one. So yeah, we're going to get that quest in no time. Easy peasy, easy peasy. You know what we could do? We could literally just put like some buns and we can just put the sauce in. Do you think he would like it? You just get a bun and sauce and that's it, number 12. Oh, you can't, you can't send it off. <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> I thought like the less ingredients, the better, right? Let's just give them rat. We're just going to give them all rat and then just send them off of the sauce and then just see if it still comes up as satisfied. I'm really curious actually just put like minimal effort in and then just see what happens okay and then we got the sauce here the sauce is just the answer to all your prayers <laughs> i swear it okay we're gonna put some more sauce in here as well perfect look at all this weird purple sauce like i don't even know like what is in this sauce it looks very very weird doesn't it <laughs> looks very strange here take this one easy peasy we got this we got this okay i don't know how many i've done to be honest with you like i kind of want to keep some sauce just for like those moments where things get like really hectic and i want to keep some back you know so we can get some easy orders out and stuff but of course we need to use them at the moment for my quest so there is that as well. All right, we're on 60%. So we're, we're getting close to unlocking the next planet, guys. <laughs> I'm very excited. I'm looking forward to seeing like, you know, what what customers we have to like deal with. It's gonna be really interesting, I think. I'm looking forward to it, it's gonna be great. Always like get excited to like see like what the customers are like and the best way to deal with them. It's really interesting, it's really fun to try and figure out how to best go about your day in this game. There's a lot of strategy involved in this game, I have to say, which I was not expecting, so it's, it's great. Are we done with the quest now? Let's have a look, 80%, so really close now really close just keep putting this flavoring sauce in there imagine having like a purple burger like what and there we go there it is we are now going to be able to visit Rama Genia or something. Apparently it's a paradise, so <laughs> is it really? <laughs> I'm not so sure that I believe that. Okay, I don't need to give that out right now. I'm going to save the rest of my sauces for, you know, just quick deliveries for when, like, customers just want to leave my, my place. So that's what I'm going to save it for, definitely. So that's going to be really cool, actually. We're getting a lot of bodies here. We're on the last wave so I think this is basically the day ended we just need to sort of wait for for all this to to like finish and end and stuff I think that's it yes I got an A as well I don't know like how to get more maybe it's like my prestige wasn't that high I think I had a couple of customers leave so that was probably why I didn't like you know get max there sadly I'm just a tiny bit short on money do I want to do another day I might just be able to take it out from my stash to be honest with you can we do that can we take it out from my stash let's just take it out I'm literally missing like a hundred and that's it you need it 1500 and I'm like I'm super excited about going to this planet so I'm gonna do that it takes like a percentage as well like 80 percent so that's why if I take a hundred it wouldn't be enough it has to be a bit over so there you go I got like four thousand in there that money there I try not to use it if I can help it because this money in here is like 
funds towards my next like second chance you know because <laughs> it's expensive and it's great having the second chance option there because like I feel like I'd probably struggle to like make a full episode if I didn't have the the second chance thing because I die a lot in this game so it really helps me out a lot for sure so I can just like do an episode in one go without having to stop and just like build up my funds every time in between you know because <laughs> I want to make progress of course so, so yeah it can be a bit of a pain in that regard okay so let's buy the next planet oh my god I am excited and let's look at the description some say it was here that I laid the foundation for life in the universe. I do not remember whether this is true or not, but the place is just right. Walking through the meadows of Ramagenia, even I become less cynical. Endless forests everywhere. The rarest flower in the galaxy grow under the crowns of giant trees, and some hollows accommodate mansions of the world elite. Once I wanted to buy one of these. I think I even did buy it, but I don't remember which one. I have no idea what you're talking about, but okay. So, let's see. So we have, um, I, I recognize a couple of them. So we got Rudises. Rudis are gonna return on this planet. So we definitely have dealt with those before. We also have the, the one with the blonde hair is like sometimes they are protesters. So I have actually seen them before, but don't actually, I've never had to, actually had them as a customer so I'm not sure what they like to eat or anything like that and then of course we have two new aliens we have I don't know what that is like a red looking alien and like a TV with a dog on like what is that <laughs> I don't know and then of course we got two new effects on this planet as well we got what looks like a plate it looks like a plate and like someone's gobbled like a portion of it I don't know what that means I don't know and then we have like a it sort of looks like a I don't know, like a soldier helmet or something? Maybe some like customers that come from the army or something appear on this like planet? I guess we'll like have to see when we like get into it, I suppose. I don't know if that would have now appeared, no. So we don't have anything on them, but we do have these. So these are mubblers. So these are on this planet. And we, like I said, we have seen these before, but I've never had them as a customer. Let's read their info because I haven't actually read their info yet. Despite their external harmlessness, this race is considered a parasite and is subject to extermination in a number of star systems. The reason is quite simple. After a meal, each mubbler begins to continuously create their own clones. Oh really? Okay. First filling the room and then entire planets with their replicas. Oh, I do not like the sound of this. I'm just gonna get like... <laughs> it's gonna be like overcrowded in my kitchen, isn't it? I do not like this at all. <laughs> They don't do that when they're protesters, but if they're customers, they might. I don't know, but yeah, this could be a pain. <laughs> this could be a nightmare to deal with. <laughs> okay, these creatures, um... These creatures are quite harmless by themselves, except that they can explode after death. Are you joking? Oh no, that's gonna cause some problems. Oh no, but wait, what if they're killed by traps? Do they still explode? Like, does it work like that? I actually don't know, I guess we'll see. However, due to their fertility, mubblers have destroyed many inhabited planets and living beings because as soon as one of them sets foot on your land, there will simply be no room, food or oxygen on it. Damn, they really are just like taking over. Theories about the origin of these vermin are very different. Some think they were brought out artificially as a weapon, which was soon regretted, and others that the mubblers are some kind of experiment by the creator, a divine joke that went too far. The latter version is hard to believe, although who knows? The descriptions are just like so crazy for like the species, like I would never have thought of like these backgrounds for like these aliens. It's like really, they're really like bizarre and so like outlandish. <laughs> it suits the game though. It really does because this game is just like so bizarre. So <laughs> yeah, it does suit it. So we do know kind of what they eat. Like I don't know what all these races are to be honest, but I know that like pink looking one is definitely a race that's going to be joining us soon I believe so yeah we'll see how this goes I feel a bit nervous I always feel nervous going into a new planet because there's just so many unexpected things that happen but that's what makes it fun at the same time so yeah let's do this I got 14 more days to unlock the zombie hopefully like we get that soon I don't know <laughs> I don't know if I'm gonna last that long I have no idea but we will find out okay hello it's God again he is 
is. He's back. It's our creator. What is he doing? Um, flower power? What does this mean? Is this a, an effect? Am I going straight into an effect? I feel a bit worried. I don't know what's happening. What is that? Even my character's confused. He's just having a nice snooze on this, like, luscious green planet. Like, <laughs> this is, like, the perfect, like, planet for those, like, tree-looking aliens, right? They would love it here. They would thrive, right? So interesting. Very interesting indeed. All right. So here we are. We have arrived. Day 27. There's no effects. So it's just letting us just sort of, like explore what kind of creatures appear <laughs> i hope that we earn enough money to be able to buy information on everything that like pops up here but we will see i just got a new record okay so we just got the information for these these are called robbies or robies probably robbie right i don't i don't know i have no idea but they look interesting um so they are good natured armored robots somewhat reminiscent of the long extinct dog race actually it was the dogs that inspired the mykinanians when they created this completely new intelligent species these androids were designed as a gift to humanity the inhabitants of mikano wanted to strengthen peace with people following the war in, in which all earthlings and their loyal furry friends died so Humanity is extinct. <laughs> oh, wait, wait, but my character is human. Wait, it said almost all earthlings. Am I like just like a rare breed then? <laughs> Is that, like, how this goes? Wow, I didn't realise that I was so rare, <laughs> but apparently we are. Unlike their ideological inspirers, Robies are practically immortal, but they are just as kind and harmless. The only negative emotion they experience is fierce hatred of their creators. However, they barely managed to hide it, at least for now. It said that they were immortal. So does that mean they cannot be killed? Oh, they cannot be killed. Their, their heart has like a little, you know, that little like infinity symbol next to the heart. So I can't even kill these. Okay, so these are literally just customers for me to please. Nothing more and nothing less. Okay, good to know. What if they go into a trap? Would like, would it make them angry? Like, how would that work? Okay, we just got the other, the other species here as well. This is a Zyklik or something. That looks weird as heck. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> looks so weird. Okay, they don't have that much health. Only four. Okay resurgent balls with poor health but explosive potential oh god i don't like the sound of that they die from almost any poke or manipulation and they accompany this process with a rather dangerous detonation due to their explosive nature they are banned in many planets but they can be periodically encountered thanks to the well-known omnomni activists who managed to prove in courts that isolating zyklics or zyklics i don't know from the whole world is unfair even in in spite of the huge number of victims every year. There are legends that they were created specifically for terrorist activities, but over time, both of their creators and the balls themselves managed to forget about this. Okay, so they're just walking explosions. Great. <laughs> That's gonna be a pain to deal with, isn't it? I'm not looking forward to it. Okay, well, at least we have one familiar alien here, so, like, I feel like I'm gonna be able to, to you know, get on with that one at the very least, so let's do that. Okay, what, wait, I don't know what meat this guy's like. I'm just gonna have to guess. So, I'm going to feed him rat and see if he likes that because I honestly, of course, do not know what he likes. Like, there's nothing here. We're gonna have to buy the info for this guy to find out more about him. So, yeah, that's gonna be a pain, but that's just gonna have to be, that's like how it's gonna be with like, you know, most of the new alien types here. So there is that. Oh, this guy wants avocado bread. But of course, I don't know what this guy likes either. I'm assuming he's probably gonna like, like someone someone like around here i don't know <laughs> like like the one of the new alien types or something i might try this one let's try this one on him or something i don't know <laughs> i don't know what i'm doing we'll see what happens and he wants olives as well he wants uh some interesting things here some very interesting things indeed i kind of want the meat but i'm scared because they're explosive like <laughs> i don't know if i want to like go for it or not i don't know i'm scared <laughs> the of course okay so the robots don't like rats that's good to know so i didn't know maybe i should just give them flavoring so then i can get the 
so I can get like the thing for it. I should just put flavoring in because we don't know it for this time, right? Maybe we should just do that so then we can get happy customers. We probably don't need to like give them a crazy amount of stuff. Just put some flavoring in for all of them and then hopefully on the next time because like you need to get them in your thing to actually get the info. So what I mean is you know these um things here like this, this is your record. So on here once they are in this record um i believe you're able to buy the information from them after the level ends so after this level ends i should be able to buy some information on these new species and we should be able to find out what they like to eat but right now we don't know and there wasn't a way for me to find out either until like now i had to like start the level first like if that makes sense so yeah, <laughs> we're just gonna have to put up with it for now. So I'm just really thankful that I've got this flavoring sauce because I think I'm just gonna use this to just make them happy and just get money. Because we're gonna need money because you know, we're going to definitely want to like, you know, get the info for these guys and it's gonna cost us a couple hundred to get that. So we're gonna need to do that for sure. Okay, a new wave is approaching. What do we got? So what do we got to deal with here? I do really want to try and kill one. It's just like getting one in a good spot. Like I want to stun one or something. Maybe I can do this one depending on where he's going, perhaps. Okay, let's try it. Do you think he'll just explode and kill me though? Like, I'm a bit scared. Do I go away from the body? Like, how does this work? I don't know. I was like really scared. I thought he was going to blow up on me, but he didn't. So that's weird. Maybe they're not as explosive as I thought they were going to be. I don't, I don't really know to be honest, but yeah, that was pretty easy to take down. So yeah, I don't mind, don't mind that actually. So that was good. Apparently I've already got the body of one of those like dudes with the, the like, um, the little blonde hair, the blonde haired dude. <laughs> I don't know what they're called. They're like, what are they called? Mufflers, Mum mumblers. <laughs> that was it. <laughs> I was thinking of the mu the little things that keep your ears warm, mufflers. <laughs> I don't know, it sounds similar to that, doesn't it? So it reminded me of it a bit. Okay, so yeah, we're just gonna keep giving flavoring sauce out to the little characters here and we should be able to we should be able to like still get good ratings over here hopefully anyway <laughs> so that's the plan that's the plan all right there you go i'm just gonna send off all these burgers somebody just died okay it's just a rudest but yeah seems to be going really well i'm really happy like i've been really struggling recently and i think i've finally cracked it <laughs> Like, I think I'm actually at a really good place and like a really good position with this game right now. So that makes me super happy. I like these little robots. The little dog robots, they're kind of cool actually. <laughs> they're really awesome. Only problem is because they're immortal, they might see other people getting killed by traps. So, so that's going to be a bit of a pain. But I do have a plan for this because I got this jukebox here, which calms down people. So yeah wait the flavoring sauce is not working i guess it doesn't matter if you got bad meat and they don't like the meat then i guess i guess it's not really like going to gonna like give them a good satisfactory rating then i guess so that's not working so that's a pain i'm not sure how the flavoring sauce actually like works and how it affects the burgers because i gave them a bad burger they didn't like it but the sauce didn't have enough effect on it to actually make them like it either so <laughs> i don't know i have no idea i only got it for the quest really to be honest with you so you know it's fine all right we got um an order for the police officer here you can kill these police officers but you have to be really careful because if you just start attacking them they will call their friends and you will get a five star badge like and it that that's really bad obviously you can you can definitely die there have been so many situations where i've died because of that like having the police on you with like full like rating that is the like thing that has killed me the most in this game so it's definitely like 
not not a thing you want to risk like not at all <laughs> so we're trying not to to do that but you can kill the police officers as long as you kill them in one hit if that makes sense so so if you use a trap and it does enough damage to take them out in one go then you're pretty safe so like that's how basically you know i've been dealing with this okay let's cook up some of this new species this is the brand new species here that we are cooking so that's great i really need to increase the speed of my cooking for my stoves actually it's kind of slow like I'm still on like the standard speed so it's, it's definitely like on the slow side here <laughs> is anyone suspicious of that no nah, we're good we're good there was nobody in there so we're fine at the moment so that's good okay I want to cook up this new species and try it out on this like blonde haired dude and see if he likes this so we're gonna go with fries and we are going to shall i put flavoring sauce in it as well now let's just send it off let's just send it off how it is okay i'm assuming that this guy isn't going to be a cannibal and like like his own species so i'm just going to try something i'm going to try the birds on him and see if he likes that we're going to go with bacon and we need fries and we're going to heat that up and hopefully if i've got time i don't know if we're going to have time for it but hopefully we do but we will see he's going to leave like any second so need to get this in quick okay well let's experiment and see if like this works out but it's not a big deal if it doesn't because we'll definitely find out next time so it will be fine it will be great okay let's see if he likes it do you like weird bomb meat <laughs> Let's see. <laughs> I'm curious. He does. I just found out what meat he likes just from just experimenting um, with stuff. Oh, I actually did have it already for that guy. I actually could have looked. I didn't realize. <laughs> so I actually did know that one already. But I don't know what this guy likes and what the other one likes either. So we shall see. Maybe I'll murder him if he's not satisfied. <laughs> if, you, if you're not satisfied, you don't get a refund. You get murdered. <laughs> That's how it goes in my establishment. What is that? dude doing <laughs> he's like a ballerina or something look at him go it's like spinning and everything he's going mad all right let's find out if this guy is satisfied by birds he is not satisfied by birds okay that sucks i don't know if i want to should i try it oh my god oh my god so that's how okay i just found out Okay, so if you don't stun them, they explode. Okay, now I know. I was wondering because when I fought it before, it didn't explode and I was like, huh? I thought it would explode. But it's because I killed it before it had the chance to. So if you stun them, then you're fine. But like, if you let them explode, then obviously like, that probably would kill you, actually. I would be surprised if that didn't or it probably does more than one damage anyway. I'm sure it would do a lot. So yeah, just probably not an idea, like it's probably not a good idea to even like, you know, get into that situation. I don't think I will. <laughs> I learnt that, I learnt the best way to deal with them. To be honest with you, a stunning every alien is the best way to deal with them like if you're gonna attack them physically like the best way to deal with that is definitely to stun them it helps so so much so yeah it's it's amazing all right so can we buy some information yes we can Let's buy some information on these new aliens that we just got now we can find now we know what they like to eat and it's gonna make it a lot easier to get through these days now and we also have what's this everything <laughs> immune to everything <laughs> every single thing wow i mean sure i mean <laughs> it makes sense they gotta have like one kind of customer that's just like impossible to kill and impossible to deal with i just hope that they're not like i hope that they don't get affected by the zombie virus but they're robots so it wouldn't really make sense if they did so hopefully not because can you imagine immortal zombies chasing after you like no thank you <laughs> that would be awful okay we know this one as well he likes the rudises and he also likes the um the breed eggs which i can give him I don't know about the other ones though I've never seen those so I guess it's just like we haven't encountered those just yet oh can you imagine these are zombies just going around exploding everywhere oh no that's just like <laughs> that's just terrifying I don't want to see it but I'm sure I will and it will be a very stressful time <laughs> I think <laughs> but like these things are bound to happen so we'll see I think I might say for the stove speed I'm really really feeling the stove speed right now for the extra health I think the stove speed actually and then I think I really want this invin invisibility 
um, skill as well. So I might either do this one or the stove one because they look really, really handy actually. We are on the fourth planet. I'm going to try my best. So let's go. The deck collectors won't be here this episode. I think it'll be like next episode. So yes, I think it'll be okay. We just got orbs on this um, level, which is fine. I don't think that we're going to really struggle too much with orbs so yeah I feel quite confident that we'll be able to make it through this one like pretty easily so there is that as well. Alright let's activate all our traps everything is ready we got our first customers coming in today. We now know what they like as well last episode we didn't know what their likes were or anything so I was having a real hard time serving them but now that we do know it's going to be a lot easier we're going to make money we're going to make a lot of money and it's gonna be fantastic so looking forward to that <laughs> okay all right so the rudises they like the same meat as well so we're gonna do that with lettuce get this on the go this is for order number one we got the orbs incoming but like it's not a big deal i just like run away from them orbs are just really not that bad so they're fine i'm just gonna clump them all up together and then just like let them all hit me there you go <laughs> and that's fine it's a dealt with now and i don't have to like worry about it too much all right let's put all of our stuff away we're just gonna keep cooking stuff just because it just it's just easier i just really like doing it this way i don't know if i'm the only one who plays like this but i like doing it this way anyway all right this guy here also likes those dudes or i could feed him these i only got two of them though so i think i'll stick with these for now it looks like a lot of people like to eat the Mikados. They must be like really nice. Are they called Mikados? <laughs> I don't know if they're called that. Mikananians. Why are they called them Mikanos? I think that's the planet that they're from. They're from planet Mikano, but they're called Mikanians. Lots of the, the like aliens from this planet like to eat these. So they just must be like uber tasty or something. Maybe they just taste like octopus. They look like octopus like men or something. So <laughs> I don't know. Maybe, maybe. All right. So this guy likes, he actually likes rat as well. So I could just feed him rat if I wanted to. So I got a lot more of that. Rat is so much easier to come by. Not that Rudus is really hard or anything, but just a little bit easier for sure. All right. Hopefully I still get my orders in time. It really doesn't stun you for that long either. So it's really like not that bad. So I don't really mind it too much. Let's put all of this away as well. See what else we got. Wow, I got 23 of those. When did I get so many of those? I didn't even realize, but okay. Not complaining. <laughs> someone just died over there. I need to get like an opportunity to kill someone. I might do the bomb if I like get a chance to take some of those out. Because of course, like... You know, we need some meat and we also need to do it for the quest as well. Look at the little dog just like playing like ball. It's like juggling and stuff. <laughs> That's kind of cool. I like that. That's awesome. It's cool just to see them just like doing just like random activities and stuff like that. You know, I like that. I like that a lot. <laughs> it's very cool. I got some very happy customers. So that's super awesome. I'm being attacked by orbs here. And just like everyone's just like walking past like nothing's happening. It's like this is is normal this is normal behavior i'm sure okay so wait what did you like again you're like okay you like these dudes and bacon and some egg i can do that for you sir don't worry your every need is going to be fulfilled in my lovely burger restaurant <laughs> it's gonna be great you're gonna have a great time here sir you're gonna have a fantastic time okay so is there anybody in there there is maybe i can get it done quick though just get this done quick 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 get him oh god oh god that guy like he was suspicious, but he didn't come up here. I guess I was lucky his range wasn't far enough to actually get up here. <laughs> I was really lucky there. That was a little bit risky. A little bit riskier than I would like, actually. Oh, we got some more orbs here. Okay, that's fine, though. Um, So we're going to do number six here. Okay, so it's going to be easy enough to deal with. I'm going to get stunned and my burger's going to fly everywhere. <laughs> I hate it when it does that, but honestly, it's not that bad compared to like what could happen in this game. So it's actually very tame, I would say. Okay, let's see if we can feed this one to number six. There you go. And we got a Rudus to feed as well. So we're going to do that. I'm getting through this Mykonanian meat really quickly at this point, but it's okay. So let's see if that actually counted for my quest. Let's have a look. So... 
I got... No, it didn't. Kill at least one customer during trap activation five times in a row. What does that mean? I don't know how I got 20% on it, to be honest with you. Sometimes these quests I feel are really worded badly. I remember I had a quest. I don't know if I can find it right now. But there was a quest that said that you had to kill... You had to no it said you had to serve even an even number of customers so i was doing an even number of customers but i was doing it wrong because it wanted you to serve an even number of customer orders so it'd be like you'd have to serve customer order number two and four and six and eight and not like doing like two serving two customers and then just killing all the rest like that's what i thought it meant at first and then like i had to like redo the whole thing again to get it right and i, I didn't realize like i think that the the the, like the way they word the quests on like the the quest log are sometimes worded really badly and it's like really hard to work out what it actually means by that like it's very easy to misinterpret it and think that it means something else and like that's happened to me a few times I don't know if English was their first language. I don't think it's like bad English. It's just like really easy to just not word them like in a way that is 100% understandable maybe I don't know if it's just me <laughs> maybe it's just me who like struggled with that but yeah like I I kind of found it like a little bit like confusing definitely so <laughs> that definitely hindered my progress a little bit like I remember I was trying to do that quest that even number quest for like over an hour because I was doing it wrong not because I didn't know what it wanted me to do but because I was doing it like I was doing the right thing but just like in the wrong way <laughs> so like it's very easy to like do that for sure okay so let's do number eight as well i'm gonna do this order because this one this one's not gonna die so i've got no worries about them dying and then you know and then like doing the order and then like you know they're not like here because they're dead because like that's happened so many times <laughs> but yeah got no well no worries with those dog dudes so at least that's a nice like thing that i know that whenever I get out the fridge for them is actually going to be eaten by them so like that's great okay so this is number eight we got number nine here and we gotta do a number 11 as well so let's see if we can do that maybe I'll feed them this weird thing just because I've never fed anyone this before so I kind of like want to just to just because why not <laughs> okay this one's number nine and then this one here is gonna be number 11 as well mysterious orbs have appeared I'll just let them stun me a second I am so thankful that this doesn't hurt you <laughs> like so thankful you have no idea <laughs> praise the lord <laughs> actually get to like relax a little bit all right we're gonna cook some of these up as well I think it's the end of the day now yeah so we earned quite a lot you can see how much you can actually earn in a day now like it's literally like you know nearly on like 2000 not that far off just a few hundred maybe i'll even make it up there i don't even know on 1.8 now but yeah you can earn like a, that much in just one day it's pretty decent <laughs> it's a good amount of money so i think like when you're at like this point of the game it's much easier to get upgrades much easier to save that coin up as well so it's great it's good good stuff i think it's going to be easier the more you play the easier this game is it's one of those kind of games definitely oh here comes the orbs incoming they make such weird noises as well like when they come in <laughs> so strange okay so we'll get just like cook up all our stuff okay someone just died oh it's just a rudest okay i don't think i want to cook any more up because like the day is basically ended i'm just gonna fast forward and then just end the day that would be great there you go perfect i got s rank as well so very good <laughs> very very good i'm very like happy about that so that is awesome okay let's buy some ingredients just to restart a little bit that would be awesome see what we got here some cheese some french fries i'm gonna buy this egg as well i just like to keep everything at 20 so yeah <laughs> that's what i'm just sort of going with here okay i think it's time to actually buy something i would definitely want to buy the stove speed i like i really wanted to buy that my stove sleep speed is really low oh an extra module this is an extra hot plate isn't it i've always wanted an extra hot plate so that'll be good i'm gonna increase the customer's waiting time as well so i've noticed that that has been like quite low recently and do we have have, okay so when we go into the next level we are gonna have a debt collector as well to deal with so <laughs> that's gonna be fun but we need 
to keep that like we need to keep that going so yeah it's gonna make it a bit annoying but there's only one and one is not that bad I do, at least I don't think so anyway. We need 1,500 for that. We actually already have the prestige, so that's good. That must have just happened recently, so that's interesting. There's only one new, like, alien type on the next planet. That's kind of a bit disappointing. Usually there's two, so, like, that's a bit sad, but never mind. It's okay. All right, I guess we're just going to go on to the next day. Eventually, we are going to bump into a different, like, variation, like, of day. Like, I know that's going to happen soon, and I'm a bit worried about when that moment does happen here it is it's happening now <laughs> great i knew it was going to happen like soon i just didn't know when it all just depends when the game decides to want to do it right so <laughs> there is that okay so people are queuing up for something wait am i just like that popular that i've got a queue outside my restaurant is that what's going on is it like happy hour or something i don't know wait what <laughs> what's happening i don't know are they all attacking? Are they rabid? Oh, they're like so hungry. They're attacking each other. Is that what's going on? Oh God. I don't know. I don't like the look of this. <laughs> all right, let's have a look. Collectors visit. Hungry visit. Wait, there's two at once. Oh wait, one of them is just the debt collector. So there's a debt collector outside, so he can't go outside. And then we have the actual like effect for this day is hungry visitors. Sensational due to galaxy wide activism and protests, a shortage, a shortage of natural meat has been reported. In restaurants where there is still food left, a huge number of double portion orders are expected. Oh, we have double portion orders. So you see that dude out that standing outside, that is a debt, to debt collector. I don't know if you can kill them. I think you might be able to, but I don't want to risk it. I'm just going to leave him outside and I'm just like not going to bother him. <laughs> That's what I'm going to do. He's going to be out there for a while. So I got to build this up to do the quest. So yeah, that's going to be chaotic. <laughs> the nightmare has begun. <laughs> you know, I'm just like, I'm sort of like dreading it in a way, but it's going to be interesting. So we'll see what happens. Okay. So this guy wants double patties. Do I get double pay as well? Did it say? I don't know if it did say or not. I don't know. Um, okay. So I'll just give you, I could give you two of these instead, a burger, bacon, an egg. This is okay. I think I can deal with this. This will be fine. I think that I've like, I always have a lot of stuff prepared in advance. So like, this is actually okay for me, but I can see that, I could see how some people would struggle to get like double patties. It could be like quite challenging if you don't have like the necessary ingredients prepared like I do. So I think I'm just like lucky because I do have a lot here. So that's good. All right, we're just gonna put some stuff on. I actually forgot to put my traps on because I don't know, I was just so distracted with everything else that was going on. I'm pretty sure it is possible to kill those dead collectors, but yeah. It's just not worth trying. Like, I don't think it's worth it. You can't stun them either. They're immune to stun. So yeah, they're a pain. Also, it looks like they are affected by the zombie as well. Oh god, let's hope the zombie effect doesn't come up because that's going to be awful, isn't it? Oh boy, I don't know. Oh, it annoys your customers if they see debt collectors. You see that bar? That's actually my customer being annoyed that he saw a debt collector. It doesn't increase it to the top, so it will just go back down again once he leaves. So it's not that big of a deal actually, but yeah, it's going to annoy all my customers, like just them seeing that. So like that's a bit of a pain in the butt as well. Uh, what am I doing here? Let's have a look. So, all right. I don't know if this was the order that I put out there, but I don't, I don't actually know to be honest. All right, we're going to have two of those. I'm just going to leave that there a second. And what does the bomb do? Like, I always forget. My memory is terrible. I don't think I'm ever going to be able to do an order without looking. So I do apologize if, like, that annoys you or anything. I just can't help it. I just don't have, like, the capacity to remember what everybody likes in their burgers, you know? She did the wrong bun there. So that's a bit of a pain. All right, there you go. That's the right bun, I think. I just have to wait for that to heat up and quick because the customer are just fed up of waiting I think he probably would have left already if I hadn't have got that like customer increase the customer waiting time so like I'm really glad that I got that so I feel like that guy would have left already if not for that so like that's good <laughs> that's good good stuff all right so we got a Rudus here he might go where's he going he's going for a smoke he's gonna get annoyed by seeing my debt collector but never mind you just have to deal with it man 
Imagine when I've got so many deck collectors running around that everybody's getting annoyed and just running after me all the time though. Like that's gonna be awful. I'm not looking forward to it. Like at all, it's gonna be awful. But hopefully I can calm them down with the jukebox. I think maybe we should upgrade the jukebox. Actually, I have a feeling that we're gonna need it going forward. <laughs> I have a feeling it's gonna get very chaotic around here. So yes, that's gonna be painful, isn't it? But yeah, we'll, we'll see how it goes. Okay, what do we got to deal with now? The dog? Okay, more of these. I need so much of these Mykonanian dudes I'm running out. It's getting bad. Bacon as well. Is that done? Okay, I think so. And I forgot the pickles. Yes, I forgot the pickles. Put the pickles. That's such a big burger. Like, can you imagine trying to put your mouth around that? <laughs> These guys are really greedy. This is ridiculous. <laughs> What's wrong with these guys? I hope they're giving me just like so much stuff for this. Uh, what do you like again? Um, so I'm going to give you the, the Rudises. I got quite a lot of those. Okay, avocado. You want bacon and french fries. Oh my god, these guys have got massive appetites. Okay, the Breedigs. They like uh, the Mycenaeans. So two of those. Oh, wrong burger type. Wrong burger type. Two of those. All right, there you go. That's those. This is number seven and this is number eight. So I'll do that as well. So yike, that would be, that would be good. All right, let's throw that one in there as well. Perfect. Good stuff. All right. <laughs> Everybody's having a fantastic time eating their burgers and whatnot. So that's great. And we're getting lots of money too, especially now that we're not paying off our bills. <laughs> we're just getting like so much money together now that we don't even need to do that either. I'm just going to speed it up a bit because like there's not really anything happening. I don't have any orders to do or anything. So I'm just kind of standing around twiddling my thumbs, which is not too great actually okay what do we got here we got mykonanians i gotta do two of those as well right so two of those lettuce onions i'm really running out of that stuff which sucks so badly okay i'm gonna try feed you something else i'll try feed you these i got two of these so i can do that avocado bun cheese and fries okay there's your massive stack <laughs> your huge burger it is like so massive. I can't believe how big they are. It's incredible. Okay, so two of those and what order was this again? I don't know. Hold on. Let me just put this one away. I'm a bit confused. These orders are just getting so incredibly crazy that is confusing me. Okay, so this is number 11. So this one and that's cheese, I think. So that's number 11. I think, yeah. Okay, and then we got number 12. I'm gonna do the Rudises because I have actually got a nice amount of those. And avocado burger. We need the bacon and the olives. Okay, <laughs> my God. Okay, so this is number 11. All right, now we just have to like sort of wait. I guess. All right, let's cook up some more stuff. What do I want to cook? I don't know. I need more Mykonanians. Where are they? I don't have any in my restaurant. Like, it's not... I don't think they come on this planet. So, like, yeah, I'm not going to get any more of those, sadly. Wait, what happened to the dog guy? I did feed him. What, what happened to him? Did he just... Did he not see that I put his order in or something? Oh, my God. They're cloning each other now. Oh, my God. That's so weird. Do I get extra money because they clone each other? Do they all pay me? <laughs> I don't know, probably not. <laughs> probably just just wishful thinking there, I think, isn't it? <laughs> okay, let's speed it up a little bit. Wow, my money is nearly 4,000. My God, it's amazing. It's good stuff. Very cool stuff indeed. All right, now we're just going to fast forward and we're just going to end the level, I think, because like we're basically done with this day. So we're just going to do that. There you go. I got S rank as well. Perfect. That was a good day. A very good day. I'm very happy. I'm just waiting for it all to just fall to pieces. It's not gonna be long, I reckon. <laughs> I just, I never, like, last this long. Like, it feels weird. It feels like the calm before the storm, doesn't it? <laughs> it just feels like something bad is just waiting around the corner. <laughs> and I'm just so terrified of that. Okay, what are we gonna do with our money? We got a lot of money, actually. Um, what do I wanna do? I'm gonna do deep freeze, actually. 
so we can keep some body parts and make my life easier when we die because I'm expecting to die. Let's see, what else are we going to get? Stamina, maybe? Or re recovery? Oh, invis invisibility. I wanted this. Let's get that. I actually really wanted that as well. That would be so good. One damage to cleaver hit also sounds really good as well. But I think we're going to leave it at that for now. The rest of my money I'm going to put away in the bank and like, I don't know, just in case we die. So it'll be useful any money is better than no money after all so yeah it's good let's just store it in there where it's nice and safe and secure and everything and yeah I think I'm ready to continue I'm not doing too well on these quests but wait it's on 50% finish two days with five collector in a restaurant without killing them maybe I don't need five collectors at once I thought it meant like all five at once but if it's already done halfway maybe I just need to survive two days with a collector in the vicinity I don't know I'm hoping that's what it is asking <laughs> I don't know only time will tell like I said I think that the way they word these quests is very confusing and sometimes like I haven't really known what it's wanted me to do okay so we have another um effect variation to contend with let's see what this one is all right so what are we doing we're robbing something or getting something out of the bin. I don't really know, to be honest. He's sweaty. He's been hard at work. I don't know. Wait, that that's a it's like a drone. Oh, it's like a little robot or something. Oh god, what does it mean? What does it do? I'm scared. Okay, let's have a look. Okay, evil robot. Danger, the crazy robot anarchist is on the loose again. All catering establishments are advised to remain vigilant. The insane extremist has a tendency to tamper with appliances. Oh, that sounds annoying. Can you kill it? Like, what, what does that mean? I don't know. <laughs> Okay, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. If it doesn't like actively attack me, maybe it's not too bad. Do we just leave it? Like, I don't think you can. I think like it doesn't have a health bar or anything and I don't want to like push my luck I think he's just gonna go around breaking my stuff which is fine I'll just fix it so it's not it's not that bad it could be worse like <laughs> there could be worse effects that the game could give me so I actually don't mind it that much so it's fine so yeah fixing stuff in like this game is actually not that bad so yeah it's, it's okay it's okay <laughs> I feel quite happy at the moment so we'll see how it goes going forward though at least we don't have double like me patties to give out today because like that was really like I was really going through my supply quick <laughs> I, I managed it so like it was fine but it was just like a bit much you know it's a bit much does the rudest like anything else oh that's a bit of a pain isn't it but he likes the the turtles the turtle thing so I not have any turtles I think it's these I think that means the birds yeah I think it's the birds the bird they they're, I call them birds but they're actually turtles but they look like birds they're like a weird cross between a bird and a turtle so like I kind of forget about them sometimes um so onion oh that guy just died never mind um I got this one here for order number one okay that was the only one that survived <laughs> but that's fine but yeah we got three hot plates now so like we have an extra little or, like place here to just like prepare stuff so that's good I actually don't even use the hot plates that much I only use it to heat up the like thing that I've already got so I don't actually need all three I used to put the buns on each one and then once it's cooked I used to fill them up but I don't do that anymore so it's not like you know as bad robot is going to break trap what does that mean oh god what's he done can I fix them? Or you can just fix them like this. Okay, I didn't realize they broke traps as well. It's a bit of like an annoyance, but that's all it really is. Like it's not, it's not that bad. So I don't mind. Okay, so let's just put these away. And I don't know, I'm just gonna cook up some of these as well. Fantastic. Okay, we're just waiting for some more meat to come in there and some more orders. I'm just gonna speed up a little bit just to like, you know, do some stuff. So he broke the the uh the gun up there i can't even fix it because there's a debt collector up there and i just would rather not <laughs> if like that makes sense i'd rather just stay away from that guy <laughs> no thank you it doesn't sound like a good idea all right what have we got here the breedigs they like this one and this one and the fries let's do the fries as well there we go and we got the bomb dudes and they like breed eggs or rudises so we can definitely do rudises and 
bacon. That guy just died, so that order's going back in the fridge because he's dead now. <laughs> so never mind. That's okay. Just gonna keep cooking some stuff here. There you go. Perfect. Number four. Yay! We we're not making as much money this time because there's just like people keep dying all the time. <laughs> I've not really had that many like people survive, so I feel like I haven't been making as much. We're just gonna speed up a little bit, speed the time a little bit, so we actually have some orders to like work with here. I'm so glad they have a speed up option as well. It really is handy, especially for the, those like times where you're just sat waiting. So it's really good um, for those times. I really like that. Okay, so we want onions and I'm gonna do the bird thing as well, I think. That would be good. And then we're gonna do this one, which is a Rudus, of course, and Oh, wrong, wrong, um, bun. <laughs> I did the wrong bun there for a second. And then fries. Okay, there you go. Glad I managed to get, like, some avocado buns there as well. Like, that was good. Okay, some of my traps are broken. That's all right, though. It broke this one. This one actually never gets used, <laughs> to be honest. This one, like, it chucks out poison. But, like, nobody really comes out over here very often. So it never really gets used, to be fair. So <laughs> it's not that big of a deal. Oh, I'd put that guy's order in as well. And he just got, he just got wrecked. <laughs> Rest in peace. Never mind, though. Okay, I'm gonna cook some more of these rudest dudes. Dude's gonna go break my traps. My jukebox. I like my jukebox. He's kind of slow and he takes a while to actually break stuff. It's kind of like the clogged toilets in a way. Like it's basically like the same effect apart from it affects your traps instead of the toilets. So, so it's not really that different from that I don't think. Alright, are you having a good day sir? Are you satisfied? Good. I'm glad that you're happy. If you're happy, that means I'm doing a good job. So that's great. All right, I don't know where he's going. I'm just gonna leave him to it. I'm just gonna wait over here a second. I guess I could put some more stuff on as well, I suppose. All right, let's do that. So I'm gonna cook up these as well. All right, what do we got? We got some more orders here. Let's do some more orders. That would be great. A bun, we got some bacon and some cheese. Oh, no, press the wrong one. <laughs> It just takes one little misclick as well to like ruin the whole order. <laughs> what a pain. Okay, is that everything? Did I, I think I missed, yeah, I missed the cheese. I thought I missed something. All right, there's the cheese. Okay, so we got number seven to do as well. So I'm gonna do that, just tomato. And we're gonna use this one as well. That's a really simple order, actually. I feel like I've been getting some really like intense like orders recently, but this one seems kind of simple, so that's cool. There's number seven. There you go. I'm just gonna cook some of these as well. Perfect. Everybody is happy and having a great time. Let's put these away. Cook up some of these. I'm re nearly out of raw raw meat, actually. That's okay, though. Like, we'll get some back, like, so it doesn't matter too much. Are we done? Is this my last wave? I feel like I didn't make as much money as yesterday. I made so much money yesterday and, like, not really that much today so that's a bit sad but it's okay all right there we go the day is done i got another s rank so that's good so is my quest complete let's check it out yeah so you only have to have the collectors okay i thought it meant that you had to have the bills on like collector number five or something now i can just clear it off so that's great. Yay, no more collectors to worry about, which I'm really happy about. I thought that that was gonna be so bad, but it's actually not as bad as I was thinking. So now I just need to do, I don't know how I'm gonna do 800 prestige in a day. Like that seems, that seems tough. Is there any like sources that can increase prestige or something like that? Let's have a look. Maybe there is a way to increase that. Let's have a look, let's see. More ingredients from the customers, removes all immunity, forces the customer. I think that one stalker recipe seems really good. <laughs> like that one seems like amazing for some of the quests, definitely. I've seen some quests that requires you to like kill three with one trap. Like that source would be good again, like would be good for those kind of quests, definitely. Let's see, reduces customers' irritation to a minimum. Maybe that would help a little bit with, you know, getting prestige but maybe you would just have to wait for the right effect to come up because I know that some effects increase prestige 
a little bit more than usual. So like if you have critics, for example, I'm pretty sure you get more prestige from critics and stuff like that. So maybe you would like just have to wait for like that opportunity or something. I don't really know to be fair. I'm not really sure. So yeah, I just basically just need to finish the quest so we can move on. Like uh, we've already seen everything on this planet now. We've seen all of the effects. Um, so all we've really got to do is just like complete the quest and then just like move on really because like we've already seen all the effects and there's not really anything else to see there. We've already like done most of the stuff so that's cool we've been on a roll recently I've been really happy with our progress we've been doing fantastically and just knocking out all of these things so it's super cool but I suppose I could do another day or two or something like why not <laughs> still still a bit of time left so yeah let's do a little bit more or something see what pops up maybe we'll get the zombie one again I wouldn't mind like doing the zombie one again I like <laughs> I want to I want to like conquer it oh good we got the critics fantastic do you know what we are not gonna put traps on today and we are going to serve every single customer that walks into my establishment just so we can get that prestige so like that's the plan that's gonna be great um so yeah <laughs> that's gonna be awesome let's see how much prestige we can rack up in one day so we need 800 of it so <laughs> that's the plan I'm gonna have to get rid of those Don protesters so that's really the only thing I've got to deal with is the protesters they are a nuisance they are annoying but they're not that bad so it's fine okay we got our first order let's deal with that so we got rudis's and you want an egg i can do that for you my friend we're probably gonna make a lot of money today as well if nobody's dying we're gonna make a lot of money and a lot of prestige and it's gonna be fantastic actually it's gonna be great we got a rudis for this guy as well i got the wrong bun haven't i yes i got the wrong bun rudis and you want bacon and fries okay i think i got your order all sussed out my friend there's order number one all right good stuff we got some more protesters we want to get rid of those i think they do get rid of prestige but like i think that they have to actually be in your like place for a while for it actually to decrease your prestige so it does take them a long time to actually be able to pull that off <laughs> so they're not that bad okay this is number two there you go have a lovely meal sir Let's cook up the rest of this at least all my meat will be all like done and stuff as well so that's good I suppose and I don't know what else like what other quests did I have let's see the other quests I had was for killing customers so like I guess I'd have to do it on a, di on a different day I feel like we should definitely do that on a different day just so we don't mess up like this perfect opportunity that we were just like given like I was literally just saying like <laughs> if we had a like critic day it would be perfect for that quest so I just like really just lucked out there I think I think the game heard me <laughs> it knew what I wanted so <laughs> I'm thankful for that actually. So we're gonna put some egg in here and what else? I'll do the turtle. You can have the turtle thing today and a rudis or we can use we're gonna use the rat actually he likes a rat too so egg and cheese so let's do that get out of here and this one here is for number three i just need that one to heat up so i'll go and take the protester out whilst i'm up there as well can you move out the way sir god <laughs> you're in the way all right this one is number four perfect i don't think i've got anything to cook right it feels weird not having anything to cook you know i'm so used to just cooking something up like all the time but that's okay all right let's speed up a little bit just because I don't have any orders or anything to do get rid of these protesters get out of here your pain's in the butt like why are you going to a burger place to protest go somewhere else <laughs> like you're not even gonna impact anything <laughs> like go someplace else that actually cares <laughs> everybody here just wants to eat a nice meat filled burger okay just deal with it it's just how it goes <laughs> you can't put your your like your opinions and your morals on everybody else <laughs> like, it's not gonna happen it's just like not everyone's gonna follow them it just doesn't go that way you know everybody is different and have different views <laughs> it's like the way it goes all right you little mechanadian oh, yeah. dude out there out you go <laughs> all right let's see what we got now let's have a look so another one of these with an avocado bun with fries I got your order sir don't worry it'll be with you in two shakes and we could do a 
do a pink dude. Let's do a pink dude. It's been a while since I cooked up a pink dude, actually. So that'll be good. Okay, it says number five. Alrighty, good stuff. Just wait for this, this like bun to finish, like, you know, heating up. And there you go. Perfect. We got some protesters on the way. That's the only one. Just speed up a little bit. That would be great. Okay. See, we're doing such, such a good job right now. Wait, somebody wasn't satisfied. I think. Yeah, the top one. Oh, and I feed them you the wrong me i thought i gave you the right one. Oh, that sucks i lost a bit of prestige there because of that so that's annoying hopefully it's not enough to like you know make an impact on like the level and stuff i hope not anyway i guess we'll just have to see though all right i do have an order here but i'm sure we'll be fine so we're gonna cook this one and tomato easy peasy let's just speed up a little bit all right let's put that one in this is for number seven okay good stuff and oh is there something else i can use for that okay let's have a look oh man i'm running out i'm running out <laughs> what do i do um do I actually have anything? I don't think I got anything he likes. Oh wait, I got this one. Yeah, I got this one. He'll he'll eat this. It's fine. But yeah, I'm starting to run out of like stuff here. <laughs> it's getting a little spicy. It's getting a little spicy for sure. All right, let's get rid of this protester. Out you go. And this one as well. It just came through at just that time, just that moment. That was perfect for me to just kick him out give him the old boot all right there you go just speed up a little bit more we're on the last wave already man i was hoping we'd get like some more people coming in here i don't know if i have made 800 prestige or not i don't know i'm hoping so but i honestly couldn't tell you all right let's just wait for these peoples to go oh i got protesters coming in as well let's kick those out there you go perfect i'm just gonna wait in here for my next orders if there are any next orders that actually might be it yeah i think that's actually it okay protesters are here again get out of here there's another one down here as well and there we go just gotta wait for this person to leave could you oops <laughs> could you leave please i'm pressing the wrong buttons I'm trying to speed up not press that <laughs> that's okay though all right where you going i can't get them fast enough when i'm trying to <laughs> when i'm trying to like do this okay how much i don't think i actually made the prestige um sadly it's gonna be a bit of a pain 800 prestige is a lot but yeah i didn't i didn't quite make it so that sucks that sucks a lot it's just the way it goes it's fine it's all right okay let's get some stuff here there we go just gonna get some ingredients of course and you know make sure to pay my bills now as well like that would be so so good let's pay my bills there you go my bills are all cleared everything is great <laughs> intriguing let's purchase this one so we're going to derivos and we have one new effect only one new effect we have like a pirate looking like picture logo i don't know whatever it is so yeah not actually that much happening on this planet which is a little sad there's usually like more new things on it but i don't know there has been a lot of things that have like been popping up Finally, you have reached something that looks like a city. This is certainly not a metropolis, sparkling with mirrored high rises, but it is a little more difficult to die here. Derivos was even once a thriving colony of Mykonanian conglomerate. Oh, okay, fashion shows were held and the leaders of the nation discussed plans for the future and the factories have supplied the best metals in the galaxy. It is a pity that this eco scandal happened later and only a cabaret bar remained of the former luxury okay it doesn't seem like there's much happening on this planet does there but we'll see maybe it will surprise me you know we also do have enough reputation to go to the next planet as well that next planet looks brutal look at that it's like a skull it looks so cool i can't wait to get to that one and also the new alien type looks really interesting on that one too but that's for another day <laughs> let's just see if we can tackle this i'm actually not that far like my days aren't as high as it was last time either so <laughs> yeah it's not as much for sure i didn't actually remember what day i was on actually but definitely not as far as the the first run my record is still day 34 right now i think i always seem to like i haven't managed to like get past that so far <laughs> that's been my record definitely i wonder if i'll get past it one day i'm sure i will i want to get the skins <laughs> so we have to uh, sometime okay so we're going to this new planet there it is just like uh yeah it doesn't look that weird 
just looks like loads of high buildings, a very posh area or something. Yeah, look look at all the Mykonanians like doing their fashion shows. <laughs> they got such weird outfits. <laughs> What's going on? This is like Hollywood or something. Hollywood for aliens. I like that. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> our bright past. Look at them with all the little hovercrafts and everything. One day this is what our planet will look like. It will be filled with aliens and hovercrafts. <laughs> our great future. It looks like there's pollution or something, doesn't it? Like, at least in that, like, poster, but I don't know. Oh, there's homeless people as well. Oh, that sucks. But, you know, maybe they'll make good burgers. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> that looks like an interesting alien there, like, on the end of the loading screen. I wonder what that is. I wonder if that's in the game. I don't know. Probably. But we will see. All right, so we are on day 21 right now. There's not going to be any effects because they never usually give you effects. Um, oh, I had a bit of lag there, actually. Yeah, they never really give you effects like when you first start, actually, so we should be fine. Okay, so this is our new alien. He's called an Onbeg... Onbegrick or something? Okay, interesting. He's very weak. He's only got two health, so that's interesting. All right. These mysterious ghosts appeared from the depths of space. No one knows anything about their origin or culture. They are extremely silent and show little interest in most worldly activities, but they have a weakness for a variety of pleasures and they are also extremely dangerous. No one has yet succeeded in killing an on be Grick on the first try. Perhaps this is why many people prefer to refine their fighting skills on ghosts. Even the police ignore any violence in their direction. Are they really that strong? They only look like they got two health bars though. There are legends that these creatures are the souls of the dead in space, hovering in search of their last vivid emotions and peace. Maybe it's a great burger that will help them free themselves from their torturous existence? <laughs> I like how they put that in there, that's funny. Just don't make a mistake with the recipe. The dissatisfied screams of on Gricks make everyone nervous. Oh no, really? Okay. Interesting. So if we get their burger wrong, they're going to be very unhappy and they're going to cause my other customers to be very unhappy too. That's an interesting take on it though, definitely. Okay, let's go set up our traps for today. Actually, that would be really cool. Let's see if uh, these guys like my establishment. I hope that they do. <laughs> Welcome to my establishment, fine sir. I don't know if you could should go in that room. Well, they're not that bad to take down. He died really easily. I didn't even have to do anything. So that was uh, fantastic. <laughs> so yeah, uh, I don't think we're going to have any problems with these guys. I think this is going to be an okay planet somehow. I think we're going to be a-okay actually. So that is cool. Maybe I can focus on my quest then. I don't know. <laughs> we'll have to see. All right, I don't actually even have anything to cook, so I'm just going to focus on just, you know, feeding up the customers, that kind of thing. Getting a bit of money together would be great. Oh, someone just activated a trap. Oh, it's one of the rats. <laughs> I see. But yeah, this doesn't seem that different from other planets, but it's okay. It's all right. I'm just, like, happy to have made it here. I've made it here, and it makes me happy. You know, so it's like, it was tough getting here. So I'm glad about that. Okay, so this is the bird and he likes the rats and some salmon. So I'll give him that. There you go. I'm sure he'll be super happy with that as well. Should I try the toxin? Should we try it? Did I make any? I'm not sure if I made any actually. I don't actually think I did. I'll have to look into that, see if I can make some for the next level. That would be really good. How am I going to make people panic? I need to make people panic. I need the collector one I can't do, and I think I can't do the toxic one. But maybe if I make people panic, I think I could do that with this guy. Maybe after he's eaten, I might do it. Or maybe I'll do it with this guy over here. I could do it with this guy over here. I will get a police rating for it, though. Like, I'll get a police badge for it, but, like, it's not that big of a deal. He'll run away, and he's now in a panic, and you have to let him leave in a panic. And I'm really close to finishing the quest, so I just want to, like, just do it, and I'll get a police badge for it. But there you go. Is that now complete? Yeah, that was it. That's all I needed to do. So for the rest of the day, there's not really anything for me to, like, work towards for the rest of the day now, so I'm just going to do a normal day. I think because I don't have any toxins. Wait, why is there more people running? <laughs> what did I do? Are there even more people that are upset? 
Did they did they see something? I don't know. I've actually still got blood on my clothes, so that's probably not a great idea. I don't know. Oh, he's going for a smoke, so that's fine. I don't need to worry about him. So we're we're good. We're good. Did I get that meat? That like new meat from that new species? Yeah, let's cook that up. I've only got one. I think usually you get a couple. Oh, that's weird. In the saucepan, you can see their eyes still. <laughs> it's just really weird. Like, you don't usually see that when you're, like, cooking up the meat. I just find that really bizarre, but okay. <laughs> oh my god, that's really disturbing. I'm cooking up ghosts. It changes colour as well, like, completely. Interesting. Okay, let's put this away. We got, like, one of these cooked up now for the future, if we ever need one. I don't know if he's... He's probably going to get killed. They like going in the VIP rooms. It's a good thing, though, because... We do need to get their meat, so I'm just kind of like wanting him to to like die, basically. <laughs> we can get some good stuff there, so that would be that would be really awesome. But we shall see. But yeah, I'm looking forward to like getting some of these quests done too. That would be awesome. Okay, let's see. Shall I do? Let's do the bird dude. So we got rat for this guy. So super easy person to serve. We're gonna do egg. Oh, I think he just died. Yeah. Yep, he just died. <laughs> the ghost dude died. <laughs> so that's good because we definitely need to collect some of his meat together because obviously I don't have any of it. So that'll be good. Also, I don't know what he likes either. So I don't think I'd be able to feed him. So it definitely would be best to just kill them for now until we get the information that we need from them. So that'll be good. What was I doing? I was doing the... Yeah, I was doing this dude look at all the meat we got now we just got like so much stuff here now don't we it's amazing all right who just died it was one of the rat dudes okay that's fine i'm feeding number eight right now number six i think it's just a rat so like i might actually just kill him for the meat actually because i don't have that much rat meat anymore so i'm just gonna take him down actually let's do that i'm on a murdering rampage today look at me go i've only got one customer everybody else is dead <laughs> Rest in peace, everyone. <laughs> That's what happens when you come to my establishment. You all die. <laughs> you all become mince meat for my burgers. <laughs> oh, I got two patties that time. I feel like I didn't get two last time. I don't know. Maybe something weird happened. I don't know entirely what happened there, but it's fine. All right, I'm just going to speed it up a little bit because there's just no one really in my establishment right now. Give me, give me this. I'm going to put it in my fridge. All right, there we go. Yeah, I'm just going to speed it up a little bit, get some people in here. We don't have any effects either, so nothing for us to worry about, which is nice. Very nice indeed. We're just going to speed up just a little bit longer. Just, yeah, because I was waiting for like people to come in and die because I knew that was going to happen. <laughs> so I was just kind of waiting for that that moment someone else just died who was it it was a rat okay that's fine that's fine okay we got some pineapple and some salmon for the bird so that's for you there is another one as well so we'll feed that one too and one just likes pineapple the birds have really weird like taste like they'll ask for like i've had an order from them before where they've been asking for like pineapple and like salmon and like olives and like such weird things in their burgers it's like i think that those creatures definitely have the weirdest taste buds out of like all the customers that you can get in this game <laughs> like i have never seen such weird burgers it's just like an abomination like i don't know what's wrong with these people but <laughs> hey that's just the way it goes i guess oh another trap has been activated somebody died i think i don't know i don't know who that was I'm not too sure, but it's fine. It's all good. Okay, so what is going on now? I guess we're just waiting again. <laughs> I'm feeling, fulfilling my orders too quick. I mean, I'm getting a lot of people dying as well, so there is that too. It's not leaving me with a whole lot to do. <laughs> I got a C. That wasn't too bad. That was super easy, actually. So that was pretty good. That was good stuff. Let's just, like, get a couple of buns here. That'll be awesome. There you go. Just restock our supplies. Probably don't need to like buy as much as I am buying like every single day. But I don't know. It's just kind of like a habit at this point. So I always do. I got to clear my police rating. I'll probably just put 200 into that. So we got a debt collector coming tomorrow. So I'm going to attempt to kill one. If we fail, then I'll probably just do a normal day. Because like... 
I've got some money in here so I can get a second chance. So we don't want to push it too much, right? Oh, the toxin. Let's go check out the toxin. Can I make them? I don't know how you make the toxin, actually. Where do you get that little weird ear thing from? Oh, I need to buy the information as well on this, like, new breed thing too. So let's do that. It should be here. There it is. All right, now we know, like, what they like and that kind of stuff. So that's good. They're immune to stun. They're immune to, like, most of the sources. They're immune to poison, and I think that's a sauce as well of some kind. I did not actually had that sauce before. Tino, Tino Spyric? Like, what? It, what is that? <laughs> I have no idea. Interesting. Okay, he's not immune to the pole dance and, like, the gun, and there's a few things that you can get him with there, so he's definitely, like, not completely immune. So where am I gonna get? Maybe it's from the deck collector. Actually, it's from the deck collector. So in order to get Toxin... Yeah, you have to kill the deck collector. You can see the parts that drop from each species once you, like, you know, put your cursor over them. So in order to get this toxin... So we just need to go on a mad rampage on the deck collectors. And I've just... I've not... I've been avoiding it because I feel like... I feel like they're going to be strong and I'm, I've been a bit like scared to tackle them. I'm going to put my money away in case that we do die. It's not like massive amount or anything, but every little helps. So, so I'm just going to put everything we've got away and I guess we're going to try this. <laughs> I don't know how I'm going to kill them because they're immune to stun as well. I don't know if they're immune to guns. Are they immune to guns? Shall we try? Let's have a look. They're not immune to guns. So I could try and get him with the gun. So like this, let's, let's try try him with that. And then, hey, that wasn't bad at all. He died in one hit. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm really shocked. I thought that was going to be so much harder than what it was. I've just, I've just been like a complete baby about it. Because like I've seen those deck collectors and they look so intimidating. And I've just been like absolutely terrified to deal with them. But that wasn't even that bad i'm really surprised <laughs> so it didn't count for my quest so i really do have to kill three collectors in 60 seconds as well like oh my god that's like quite a lot that it's asking me we have to get our debt up as well my debt's not even like anywhere near that so <laughs> i got work to do for sure <laughs> so that's gonna be a pain we still haven't got a new effect or anything like that just yet so we're gonna have to wait for something like that to come up i'm sure it will i like this little piranha plant in the corner i wonder if this is a trap i've never actually like i don't remember seeing anything maybe it's just decoration or something i'm not too sure actually we're getting a nice supply of those ghost dudes together. So that's great because we definitely need to get some more of their meat because I still don't feel like I have enough of it. So the more the merrier, right? So that's going to be great. All right. I'm going to feed the bird. Wait, is it double? Oh, it's double meat day. I didn't realize it was double meat day today. That's all right, though. Because that means we'll get extra money as well. So that's good. Are you a... I think that's actually a rat. I'm pretty sure it is. Okay. We're getting through a lot of this rat meat today, though, I have to say. So this is for number four. This one here will be for number three as well in a second. Don't feel like I have that many customers coming in. Oh, my God. This is the first time I've had debt collector meat as well. So I've been too much of a wimp to actually deal with them <laughs> so that's interesting it's cool that we got some of these because there is actually some aliens that really like to eat deck collector meat surprisingly <laughs> i've actually seen some aliens that have that but they also have like other preferences as well so i just like haven't fed them deck collector meat because i didn't have any so there is that too but yeah that's gonna definitely make me like try and get deck collectors in the future as well it seems that they, they don't come back like once you kill them like that's it they don't seem to respawn probably only come back like the next day or something I don't really know I don't know if that affects like your bills like I don't know if it goes up higher if you kill the deck collectors it probably doesn't affect it that much to be honest with you but it's really interesting uh, for sure that you can just take them down without any like consequences like I was expecting a consequence if I'm being honest <laughs> those ghosts just cannot survive in my restaurant like every single time they die <laughs> i'm gonna get loads of meat from them it's gonna be a fantastic actually okay so i have the rudest two rudest meats lettuce tomato all right that's the number eight done and we got tomato and 
two more Rudis for you as well. Hopefully they don't die because that would be bad. I'm sort of, okay, one did die. I'm sort of remembering some of the meat from some of them, but not all of them. Okay, so that's this one we need. This is a big order. Salmon, egg, and pineapple. Yes, I think. <laughs> okay, one of them died. This one here died, so I'm going to put that back in the fridge. But this one here, number seven, is still alive. And this is for number nine, so I'm going to send those off. Perfect. Okay, we got some more things on the go as well. Perfect. We're about to get some more meat together as well now. There you go. Two more patties. Very nice. We'll cook those up too. I can just hear their souls screaming as they're being fried on my frying pan. Can you hear it? <laughs> it's like, ah, don't cook me, Moti. <laughs> but I'm sorry. That's just how things have got to be. <laughs> I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. It's just like, I got to feed my customers, you know. We got some very hungry patients today, like clients even. They're very hungry today. They want double the, the meat. So I got to deliver. <laughs> I got to deliver for all of them. That ghost guy's probably gonna die. Like, they love going into the VIP room. It's like the first place they go. And they just, little do they know, it's just a, like a complete death trap. Here he goes. <laughs> into the death trap he goes. He just can't help himself. Oh, he avoided it. But he'll probably get killed on the way out, if I'm being honest. So <laughs> he probably won't last that long. I don't suspect he'll last long anyway. All right, I think that's a natural rat. There's a lot of like rat customers in on this planet which I wasn't expecting because they're really easy to deal with. Like, this is a, I think this is an easy planet actually, like so far anyway. So yeah, oh, there he goes. That guy got murdered. <laughs> he is no longer of this world. Well, he wasn't of this world anyway, but he's definitely not anymore, <laughs> apparently. Okay, I'm really going through this map, this rat meat, like quick. I'm wondering if I should use an alternative or something. I'm not really sure here. I got a few orders here, so we'll put these orders in. Some cheese as well. Okay, got you. So this is for number 12. There you go. And I got more rat here too. My god. And some cheese. I never thought that I would be low on rat if I'm being honest because rat was something that was really easy to come by on the first level. But then when you start going to like other planets and stuff, you don't really see the rats as much so yeah they don't appear as much so it's a little bit more like it's harder to come by definitely I'm a bit sad that I fed that pink guy and then he died especially considering I gave him double meat as well but hey look how much money we're getting like I started this level with zero so we've basically earned exactly 2,000 on this one which is really really good really good amount I would say so I'm pretty happy about that <laughs> yay good stuff all right I think that's the day over I think we have conquered it I got an S rank that time very nice indeed so can I make some toxin now since I killed one of them I can make two toxins so that's good we can start working towards that quest as well so I'm very happy about that too all right let's see here just resupply a little bit over here so that will be really good actually some pineapple a little bit of salmon okay I'm thinking I might either I'm either going to store this money or I'm gonna use it I'm not entirely sure what I want to do with it just yet actually I don't know wait let me check my my bills a second I just want to see okay so we're getting close to having two collectors now we're getting very close to that point let's have a look I might use it maybe I'll use a bit and then store the rest maybe that would be a good work around actually we shall see let's have a look an extra stove i don't think i need an extra stove if i'm being honest stamina though maybe a stun hit activate all the traps remotely seems kind of useful actually what do you think shall we do it activating all the traps remotely though most of them have have motion sensors on them to be honest so i don't know how useful that would be <laughs> i think i'll go for stamina recovery actually because every like stamina is really important in this game and i feel like that would be a really good one to go with i got 300 left i'm just gonna store the rest away like for a for another day for a rainy day for a day where i die and i need second chance probably <laughs> but yes I think I'm ready to continue and see what today brings. Oh, here we go. We got one of the effects happening. Oh God. All right, let's see. Show me what you got. Come at me. I'm ready. Okay, so there's a prison. 
and it exploded. Oh, we got convicts coming into our establishment. Oh God. Oh no. <laughs> They're really hungry after breaking out of prison. Oh boy. So what does this mean? Do you think they'll like start fights with like the customers and stuff? Like, I'm curious actually. Wanted criminals. Okay, a killed criminal equals money reward. An escaped criminal equals prestige penalty. Okay. Oh God. Attention. Good Burger has a chance to serve its people today and not in the way it usually does. Insiders say that several unpleasant and rather dangerous individuals will be dropping in. Runaways from... Waturgeon Jail, I think that says, as you might have guessed. The police have already promised to pay for each murdered villain. The police want me to murder villains. Excuse me. <laughs> and at the same time to forgive one sin for each criminal head. We hope that the chef of our favourite diner will once again amaze the public. After all, if any criminal escapes from his restaurants, the inhabitants of the galaxy will not be delighted. So I can't let any of these criminals leave. They have to die. Do I feed them first and then kill them? <laughs> That's the qu that's the question, isn't it? I don't know. All right, we gotta kill another debt collector. So like that, let's like let's start with that. Oh god, oh god, it's not it's not going too well. Oh no, oh no, I'm trapped. Um, I'm gonna have to kill him like the old-fashioned way. Never mind. Okay, well <laughs> that didn't go according to plan, but it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Oh my god, he was not as tough as I thought that he would be. I panicked a little bit there, so I actually lost health because I panicked mostly. I probably could have done that without, like, you know, without losing health, but I panicked, so it is the way it goes sometimes. Sometimes the unexpected happens, you know? Are you a criminal? You, I don't know how you tell which ones are criminals and which ones aren't criminals. He kind of looks like his clothes are different though, so perhaps he is? I don't really know. Is there a way to find out? Like, I have no idea. <laughs> I have no clue. I don't know, I guess I'll just keep my eyes peeled and then just like, see what happens. I suppose, do you think I should just kill everyone? <laughs> I don't know. I have no idea. Most people in my establishment end up dying anyway. <laughs> I don't know. Um, you lose prestige, but I don't know how much prestige. So I don't know. I can't even kill this guy because he's impervious anyway. So I don't know. I feel like it's this guy. I feel like everybody else is fine. But this guy just looks different compared to the other ones. So I reckon this guy here is probably the criminal. Oh, okay. He spotted that. But wait, I can just move him over here and just get him killed that way. There you go. I don't know, like, <laughs> I wish I knew if he was the criminal or not, but I'm not too sure. But hey, he's dead anyway, so, you know, that's not going to be a thing that happens because he's dead now, so it's fine. <laughs> okay, well, let's just, like, carry on. Let's just do a normal day and we'll just see, like, what happens. Like, I'll find out. Like, if, like, I end up losing loads of prestige, then I will know and I'll be like, oh, that's what a criminal looks like. Like, so, you know, that will, that will be helpful, I think. Oh, someone just went. I think I was a bit slow, I guess. I have been a bit slow, actually. I've been more interested in, like, finding out what these criminal dudes look like. So, yeah, I was a bit slow there. My bad. <laughs> I was just, like, seeing what was happening, you know? You never know what's going on. <laughs> you never know. Okay, I gotta feed people toxin as well, so we gotta do that too. I haven't got... I'm not gonna get the de debt collectors, but I might be able to do the toxin today. So I'm gonna try and tackle that as well. Hello, good sir. I have some lovely burgers for you. There you go. Enjoy your burger. Enjoy. I hope it's delicious and nutritious, filled with lots of protein. Yes, sirree. That's what my establishment offers. <laughs> Hello, sir. Welcome. Come and take a seat and make sure you go to the VIP room because you definitely won't die. You definitely will be fine. <laughs> I swear. <laughs> Are you going to the VIP room, sir? Good. I'm glad. I'm glad that you are. That's fantastic. <laughs> Here he goes. <laughs> he made sure that the pink guy survived. See, he was, he was, it was a worthy cause. It was definitely a worthy cause. <laughs> nice. Good stuff. <laughs> I like that. Oh, hello. Oh, you're definitely a criminal. He looks completely different. Oh, maybe this is my first criminal. Maybe. I thought that the ghosts were the criminals, but maybe not. You can definitely tell with this guy. I wonder what kind of thing he will order. I'm really curious, actually. What's your order number? Order number eight. He's just doing a normal order there. I just got to find an opportunity to 
to take him down, actually. I could feed him a laxative and make him go to the toilet, but then he might just go to the wrong toilet because only one of the toilets like actually kills you. So there is that because only one of them has the trap. So I don't know. We'll just see how it goes, I guess. I don't know. We'll, we'll see. We'll see. Okay, let's put some meat on the go here. Make sure we're keeping this all supplied and stuff. That would be fantastic. I got loads of food and stuff coming in now. So that's great. Uh, lettuce. There we go. Let's put this in. Oh, the criminal died <laughs> by himself. I didn't even need to do anything. He just got himself killed just like on his own. So <laughs> that was handy. That was really handy. Uh, this is the right one, right? Yeah, this is order number nine. There you go. Perfect. All right. Let's put some meat over here as well. I'm just going to put this in the fridge as well. There we go. It's going really well. I'm always really surprised when it goes well. <laughs> it, this doesn't happen. Like this, this is like a rare occurrence. <laughs> but you know, I have actually put a lot of hours into this game. I'm currently on about 26 hours. So <laughs> I've put a lot of time into this game, just like repeating days and just like messing about with it and I've just had so much fun with it it's really addicting I don't know I just like I love the gameplay loop for it I just find it really like addicting and like it kind of gives you that adrenaline rush sometimes when you got like a customer that you gotta try and like take down you have to try and work it out I think that's really fun okay we got another criminal over here at least there is a big like you can tell which ones other criminals so, so that's good now I know what they look like so that's good to know <laughs> actually because I was unsure for a while but everything is just kind of just playing out by itself I don't even really need to make much input here it's really it's really easy actually I have to say this dude here can I get him with the gun or is he immune to it he is not immune to it I could take this dude down with the gun actually let's do that Oh, he's not coming close enough. I need to expand the radius on this. It's really not very big, so I should do that. That would make it a lot easier to take down people. But he's going to go get himself killed in the VIP room anyway, so it'll be fine. I don't think I need to worry about it. There he goes. <laughs> he's down. Just because I just want to keep getting meat still. How much have I actually got now? I've got 12 meat from those ghost things but I must get more it is not enough I like to be very fully prepared so yes we need more okay all right yes going going well it's nearly closing time we are you know like a couple of seconds uh, from closing up shop today but we've made quite a bit of money so that's great what is this guy doing you survived this guy survived the VIP room. He is a winner. <laughs> the first time anyone has, any ghost has ever survived that room is a miracle. I'll feed you. To celebrate your victory, you get food. <laughs> oh my god, what's happening? Uh, what do I want to feed you? I'll feed you a police officer. You like police officer? I can feed you police officer if you like. <laughs> that would be absolutely fine. No problemo. That would be awesome. Oh, got a bit of spike there. I don't know why that keeps happening today. I'm not really sure, but it's fine. All right, there you go. Order number 11. There you go, my friend. All right, have some lovely food. You deserve it for surviving, you know? So I'm very proud of you. <laughs> You're not a criminal, are you? <laughs> I don't know. I can't tell. Like, they do. It does look a little bit pale I was thinking maybe it was a bit discolored but no I think he's fine actually that's probably I think that's how they always look so I think they're fine all right there you go and the day is over what what is that what was that on the floor I don't know <laughs> he dropped some weird thing on the floor and I picked it up I don't know what it did maybe it scares customers or something I'm not too sure we're just going to speed it up I was on like fast forward so like I really have no idea <laughs> so I couldn't tell you but we did it and we got an S rank today as well oh yeah I forgot to feed toxins to people didn't I but you know you need a few of them like I need to add toxin sauce to three customers and kill them so I need to do like a couple so I couldn't have completed it anyway like even if I wanted to so there is that as well all right I'm gonna need to replenish my my life as well that would be a really good idea so let's do that some nice medi kits perfect I got 900 money do I want to use it increase my washing speed huh? now I'm just gonna store it all for now 
now. That would be a uh, that would be good actually. All of it's just gonna go in here, and then I don't know. I'm sure I'll use it at some point. It's really handy just to have that in there. Really, really handy, definitely. Okay, let's go. Next day, 17 more days to get the zombie skin. It's taking a while to get that one, huh? Okay, today's special is collectors and meteor showers. Huh? Oh, not meteor showers. I don't like meteor showers that much, but it's okay. We'll be okay. All right, here we go. We got the deck collector. Oh, I messed up again. We're just gonna take him down the old-fashioned way. That's fine. It's all good. I actually can take them down that way, so I don't really need to rely on the, the trap if I don't want to. I could have even let the meteors just kill him. If I just left him outside, he probably would have just died from meteors, I reckon. <laughs> so that would have been, like, good, I guess. I don't know. All right, who has just got, like, really low, like, life? Like, let's have a look. I think the ghosts have, like, the least amount of life, but would it kill them though that's the question hmm i'm not too sure what's happening down here oh it's another debt collector oh i had got two now oh god and the police are here wait why have i got why i just instantly went to five like maybe it's because the debt collectors are here so he like saw it and then i just instantly like went up like that really sucks okay i'm gonna be like careful then i think the debt collectors might make the police like alert and now i'm gonna have to pay that off which is annoying but it's fine i'll deal with it i'll just have to i'll just have to kill him like once the police are gone it's, i don't think it's a good idea to do it right now so we'll wait until the police have like finished their investigation before i like do anything about that i also don't think it's a good idea to use the toxin whilst the police are here as well it's a little bit of a risk so i don't think it's a good idea hello you don't even have a not even suspicious i'm surprised at that oh someone just died i don't know where they died i hope that they died from a trap and they didn't just die from meteor otherwise i'm gonna be in trouble oh god oh no oh, that skill's really useful <laughs> i've got a skill that turns you invisible I just have to press the left trigger and I go invisible and it's really useful for when the police are after you. I can't tell you the amount of times it's saved me. <laughs> so yes, definitely get the invisibility skill because when you've got loads of suspicious police officers roaming about, it's so very useful to just hide away and like they, they don't know anything. So it's great. Can you guys go already? Oh my God, <laughs> these guys are annoying. I'll take out that debt collector for sure after this is over. It's just a pain. They, they just like, they stay here for such a long period of time too. Oh, oh god, I got a bit scared. <laughs> I just like want to hurry them up a little bit. They're just taking forever. Can you go? I, like, I don't even have anyone to like serve or anything. It's usually quite safe by this, um, by this fridge. It's usually safe by this fridge anyway. It's usually where I stay. Apart from when there's meteors just landing on my head. That's obviously not too safe, but usually it's all right here. There's also a ghost over there. He's probably going to get himself killed, but that's okay. Sometimes when you have the meteors, there's like a really awful like popping sound that the game makes that really like throws me off guard. It doesn't do it that often, so it's not that big of a deal, but there's definitely some kind of like audio glitch with the meteors I've noticed. <laughs> it's not that bad though. All right, they're finally leaving. Like, thank God. All right, are they all gone? They're all gone. Now we can deal with the debt collector. How am I going to do this? Shall I put the motion sensor on and just let him get punched? There you go. That solved that pretty easily, I have to say. So that was great. <laughs> I need a better strategy in place to deal with those though. But that's okay for now. Oh, I'm surprised that ghost survived. That ghost actually lived. He survived the VIP room. Are my traps on? Did I put them on? I thought... Oh, I haven't even put them on because I just got the police. The police were there just like so early. So I guess I just didn't have the, the chance to do it. So that would probably be why everybody's still alive. <laughs> I'm assuming. So... Yep, that's a pain. I think this is this guy's gonna like this guy's totally just gonna gonna walk out. He's gonna leave because I just like I didn't have time to do it. So yeah, he's he's gonna go sadly. So that sucks. My reputation, no, <laughs> my reputation. My like my it's been so good, and now now people are leaving. <laughs> Makes me very sad. Oh, oops, <laughs> my bad. <laughs> that that did not mean to happen. Oh, that guy down there just died. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh god, don't don't notice him. It's fine. <laughs> just you just see like a little pancake thing on the floor. It's so weird looking. 
<laughs> it's so strange. I don't even know. I don't think you get anything for that though. Um, yeah, this has been uh, an awful day. I haven't really made that much money and now I've got like four police badges as well. This has been an awful day. We're not closed yet so I might still be able to get a bit of money but I need at least 350 to clear those p police sirens so I really do need a little bit of money. That was actually really close. I nearly got hit by that meteor. That would have been bad. That would have been very bad. Okay. It's a little bit calmer now. So that's good. I think that we should... Number eight. Order number eight. I'm going to use Toxin on. I'm going to try and kill him with Toxin. And just like see how that goes. Okay. So Toxin. Which one? This one here is Toxin. He's lost a little bit of life. So I feel like it might be possible for the Toxin to just straight kill him. But I guess we will see. We will see. So this is for order number eight. Let's hope that he like goes and does this. What's happening? Are you calling the police again? Why? Oh my god. Again? Let's just like, let's just get them all after me. <laughs> oh my god. I'm like going on a crazy mission with all these people here. Ah, uh, they're so quick as well. Like, oh my god. I don't know if this was a good idea after all. I'm not too sure. <laughs> Running around with some crazy people activate kill them. Oh, no. Oh, no. That wasn't a good idea That was a really bad idea. Why did I do that? <laughs> oh my god Things got a little bit extreme today, okay, we're going to We're gonna take this guy out as soon as possible I'm just gonna let this pink guy just go and then I'm gonna take out this debt collector, but it's so easy to to die in this game right okay let's just oh he's not dead he's not dead oh no no i got this dude on on me as well oh no oh no you don't see anything nothing's happening nothing weird is happening here oh my god everybody's after me now <laughs> what do i do about this situation i needed to get the debt collector like off my butt <laughs> Okay, okay, this hopefully will kill it. Why is it not dying? <laughs> Why? Oh, no. Oh, no. I actually died for real. Oh, I was too careless. This is Tarotia. Once upon a time, many interesting people lived in this system. Vipal Vipalinex Talormats Distachurias. What on earth is that? They were cool companions, you know, beautiful, peaceful, which is nice. But I, along with other deities, decided to play a prank and accidentally extinguish their sun. So now there's only a half abandoned port with all kinds of space but scum like you. Oops, I made it awkward. <laughs> wow, how rude. <laughs> so the new effects on this planet is the, um, is the short circuit one. There's only new one. There's only there's only one new one. Of course, I've already seen the short circuit one, um, but it will be in... I don't know if it's in the next episode. It might be in, it might be in the next episode. I'm not sure. I can't remember, <laughs> but it's fine. You'll see it anyway, like eventually. It's just... Um, it makes things malfunction, basically. It makes your traps malfunction, so like that will, that will be in there somewhere, so you'll get to see it too, so that'll be cool. But anyway, let's do this. I'm raring to go. So I'm looking forward to conquering this planet as well. Go have a little mess about with it. <laughs> Why not? Okay, here we go. Flying to this weird looking skull planet. It looks really cool, I have to say. I love the way it looks. It looks impressive. <laughs> Very impressive indeed. All right. Oh my gosh. Is that the... That's God. What's he doing here? I don't know. Did... Oh, is it a hologram? I actually have no idea, but okay. God, what do you want? Leave me alone. <laughs> I don't know what you're after, but just get out of here. <laughs> you're ruining my, my mojo. <laughs> All right, let's see what we got today. We're on day 91. <laughs> I'm really far. I'm really far as well. I know it's going to be weird because I'll be on a lesser day on the next episode, but I didn't know how else to do it. So it is what it is. It's fine. It doesn't really affect that much, really. Not not particularly. You might notice that I got four stoves and it'll go back to three in the next episode. You'll see me get the, up the upgrade in the next episode as well. But yeah, that's just like... I just, I honestly thought it was glitched out and I didn't want to, I thought I had to, I thought I was going to have to redo my whole, like, run to get it to work, but I actually eventually managed to get it to work, but you will see that throughout the playthrough as well, but I just did it in a really weird order, I guess, but it's okay, but this is the new creature here, obviously, um, I'm going to go through the description because I haven't actually gone through the description, but these are the new alien for this planet, so this is the Nubble Shah. 
They're fast, tenacious, and smart. In short, ideal killers. Their nature is changeable. On the one hand, there are prominent scientists and notable politicians among the noble shahs, but a little part of a psychopath lives inside each one. Oh, dang. Is that why they have such huge teeth or something? I don't know. And it is that part that sometimes pushes them to cannibalism and serial murders. Just for fun. At other times, this race would have been destroyed long ago by forces like the Mechananium conglomerate, but clever noble shahs were able to penetrate into all spheres of life in the galaxy, and now they are actively lobbying for their interests in the political arena with the help of blackmail, diplomacy, charity, and targeted repressions. Okay, that's not what I was expecting. So ordinarily, I would not have the information for the Nubble Shards, and I actually don't have it in the next episode. But we do at the moment, so I can just like feed them whatever. So that's what I'm, I'm gonna do. So yeah, I need to get my reputation to max as well because you actually need it at max for the final planet as well. So I need to definitely uh, make sure to do that too. Okay, let's see. Maybe this will be a bit calmer than some other planets I've been on. <laughs> there are some very insane, hectic planets in this game. Let's just say that. <laughs> so we will see how this goes. Okay, you want some tomato, my friend? I can do that for you. So we're feeding a Mikananian right now as well. So let's do that. So Mikananians like uh, the pink stuff. So let's feed that to them as well. So this is going to be number one. There we go. All right, we're going to do another order over here. This is number two as well. Fantastic. All right, we got one of these bomb dudes over here as well. Do we have... We don't... Oh, yeah, we don't have any effects today either because, of course, it is just like the first day, so you don't get any on this day. But that's okay as well. All right, this dude is going for a nice smoke. I hope you enjoy your smoke, my friend. <laughs> Very nice indeed. I'm sure he'll have a great time. Okay, now we're going to get some bacon. We're going to get some olives and some fries. There we go for the bomb guy. So what do you want? He wants the... He wants, um, actually the new race. I'll give him, I'll give him that because why not? <laughs> that would be good. All right. Let's see if we can get some reputation and stuff like that. That would be really awesome. I'm just going to cook up some tarots and stuff like that. Actually, that would be really cool. I'm looking forward to just sort of getting a lot of stuff going here. I got, I got quite a lot of tarot, <laughs> as you could probably tell. There's a lot of tarot around here tarot for days let's speed this up a bit i've already done like my orders and everything so now i'm just twiddling my thumbs just waiting for some more guests to come in come on guys come into my store have a great time in my store i promise i will treat you very well and you will have a great time okay let's have a look here where are you there you are uh the pink little meat i'm actually running out of this stuff as well so that's not too great but that's all right okay let's so feed this to number four there we go and i need some pepper that would be good and some chorizo so we're gonna feed that to this guy as well and get some get some rat meat up in here as well i got 300 rat meat i got a lot of rat meat so much of this stuff so definitely and we got this dude here he wants some rat so let's feed him that as well i think it goes in oh I, I did double rat oh no i already put the rat in i didn't realize that i did put the rat in <laughs> no <laughs> it's okay though okay um i guess i could show you i guess i could like kill one of the new alien species that are not actually that hard to take down they're okay they're all right they actually have a lot of life but because i'm quite strong i'm quite strong at this point so i don't really like i don't really think anything's gonna really be able to take me down at this point of the game but i don't really know like they 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 um take three hits to take down so it's not too bad but yeah you can take those down as well <laughs> that one automatically the body automatically disappeared as well so that was cool that was cool actually all right that guy's going up there for a nice smoke all right i'm sure he's going to enjoy himself so that's good okay we're gonna get some bacon and some fries in here for this dude for my bombs so let's make sure to feed him up and everything 
All right, there you go. And some olives for you as well. All right, this is for the bomb too, isn't it? Yeah, lots of bomb characters here today, but that's all right. So this is number six and this one here is number eight and that will be all my orders fulfilled. So that's really awesome as well. All right, there you go. Yay, everybody's happy and merry and jolly and they're having a good time. I wish I could kind of like sit on the couches with a little like people in the VIP room, just chill out with them, just like have have a nice time and just get to know my customers you know <laughs> but sadly we cannot it is just cook for them or murder them that is the only options here <laughs> there are no other options <laughs> I'm gonna try something actually I got this like sauce that gets rid of like invulnerabilities I want to try using it on this Mikananian and and then I'm gonna try attacking him with a physical attack because because I'm really curious about like what would happen so I'm going to try that which one was it got one here I don't know which one it was could have been this one here I think this might have been the sauce I really wish that they labeled what each sauce was because you kind of have to go from like memory from like because you can tell when you like make the sauces but when you're actually in a level and you're trying to like work out which sauce is which sometimes it's not so obvious some of them are obvious but not all of them are obvious so, so it's like a real pain in the butt I wish they just put like some kind of label on them so you just knew like which one was which because it's a real pain in the butt sometimes you know so yeah it really drives me mad um so i just fed that to the mechananium he's just coming to eat his food right now i just want to see if this works on him or not so we will see never actually tried the sauce so i want to see what happens all right go dude go have a lovely feast <laughs> feast on that lovely burger i hope you enjoy all right i'm just going to speed up a bit sauce eaten okay i like i need to get him alone so i can like try and take him down all right he's going over here there might there's a witness i'll get rid of the witness all right come over here oh okay never mind it still like didn't work so that sucks that predict will just go and revive him anyway so it's fine i'll just get this guy off of the jukebox uh, i think yeah there you go <laughs> i just like was wondering maybe i used the wrong sauce but i have a sauce that like gets rid of like the immunity effect and i thought that maybe it would work on him because he's obviously physical to my cleaver and i was just wondering if it would have like gotten rid of it but yeah it didn't do anything but i don't know i might have just used the wrong sauce because i can't tell what sauce is what so it gets like extremely confusing sometimes so i don't know <laughs> it's okay though all right let's put that in there that will be great all right there you go just gonna cook up some some more stuff over there that would be awesome all right there you go my bomb friend now we just like finish the day i think it's like pretty much done actually so like that's cool but yeah everybody's happy we got some happy customers today so that's awesome and there you go i hit the max reputation too yay happy times happy times i'm really happy about that i just gotta keep it now <laughs> so i can like actually like use it <laughs> so that would be good why are you not leaving get out of here what do you want you don't even order stuff like what are you doing <laughs> he's just wanting to mess about and play games and stuff you know what i'm just gonna murder you because you're just like taking up my time and my effort so like just just die just get out of here will you <laughs> there you go i got an s rank as well so that's awesome all right let's do a couple more days let's let's go again let's see what happens today let's have a look what do we have today is wanted criminals so let's get rid of some criminals as well that would be good all right come on peoples let's go crazy ah we got some criminals down here as well interesting i like that some of the uh criminals like i like that like mcnanians and stuff like that just like look so different it's cool i like that <laughs> you know i didn't notice that before like i hadn't seen those types as criminals so, so it's kind of cool actually okay come in peoples come in have a great time we're gonna have a ball and everything why are you annoyed my bomb's annoyed already i didn't even do anything to you like geez why are you so uptight for i have no idea all right let's put some traps on and stuff just because i'm actually running out of meat a little bit so like i was thinking it might be an idea i can actually kill these really really easily now as well <laughs> the, these guys the breed eggs keep coming in to try and revive them <laughs> and i'm just like no sorry not happening oh look that's a criminal down there he needs to die because we lose prestige if, he, if we, the criminals get away right oh i didn't even kill him that's surprising 
I thought that it would, but clearly I was I was wrong there, but never mind. I took him down, so that was awesome. There's another Mykonanian. There's a criminal Mykonanian there, but I don't know. I might be able to deal with him. I don't think those guys are criminals, though. They do have different clothes, but I don't think they are because there's a few of them. And, like, I don't know. It just doesn't seem likely, but I could be wrong. So I don't know for sure, of course. Okay, so we got... Let me see here. I got these dudes here so I need to give them some rat so let's do that and we're gonna give this guy some egg and I guess I'll just give him nicotine sauce I still got quite a lot of this stuff so I'll make sure to do that and some of this pink stuff but yes I definitely am running out of that pink stuff which is annoying okay just speed this up a little bit so I can get this order out to number four I'm just gonna keep cooking as well I've been running out of some things, so I really want to cook up some more stuff. That would be really great, actually. Okay, we're going to put some nicotine sauce in there. I keep forgetting what this guy likes. I think it's the pink thing, I think. I hope I did that right, but I'm not 100% sure. Yeah, it is right. Okay, cool. I didn't remember. Like, I don't know, so many different things to remember here. And this is the, the breeding, so this one here. Okay, cool. So... Yeah, I don't know exactly what I was doing here. I think some people left. Yeah, I think some people left. So that's unfortunate. I'm going to lose a bit of reputation there. Unless I can kill them before they... Shall we kill them before they leave? Let's do that. Let's just murder them. There you go. Come on then. Bring it on. I'll take you all down. <laughs> Let's do this. Oh no. Dude, you don't see anything. Nothing weird is happening here. Nothing at all. You didn't just see a pile of dead bodies. You're just imagining things. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Everything is fine. <laughs> Nothing weird is going on, I swear. All right, we're good. We're safe and everything is great. <laughs> Nothing just happened and I didn't just go on a killing spree. Everything is fantastic. Okay, so we got some mushrooms, some fries, I think, and some rat. I'm going to put that in over there as well. So that's good. Now just to wait to get some orders. Still got another three minutes of this one to go. So still lots and lots of orders for us to to deal with but that's okay all right let's see this one here is going to number eight so that'll be really good we got this one here too so this is the oh someone just died it was probably a trap or something i'm assuming <laughs> that's okay though i did lose a little bit of reputation which is a little bit sad but never mind okay let's put that in there this one was for Mykonanian and that was the pink stuff so let's put that in that was my last one too which is very sad <laughs> very sad but never mind okay I don't think we have Naboots on this level right like thank god Naboots are just the worst <laughs> I really don't like Naboots they drive me mad because they always mess with my head I never know what to like feed them because of it so yeah it's super annoying okay let's put these in oh we just lost something but that's fine i don't think it was a customer or anything so i don't need to worry about that okay i got some nicotine and i got some egg here and the mykonanians like the pink stuff i don't have any oh no what am i gonna do about that is there an alternative oh i can use um either i could use this we'll just put this meat in instead as there's always an alternative for many of these creatures so i'm sure it will be fine to do that there you go number 13 fantastic let's just keep cooking all of this stuff up that would be a super cool all right there you go use up this teeth of meat <laughs> sauce activated they're going for a smoke all right i think everybody is happy so that's good i'm not gonna like you know lose any reputation from these so, so that's a super awesome all right good stuff good stuff all right let's put this away as well just cook up more stuff yay <laughs> everything's going real smooth in my restaurant today so that's really cool i actually should slow down time so i got some more orders to fulfill here that would be bad if they like walked out i don't want them to walk out i want happy customers today we want happy happy customers all right here you go let's have that and i also want to do some carrot as well that would be good and mykonanians like 
Um, I can use this as well. Yeah, I can use that. So <laughs> that would be good. Kind of got me a bit stumped there. I'm so used to giving them the pink stuff. I usually give them the pink stuff, but yeah, that uh, wasn't available. So <laughs> I just had to just work with what I had. All right. So I got somebody who's mad and they're about to leave. Did they get out? Oh, I got a criminal there as well. I need to get rid of that guy because he's a criminal and we don't want criminals to leave because we'll lose prestige no matter what. So there is that too. I want to get rid of this dude as well. He's also a criminal and he's also unhappy. So that is just like a double whammy probably. So we don't want that either. So let's just get rid of that dude too. There you go. Haha, <laughs> take that you evil doer. That dude down there is also a criminal, but like, I'm not sure if I can do anything about him because he's impervious to uh, physicals, so that's going to be a bit of a problem. I might end up losing something from that. He's happy as well. So sad. So sad. I made a criminal happy. <laughs> What's going on here? <laughs> I have no idea, but it's fine. Maybe I can activate this and kill him with this, but then again, I don't think it would kill him. Oh, that's not even the right guy. No, that's not even the right guy. I don't think I'm going to be able to do anything with him. So I'm just going to take the hit. I'm just going to take the, the loss, I think. Because, yeah, not much I can do there. So that's unfortunate. Okay, so we're going to use this. Um, got some impatient customers here. Oh, someone died. So I only have to do this one more customer now. So that's all right. So that's number 18. Okay, now we're just going to speed along a little bit. The day is over. We've done our second day. So that is cool. And Actually, I just need to wait for these bozos to leave. Leave my diner. Damn, I lost I lost some prestige there. Why were they unhappy? I thought they were happy. I don't know what I did wrong, but fine. <laughs> Whatever. It's fine. Okay, let's get some more things together here. There we go. Just gonna get a couple of buns and stuff like that. There we go. Just resupply. Everything is great. Right, there you go. I don't really spend that much money on um, restocking, actually, but that's fine. I need a little bit of health as well. I lost a little bit from the little bit of fighting that we did there, but it's it's okay. <laughs> we, we did all right, I have to say. Okay, let's do some more days. Let's go again. Maybe we'll see the short circuit like um day as well like level maybe i don't know <laughs> oh i got a debt i keep forgetting to pay my bills <laughs> never mind i'll just take them down easy peasy i don't have to worry too much about that so like that's good all right what is happening today let's set up some things so i just got the mysterious orbs today so nothing like too crazy actually but that's all right okay let's set up all our stuff oh <laughs> i didn't mean to do that i accidentally activated it by accident but never mind it's fine okay let's put this stuff away as well ah mysterious orbs coming at me it's fine this just don't panic <laughs> don't panic everything will be okay <laughs> everything will be fine okay so we got the olives over here do you think we should go and murder some people today i'm feeling a little bit like itchy like i want to do some murdering you know <laughs> sometimes these things happen all right here we go we're gonna start with these guys take down these things there you go you saw nothing nothing weird is happening we're fine I just like I don't want to like push my luck though so I'm just kind of like waiting for my moment to pounce <laughs> I'm gonna try and murder lots of peoples and it's gonna be a grand old time I'm not covered in blood you're covered in blood <laughs> what are you talking about haha <laughs> die fiend take that you want to die too haha <laughs> die take that that's what you get. Everybody's getting murdered today. It's a murder spree day. Let's murder some peoples. What do you think you're doing? He was trying to run at me. Now he dies too. I actually need some meat anyway. So like it's the perfect opportunity to like take them all down. I would say <laughs> let's make sure we murder everyone except for the Mykonanians. I can't touch those sadly. That makes me sad. I wish there was a way but nope there's not really okay i'm gonna hopefully take down this dude as well let's do that haha -ha, take that <laughs> who is the evil alien here i don't know all i've got left is mykonanians i actually can't take them down so i'll have to serve them <laughs> sadly <laughs> that's okay all right so mykonanians i can just give them 
let's see, I can just give them this. That will be fine. Some smoky things and this thing. And yeah, we'll just feed them this thing as well. All right, there we go. So this is number five and this one here will be number six as well. But like that got rid of a lot of customers. <laughs> now I have no customers in my establishment as I murdered them all. <laughs> but it was a worthy endeavor. It was a fun endeavor. All right, let me through. Don't see me. Nothing weird is happening. I'm fine. This is just the blood from the meat. You know when you chop up steak sometimes you just get blood on your clothes. It's just what happens. <laughs> it's inevitable. You would know if you cut up some steak or some pork chops or something. This thing happens all the time. <laughs> My god, don't question me. <laughs> you should question yourself. <laughs> Maybe you just haven't got the right meat. Maybe you got fake meat or something. I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea. Oh, a Mechananian died? How did I pull that one off? I don't know what I did there. Don't know. No idea. All right, we got some more victims to murder. Haha, -ha, take this, you evil alien. That's what you get for just breathing the same air as me. Take that, you evil creatures. Haha. -ha. Oh, there's a policeman. So tempting. So tempting, Mr. Policeman. What do you think? <laughs> I must take him down too. All right, Bombo, are you ready to go down? Are you ready to meet your maker? Oh, and my controller's going all weird. Okay, what just happened? I don't know, something weird happened. Hey, what do you think? Oh, dang, that actually got me. <laughs> that was not intentional. <laughs> okay, I'll stop, I'll stop being stupid now. <laughs> I just like, I took a little bit of damage there. My controller went all weird and like made me panic a little bit. So like, maybe let's not try that again. <laughs> That's probably not a good idea. <laughs> okay, I'm fine though. Like, I got a nice chunk of meat from doing that. So, like, it was w a worthy endeavor, I would say. Uh, what am I feeding you? Oh, yeah, this one. Okay, that's fine. I just got mysterious orbs to deal with. I also have taken a bit of damage as well. So, like, yeah. I probably want to be careful now, to be fair. So, that's what we're going to do. We're going to finish feeding all the rest of the peoples here. I got, uh, let's see, bombs. What do you want? Uh, okay. So, let's see. This stuff here. Let's feed you that. And we got mushrooms and fries and tarots. So, we're going to feed you that as well. And we're going to put all this on. Look at all the meat we got now. Yay! I was running out. So, it's good stuff. All right. So, this is 4.13. And this one here is for 14. Good stuff. All right, let's put this stuff away as well. Ah, no, my patties. You made me drop my patties on the floor. How dare you, so rude. Now my customers are gonna have dirty patties that have just been like all over the floor. There's nothing that can be done about it. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys, I'm sorry. It's just like the way it goes. You're just gonna have to put up with it. <laughs> I'm afraid. Okay, there we go. Very nice. Alrighty. All right, let's grab some of this stuff as well. There you go. Let's just put this on the go as well. Very nice. We got a Mykonanian coming in. I don't think there's going to be too many more customers because we're nearly like done here. I just kind of want that policeman to go so I can like start killing people again. So like the policeman will instantly like make a raid appear if he sees you with blood on your clothes. It's just like, it's just not worth it. It's just like a pain in the butt. <laughs> it's like, I just don't think it's worth the risk, you know, it's just it's too annoying. Police raids are annoying. I can get Get through them they're just annoying that's all okay so yes yeah, so we can do this and I'm gonna feed you this I think he's leaving yes he's finally leaving and I can start murdering people again <laughs> I can go on a murder frenzy yes yes okay it's number 15 okay let's um see what we can do here I'm gonna start with this guy up here we're gonna murder him and it's gonna be glorious oh I can't kill him with a trap but that's all right I'll just kill him with my cleaver instead because you're not impervious to cleavers so I'll make sure to kill you that way haha -ha! they're useless anyway like they don't even do anything in my establishment they just sit there and just like do nothing <laughs> They don't even order anything, so like they're pretty pointless in um in my restaurant. All right, let's take everybody down. Haha, -ha. who else? Who's next? I need to take number 19 down, don't I? Yeah, somehow, but he's kind of like dancing over there. <laughs> he's having a grand old time. I was trying to wash the blood off, man. That's just mean. Oh, is that dude coming in? Number 16? You, you want to die? You want to die too? All right, I can do that for you. There you go. 
All right, bombs coming in. You didn't see nothing. Nothing happened. Everything is okay. Everything's fantastic. <laughs> there you go. Um, I probably should serve number 18. I might do number 17 as well, like whilst I'm there. Yeah, let's just serve these two. They're the lucky ones. They're the ones that actually get to survive my wrath. So <laughs> yeah, that's good. Okay, the bomb. Let's see. The bomb is this one. So we need this one here. And oh man, stupid orbs are coming. I hate it when they come and just like make me drop everything. <laughs> it's super annoying, but it's okay. All right, so we're gonna feed egg and this thing and we'll just send this off quick. There you go. And I think this would be the end of the day. I think we've done a good, a good job. So that's awesome. Still got some stuff to cook up there, but that's okay. I'm just gonna speed up now. Nothing is gonna like nothing bad is gonna happen if I just speed through the days. So we're we're fine, I would say. Are you doing okay up there, sir? I think it's time for you to leave. The day is over, but thank you for visiting my establishment. How dare you? Don't give me bad prestige. Who do you think you are? <laughs> but you got S rank, so that is good. I am happy with that. Okay, so this is like an icicle planet kind of thing. Looks interesting. Have you decided to save some money on the refrigerator? Well, I hope you dressed warmly and took a pickaxe with you. It will come in handy both to rip your head off the pillow and to make a hand of gold. There is so much of it that no one else really needs it. This time, by the way, congratulations, the clients will be richer and the views more picturesque. It's a pity that there is nothing to do here, the perfect place for a lazy bones like you. Oh, perfect. I like it. Okay, so there is, so there is two new aliens here, like a mushroom looking thing and whatever that is with the green little hat on, if that makes sense. So we're gonna go and like see like what these creatures look like actually i'm looking forward to to that okay let's go let's do this okay i'm looking forward to seeing this crazy crazy planet kind of looks like it's crumbling doesn't it like my god what is happening to this thing should i be worried <laughs> I don't know. There's our little dog robot, like sunbathing, having a great time with his little buddies. They're even going skiing. Look at them. There's even cats now as well. It looks like a cat anyway. Okay, they're skiing down the mountain with their little mushroom buddies. I think they're mushrooms. I don't really know what they are. They look a bit strange. They kind of look like they're half human in disguise, maybe, and we just don't know it. <laughs> My dude is freezing. He doesn't know what to do. He's taken to alcohol to warm his body up or something. Thing. I don't really know. <laughs> I'm excited to see these new aliens actually. It's gonna be great. I'm on day 66. Can you believe it? <laughs> I've been doing really well. Look at all my, my meat as well. Look at all my rat. <laughs> that was when I was trying to get that quest to work. I was doing it on the rats and I just ended up with so much meat. I was literally just like stood at this doorway just like killing them over and over to get like some of the, the days that I wanted and different effects and stuff like that that I wanted. Okay, so we should have a new rat record for this new creature here. Let's find out more about him. That would be good. So this is called a slack. Okay, his, his tummy is sticking out. <laughs> Parasite parasitic slugs that enslaved the once developed space snails. It is the green creature on the head that is the true master of the body. The corpse is just a weak tool in the tiny paws of the swamp invader. Oh, okay. So the green thing on the top is actually the thing controlling it. That's really interesting. Okay, the poor thing. He doesn't even have a mind of his own. Slags were once a successful and thriving civilization with a large share of the galaxy's entertainment industry. However, However, success relaxed them, and uncontrolled consumption with the influence of hollow vision distracted them from their real problems. The ecological crisis and the invasion of cute looking but very insidious parasites. As a result, green vermins enslaved the slacks and became the dominant species on their planet, and woe to those who dare enter into conflict with these little ones. It is relatively easy to kill them, but difficult to get past the acidic pool of blood. Oh, so if they die, they'll have like an acidic pool of blood like underneath them. Okay, I should probably watch out for that, right? That doesn't seem too good if you ask me. Okay, maybe we should put our traps on and stuff. I don't know if this will kill them like or not. It doesn't look like... 
I think that like, one of them was poison. I doubt that poison would affect them. It makes sense since they have acidic blood, right? So that would make sense, I guess. Um, so I wanted to look at the other one. We should have another record here for the other one here. This is a dual bell, apparently. Okay, interesting. Two personalities in one body and also two mouths both of which must be fed. If what is said is true, the love of one ancient couple was so strong that they begged to be made inseparable. The creator responded, the operation was successful, but their children were also connected. And of course, further descendants of the couple did not share their enthusiasm, I bet. That's kind of cute in a way, that they were like, they loved each other so much that they just wanted to be like, inseparable. How cute is that? Sadly, it's always the children that suffer, isn't it? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> okay, uh, still, living in one course is un unenviable I think that says and one had to pay for an extra head with other parts of the body for example doorbells have no hands at all and therefore each individual learns telekinesis from childhood or perishes oh okay they don't have hands that's interesting so like psychic creatures <laughs> due to their abilities they can be very dangerous but they only attack when they feel they outnumber the enemy also if they don't like something their sneezes are just beyond disgusting so they'll only attack you if you have like loads of other creatures like attacking you at the same time that's what i'm getting from that but i'm not 100 percent sure there they look so weird such strange aliens in this game for sure obviously we don't know what to feed them or anything so I'm probably just gonna guess I think I'll send them to the toilet I don't know and he wants cheese and god what meat I got so much meat like I've got so much choice here <laughs> where do I start let's try giving him a debt collector or something I don't know we'll try that why not and an egg for this guy I don't I don't exactly remember what the what the robot likes to eat actually let's have a look uh the pink thing I could feed it the pink thing I don't know if like I'm gonna end up like getting that thing killed this is the second time this has happened now you see it won't let me press a on the burgers when I had like that meat out for some reason hopefully it will now see it won't let me put the meat in that that's really weird I don't know why that keeps happening I seem to be bumping into some glitches we'll just do it this way instead I'll put it in from the fridge because that seems to work but for some reason like it keeps doing that I don't know why exactly it's very strange but it's fine there's a workaround for it so I'm not really that mad or anything and there hasn't been that many glitches throughout playing like the quest one is the first glitch I have found and well yes it is extremely fr frustrating and is kind of impeding my progress a little bit it could be worse I guess it could be like at least I can still play <laughs> like you know I've played games that are worse and stop you from playing so <laughs> I guess it just um depends right okay so we're feeding this new alien here and also I just killed one of the new alien types as well but I haven't got the food through just yet ah there you go it just came through nice we got these new little meat things over here interesting very interesting <laughs> okay Oh, it looks like my dude, my parasite dude, did not like what I fed him. What's he doing? He's puking. Was it that bad? Oh no, he's literally puking. Do you think we should hit him with this gun? It killed him. Okay, oh, is that is that the acidic blood? Should I be careful? Does it hurt you? Is there a pool of blood on the floor? Oh damn. Okay, it actually does have acidic blood though, so that's like quite interesting, I would say. Okay, let's put some of this new meat on the go as well. I don't actually know what I want to what else I want to cook actually. I don't know. There is a couple of things I don't have much meat of and definitely the like bird turtle things, the rudises and these dudes, I forget what they were called, but yeah, there is a couple of things I don't have much meat on and a couple of things I just have like so much meat on. So I <laughs> guess it just depends, I suppose. I don't think I have the meat from um, 
that new species just yet. Okay, so we're gonna try again with this new species. What just died? Okay, it wasn't that. Let's try with the, the other new species. We'll try with like the little, I don't know what they're called, the little two-headed guys. We'll try feed that because who knows, maybe that's a thing that they enjoy eating. We will find out, right? So this is to number six. Let's hope that they like that. <laughs> we shall see. Okay, we got the poltergeists. What are the poltergeists like? The poltergeists like the little turtle thing. So we'll give them that. So we also have a Rudis. Rudis is like debt collectors, I think. I will double check that though, because I'm not 100% confident with that actually. So <laughs> I'll have to uh, like have a little look actually. Uh, this one goes to number eight and Rudis is. I feel like I haven't served a, served a Rudis in ages. It is a debt collector. I was right. Okay, number nine. There you go. And we need an egg. And I always, I forgot what the robot people like so I don't I don't serve those very often what's that weird noise <laughs> something's making weird weird noises some alien is going out of control <laughs> I don't know what's happening over there but okay I'm gonna cook up this new species do I have anything else oh yeah I've got a new species over here to cook as well oh I need to need to get this one out too so there is that was my new species there it is cook that one up and this one goes to number 10 there you go. Everybody is kind of like, you know, just satisfied, I guess. Oh, good. I found out what this guy likes. So he does like the, the new species. I think that happens more often or not. Like when you get to a new planet, they usually like the other species that like turns up at that planet. So it's kind of like, it's not that bad to like work out like what to, to give them. Sometimes just like the meat that you've already got doesn't really tend to work in most cases, <laughs> but that's okay. I wonder what kind of effects we're gonna have on this planet as well, actually. Let's see, I'm gonna take these as well. All right, there we go, cook up all of that stuff. That will be super awesome, actually. All right, there you go. Has we got any more orders today? I think we got a couple more orders to fulfill today as well. I also have managed to kill those little rivals. You know those little rivals that always come and steal your stuff? You can kill them with the vending machine really, really easily and get their meat. So just another way of getting like extra meat, I suppose. I was curious if you could actually get meat from these robies. I guess you can't. You're not really supposed to kill them, but I think there would be a way. If you use the, that immunity source, I reckon you could kill them, you know? So I reckon that would be a thing that you could do if you really wanted to kill them for whatever reason. I don't know why you would want to. Why would you be such a monster? <laughs> I don't know, but I think it would be definitely be possible. Okay, I could feed you a police person. Feed you a police person. Why not? Bacon and cheese. Let's go with that. I don't remember what the, the dog likes at the moment, actually, because I haven't served them enough to, like, remember. But that's okay. Let's feed this one. I mean, cook this one even. And what were we doing? This one, we were doing the dog, which we can just use the pink stuff. Stuff. We've got 50 of those, so we're well prepared with that, I would say. <laughs> Definitely. And this guy, oh yeah, we don't know what he likes, but I, he, I figured out that he liked this stuff, so we can feed him that, and he'll probably be happy with that, actually. So let's feed this to number 13, and this one here goes to number 12. There we go. Just cooking up some more of this. I got so much meat to cook here that I don't know if I'm ever going to cook it all, if I'm being honest, <laughs> but I'm going to try. I'm going to definitely try my best okay rudis let's see rudis rudis what do you like again okay um I, oh yeah deck collector i got so much deck collector i was just going around killing like deck collectors like for quite a while so i got a lot of those as well Okay, this is going to go to number 14. There you go. I haven't put any traps on today because I wanted to get the meat from like this new, this like new, these new creatures. So like that's why I've done that. What am I doing? Oh yeah, we don't know with this guy, do we? This is the first time I've served one of these. I'm thinking if we do the opposite, so this one. So if we feed it this one. Oh, this is the wrong um, bun. We need uh, what a different different bun for this one. So this one here, and we want bacon. 
and oh, is that pepper yeah jalapeno things I think that is and cheese all right let's go with that that's quite a big burger I have to say but hopefully they will like what I have made them only time will tell so we shall see <laughs> all right let's just keep cooking as we go as well that would be great I also need to make sure that we get lots of reputation too because I actually need 10,000 to get to the the final planet too so I'm going to keep working on that as we go all right there you go very nice somebody just died it's just a rudest so it's fine okay that person still hasn't finished eating yet I'm really curious about what they think of what I made them do they like it they do like it good oh well, I know I know now what to to feed them even without the information it seems so that's kind of cool and we did it very nice very simple like wasn't too challenging there so that was good all right so with the remainder of our money we're just gonna use it on bills and maybe some upgrades or whatever just to I don't know go do something with my money I'm kind of getting to the point now where there's not that much to do with my money so I've really spent a lot of time with this game so yeah I don't know what I'm gonna use it on entirely I got a thousand here should we just put it into something I don't really know just the meat processing speed let's just go for that I guess I don't know <laughs> it's fine we also have the phone thing to do as well so curious about what what that one will be too but we shall see it's gonna take a bit to get some variations I guess we just got some hungry visitors today oh I forgot to buy the info it's fine I already know what they like to eat anyway so I figured it out by myself so <laughs> it's not that bad I'll make sure to buy it next time though I just completely forgot I guess just like <laughs> so much going on so that would be why we got hungry guests so I'm not actually going to put any traps on today I might have to do it for the new residents though like I might have to like go and kill them or something I don't know just yet <laughs> we'll see because I don't have that much meat for them so that's going to be the one that I struggle to serve right because double meat for that's going to be hard for sure uh let's see poltergeist what do they like to eat again they like either the police officer or i could also use the little owl thing i'll use the police officer i actually got more of that so like that would make a lot of sense i feel like all right so that's that done we just have to wait for it to heat up and we need egg and whatever the robot likes because i forgot what the robot likes the robot likes two of those pink things i got loads of those so that is fine uh what just happens i don't know <laughs> i think something weird just happened oh it's doing that thing again where it's not letting me put it in the burger that's annoying okay okay it's fine i'll just do it this way it always seems to do it with the pink things for some weird reason i'm not sure why that is but okay that's interesting okay let's see i can cook these up as well so now all those are cooked up and ready to go so that's cool this is for order number two all right so this guy wants a sauce we'll just give him a laxative and some cheese and i know he likes these so we'll give him two of those actually and we're gonna need some bacon and i know that they oh i don't have enough i don't have enough for number three I might have to kill him maybe <laughs> we'll have to see okay so this one here is for number six feed that one to number six perfect i could do the rudest uh let's see onion as well and we'll just put some more stuff on the go as well yeah i don't have any more of those that is very unfortunate actually <laughs> so that sucks oh one of my my ghosts has been satisfied so he's just like he's just left this world so i'll just pick up his body parts so that'll be good oh he's left i uh, didn't feed him so he just left so I'll, I'll just let him leave it's probably safer as well to be honest uh debt collector two of these debt collectors for that dude okay i don't know what happened there very strange all right let's keep cooking let's keep cooking up all this stuff that would be great so i'm just going to keep cooking these police officers at the moment actually that would be good oh man oh man and oh no i had the i had it ready and i didn't give it in time <laughs> dull that didn't work out so well it's fine it doesn't matter too much though okay let's get the meat here and put it in the fridge that would be great let's put some debt collector stuff here too that'll be awesome okay who is next who is next let's see <laughs> i'm ready and i'm raring to go let's see if we can serve all of our customers today 
All right, guys, roll up, roll up. <laughs> it's double meat burger patty day today. Come and get your amazing fat burgers. <laughs> There's gonna be some huge burgers today. Oh, I can't feed number seven, so I don't have enough of those. This is the new meat and I don't have that much. It's crazy that it put that like so early when I don't even like have that much at the moment like that's really really crazy to me actually let's see i just got unlucky i guess i don't know all right two of those and this is for number 12 that i'm doing right now so these two and that's gonna go over to number 12 i'm sure that he will be very happy with that actually that'll be good i'm just gonna do this straight away number 12 there you go and we need some bacon some egg for this one this is for number 10 let's have a look we need the pink stuff gonna give the pink stuff over to you as well all right there you go very nice okay we're gonna put some more on my cooking speed is quite fast I feel like I'm always constantly like putting more stuff on all right this goes to number 10 number seven is probably gonna leave I think number eight is gonna leave as well is not too much I can do about that I'm afraid so I just don't have the stuff required for it wait what was that what was this one this one was uh, the police the police uh, meet so we'll do that one and what else do we need we need the pepper and salmon and a sauce I'll just give you laxative I'm just not really using my nicotine sauce because I guess I still have hope that I'll get the quest done but I don't think I will <laughs> if I'm being honest I just like there's a part of me that still wants to unglitch my quest but I don't think it's gonna happen so I tried for a long time to fix it and it wasn't happening so yes it's a pain in the butt oh I missed that order yep that order is gone they they left they are not happy bunnies sadly so that sucks a lot all right that's it i think oh no the day's still going i just gotta like wait for more customers to come in you really get a lot of customers when you're like at this point of the game it really takes like a while for sure all right let's keep going all righty let's see what happens here got some more people's incoming awesome i might try and murder a couple of them because there are some that I can't deal with at the moment. Someone just died. Don't know where. It's just one of those ghosts, so it's not like a big deal. I was just wondering where the body was because I don't see it. <laughs> so <laughs> I have no idea right now where they are. Deck collectors, I think, works for that one. So we can definitely go ahead and do that. All right, we're getting through some of this, like some of these dishes. <laughs> at the very least i can't do those i can't do those okay we're gonna have to try and kill some of these i feel like i don't know how i'm going to but i want to try hopefully because otherwise i'm going to keep losing reputation and i really want reputation right now actually okay i'm just gonna do this order here though so just put this here because i can do that one at the very least all right cook up this don't really matter what i'm cooking just cook anything that would be great Okay, is there an opportunity for me to like kill some of these? My motion sensor's not on. Why are my motion sensor's not on? I thought I put them on. Oh, because it was like a hungry day, right? And I wanted to to like get all the stuff for it. That would be why <laughs> I forgot about that. So let's see if we can kill one of these. That'd be great. Oh, yep, I got hurt by the acid. The acid stuff like on the floor. So yeah, that's definitely a thing that actually does hurt you quite a bit actually so like that's kind of crazy I don't know if I want these traps on actually let's just take those off so I was doing really well with my orders so I think I want to keep up with my my orders at the moment actually uh what was this I was doing something here <laughs> I don't know <laughs> um I thought I put two in but that's weird I could have sworn I put two of these in there so that's very strange it's fine though right this is for number 17 let's see number 18 I could probably do that order as well that would be great all right dudes I am gonna have your patties and your burger already ASAP I swear it I think it's this one isn't it yeah this one okay there we go now we just have to wait for that to heat up and I'm sure he'll be very happy there you go my friend enjoy enjoy all right we got some more police officer meat there for them to enjoy I'm sure they will have a blast with those too I'm sure they're gonna be super hungry and super excited to eat those when 
like, I don't know, when the customer comes in. <laughs> I have no idea. We'll have to see how it goes for sure. All right, there you go. Let's put that one in, cook up some more of these. Constant supply of meat right now, which is what I like. Okay, we have some very happy customers, which is great. Let's see if we can find that body. There is somebody who's dead, but like, I don't know where that body is because it's just one of those ghost things. Sometimes it's like impossible to find their bodies. Like I have a real hard time finding them. Oh look, he's outside. I don't know why he was out there, but sure. <laughs> It's okay. It's all good. And there we go. We did a day on this planet. Very, very nice indeed. I think that was, that went really well, actually. I like that. <laughs> very cool indeed. We hopefully will get a different effect like tomorrow when we do our next day. That would be really fun. Actually, I'm looking forward to that as well. Let's just buy all our stuff back. Make sure that we're all fully stocked up. I lost a bit of health as well. I think it was from that acid, wasn't it? I remember. <laughs> that acid got me good. It was very, very lethal. All right, now we're going to buy some more stuff. What shall we buy? An extra stove, an extra module, increase the cooking speed. Uh, I'm just going to go for the processing speed. We'll just go for that. Why not? Is there anything else I can buy with this money? No. Okay, we'll just keep this money. It's only like a thousand. Shall I put it away or not? How much? Uh, I'll just put it away, I guess. There's only actually like 8,000 in there. So I'm just going to put it away for a second. I feel like that would be a good idea, actually. I should look. I don't think there's anything I need to do for the next planet, actually. We are currently on this one so yeah I could actually go to the next planet like right now if I wanted to but I'm gonna stay here just for a little bit because I want to see the effect that is on this planet and there is one here I'm actually not sure what this one is actually so this could be this could be interesting actually let's find out uh, I think this might be the electric one wow okay so Electri electricity is on the fritz and maybe my traps are gonna work against me instead of like for me so yeah that's gonna be horrific <laughs> but I'll try short circuit scandal rumor has it that good burger is literally stuffed with traps and that today due to a short circuit all these traps have gone haywire and activate automatically and indiscriminately we don't know if this is true or not but the appliances in the diner seem really out of control and pose a mortal danger oh no free prestige for every surviving customer prestige loss for every injured customer okay so we don't want to hurt our customers in this like level okay good to know so we're just gonna have to try and serve them just like how we usually would i feel like the days are getting like longer and longer in this game as well did we really like did we always have like a six minute level i feel like they definitely are getting like a tad longer than before actually but that's okay we get to make some money i guess i guess in a way as well i'm sort of like i guess i'm not having as much purpose as well because like i already have so much money at this point oh yeah look one of my traps just activated on its own it's like there's a ghost in the vicinity <laughs> what is happening i don't know all right let's see if we can do some more stuff here also it looks like that if i gave them like the certain like um sources it could be lethal to them so if i make them smoke and then like the trap goes off then it could be kind of bad right <laughs> that could be kind of bad okay what are we doing i need a police meat so let's put that in the burger as well oh no people are dying right short circuit oh no they didn't die it's just they got lucky i guess <laughs> they got very lucky all right i guess the less traps you have on this like particular like run would be like better i suppose i don't really know okay so i want to do this one and i think this guy likes debt collector so i'll give that to you there you go we need some egg there you are my friend and what else do you want some pink stuff so i'll put some of that in there as well that would be really awesome i'm gonna cook up some more of this stuff all right this is to number four so we'll send that one off this is to number three <laughs> my trap's going off it's so weird it's so very strange just seeing them all go off like that very strange that guy's right next to the shooty trap no move away from the traps dudes <laughs> move away or you'll die <laughs> and i'll lose stuff and that would be 
like really bad, right? I don't want to to lose stuff, right? Because that would suck. Okay, anyways, uh, we need, oh yeah, deck to collector for this one as well. So we'll put that one in. My kitchen is running very smoothly today, I would say. Just speed up a tiny bit and give this one to number six. I don't think I can feed number five, sadly. It's not too much I can do for you, sir. Uh, so that sucks. I keep forgetting to buy the information on the aliens as well. I really should do that. <laughs> it's not that big of a deal though, really. Like, it's not like that important for me at the moment. At least I don't think so, because I've already worked out what they like and stuff. So it's fine. All right, there you go. Let's put that on the stove too. Okay, we got a body over here. We got a situation over here, <laughs> but it's fine. So that's good. All right, that little guy's not gonna get hit right. Okay, we're fine, we're good, we're good. How much prestige do I need for the next planet? Let me have a look quickly. 5,000? Oh, so we're definitely good on prestige as well for the next planet. Probably not the one after that though, so I'm gonna have to definitely build that up a little bit, I would say. Okay, so bacon and cheese, and I think I actually have what he wants cooking right now. Uh, why did I put two in? We don't want to put two in. Oh, I've been putting two in this whole time. Oh my god, I've been like in the habit because last like uh, level we had, we had double meat and I think <laughs> I've been in the habit of putting double in and I didn't even realise I was doing it. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> they should be happy about double patties. Wouldn't you be happy if you received a double patty? Like for the same price? Like surely you would be, right? <laughs> I don't know. These customers complain too much, you know? Like what's wrong with them? My god. <laughs> okay, so actually this guy will take a uh, rat. We should give this guy rat. I got so much of it. I got a hundred of this stuff. You can definitely have rat. <laughs> I got so much of this stuff. Like, be my guest, man. I'll give you all of it if you want. <laughs> it's just like, it's coming out my ears. <laughs> all right, here you go. Number nine. You can have that. People are dying, which is unfortunate. But that's just the way the cookie crumbles, I'm afraid. And this one wants uh, police uh, meat, so we'll do that one. I actually got 60 of this stuff. I don't know how I got so much, to be honest. I got so many resources at this point that it's crazy. Okay, I'm just gonna cook these and I'll cook one of these as well. Why not? This one is done. Yes, this one is done. It's for number eight. And I got the dog. The dog likes to eat the pink stuff, so I'll give him some of that. So I got a lot of that anyways, so that's good. That's very good. And I need some of this, like, new species for this new customer that I got here as well. He wants egg and he wants this stuff. At least I think it's this stuff. So that would be good. This is for number 11. This one here is for number 12. If he survives, I think he will. I think he's fine. <laughs> number 13, we got this order as well. So I'll feed you this one. There you are. All right, what shall we cook now? Let's cook up this this like pink stuff as well. So we, we nearly got to the bottom of it. Am I ever gonna get to the bottom of that? Like rat, I just don't, I don't see it happening. Do you? <laughs> 300 imagine trying to cook up 300 tarots <laughs> like that would just require a monster sized kitchen I feel like so yeah I don't know if that's gonna happen but whatever <laughs> it's fine all right oh I should probably clean up that body wherever it is oh it's just down here we'll clean that up so people don't get too annoyed with me because they, they sometimes can. Oh, he got suspicious because one of the traps went off. It didn't hurt him though, but I guess it doesn't matter if they see it. I guess it does look kind of kind of suspicious, I suppose. I guess I would be pretty scared if I saw a gun go off next to me as well, if I'm being honest. Okay, so we'll feed you rats. There you go. This one goes to number 14. I'm on a roll with these orders. This game's got nothing on me. Like, I can fulfill all these orders, no problemo. So this one is number 15. There you go, we got the cheese, the bacon, and this is for the dog. What's the dog again? I always forget the dog. <laughs> I guess I just don't serve it very much. Wow, how did I get 74 of that stuff? I don't know. All right, some egg, and we got this one. I mean, I have played a lot, so that's just probably it. <laughs> I've just played this game so much, I think. So I just got so many resources. Oh, I got a bit of lag there, actually. <laughs> just a little tiny bit, so that was annoying, but it's okay. It's not too bad, actually. Uh, what was I doing here? Oh, whatever I was doing, the customer died, so never mind. Probably have lost a little bit of prestige here, because 
Quite a few peoples have ended up dying, actually. Okay, that's all right, though. Let's put this away and this one. All right, there you go. 52. I'll probably have better luck cooking all of this stuff, if I'm being honest. All right, there you go. Let's see. We're done, right? The day is done, and I think, like, we succeeded. Like, everything is fine from the looks of it. So, that's awesome. All right, guys, I hope you had a fantastic time in my restaurant today. <laughs> I, I know I have. I've had a good time. Okay, oh, I got one more order. Oh, I didn't see you there. I guess you just snuck in or something. Very, very, like, sneaky. <laughs> very sneaky. Uh, what am I doing? Am I, is that right? I think that's right. And then you want... Oh, I don't know. I don't have any... I can't, I can't do his order because I don't have the, the meat that he wants. So unfortunately, he's probably just going to leave and I'm going to get bad reputation. But it's probably better to just let him leave rather than killing him, if I'm being honest. Because you lose prestige for killing them. So I would assume that you would lose more for killing them in this current situation. But I don't really know, of course. All right, let's just hope he survives. All right, I think he's leaving. All right, we're done. Good stuff. We conquered it. Very, very nice. <laughs> Yay! We made it, guys. We made it. But as expected. <laughs> All right, let's restock our supply and everything. Just get a bit of bit of stuff here. I could probably max all of this out if I wanted to. I wonder how much like you can actually hold. Like, how much is the max for all of this stuff? <laughs> I could just buy it all out and then never have to worry about it again. That'd be kind of nice. Alright, what shall we buy? An extra stove? Why not? Now we have like... Maybe I'll be able to cook up all that, like, tarot meat or something. All that 300 tarot meat. <laughs> I don't know. I have no idea. Okay, I think I might try another day. Hopefully, we'll be able to see that effect or something. Yeah, I think that would be a good idea because we're probably just going to be moving on to the next planet since I'm able to just go straight into it. So, we're probably just going to move on to that actually is there any new effects on the next planet yeah there are there's like two new ones cool i'm excited for that actually that's gonna be really awesome all right so well we'll just keep going and hopefully it'll pop up it might not but like you know if it doesn't then we'll definitely see it in the next episode look at all my stoves i got four stoves going here cool right <laughs> very cool indeed i like that shall we put effects on all i've got is rivals so it's like it's not like really that big of a deal actually so so like yeah that's pretty cool all right here we go set everything up because why not all right let's take all of this this meat here but yeah having an extra stove is nice and helpful for just doing all of this stuff oh i keep forgetting to get the info for the guy <laughs> I don't know why I keep forgetting like every time I like, I keep telling myself I'll go and buy the info for those like customers but I keep forgetting <laughs> oh my god I got such a bad memory I just keep like getting distracted I just like I got so many things to remember in this game all these different like meat types that these aliens like and I'm having a like a rough time even remembering all the different things to feed all these aliens let alone remembering as to buy specific upgrades so i think that might be my problem to be honest but that's okay all right get out of here rival there you go all right we got this one is a little bacon treat for number two this one here is for number three there you go very nice all right let's get some more of these on the go as well i got the habit of just picking up um like three i should like you know put more pick up more stuff because we can now so i i should i just kind of forget sometimes so there is that as well okay let's see shall we go with a a sauce ah we got a we got an invader what do you think you're doing? Trying to sneak into my kitchen. How very rude of you. Okay, this is for number five. There you go. Let's get all our meat here. That'll be great. All right, there you go. I <laughs> picked up three again. <laughs> it's such a habit. It's such a habit. I can't help it. <laughs> okay, and bacon. And I don't know what meat you want, actually. The pulsar guys. I kind of keep forgetting. The police thing. Put the police in there. That would be good. There you go. Let's get rid of this darn rival. So annoying. That silly rival always trying to irritate me okay there's that meat and we need to get 
gets an extra one in here actually that would be super cool all right let's see do i want to put this in yeah let's put this in number six there you go just fast forward a little bit we still got quite a ways to go in this level i'm just gonna wait for some more customers i got no one to i got no one to serve <laughs> this game's too slow <laughs> it needs to pick up the pace <laughs> what's going on i've just sat here twiddling my thumbs <laughs> okay let's put some of these on as well there you go all right let's see what we got here so i'm gonna use this nicotine actually why not we got an egg here let's do that why is there someone suspicious what did i do to deserve this treatment I don't know I have no idea <laughs> but that's okay all right let's grab all of this there you go put some more of this on too perfect so much stuff there's so much stuff um so what are we doing by the way uh so I got this one and this is this one here yep this is number number nine I have to wait for it to heat up of course and what was that again oh yeah the police thing a police thing in this one and then that one there was the dog so this would be the pink stuff on the last one there you go and that'll be three orders like ready to go in like straight off the bat so like that's really cool actually there you go i think i got a rival incoming but that's okay okay so this is for number nine this one here is for number seven this one here is for number 11 there you go still got a few more to do but that's all right okay let's put these away and keep this up oh i actually picked one extra up but then i didn't pick the one on the end so that wasn't as efficient as i would like but never mind oh that guy's gonna leave oh no we got an angry customer I took too long and there I was being like hey the game's taking too long it's probably because I fast forwarded it though so like that was probably my fault for fast forwarding too far probably but that's all right okay let's grab all of this stuff I think we're nearly done with the day I think this might be my last customer actually so that's cool I've been doing really well actually okay let's give this one out as well there you go Oh no, we've still got a minute left to go. <laughs> There's still more people that may enter our fine establishments today, but that's all right. We all hopefully make them happy too. We'll just speed up a little bit. Just make sure to get the rival as well. Just get some orders in here. So we don't have much happening right now, sadly. <laughs> that's okay though. All right, let's put this away and just keep cooking. Just keep cooking the stuff. We're actually cooking the rat now, like at last. <laughs> Do you think it will go well? Like, I hope so. All right, let's put this one in here. And what are we looking at? Peppers and salmon, I think. I haven't put the meat in yet, but I will in a, in a jiffy for sure. All right, let's put this stuff in. There you go. Trap activated. Ah, did I kill someone? I don't know why I just did. I have no idea. All right. Anyway, so we need the police for this first order here. And then this one here is, I don't know. What am I doing? Ah, the dog. Yes, the dog with the pink meat. Let's go and put that one in as well. There you go. Oh, rival incoming. That's okay though. So this one is for 14. This one here is for 17. Let's do that one. And I gotta do this one quick. Quick, quick, quick. And it requires, uh, I don't have the meat for it. No, I don't have the meat. That one's gonna have to leave. The top one left, I didn't even have the meat. So I couldn't do anything about that one anyway. So it's fine. <laughs> Oops, it's all good though. All right, let's put this stuff in. And yeah, we're finally cooking up all this tarot. <laughs> tarot for days, tarot for everyone. I should just make like a happy hour for, for tarots or something and just do a tarot day where all I serve is tarots. <laughs> that would be awesome. All right, and you want this one, okay good stuff and this is for number 18 so that's good your order will be with you sir very shortly you will have a lovely meal and you will leave satisfied okay this is not a threat <laughs> i swear <laughs> don't give me bad reputation or something bad might happen to you <laughs> just saying i'm just putting that out there just in case you didn't know what kind of place i'm running here so yeah they just need to they just need to little, be a little careful <laughs> all right let's keep up with this tarot cooking 306 to go guys we'll be there in no time what are you talking about this is easy 
<laughs> this is fine. All right, I think this is the end now, right? Yeah, everyone's gonna gonna be leaving now. He was trying to steal one of my my 300 meat. Like, how dare he? He can't have any. Not even a sliver. All right, let's finally buy this info because I kept forgetting to buy this info on these aliens. I finally remembered this time. <laughs> I kept like forgetting. Like, I got such a bad memory sometimes. <laughs> my God. Okay, let's buy a couple more bits and pieces here. There we go. Do we need anything else? Nah, we're good. Awesome. Okay, that's good. All right, do we need to buy any? Let's buy a couple of upgrades, I guess. See, we just literally have barely anything to buy now. I really am running out of stuff to buy. <laughs> I'm going to keep, like, buying stuff, though, whenever I can. So that will be good. Oh, I got quite a lot of bills here. I should have probably paid, paid my bills because... I got some debt collectors incoming, but never mind, it's okay. Technically, there's not any new aliens on this planet, surprisingly, since we already saw that alien on Terra Rotia. There was the largest human colony here even before you were born. You probably noticed this already. A few races would have thought of completely purging all flesh just to build up the stone boxes. Well, humans have always reasoned differently. It was not me who created you anyway. It is even a pity that the Mykonanians with their holy wars took a possession of your houses by force and of you too by the way just for the company i lost a lot of money on the sweepstakes back then who is who's talking here do you think <laughs> i have no idea this looks like a really weird looking planet so is it a planet made out of flesh is that what we're working with here i have no idea but it's intriguing i have to say i'm looking forward to these bizarre effects that are most likely going to pop up very soon welcome hello Welcome to the flesh planet. <laughs> I have no idea. It looks strange. It kind of looks like a giant onion ring <laughs> to me anyway. Okay, it looks very worn down. Like, oh my god, is this what the war did to it? Wow, those creepy aliens are taking selfies. That's really disturbing, I have to say. What is going on? <laughs> my dude is like, really, What? what is that face that that dude is showing me right now it looks like the kind of face you would pull when you're on the toilet <laughs> or something i don't know <laughs> okay let's see what's happening today then only got debt collectors i'm on day 71 right now not bad not bad at all all right let's get rid of my debt collector because i failed to pay my bills because i'm naughty <laughs> but it's all right it's okay i actually got another one over here as well so i'm just gonna quickly sort that out oh we got naboots to deal with as well naboots are pain and pains in the but if I'm being honest, they're a real pain in the butt. Can I help you, sir? What do you want? <laughs> I think he was coming to revive, but then I just like brutally murdered him because I am a savage and I show no mercy to these aliens. <laughs> Every one of them must die. So of course it has come up saying I have a new record here with this alien because this it actually technically is the first time I've seen them. But that looks amazing, I have to say. That looks really cool. I don't know, like, what it likes to eat or anything at this point. But I'll work it out. I'm not going to read the description because I probably read it, like, on a past previous episode. So I probably won't do that right now. But it's got 10 health. That's an insane amount of health. Oh, God. <laughs> I didn't even know if I'd be able to take that on, if I'm being honest. Because that looks like a real pain in the butt but hopefully we can just feed him and make him happy or something i really don't know what it likes to eat though so this is gonna be this is gonna be interesting all right let's see let's see what we got here i'm gonna try feeding it a debt collector maybe he likes debt collectors i don't know we will see we will see okay let's put some meat on the go here as well there we are all right, did I put everything in here? I did, I think I, oh, that was a different order. Oh, I see, okay. We can try a different one with this one. Okay, let's go with, let's go with fries, chorizo, and I'm gonna go with this thing this time and see if like this works. This is number three and we will see how this goes. Of course, we don't really have any effects on this day, but I'm hoping there will be one tomorrow. That would be really cool. And we're going to do number one on this one. Okay, let's see here. Some bacon and this is the bomb. I haven't served a bomb in ages, actually. What do you like? Okay, I can feed you one of these flower power creatures. Why not? This guy likes cheese and fries. Feels like it's been ages since I 
actually fed this guy too. He likes the spiky thing or the gloopy thing. <laughs> the gloopy things. I got a hundred of those things. <laughs> I, just, I can't get rid of them. <laughs> They're everywhere. This is for number four. All right, let's see if we can give this one to number two quickly. Nearly, he nearly left. That would have been pretty bad. All right, we have so many aliens, don't we? Look at them all. There's so many. <laughs> There's so many things going on here. And you like the, yeah, the slimy things. I got a lot of those slimy things. Be my guest. Crack on. Enjoy yourself. <laughs> that would be great. All right, and we have uh, another bomb. Another bomb to serve here, I think think is that what i'm doing yeah yeah i'm doing the bomb all right good we'll serve that one as well this one is for number five okay i failed on that one on the bottom one i guess i got the wrong dish there but i wasn't really sure what i was doing number number six number six. Oh, we got a nab boot yes we got a nab boot okay nab boots like okay they like these and nope that was wrong okay this one <laughs> so much to remember and mushrooms and peppers i think yes got you <laughs> nice okay and we're doing oh i don't know hold on i'm just gonna serve this one a second this is number eight there you go i got number seven to do as well let's see fries mushrooms i'm just gonna put that here a second and then i'm gonna guess the meat because we don't have the info on him at the moment so let me see here i don't know what to feed him <laughs> i have no idea shall we try a policeman let's try a policeman or something i don't know i'm sure we'll figure this one out surely all right there you go number seven perfect all right let's put the deck collectors in here and we're gonna you know feed them all up and stuff oh no some of these are naboots and i think i got that order wrong because i thought that they were actually like a different breed so oops i think i might have messed up there <laughs> actually i really like the look of these aliens here with the big teeth i think they look so cool actually i actually really like their design i actually think they might be my favorite design so far they actually look really cool actually so cool okay a visitor has been stunned i don't know what's going on over there can you please take it outside sir <laughs> like what are you doing okay i'm wondering if this number 10 are you actually are you a naboot like i'm kind of wondering now because i got naboots on this mission again i haven't had naboots for a while and it makes me wonder now if that's what they actually are it's playing tricks with my mind <laughs> i don't know what's going on i don't know if you're really that person or if you're something else who knows okay so that was bad all right let's try something else let's try this one okay and this will be yes this one we're gonna try this one all right that's good number 10 there you go and we gotta do this last one here the bomb what was the bomb like again let's find out okay so we gotta get this like uh little flower dude and this one's gonna go to number 11 and we're gonna test that one and see if they like that it's gonna go to number 12 okay we still got more customers incoming today it's quite a quite a long day but it's okay we're gonna get lots of customers served so it's going to be it's going to be great i'm sure of it come in customers come in i just had to speed it up a little bit so we can get this show on the road you know <laughs> that would be awesome all right now we have mushrooms and i forget what you like let's see we got this stuff there you go we'll make sure that that's nice and cooked up what happened to the last one did he like it let's find out he's about to finish eating actually he liked it okay i'm on to a winner now i know what they like at least for now anyway so that's good so chorizo and they like this stuff okay i gotta remember that at least for now anyway at least for the rest of like this uh level anyway so <laughs> that's okay though all right let's see we got some bacon some olives some fries for the bomb this one goes to 14 and what else yeah so the bomb what do we want okay we want this flower power stuff flower power <laughs> is what it looks like to me it's like a flower little plant enemy or whatever they're called i don't know what they're called i have no idea there's so many creatures in this game it's hard to remember all of them all right here we go and then we're going to feed this one it's our last order at least for now but we might have some more customers incoming look at all this rat stuff 
let's make sure we cook all this stuff up as well. All right, yeah, some pretty happy customers today. So that was great, actually. That was super awesome. All right, let's put all this in here as well. Let's cook up some more things. Let's cook, cook up a storm, guys. <laughs> We're gonna cook some amazing dishes. Gonna blow our customers away and they are gonna be so satisfied that they don't know what hit them so that's cool all right we're just gonna speed up now to the end of the level so i think i've done enough for this level for sure but there you go that's the end of day 71 wow <laughs> fantastic good stuff good stuff all right let's look at our upgrades we really don't have much to upgrade oh yeah i need to pay my bills don't i i completely forgot about my bills i got really high bills right now didn't manage to entirely clear it but it's fine all right uh, i don't know shall we see about see if we can actually make some stuff oh yeah i need to buy the info on that creature as well so we gotta do that too so i don't actually have it uh right now so there we go they're called noble shards interesting and that now i know what they like and everything that they do so that's going to help in remembering all of that stuff so that's great okay i don't think i can do anything over here right now no okay let's go let's start a new day and see what happens here no new effect oh it's being really stingy with the effects i got wanted criminals and hungry visitors i remember there was a time when i was like getting a new effect popping up like every time but now it's just being a little bit stingy i hope we get something something new popping up tomorrow that'd be great um this is also double double stuff as well like oh my god <laughs> There's double resources. That's gonna be a pain in the butt. I really want to kill this new alien because I haven't killed one yet, but he's immune to so many things. Oh my god, that's a lot of things. You're not immune to stun though, are you? I don't think you're immune to stun. Let's see what he does. He's going for a smoke. Um, maybe I could get him with this. No, he's not quite coming. Shall we try? Let's try. And then we'll stun him with this and then take him down i don't know i just really wanted to kill one i just i was feeling in a murderous rampagey mood my god i'm really surprised because like i guess that just goes to show how upgraded my cleaver is i took it down in three hits and it had 10 life like that is pretty insane like my cleaver's pretty strong at this point right so yeah that's cool i didn't have any meat for that guy either so i kind of like wanted some so now we've got some so that's good all right bomb dude what do you want you want two of these i put, picked up a bit too many there but it's fine you are a bomb right i think there's now boots and they're confusing me and i i don't know what to do about that <laughs> I have no idea, actually. Okay, there you go. Got that new that new species there as well to cook too. So that's really awesome. Okay, and we got fries and bacon. And I got to get some more things for number five. I'll give you some of this stuff here. So you can have that stuff. All right, let's see. So such big orders. The orders are huge now. Oh my God. But it's fine. We can conquer it. We, we got this. So two of those. Let's put that there. And we're going to cook up some more of these. Great, great stuff. Okay, what have we got here? This one was for number four. This one here was... Who was this for? <laughs> I don't remember who this was for. I think I gave it... Did I give it to the wrong person? I think I just gave it to the wrong person. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> oh no. I'm going to have a very unhappy customer. Okay, fine. Whatever. It's all good. I'm sure they'll forgive me one of these days. <laughs> my prestige is getting up there as well. My prestige is getting quite high. What are my quests, by the way? I should be working on quests as well. Like maybe there's some I can actually work towards. Customers with remote controlled traps. Perhaps I could do that one. The source. I might have to look into that source after this level, actually. And we'll try to work towards that. That would be really good. So once we get somebody in like the vicinity of a trap i can remote control it because i actually do have that power you just press x and then you can remote control like flick through them like this so it is actually really useful sometimes but motion control honestly works better if i'm being honest with you so i prefer to actually do that oh god i got a lot of customers that are about to leave i've been a bit slow here i got a bit distracted <laughs> it's fine it's okay let's see we're gonna do yes we're gonna do this customer here so two of these there you go like why do you want so much so much stuff are you leaving 
Okay, he's there. He's still there. He's still there. We got this one. Number seven. Send that off quick. ASAP. Before they, they leave us forever. That would be sad. Okay, so he wants the rats. Actually, I'm really surprised that this race actually accepts rats. I wasn't expecting that that's just like such an easy like thing to get right i need to put another rat in there right because we're on double resources oh one of those was a nabu and i don't think i took that into consideration i am just like not really looking out for them as much as i should be <laughs> but it's fine okay let's put some rats in here as well it's not like it's gonna really affect me too much if i make a mistake though because i think i'm making more like success successes than not successes apparently someone exploded i don't know who exploded i don't know like if i want to know <laughs> i have no idea but somebody's having a bad day as long as they're not having a bad day near me, then we good. <laughs> so that's all right. Okay, let's see. And Chorizo over here as well. And this is... Who are you? Okay, we just need to put some rats in there. So we'll do that as well. Fill that up. That will be good. Oh, it's another Naboot. I'm going to lose a little bit of rep from that. I think I have lost a bit of rep. I could have sworn I was nearly at... 8,000 and now I've gone down a little bit so oopsie it just happens sometimes it's fine I'm sure we'll build it back up eventually so it's fine we got 2,000 from this level as well and I think I was like almost like completely out so like that's pretty cool I guess all right yeah I lost a bit of reputation whoa I lost a lot of reputation was I really that bad I'm guessing there was a lot of nab boots and I just like missed it and I just didn't realize or something I guess I need to pay more attention to that because they are a pain in the butt <laughs> they're a real pain okay we need some of that nasty gloopy stuff in there and the bomb as well want two of these so we'll put that in this one too oh my rep no i've lost like a whole k of rep here this is really bad this is really bad did it just have like some really hungry customers leave like what happened yeah i think we had a lot of people just leave and i don't know entirely what happened this is number 15 i don't know what happened to this order here let's see the fries let's see hold on a sec yeah, I don't know. I think I've messed this one up. I don't know what I was doing. I'm not too sure. <laughs> it's okay. All right, let's uh, maybe start again. Is that the bacon? The bacon. Okay, so we need olives and we need chips. I kind of like don't know what was happening there for a second. Kind of lost my marbles. Why are so many people leaving? What did I do? Did I upset you? What did I do? <laughs> I have no idea. I'm sorry if I upset you, man. I didn't mean to. That's a Nabu, isn't it? That's totally a Nabu. Okay let's see let's do just do nabu stuff so two of those all right hopefully that's right i'm losing rep and i don't like that i don't want to lose rep <laughs> okay so this goes to number 19 when it actually heats up all right there you go perfect we got another customer incoming he's running walking with swag <laughs> guest exploded more guests are exploding oh man it's injuring other guests here as well not looking too great huh it's okay though all right let's deal with our customers here we got a couple of customers here to solve as well i think one requires rat so this one is the rat one number 22 and then the bomb we are just going to use this stuff all right cool let's see if this like works and <laughs> goes well i hope so all right it's number 22 and this one is number 21 all right there you go hopefully we'll get some nice like rewards here oh good i think i chose the right the right option there the right meat there so that's super cool that was really really long that was a really long level and i didn't do too well i only got an f which is kind of sad actually so yeah i'm a bit upset about that all right so we need to work on these quests that we got as well so i'm gonna try and get this anathema sauce whatever that is i actually don't know what this stuff is oh i don't have enough forces the customer to leave after eating the burger i think i gotta kill that new race to get some of that so i actually had one towards it but like clearly not enough so I need to do a little bit more there but that's okay I'm sure we'll be able to work towards that as well so that'll be really good all right here we go 
just stock up our little things that would be great went through quite a lot of french fries today actually that's um interesting wasn't expecting to go through quite as many of those but it's okay all right we got some bacon here i actually think i need to do my bills as well last time i looked i had a lot of bills so, so we need to clear those off there you go perfect all sorted so i'm happy about that and we even have enough to get something else here let's just go for meat processor for speed it's all maxed out now my meat processor for speed's all maxed out 28 more days until I can get a new skin or anything. Still no new effect. I'm just really unlucky with these effects right now. So that sucks. But yeah, I think any of these things that come in now, I'm going to kill them. I think that would be a really good idea. They actually only take three hits. So, so I think we just need to get them to a, like a secluded location and then just like take them out. All I've got is protesters today. So it's not a big deal. I actually think I'll set all my traps up. Maybe we'll go on a killing marathon today. What do you think? I feel like we haven't really done much killing recently. And it could be an idea. Maybe I'll set them, do them remotely. Let's do them remotely because I haven't actually killed many remotely and I got a quest for it as well. So like that's what I'm gonna hopefully do. So that'll be really good actually. All right, where are you going? Probably could get you with the gun. Does the gun affect you? Let's have a look. The gun does not affect you. Never mind then. <laughs> that's not gonna work then, is it? All right, we'll hit you once and then stun you and then just take you down exactly the same way as before actually so that's good hopefully we'll get some parts from that to make that sauce because we don't have the sauce right now okay not too much i can do there actually shall i kick you out get out of here silly protesters what do you think you're doing get out of my fine establishment i want some more people to go into these rooms like hopefully <laughs> nobody seems to want to today it's like they know they know what i'm up to here so that's kind of annoying that's just a nabu up there i believe let's just go and kill people i want to murder people i'm in a like a, a murdering kind of mood right now so that's what i'm gonna do were you a protester i don't know what you were but you are now dead <laughs> you are now splattered in many ways many ways all right let's get rid of you as well i'm so i'm so strong that i just like kill most things with one hit now it's kind of a bit like it's not as fun when it's not hard <laughs> i was liking it like <laughs> I actually was kind of liking it when it was hard but at the same time it's stressful it's just like you can't have the best of both worlds I guess right so one of those things I suppose all right let's have a look what's going on here all right oh he just blew up and murdered somebody I'm gonna get in trouble for that aren't I oh boy oh boy oh no here let's just just have a dance everything's fine are you still attacking me wow I'm really shocked at that I thought he would I thought he would go away for sure after I like, you know, told him off. I'm actually surprised I only got three badges for that. I for sure thought that I was going to have a police raid, but no, we actually didn't. So like, that's really surprising. Take that. Ha ha. I will murder all of you and there's nothing you can do about it. Yeah, you want to go as well? Oh God, this guy has more, more health than I, than I remembered. <laughs> it's okay. It's all right. We got this guy too. He's down. He's down. We're going to get loads of meat today. It's a meat, meat bonanza day today. <laughs> Let's just kill everyone. Everybody's dying today. Anybody else? Come at me. This guy actually might might explode. I don't know. I actually didn't. I, I one shot him. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> I'm not sure like how strong I am. So like I didn't know. I didn't know like how it would go. All right, scared rid of you. That Mykonanian obviously is immune to physical attacks. So so I had to kind of leave him. To be fair, but like that's okay. All right, we got a, a Nabu over here. So that's an easy kill. There you go. Very nice. Hello. Welcome to my establishment. Would you like a cleaver to the face with that burger? <laughs> I swear it's a, it's a good deal. It's a good deal, I swear. Die. Everyone die. Ha <laughs> ha. Take that. I should probably clean up. <laughs> like, 
<laughs> it's been, I've been a bit crazy today, you know? Me too. Get rid of you as well. Oh, this guy's in the perfect position, don't you think? Let's get rid of him. There you go. There you are. I really want to kill some more of these dudes, actually. I was going to stop, but you know, I'm enjoying my rampage so much that I think I'm just going to kill everyone and just get tons of meat. This is how you just get, like, so much meat in this game that you don't know what to do with it. It just becomes, like, absolutely insane. What happened to you? You, like, got stuck in the doorway. Like, I literally have no idea what just happened to you, but, like, okay. That was strange. Okay, I got this dude on me, which is kind of bad because I can't actually, like, hurt him with physical attacks, so I'm just gonna distract him over there. <laughs> that seems like a good idea. Actually, please don't hurt me. I didn't do anything to you, I swear. I'm just having a good day over here. Nothing weird is happening. Nothing weird is happening in my burger joint, okay? Nothing at all. <laughs> my god, there really is a lot of customers just like going crazy here. Okay, quick, get the body. Ah, I think I just hurt him. Okay, I think I'm done with my rampage. I've, all, I've got a police raid coming, so <laughs> I think I've well and truly uh, done enough here. I think I've done enough damage, don't you think? <laughs> I think it's a good idea to call it here. All right, I'm just gonna go invisible a second so I can just get around here. Oh, <laughs> he saw me. It's fine though, it's fine. Okay, oh uh, well, that was intense, but fun. <laughs> I like going on rampages sometimes, you know? It's just like, it's amusing. All right, there you go. I killed so many people as well, like so many. There were so many deaths. <laughs> so many things that fell to my hands and it felt great. It felt amazing. The police will never know. This is our secret, okay, guys? They don't tell anyone that, like, that's what we did. It's it's a secret. So don't don't snitch on me, okay? I didn't do anything this whole time. I've just been running my burger joint, and I've just been so innocent about the situation. And like, I honestly swear that I didn't do anything at all. Okay, what do we got to do here? Okay, I got some some more of this slime stuff. I'm just gonna pretend like nothing happened and that I've just been serving customers this whole time and the police will never know. It's funny that the police are actually not suspicious of me. They don't have a red ring around them, which means they're not suspicious. I don't know why when like multiple, multiple people called in and said there was something weird happening at my place, but Hey, maybe I bribed the police and I got him on my side. Maybe, I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea. Let's cook up this uh, meat because I actually don't have much of this stuff. So, like, that would be good. Hello, police officer. I swear I've been good today. I am behaving. Everything is great. So please move along. <laughs> I can make you a cup of tea if you like. Would you like some tea or something? Get out of here, protester. Who do you think you are? My god. Okay, let's cook this stuff up as well. That would be super awesome. Let's put these in too. Ta -da -da -da. It's going super great right now. Even though there's police here, they're not really disturbing me or anything. So, like, I don't really have to worry about them. It's great. Okay, so I want, I want rats. Yeah, we want rats here. Oh, I got the wrong burger type. Yeah, the wrong burger bun even. <laughs> but that's fine. Let's put this away and we got another one over here as well. Let's see. I guess I'll put some more of these things on too. Alright, there you go. And this is for number 11. Good stuff. I guess I could just speed it up a little bit. I don't think the police are gonna do anything to me anyway. They're probably just gonna, gonna leave. I'm gonna have to pay off that like police I'm gonna have to bribe the police like to get off my back after we're done with the level but it's fine I got loads of money anyway so it's not really a big deal all right so this is number 12 and we're gonna give him some slime there you go enjoy your slime meal <laughs> Your lovely, delicious slime. <laughs> My god, it must be such a yummy meal. I just cannot comprehend. <laughs> All right, there you go. So this is for number 12. This one here is for... Oh, you're a Nabu, aren't you? I just saw you transform. I'm pretty sure you are. So I hope you do this stuff instead. 
All right, so we got bacon and olives over here as well. Isn't it funny just like how much you can kill like when you have like all the upgrades. So you can really just go on like a mad rampage. It's amazing. Okay, so the bomb one, we want the rudises, I think. Yeah, the rudises. Let's put the rudises over there as well. So that'll be good. Just need to wait for this to heat up a little bit and then we'll give that to you. There you go. Oh man, my prestige is getting lower and lower I swear I'm not even bothering with the protesters because they're just annoying and I just can't be bothered I think they do get rid of your prestige so I should I just can't be bothered <laughs> they're just too much of a pain in the butt they just irritate me you know they just never they never go away I think we're finished with the level yeah I only got an E <laughs> just because I killed so many people I think so any I only got an E for that one so that was not too great but it's okay, it's fine. We'll be able to make this, this sauce now. And hopefully we'll be able to do something with that. Where is it? This one here. It forces the customer to leave after they've eaten the burger. I can only make three of them. How many do I need to do for my quest? Let's see. Let's see, three times. So that's actually perfect. That will complete my quest pretty easily. I do need to do the remote uh, one as well. So we do need to tackle that at some point too but like that's okay i'm sure we'll get the opportunity to do that as well let's just buy some things buy some resources i still got like 900 left over i don't know what i'm gonna do with it i don't know if i can do it i can't do anything with it anyway so i'll just hold on to it let's go for a new day hopefully a new effect come on oh good finally i really wanted a new effect okay i don't think this is the mold one i think this is something else interesting is there like some weird aliens some weird alien experiment being let loose in like my restaurant like what is this is this what these scientists were doing this whole time is this what my money was going towards <laughs> these crazy creatures oh god they look horrid oh no look at that that looks awful I'm a bit scared about that guy. Oh no, do you have to come to my restaurant? Please don't eat me. I don't taste good. All right, let's see. Devourers. Attention, hybrids designed to kill humans have been spotted near Good Burger. They are kind creatures and never skimp on tips, but seeing a human will drive them into a crazed frenzy. So if at all possible, you should avoid the restaurant. Oh my god. Wait, so they come in and ask, they come in and they actually order, but if they see me, they're just gonna attack on sight. Fantastic. <laughs> I'm a bit nervous about this one, actually. It's been a while since I had, like, an effect that's actually worrying, like, worrying me. So, yeah, that doesn't sound too great. Let's put my traps on just to be on the safe side, because I do feel a bit a bit insecure with this one so just to be safe let's uh let's go with that <laughs> i don't know if like i don't know if you can kill these things or not but i'd rather be safe than sorry so that's what i'm gonna go with actually okay so that one down there is actually a that's actually a naboot that that like uh teeth alien down there so like that's good to know all right what are we dealing with okay we just gotta put some slime thing in there and that will be okay that's that order fulfilled at least i think so these things will just appear at random right so i just gotta be alert at all times and just kind of hope that they don't murder me <laughs> but we will see okay so we've got some jalapenos and i forget what naboot's like actually i haven't served any in a little bit okay so i could give them the bird or the pink let's give them the pink stuff i got a lot of that pink stuff actually so that would be good got some bacon and deck collector for the policeman i think so that would probably be okay i'll double check it though in a second let's put some of this on i'm still picking up three i just got i got such a habit with that i've like basically played this whole game while just having three stoves so it's really weird for me to have more than that at this point you know okay so this is number two and the policeman i just want to check deck collector yeah that is right so number three is over there do we have another order yeah we got the the bombs so he wants olives so i can i can definitely do that for you i'm surprised that these things haven't appeared yet like i would have thought that they would have but it's just biding its time oh now they're here oh god they look scary it's a new record as well okay here we go can you kill you can kill them and get their like parts too god they look really disturbing <laughs> i don't like it 
Another monster that settled down in the galactic community. For the majority of space inhabitants, this race is not dangerous, but if a devourer sees an earthling, it will try to kill that earthling at any cost. The monster suffers from its aggression no less than its victims. Deep in their souls, devourers are kind and sensitive creatures who prefer to stay away from people and lead a monistic lifestyle. Its appearance says otherwise. It looks like a terrifying spider, but okay, I'll, I'll believe you. <laughs> but their genetic programming pushes them to crime because during the war with humanity, the Mykonanians bred devourers artificially with one and only one girl. Oh, okay, this makes sense. So that's why the humans were wiped out by the Mykonanians. I didn't know that actually. To destroy earthlings. Over the next decades, some insisted on the complete extermination of these monsters. Others defended them as victims of the war. Finally, after the destruction of mankind, the galactic community allowed devourers to live among other aliens through the efforts of Om Nomni, and the last surviving earthlings are not happy about this, of course. We gotta eradicate these guys, they only got 5 health. It's not that bad, actually. I wonder how tough they actually are. Do you think we should try and take one down? I wish I could kind of take it into a secluded spot and just kind of like deal with it, but I'm not really sure. So yeah, they're just going to be suspicious at like all times. I honestly don't know what to feed it either. I'm thinking I want to kill it. Let's, does it, wait, I don't know what it's immune to though, do I? Maybe I should wait until I have more information about it because it might be immune to like physicals or like anything. And if that is the case, then I'm probably going to get myself killed. So it might not be a good idea in that respect. So I think I'll wait till I get the info at the very least because I choose life. <laughs> Thank you. I worked hard to get to this stage. I'm not willing to, to die now. If it dies by a trap though, then like that's kind of cool, I guess but we'll have to see what happens there. Are you the devourer again? Are you coming up here? I feel like you're just like taunting me at this point. <laughs> what do you want? I don't even know what to feed it. Um, God, I don't know. I'll try feed it this, Let's see if it likes it. And so far, nobody seems to like this. So I'm thinking that it could be an idea. So he's already got the, yeah, he's already got that. We just need, we need the peppers. Let's put that in there. And oh God, did you see me? Did you see me? You saw me. It's fine. I'm invisible. You saw nothing. We're fine. We're fine. We're good. We're good pals. What are you talking about? No. You, you haven't seen me. You haven't seen me. It's all a figment of your imagination. Can you please let me give you the burger man? I'm just trying to give you your order. <laughs> That's all. How are you seeing me from here? I guess I'll have to wait till he like moves or something. That's super annoying. I can't even serve anyone until he, until he like moves. <laughs> Which is really annoying. Oh man, I wish I could just murder him. Maybe I could, but I don't want to like take that risk. Gonna have people like leaving at this point. Are you going, sir? Okay, thank you. Thank you. I can finally serve you. Here you go. He's gonna come back now, isn't he? Because he's gonna want his order. <laughs> it's like, just put it in. Oh no. It's okay though. It's fine. All right, so let's get some rats. Gonna put that in there as well. Don't know if I'm gonna have time for it, but I'll try, I guess. Oh, the devourer died. He just got murdered by my trap. Awesome. We're gonna get his parts then. So that's really good because I don't have, I don't have his parts right now. So yeah, I wouldn't mind having it. Oh, that's a Naboot. Okay, let's make sure we give him the right stuff. I'm going to give him the pink stuff actually. So I got a lot of that stuff. Oh, the Naboot just died. Never mind. <laughs> Looks like I'm not going to be doing that after all. I just got my traps on because I feel a little bit uneasy at the moment, especially with this dude. Oh, there's a devourer down there that actually did survive. So I guess one died and one one actually did survive I suppose um what do I feed this guy I think I'll go with this thing oh I'm not gonna have time he's gonna leave yeah I've taken taken a little bit too long with that dude there's a little bit too much craziness happening here you know <laughs> there's a lot going on <laughs> for sure that guy exploded because he was not happy but these things happen sometimes you know sometimes I'm just a little bit too slow so that's unfortunate okay this one is deck collector if i remember the bomb likes this stuff i'm running out of this stuff as well maybe i can cook some do i have some to cook i actually do have some to cook so i should probably start cooking some of these actually because yeah i don't have any of those going right now um hello devourer i come in peace i swear it i come in peace don't murder me please i just want to be your friend hello number 12 
And we got this one, number 11. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. He's like the devourer of souls. <laughs> the devourer of man's soul. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> so creepy, so creepy, man. Can't believe that we got this crazy dude in our restaurant right now. Okay, we got, I think, a Nabu. Wasn't it these guys? I think it was this that he likes to eat so we should be good with that so this is 14 this one here is oh had some lag there but it's fine and this one here is 13 i think and we got the actual this dude here i don't even know if he liked what i fed him i don't actually know i didn't look to be fair let's feed him another one and see if he likes it so i don't i don't actually know <laughs> we will see we will see i kind of like had my hands full just kind of surviving so there was that as number 15. I have to say that with the invisibility thing where you can just like go invisible and stuff, it really like makes it like quite easy to get out of like hairy situations. So it's not like really that big of a deal anymore actually. All right, here he comes. Just taking all of the, the stuff there. All right, cool. Okay, we're nearly closed up for the day as well. We're probably just gonna get a few more orders in here. I think that was right anyway at least I think so all right what are we gonna do here this is a Naboot yes this is another Naboot oh that was close <laughs> and nearly and nearly he nearly saw me but not quite so we're nice and safe for now anyway <laughs> for now how long that will last is another story right <laughs> so I don't know I kind of messed that up a little bit actually I was number 18 we're doing this one and bacon and the bomb where is the bomb okay we got the bomb here do I have any like Rudises I guess I could put a Rudis in there it's your lucky day you get one of my rare Rudises today we can cook up this new meat as well there you go perfect just give this to number 17 did that guy like what I gave him oh he did he did he does like that teeth stuff oh that's good i found out what he he likes without even knowing so that's pretty awesome hello devourer please don't eat me <laughs> okay this is number 19 and you just like the rats so we should do that i've completely forgot to use my sauce as well but that's all right we we have plenty of time to like try it out and use it i still gotta get that mold effect to pop up so we can do one of the quests as well so we're not going to be able to move on from this planet until we've done that at the very least so like i don't know how long that's going to take to pop up it might take like a a couple of days or something i don't really know to be honest but yeah at least i know what this guy likes sweets so that's good I actually guessed on my first try. <laughs> it's kind of easy to suss out sometimes though. Oh, the devourer just died. Haha, <laughs> take that devourer. <laughs> That's what you get <laughs> for trying to murder humanity. How could you? How could you do such a thing? All right, let's put this stuff away. And I got some more of these to cook as well. Perfect. I'm sure we'll get some species that really like to eat this thing. Even though it looks like really disturbing. I don't know why anyone would want to eat that. But aliens are very very strange after all <laughs> all right now we're just gonna wait for the day to end and there we go i got an s rank i have had really bad ranks recently so it's nice to see an s rank again for a change you know <laughs> they haven't really had much luck here <laughs> but that's okay all right let's restock our supply that would be great so we might be able to get a new upgrade maybe i don't know so i think we still have some bills and stuff like that to pay off as well so i may have to think about doing that too so let's see there you go all my bills are done i don't have any police after me or anything let's see do i have shall i buy something let's see i got extra module or stove speed hmm it's just like i do really feel like there's just not much for me here anymore <laughs> it's just like a couple of upgrades here they're not even that useful either so i do kind of feel like a bit like the progression is wearing off and i'm the kind of person that really loves progression in games and once that progression starts to die off that's when i start to like get a bit bored so <laughs> it is kind of like getting to that stage honestly but we have done extremely well and i really want to see what like different aliens we're gonna get when is actually the next like lot of aliens there's not actually that many more aliens now like oh my god looking through the planets it looks like only the final planet has like different aliens so, so that's a bit sad our dude is looking very happy whistling away there chopping his tomatoes 
He smells something really pongy. What do you think it could be? Is it radiation or something? Oh no. Oh no. Oh, the food is like rotten. Does it make all my food rotten? Please don't say that. I got so much food. Like seriously, so much food. <laughs> oh God. Oh, this is the mold one. Oh cool. So we can do the quest with this one. So I'm very much looking forward to that actually. So we get times two payment for burgers while the mode thing is active so like that's nice not that i need money but hey that's a nice addition i suppose what a misfortune today's inspection revealed mold in the fridge of the good burger restaurant no not moldy food even one lump of this infestation can consume a year's supply of meat over the course of a single day a good chef knows that the only place for mold is in the garbage and that you have to deal with all the mold or it will just spread again okay so that's going to be the main focus of today since we do have a quest for for that let me see I have to not allow more than five units of mold to form during the mold day now I'm not entirely sure how you go about stopping the mold from forming but I'm sure there's just like something I can do to just like prevent it or something so I'm going to focus mostly on that I don't really know what to expect I've never seen it before so we'll just have to see and also I'm gonna try using this sauce as well anathema sauce three times I don't know which one this is actually I'm not even sure what like one I wish it gave you a description and like actually it told you which one mold appeared like what what do I do here it is mold is here what do I do with it put it in the bin I put it in the bin oh okay that's not that bad mold is spreading what do you mean mold is spreading I got rid of it didn't I D am I missing something here what was that flash? I don't know what that was about. Maybe it's like, oh, there's more mold here. Oh, it just like hides. It hides in all the tabs. You really got to like, look like really carefully at like where all the mold is. Okay, that's really annoying. It actually spawns really quickly as well and very easy to overlook too. But I think I can do it. I think we'll be okay. Someone just died. Oh no, oh no, oh no. This is bad. Oh, he got revived. <laughs> I guess that's good. Hey, that's the first time I've ever seen them revive something, to be fair. All right, where's the mold? Let's get rid of the mold. I just have to, like, watch out in the corners. It does tell you when the mold, like, is forming. It's just constant. It really just, like, it's really quick. Like, really quick. Someone just died again. Who just died? You just died? I'll just get rid of the body quickly. I don't know what happened. I'm surprised nobody, like, was suspicious about that. But apparently they weren't. I got some more mold in there as well. Let's get rid of that. I'm just constantly just trying to get rid of the mold. I can't even do anything else. <laughs> How am I even going to go about my day? It's just constantly here. It's driving me mad. <laughs> my god. Um, Can I take down... I'm going to take this guy down because I'm not going to be able to feed him. He's going to leave for so... Like, I just didn't have time to actually deal with him, so it's fine. I think that's the only bit of mold, right? Yeah, this is the, the only bit of mold in there right now. Uh, I can't even clean myself up right now. Again? Serious? This is driving me crazy. The mold is so annoying. It just doesn't want to disappear. <laughs> it's every two seconds. Seriously. <laughs> This is annoying. Okay, okay. We're going to hopefully, like, serve a customer. All right. So we need this and this mold again. But I'm just going to leave it for two seconds. I'm sure I'll be okay for two seconds. And we need... Oh, man. That guy just exploded. All right. Oh, God. Two bits of mold in here right now. Is that the only bit of mold? That's the only bit of mold. I don't even know how I'm going to serve my customers. It's just getting so hectic. I don't know what's going on. Visitor is in a panic. Oh, my God. <laughs> With the meteors and the mold, it's just really hard to multitask with this. Really hard. And I just like, I don't want to fail this quest because it kind of takes a while to like get the effects that you want sometimes it can take a real long time to get the things you want so yeah super annoying um okay i'm gonna serve this customer over here someone is leaving i'm losing reputation sadly okay so what do you what do i want to feed you let's find out so some rats so let's feed you let's feed you some rat here I'm actually gonna serve someone it's a miracle it's a miracle out <laughs> that was not a miracle I just got hit by something mold appeared all right where's the mold at it's usually in here all right there it is get rid of that 
give this to number six. I actually serve someone. Yay! There's some more mold. Just get rid of that mold. It looks like it comes at two at a time. So if I just keep that in mind and then I'll just kind of get rid of it as it comes. So I just got one. I'll wait for the second one to come before I like remove it because I think another one is going to appear very very soon at least that's how it has been meteors on the way okay can you hurry up sir please mold is spreading oh god oh god oh god oh god the mold is spreading we need to get rid of this stuff okay we're fine it was only three bits you just can't have five bits but man it's annoying it's like the most annoying thing ever it's number seven all right we got this one i think we just give the the rat to uh, to this one as well how do things get moldy so fast i don't understand a visitor died oh my god oh no i think they might be reviving are they reviving Oh, I think the police are coming, aren't they? Oh my god, everybody's dying. I don't even know what's happening at the moment. Oh my god, the police are coming. The police are coming. <laughs> I didn't even have a say. I didn't do anything. It's not my fault. <laughs> I swear it's not my fault. I'm just going to put this stuff back in because I, I think half the people that I was going to serve just kind of left anyway. So it's fine. I'm just going to keep grabbing this mold i don't want this mold in my fridge go away you nasty mold all right let's put that in the bin over there oh my gosh imagine if like mold just appeared this quickly though <laughs> it would be terrifying it would be extremely terrifying for sure okay so we got mushrooms fries for you and i think they eat rat so i'm just gonna put this here ready for this guy oh god what's going on i'm sorry I don't know what I did. <laughs> it's okay. We have mold. Now we're good. Now we have mold. Mold is, is just listening to me. It knew. It knew. All right. Let's give this to number 12. I actually served someone. It's a miracle. Like, oh my God. Some uh, little peppers and some chorizo and some rat. I'll put this here for you later. I think we got some mold here. Yes, we do. But it's okay. It's okay. I actually can't put this in the bit in the bin because the police officer is just literally right there. So I'm just gonna have to hold on for it to it for a minute. I think as long as it's not in the fridge, it, I don't think it counts as long as it's like not in the fridge. So it should be fine. All right, there's that. We're gonna give this to number 13. There you go. More mold. Oh my gosh. Let's get rid of that as well. My God, meteors are on the way again. I lost one bit of life, but it's only one, so it's fine. Okay, so let's start on the next order. So we have cheese to tomato got some more mold there as well to deal with and some some bacon and some olives all right let's put that there oh you didn't see nothing nothing's happening we need to get rid of this mold quickly oh my god this is the worst ah that hit me on the head as well not good okay we need to feed this guy let's see what we got here we got the we got to give him the the slime stuff or feed him the slime this one goes in here and then we got the bomb which is let's see i could feed him the rudis or something i'm not too sure oh if we get put this mold away let's put this mold somewhere some more mold is coming but meteors are also here as well i didn't put the moldy thing in there did i i think i might have put the mold in there by accident i did not mean to i should probably like i don't know do something about that i pretty sure i put mold in there i did not mean to where'd it go yeah i did i did i totally i nearly gave him a moldy like meal <laughs> That would have been really bad. I'm finding it really hard to maintain this while, like, dealing with the mold. Like, seriously, I'm not getting my orders out, like, at all. And it's, like, really difficult. Definitely really hard. Especially with trying to avoid the police as well. At the same time, it's a really hard to multitask this. Definitely really hard. Um, okay. I got this one. This is for... Oh, he just left. Yep. All my orders are just leaving. I'm just I'm gonna lose rep on this one. But you know it's it's alright. It's uh it's best to just get this quest out of the way, to be honest with you. It really is a horrible one. Some more mold here as well. God, meteors coming too, but that's okay. Alright, yep, we're losing people. <laughs> no, stop leaving my restaurant. Just give me more time. I just need more time. Okay, oh my god. Okay, okay, let's let's do this. Alright, so we got the bomb person, we got the this one here let's put that one in and for that's a nabu isn't it yeah that's a nabu so we want uh we could just go with the same one for this one as well actually 
Mode is here, but I just need to wait for that Meteor. Okay, cool stuff. All right, let's get rid of the mold. There you go. It's all good. Put that in the bin. All right, this one is number 18. Let's actually send some orders off. Oh my God, my first order's actually gone out. It's a miracle. I haven't managed to get any out today. So I'm glad that I managed to get a few bits and bobs out here. Okay, this would be, no, this would be a rat. And it would be this one and this one. Let's just put that one here. So this is I need to get rid of that mold. It's spreading. It's spreading. It's spreading. Do not Do not spread that was four. That was close. That was pretty close You can just like you can barely leave it like you can leave it for like one second and it like all starts spreading so quickly It's insane. Okay, our guest exploded. Oh, he's got revived. It's fine. It's fine. Everything's good This is for number 20 Are the police coming back again. Seriously? Okay, wait, uh, this is for number 21. The police are coming back again. <laughs> My god, put this mold away. There you go. I really hope that I didn't go to five, but I think we're all right. I don't think it will tell me, like, on the quest. Yeah, I don't think it will let me. Like, it won't tell me, um, definitely. So that kind of sucks. All right, mushrooms. Let's put these down over here. And these are the blonde guys. So we need the slime. Okay, we'll do the slime in a sec. I think there's a meteor coming. Yeah, I was waiting for the meteor to, like, come. But we're okay. So that's good. Okay, let me put this in the bin. And we need... Uh, this is a a rat i think we need a rat uh meat so we'll grab this one too meteors are coming all right that's totally the wrong order like what what's happening here oh no that is for 22 but i just probably not gonna get that out yeah he left i'm literally getting hardly any orders today it sucks it's so bad i'm really struggling with this one i have to say there was two in there i think that's all i had though so like that's fine it's not too much to worry about there so that's good it looks like i actually did feed one guy but that was like the only one that i actually did manage to feed <laughs> sadly but it's fine it's all good oh man he's gonna see me it's fine i'll just go invisible so we're fine everything is good everything is good <laughs> uh, are we are we nearly finished with this level like please say because like please say it is nearly done because this mold issue is just absolutely savage i'm really having a hard time containing this <laughs> this mold is so bad i can't believe how fast it like spreads it's insane <laughs> i wasn't expecting it to be quite as fast as this honestly all right mold appeared okay are we good oh there was another one in there as well yep a little sneaky bit of mold there that i didn't notice <laughs> that's okay though all right okay we're good we're good at the moment anyway we'll just wait we've got to wait for these police people to like leave first of all before like we can actually do anything here so there is there is that all right sir are you leaving now good because i need to put this mold away if you don't mind <laughs> that would be good probably gonna be some more popping up in here any second i would fast forward it but i just can't because of the mold situation and i don't want to fail this so i'm really hoping we succeed <laughs> i'm really hoping so all right got two bits of mold there put that away i didn't see any more than four appearing it says more than five i'm pretty sure i didn't see more than five appearing so we should be okay i feel a bit anxious about it but we should be okay <laughs> i'm pretty sure i've managed it well it's like i even like prioritized it over feeding my customers so, so <laughs> i definitely was paying attention at least i was trying to anyway is there any more in here i think we're fine at the moment i don't think there's any mold in here at the moment so we're good we're good quest complete that's got to be it right that's got to be my quest i really hope so let's have a look see if it actually counted yes it did yay okay so we gotta do one more day to like get these other two quests i was so focused on that quest that i just did not have time to focus on anything else sadly so yeah that sucks a little bit but i think it was worthwhile to do it like that because just missing out on that would have been just hell 25 more days for the golden skin i can do it oh and we get another effect today as well one we have not seen yet these are rivals right they're breaking in oh my god this is like the phone one. Oh, they're like breaking my order thing oh god is there a way for me to fix it or something does that say f u at the bottom <laughs> i'm not sure <laughs> what's going on here 
I have no idea. All right, let's 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 find out what's actually happening today then. <laughs> it's gonna be interesting. System crashes. I get two times payment for burgers. All rise, the court is in session. The, env the envious Larravi, yeah, so they're the rivals, who recently opened their own restaurant have, have sabotaged their rival. The good burger diner. The little pranksters will have to answer to the law, but the chef's task is to continue daily operations, even with a broken queue system. What do you mean, a broken queue system? What, what does that mean? <laughs> I don't like the sound of that, if I'm being honest with you. All right, so today what our tasks are is to give three different sources to the customers and also we have to kill people with remote controlled traps, which I am going to attempt to do. So yeah, that's going to be cool. Oh, you can't see the order number. Oh no, that's what that means. Oh, good Lord. That's going to be painful, isn't it? It's going to be super painful. Let's just put this one in quick. <laughs> Because otherwise it's gonna be hell. All right, let's see. I need to try and get them in a in a place where, like, I need to watch where they're going so I can activate these traps as well and get these traps going. Like that would be really cool. I guess I'm just gonna have to like guess which is which. <laughs> this is like literally so insane. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know how I'm gonna deal with this, but I'll try my best. All right, is anybody like going into like a trap area or like anything like that? That would be really cool do you have to kill them with the traps or do i just have to activate the traps you have to kill them with the traps so it can can't be a stun one it has to be one that actually kills them okay wait 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 i might be able to do this top one if i can get there in time oh that's just a stun one. Oh, he's gone out of the region for it that sucks but maybe if i like wait a little bit i might be able to get him with this one i just don't like don't know how long he's like gonna sit there <laughs> I'm mean, gonna have to wait for him for ages because he's like he's doing some like police investigation over there or something I don't know like when he's gonna move. Are you gonna move anytime soon, sir? I'd like to get you with this like shotgun if you don't mind <laughs> I'm hoping that he doesn't just sit there all night Let's hope he actually moves over so I can get him with this. I have to do it like this as well He's moving. He's moving. All right. This is my chance I should be able to get him right. Come on, dude, just go right in front of that gun. Like, I swear nothing bad's gonna happen. Activate! Yeah! And hopefully, that would have counted on my quest, I'm hoping, anyway. Now it's gone to 40%. I think it was a bit lower than that before. So that did count, so that is fantastic. At least that quest is actually working and counting, which makes me happy <laughs> at the very least, because, uh, yeah, it's not been working out too well with my quests at least not not always anyway all right where's that bomb going he's just going up there to the to the room hmm i wonder like when they will actually go into a different room maybe i should start serving customers though like just in case so i don't want to lose a rep either so there is that too okay let's put that in the bun over there and we're just going to keep an eye on them okay perfect right so no we don't we want to activate some traps here all right so if we activate this one there you go activate it didn't actually hurt anyone i guess he was immune to it or something let's activate this one did that kill them okay that killed one okay that was good so i was on 40 percent last time now i'm on 50 percent. so it's working so that's a super good all right so this one here is for yeah this one <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of hard to see but I think I can sort of I sort of like get it so it's not not that bad actually the order one's not that bad as long as you are observant I think like you can get away with it so it's fine okay so we need to definitely feed this one but it's not as effective I feel like the motion sensor is way more effective if I'm being honest okay so what does this this one here wants let's see the slime stuff i think i'm gonna have some people leaving yep yep and so, like i'm so focused on like doing other things that i'm just not just not getting these orders out in time so i'm trying to do quests and it makes it a little difficult when you're like trying to do quests that you know it's hard to get everything in time we're gonna punch him that didn't that didn't even work <laughs> never mind then 
<laughs> that sucks. Yeah, I'm losing rep. It sucks. It's all right. It's only a little bit. I'm sure I'll be able to build it up. Like we're we're busy doing quests, and honestly, there isn't that many more quests for me to do before we can get like to the end planet. So so it's not too bad actually. All right. So these are basically like the only quests I've got left to do. So yeah, it's not too bad. Okay, let's get these rats over here as well. Let's activate a trap. I feel like I might be able to do something if I'm quick enough. I wish there was a faster way to scroll through them if I'm being honest did that work it didn't kill him oh no I didn't kill him okay that sucks <laughs> never mind though I should probably upgrade that I didn't realize it did such little damage but hey it's fine this is this one this one here is this one yep I think he's going home because I made him mad, so that sucks a bit, but never mind. Okay, let's see what else I can do here. Let's activate this one here. All right, that's good. I got someone with that, so that's awesome. Let's see if we can maybe get this one too, the pole dancing thing, if he gets close enough. I'm hoping he does. It's so slow motion in this, like, mode. Get him. Yes. Did I get him? Awesome. Okay, that's good. I got two people there, so that's got a 70%, so we're, we're getting there. We're getting there. It's getting, like, it's taking a while, but... I'm doing it <laughs> slowly slowly but surely okay so we need to feed I'm going to feed you the bomb person so what are we doing here so I need this stuff here and let's see we also need some bacon and some fries oh I've done the bacon already it's just the the fries and we need the sauce but I don't really know what sauce it was I should have looked actually I think it could be this one could be this one we will try it so this one goes to you at least i think so <laughs> i think anyway and then the tomato let's see and this is the this one here so we need the slime let's do the slime quickly i don't think there's going to be time for this one but i'll try my best and we want to feed this one to you as well let's hope that we get this in in time i don't know if we will be able to i just got it all right awesome so the ones we've served we of course like we don't want to kill the ones we've we've served right okay let's go to this one i've actually served number 10 so we don't want to kill that guy actually we'll just wait for another opportunity there doesn't seem to be an opportunity right now that guy's gonna leave there's not much i can do about that one so that sucks source activated okay that's good right i think that's good i don't know I don't know if that worked, but I hope it, I hope it did. <laughs> I have no idea. Yeah, use the sauce three times. That, I think that did work, so that's good. Okay, so the bomb. We need to feed the bomb a second. So we need to give him this one, and I'll try to give him the sauce. So this is the sauce, the little carrot stick sauce then, I guess. <laughs> so that's good. We should be able to get these quests easy peasy. All right, so this one is this one i think yes i'm pretty sure okay is there anybody yes there is i don't know if i'm going to reach this guy in time uh, i think i just missed him that's unfortunate oh wait i could get him in the bathroom we could totally get him in the bathroom once he like gets into range for that there he goes did i get him is he immune to it? Oh, maybe he's immune to it. That's unfortunate. <laughs> Never mind. I tried. That's what matters. So, so there is that. Okay, I think we got some people eating and stuff. So like, that's good. I don't have any of that sauce left, do I? No, I used all that sauce. I don't know if I managed to get everyone with it or not. I don't know. I'm on 70% with the, the traps. What did it say on the other one? And 66 with the sauce. There's one more person to eat the sauce. I don't know if it's the person that's like eating right now. It could be. I'm hoping so. Quest complete. Sauce eaten. Yes. I think we got it. Okay. So it's just the traps. That's all we need now. Just the traps. I think there's somebody just about to go into the room. I don't know if I got that guy. Actually, don't think I did, unfortunately. So that really sucks. And that guy's gonna go and boogie now. So we're not gonna get much chance there, I don't think. So that sucks a little bit. But it's okay. Um, I think we're gonna have we got some very angry customers today. <laughs> some very angry customers, but it's because I'm focusing on the quest. It I find it really hard to like focus on other stuff when I'm like doing the quests and stuff. So so be it. If we lose some rep, it's fine. I'll just have to sort it out some other time. This guy, I think he's gonna 
Stop dancing any second now? Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna get him with this one. Maybe I can get him with the with the poison with the poison though, so I'm hoping he goes into it. Might be uh maybe not. But this this like dude with the blonde hair, it looks like he's coming in. So it's possible that I could get this dude with it instead. I just go like wait for my chance. I go wait for my time to shine. Oh come on. Come on, man. He's avoiding it on purpose. I swear. Alright, maybe I can get him with this one. Come on, it's the cooldown's nearly done. Come on, man. Come on, the cooldown's nearly over. Come on, get him, get him, get him, get him. We gotta get him with this. All right, good. He's actually staying there, so that's, like, great. All right, hit him with that. Perfect. All right. Okay, so what are we on now? Let's have a look. 80%. So we just got to get two more people with this trap. We can do it. We can do it. We just got to get these people's in there oh i know shall we get him with the the punchy thing there's a lot of people in there so like kind of is a bit risky i guess you could say but i'm willing to do it for the quest so that's what i'm gonna do he's nearly there now let's try now that missed hmm maybe he's immune to it or something i'm not really sure but didn't work out as planned huh you're number 17. I don't know what order you are, but I think you're going to leave anyway. So I'm just going to kill you so I don't like end up losing that prestige. Because I think that's going to be something that happens. All right, where are you going? Okay, you're just going here. Oh, I could. Ah, oh, too late. I could have remote controlled that actually, but never mind. It's fine. <laughs> it doesn't matter too much actually. Okay, come on guys. I just need a couple more people in my traps. That would be awesome. All right, maybe we can get this guy. I don't think he's going to get close enough now. He's just doing his hands, so I'm not going to be able to get him, sadly. But never mind. Come on, dudes. Come into my trap rooms so I can murder you. Oh, I could do that guy up there with the, the gun. Let's get him. That missed. Oh, maybe he's immune to it or something, but... Yeah, that didn't quite work out, did it? <laughs> it's a bit of a, a pain to get these guys sometimes. Aha, this guy. I think he's coming into the room. So let's see if we can grab this guy too. That would be great. Come on, little dudes. Come, my pretty. <laughs> Come into the traps of doom. Come into the VIP room of doom. You know you want to. I've scrolled a little bit too far there. That's all right. That didn't kill him. Ah, oh, maybe he's immune to it or something. Why are they all stinking immune? <laughs> Drives me mad, but it's okay. All right, this guy's coming in as well. Hopefully I can get him with it. Nope. <laughs> Sad times. I didn't get anybody with my trap and I'm very sad about that actually. Alright, maybe I can get someone with this if they like walk past or something. No, it's all on cooldown. Makes me super sad. <laughs> that sucks. <laughs> no, I just want to murder some peoples. They don't want me to murder them. And it's like, it's very sad. It's a sad situation. <laughs> Maybe one of these days. Come on, death is not so bad, I swear. You'll be fine. Everybody has to die sometime. <laughs> it's just a bit earlier than usual, that's all. It's nothing to be scared about, I swear it. <laughs> it's hard to find it, like which person is which as well in this situation too. So like that's kind of crazy. My guest exploded. Oh, we got a person coming in right now. I wonder if we will get him. Let's see, hopefully he goes into range. That would be great. They never go into range of the poison, do they? Let's try the other one though. He might come into range. All right, let's try it. There we go. Perfect. Finally, I got another one. Okay, hopefully that counted. It was on 80%. Let's have a look. Now it's on 90%. One more person. One more person. And then we could, we could be victorious. That'd be super cool. Come on. Come on, my prey. <laughs> I don't know if like they will come into this one, to be honest with you. I'm not too sure. I think he's not gonna he's not gonna go near it, is he? He's just gonna go down and do some dancing. Maybe I can get him on the way out though, perhaps. Like that would be good. But we'll see. Do you think I don't know if he's gonna quite go close enough? Oh god, I could activate this one. I don't know if that kills him. No, it doesn't it didn't kill him, so. Sadly, no luck with that one. It's definitely taking a bit longer than I thought it would. We're on the last wave as well, so it's like, 
There's not too many chances. I think that might be it, sadly. I was so close. I was so close to getting them. Hmm, maybe there's something I could try. Right, we've only got this one person left. So I feel that, like, I probably, if I attack him, he'll probably run. So I probably won't be able to lure him into a trap or anything. At least I don't think so. I'll try. Oh, he just straight died. That's unfortunate because I was really wanting to do it on this day, but it seems that the game says no. <laughs> Not being able to, to finish it on this in-game day. Well, we'll get it on the next day for sure, right? This is literally all we have left and then we can go to this planet, um, Kringorum. So that's exciting. I'm very excited to do that actually. So that's going to be super cool. Can I make any more of this stuff? I can't, huh? Don't really know what materials that is, but it's fine. All right, we're gonna do another day then, and we are going to see if we can get this last one. Invasion of cockroaches. Here come the cockroaches. Oh boy, oh my gosh. All right, let's see if we can, I don't know, deal with this situation. All right, come in, come in. Welcome to my establishment. Please come in, like use my stuff. <laughs> Don't be shy. Oh, perfect. That was perfect. And that should be everything done. I'll just wait for it to update. It takes a bit to update sometimes. And there we go. We are now able to enter Kozu Dance or something. We need a little bit more money um, and we need, we need to start getting prestige because you need 10,000 prestige for the last planet. So with the rest of the day now, I'm just going to use it to, you know, finish. Um, I think I got one more quest to do as well, like to get to this one. I just need to use flavoring sauce. So we could probably just do that. So then we can just go straight to the next planet afterwards. So that would be really, really awesome. Actually, I'm really looking forward to seeing what these planets are like, actually. Okay, let's start feeding up these people so flavoring sauce flavoring sauce I think would be this one I think it's this purple stuff at least I think so we only have cockroaches here so like this isn't this isn't like a bad one to, to deal with so I'm gonna give this to number two there you go we're gonna put some olives in this one this is for the bomb right yeah this is for the bomb let's see we're going to feed you this stuff just because it's your lucky day today you get to eat really good food today aren't you lucky <laughs> all right let's put some stuff on the stove as well that would be great policeman over here as well this one here is for number three all right let's keep this up let's keep this up i'll be able to manage this fine now because I'm not distracted by like quests and stuff like that. I feel like most of the time when I've like died in this game it's because I've like been distracted trying to like complete a quest or like something like that. So yeah, it can be quite difficult when uh, you're trying to multitask with like a million different things and miss what this game like expects you to do sometimes. <laughs> so it can be a pain in the butt for sure. All right, down you go cockroaches. All right, this one is for number four. Do you think this is counting? for the flavoring sauce yeah it has I got a couple towards it now so like that's really good and I don't think it's gonna affect their meals or anything so like should make them should make them happier like actually so like that's pretty good all right let's put all the meat on there we go all right next order please next one come on come on come get your orders what we got now, we got some chorizo, some fries. Uh, this is a Naboot, isn't it? I'm pretty sure. So we're gonna use the, the pink thing and we'll put the sauce in as well. Just keep going with the sauce until the quest says it's complete. <laughs> That's the plan. So we got some olives, some fries. There you go. And this is for, um, what just happened? Oh, it's just cockroaches. That's fine. Just take the cockroaches down first. This is for order number five. This one here is for, yeah, that was for the bomb, wasn't it? Yeah, that was for the bomb. So I'm going to feed you this stuff. There we go. Should I put some flavoring in there too? Let's put some flavoring in there too. Why not? Just to make sure that we got all this, like, you know, going. Like, make sure that everything is great. That would be awesome. Okay, so this is the blonde dude. And you like the slimy stuff. And I got tons of that. So just be my guest, my friend. Okay, do I have any more orders? I got this one here, the mushrooms, the fries. Okay, I'm just gonna set that aside for a second. What's my quest on now? 
let's have a look. Let's see, um, it's not done, it's on 40%. Okay, let's just keep putting these sources in. So this one is for number eight, and this one here is for you. And I think they like rat, don't they? Yeah, they like rat. I almost forgot for a second, but that's okay. Put that on there, and we'll put some flavoring sauce in. Perfect, good stuff. Okay, let's just put some stuff on the stove as well. Ah, cockroaches are back again. He tried to get me, he nearly got me good there, but it's fine. <laughs> we're, we're all good, so that's awesome. All right, just speed it up a little bit, so I don't actually have anything to do at the moment, because I'm nice and speedy right now, since I'm not dealing with something else, so I've got time to actually think, <laughs> so that's nice. Okay, so this and this, and let's see, what do you actually... What do you enjoy eating, sir? Slime? Of course. Why wouldn't you like to eat slime? Everybody loves slime in my establishment. <laughs> it's just the best food ever, you know? All right, this is number nine. There you go. Enjoy your food, my friend. Sauce activated. Good. Cockroaches are coming. Okay, let's deal with those first before we continue with our orders. There we go. Let's check our quest again. I'm curious to see our progress now. Is it done? Yeah, it's done. Woohoo! So we're just gonna be able to just fly to every planet and not have to worry about anything. So look, everything is done except for this one quest that I just cannot do because it's glitched out. So I'm really gutted about that. Like this is such a good run and like I had a really good quest as well. Not that bad. The quest weren't bad at all. I don't know. <laughs> It's annoying, but yeah, it's just like how it goes, I suppose. I could try it, like, maybe on this level. Should I try it? Like, why not? Should we have a little go just to, like, make sure that it's, like, not working? But I'm pretty sure it's not working, but, like, I'll try it anyway. Because I kind of, like, don't really want to, like, reset, but, like, I will if I have to. <laughs> you know, because we want to... Because, like, that's just, like, how it goes. Um, anyway, so for the quest, you have to feed them nicotine sauce and then you have to kill them while they're smoking. That's literally all the quest is, but it just it won't update for me. So, I don't know. All right, let's see. This is for number 11. And this one here. Let me just double check here. So you need the, the slime. Gonna feed you the slime. Oh, we got cockroaches incoming. Let's make sure we deal with those first all right let's put that in there and i'll feed you some nicotine sauce as well so we'll just like try it a few more times i'm not expecting anything though i'm not expecting the quest to really update i'm not expecting it to happen but i'd be so happy if it did <laughs> just to just to try it it's like i don't really have anything else to do anyway so i might as well like just try it like why not <laughs> just put loads in i got loads of nicotine sauces anyway so it's all good all right put some bacon in there as well okay what do what does this guy like this guy likes rats i don't even think this guy smokes so there's probably no point putting it in here because you can't force a non-smoker to smoke in this game i don't think you can actually do that so it doesn't actually work with everyone unfortunately this goes to number 13 okay all right cool we just need to take down the cockroaches there we go so we got a dude down here that's smoking and you can see that he's highlighted that means he's got the nicotine sauce on him right now and if you kill him whilst he's smoking like this the quest is supposed to update but it hasn't been so i haven't been able to like do anything with that there's also another dude up here as well and i'm going to also i'll try killing him with the trap this time just to see if like anything pops up but it was on 20% right and oh it actually counted oh my god it actually counted oh my god maybe it will work i don't know why i tried so many times to get it to work and it just was never working and it actually updated that time i don't know why this is really interesting okay we're going to we're gonna try again <laughs> If that is the case, because that means I might be able to get it all done in one run, and I'll be so happy about that, because I was going to, like, do it in a really weird way, so, <laughs> yeah, I'm happy about that, actually. Okay, so, let me see, I'm just gonna try this. It seemed to work with this, like, dude here, so that's what I'm gonna try it with, the, the, like, um, the purple dude. I don't know if, I don't think it counted for both of them, let me see. 
Let me see here. Yeah, it didn't count for both of them. It only counted for one of them. For some weird reason. Maybe it was the one the one I killed with the trap. Maybe it doesn't work if you use traps or something. I'm not entirely sure, but it only only one of them actually gave me progress. I was trying for hours to get this to work. Like I tried it on so or like loads of different species of like creatures and just could not get it to work. Like no matter what I was doing. I think this quest is very glitchy and is just like it doesn't seem to respond too well so it's really hard to actually like get it to count I've noticed so yeah it's it's painful it's a painful one for sure like it's an easy quest but it's just hard to get it to actually like actually I don't know track the progress for some weird reason okay this is I don't know let me see okay cockroaches let's get rid of those this is the bomb so we're just going to put this in there actually and this is for number 17 so that's good all right I thought I told that guy to smoke but maybe not I'm not really sure oh there you go I think someone's going to smoke again so I'm gonna try this I was going to the top which makes things a lot easier so that's really good so I'll just let him smoke just for like a little bit just for a minute just to make sure he's actually like smoking maybe just leave him for a bit all right that should be enough let's kill him and hopefully this will like count this time so it was on 40 percent last time let's just leave that for a second because it takes a little bit to update let's see if that updated this time 60 percent it is updating now i don't know why it wasn't updating for me earlier it's like i was having a real issue getting that to update so that was very very bizarre but i'm really happy that it is updating to be honest because i was pulling my hair out trying to get that to work so i'm super glad about that <laughs> so that's really awesome all right now let's get this guy down as well and hopefully this one will update as well but yeah i tried it on the rats mostly the rats and it was not working for those it's definitely working for these like purple teeth looking aliens so i'm really glad it's working with them i'm gonna try to just use it on them going forward so it seems to be working which is really good i just need to I just need to do it like with like one more one more like person and then that's like every quest done and that's like a full run in one like playthrough which I really wanted to do I would rather do it like that if I'm being honest with you but yeah that's a super awesome I'm very happy about that actually we are going to be moving on to a Kringorum and we've done everything on this planet I think we've seen all of the effects so far as well yeah we have we've like seen everything now so it's the perfect time to move on so let's see what this planet is all about i thought that after that story in courts you would never come back here well apparently it wasn't enough for you you already know everything about this planet the main buriatic center of the conglomerate the gloomy marble halls the chamber of the great kringorum courts and also the place where they changed their minds about executing you and all that and of course a black hole in a ball is a sight to behold According to the myths, I personally put my hand to this miracle, imprisoning the souls of the sinners in a glass sphere. Is it true? To be honest, I don't remember myself. Hmm, okay. It's like a black hole. <laughs> like, what? what kind of planet is that? So, no new aliens on this planet, sadly, but there is one new, like, new effect. It looks like a, like a bin, like a dustbin or like a garbage can, whatever, it doesn't matter really. Like, <laughs> just dis different sayings from, like, you know, wherever you're from, I suppose. But yeah, it seems to have one new effect. It's getting, it's a little bit sad because I feel like the planets are starting to run out of, like, new content. If that that makes sense because there's a, like there used to be like a new like a couple of new aliens and like a couple of new things and like now it's really starting to run dry which is really sad it's running out of steam definitely that's how you can kind of tell that we're getting close to the end of the game and honestly I don't really have that much more to buy either so I'm kind of glad in a way because I'm not making too much more progression at this point <laughs> it's fine though all right let's buy a couple more bits and pieces here actually that would be great i don't know how many upgrades i got left but i don't think it's much let me just have a look chorizo all right cool let's see i just got like these left and that's it so not much i actually can't afford anything today but that's fine all right let's go i'm excited to check out this new planet 
And here we go, to the black hole. Is that sand glacier in the background? You can see some of the old planets in the background. That's nice. I guess like you gotta fly past them, I suppose. Oh, look at these Mykonanians. It's the court of the Mykonanians. <laughs> this is how criminals get punished. My God, they just like throw them out into space. That must be like the worst. Oh, they get thrown into a black hole. Dang. <laughs> Is this the planet where all the criminals go? Is that what this means? I don't know. Interesting. Okay then, well let's get stuck into it. Let's get started. We're on day 78 right now. Super cool, right? Of course, we're not going to have any new effects or anything like that popping up today. They never do it on the first day. But yeah, there's like, there's nothing new about this planet. Wouldn't it be really nice if like, they actually like, put like, di like a different, like, I don't know, different restaurant or something every like planet you went to that would be really cool like it looks like significantly different or something like that would be awesome but i don't know maybe that is like a lot of work for them to do i think that they've put a lot of love and a lot of heart into this game as it stands like right now so i think they've done a really good job but if they were to ever make another one i would really like to see like different restaurants that you go to and like i don't know expanding like maybe going between a couple of different restaurants and then like expanding it and like building them up like as you go through the planets like that would be so cool but yeah it doesn't seem to be a thing that we can we can do right now oh we should still stick with doing doing the um smoking thing it's just who to do it on because mm, there's not very many good candidates here at the moment i would say some of them like some of them are impervious to attack damage so i they're, they're not gonna they're not gonna work so i'm gonna have to like choose a good uh person to actually do this quest with this is the last quest i've got and then like i've done all the quests so it's just going to depend right okay so this is number three we also need to build up our prestige as well what about that weird like thing that weird alien with the thing on its head does it smoke it does not smoke so i can't do it on this one either so that sucks a little bit, but never mind. Okay, the bird, I think he likes rat, doesn't he? Yeah, he likes rat, so let's feed this dude the rat. Shall I just turn my traps off? I think I might just turn my traps off actually because the thing that I really need the most is prestige and um, reputation. We need quite a lot of reputation first, so I think that we shouldn't really be killing people at this point because I don't really need the meat anyway, so like, yeah, I don't know. I don't think that's a good idea, to be fair, but I didn't really think it through. I just, it's a habit to just turn all the traps on, you know, <laughs> so <laughs> there is that. Okay, we need to get some more people in here. I don't have anyone to like serve or like anything like that, so... Yeah, that's a pain in the butt. All right, let's see. We've got some egg for you and we got some egg for you as well. So that would be really cool. Um, it's a shame you can't feed like two sources to the like candidates either because that might have like made it a bit easier too because then I could have got rid, I could have used the source that gets rid of their immunity and then done it. But yeah, that's not, that's not going to work either. What about the blonde dudes? Do they smoke? The blonde dudes don't smoke either. There's like no smokers on like this level. <laughs> I guess I'm not going to be able to like do it on this level then. Uh, what do these things eat by the way? Let's find out what they eat. Okay, so either the, I could just use the bird. Let's use the bird thing. So this is for this one. And what was this? I just got like an egg in here. I think that was for the Mykonanian. So let me see. Yes. So we can use the, the pink stuff. So I got a lot of this pink stuff. So we'll use that. This one goes to number six. This one here is going to go to number eight once it's finished. So that will be really good. Actually, just put all this on. So this is for number eight. Let's do that. There you go and enjoy your burger enjoy your lovely burger i feel like i've made enough burgers to last a century <laughs> i've made so many burgers in this establishment and it's been all burgered out <laughs> that's even a word i don't know okay let's see this one here and we got the poltergeist to do as well we'll just do the the police officer i can't believe how many police officers i got i don't remember killing that many police officers but i 
guess I must have. I don't know, I've spent a lot of time with this run, so <laughs> maybe, maybe, I'm not too sure. All right, there you go. Let's just speed it up a little bit. That would be good. We need to get a few more orders in here. So that would be really good. It's a bit slow with the orders today, isn't it? <laughs> but we'll get a couple more in here. All right, that will do. Oh, that guy's just died. We got a couple of ghost patties down here. So let's make sure to collect these so my people aren't like super mad now i got just like it's one extreme to the other isn't it <laughs> now i got like a million different like orders in here <laughs> there's so many orders now like my god okay we want some egg over here that would be good all right this one is for you you want the slime i can i can arrange that for you lovely slime for you there you go and i was doing the one with the egg so the mechanian Mechanian is over here, so I just give him the pink stuff, so let's do that. There you go, my friend. Enjoy your gloopiness. Gloopy surprise. <laughs> this is for number... Oh, no, I put down the wrong person. Oopsie. Oh, no, that person's gonna be mad. This was his order, and, like, yeah, it didn't quite go so well. I'm gonna have to, like, murder him somehow. I don't know how right now. He's over there. He's gonna go get his food and he's gonna be very upset. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Just, I don't know. It's fine. I could just take a small reputation loss. It's not gonna affect me that much, I suppose. All right, so we're gonna do number 15, which is this dude. You want the, the slime. Let's give you the slime stuff. All right, so we want this and we want egg, salmon, and we want... Oh, no, 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 no. I put the wrong meat in. No, I don't know if I'm gonna make it now because I messed up. No, no, no. It's not gonna make it. This is the cheese. This is 15. This is 15. Yeah, yeah. The the bird is gone. I think those two are gone. Yeah, I missed some orders. Because I fast forwarded it, I think. <laughs> Probably. I made like I'm just met my own demise because of that. So that sucks. Yeah, I'm gonna lose a little bit. No, <laughs> that sucks, but never mind. It's fine. Okay, I'm just going to I think I'm gonna try and kill this guy before he like leaves. Like hopefully. I hope so. Anyway, it's more important to me, like, not to not to lose the rep. We don't want to lose the rep. Those guys, like, have no blood. Like, I've killed a few of them, and they don't leave blood on you. I think they just don't have blood or something. It's really weird. <laughs> it's really, really strange. It's like, so many times I've killed them, I've been like, hey, I don't even have to, like, wash the blood off. It's so, so convenient, though. <laughs> They're easy kills. Easy targets, for sure. But at least I didn't lose the reputation with those guys. So, like, that's good. All right, now we can get back to cooking up a storm so let's do that so some olives in there we want this one with some fries perfect and we got this dude all right we're going to make so much money as well so it's gonna be great okay so we got the weird thing with the parasite thing on his head and he wants this stuff so that's what i'm gonna give him <laughs> definitely so who is this for again yeah for you for you okay i'll give you that okay let's take some stuff off the stove here put some more of this rat on because you can never have too much of this stuff right so this is for number 20 there you go i really need to do i really need to do that bird let's do that bird so salmon pineapple egg and bird um bird no rat yeah rat i think okay put that on that would be great and we'll just put all these on as well oh i took one extra there we need to get this to number 18 asap all right cool okay who's next in the queue let's see this is the the blonde thing so the slime let's get some slime for this guy over here there you go and this is the mechanian i guess uh we guess we got two of those two of those mechanians to serve so that's helpful because i can just look at it once and then serve both of them so the mechanians they both like the pink stuff so i'll just take two of the pink stuff and i'll put one in there one in there and they both want exactly the same apart from 22 wants a sauce so i'll just give him like a laxative or something so that'll go to number 21 and then we'll want the one without the sauce goes to 22 and there you go everybody has been served so that's great it's the last wave as well so i think no more customers for today so let's just hurry this up a little bit 
that would be good. Make everybody leave. Oh, I didn't mean to press that. I was trying to fast forward it. <laughs> it's so easy to press that by accident. Okay, we just need to wait for this guy to leave. He's going now. Off he goes. And we did it. Yay. Good stuff. I like that. <laughs> Very nice indeed. Okay, let's buy a couple of buns here. Just to restock and everything. That will be good. A couple of tomatoes. A couple of cheeses. Some french fries. Some eggs. Lovely. Lots and lots of in ingredients for us to feed to all of our guests. So <laughs> that will be really good. We could buy some upgrades. So let's buy the extra module. Now all we need is stove speed and I've brought every single thing out there's nothing else to buy so oh apart from this devourer information I must have forgotten to purchase the information on this guy well at least we have it now I guess not that I really needed it like that much so yeah they don't appear that much so it's fine I could actually just move on but we're not going to I'm going to like play a bit more on this world I got to, I want to do these 22 more days as well so this is going to help towards that too but basically I don't know I feel like I haven't spent enough time on this planet I want to spend a bit more time oh no zombie epidemic <laughs> it's been a while since we did the zombie epidemic hasn't it <laughs> I got a strategy in place for the zombie epidemic though so it's not as bad but it'll be interesting to try it on this planet though because we've got different kinds of aliens that I haven't experienced a zombie epidemic with before as long as I just make sure to put all my traps on we should be good I'm just gonna kill this guy because he's infected you can see which creatures are infected because they have like this like green sort of glow like that one there is infected as well but I don't think I can do anything about it right now did I kill him oh I think he died oh sweet usually on zombie epidemics it's actually best to just kill everyone and just not serve anyone just get rid of them all because everything just spreads and it just becomes so chaotic that in most cases it's better to just murder everyone so we can stop the spread of the virus do we have any zombies in here right now or is everybody sort of like safe we're actually fine we actually don't have any zombies right now so i'm actually just going to try and serve them that would be good serve them as quick as possible so i can get them out of my restaurant as quick as possible so you don't want these guys hanging around okay someone just came through did someone just come through the port maybe not i thought i saw someone come through the portal so that's fine all right let's feed these peoples all right so this is the slime some people are just dying from the traps anyway the more people that die the better so you don't have to deal with the zombies <laughs> the more even like even the like more normal customers you have even people that aren't infected with the virus it's just more chance it's just more chance of like zombie viruses like happening isn't it so it's just not worth the risk <laughs> so that's how i deal with these zombie viruses when i first encountered the zombie virus i literally had no idea what to do and i just like panicked i just like it was like so chaotic but i think i've got it down now i've, I've spent so much time with this game that i think i can handle anything that this game chucks at me now so i really have played it for a long time so yeah it's good it's good all right are you happy you're cloning yourself <laughs> okay sure why not someone actually is gonna manage to get home it's a miracle Cool. Oh look, it's a criminal. Hey, I've never seen a criminal version of that guy before, so that's pretty interesting. We got another zombie there. That's a criminal too. Wow, I've never seen those races as criminals before. So very interesting. I'm just gonna hover around this guy because he gonna turn into a zombie, right? Are you not? Oh, it disappeared. I thought you had infection. It's just like kind of gone okay this guy has definitely got the zombie infection here oh he just turned i gotta kill him that was that was that was good if you kill a zombie you actually don't like people don't get alerted to you if they're zombies <laughs> so if you're quick with it you can just kind of nip it in the bud just like that so you just have to be aware of like who's entering the establishment and just like get rid of those zombies as soon as possible that's how i deal with it anyway so it's good Good, good stuff okay so salmon and oh yeah i think rat as well for this for this one so we're gonna feed you you actually are gonna be getting fed it's a miracle i'm just gonna give you some laxative actually this is for number five let's see number five yeah we're gonna give him let's see here i'm gonna give him this a rudus that would be perfect actually oh we got some people dying i was about to feed you 
But like, never mind. It's best to have people die anyway. Like, I'm not mad. I'm actually like glad that people are dying, to be honest. Okay, the Mykonanian. We're going to feed you the pink stuff. So let's make sure to do that. There you go. And we need, let's see, salmon. And this one who just died. Okay, never mind. Don't have to do that order. We'll just do number nine then. Oh, that guy just... He didn't die. Oh, well, rip. <laughs> Never mind. It's only a police badge. Like I can easily get rid of that, so it's it's fine. It's really cool to see criminal types of those, though. I've never seen that before, so that's like really cool. All right, I'm waiting for some more zombies to come in. <laughs> come on, zombies. Where are you at? I can deal with you, so everything will be fine. All right, no zombies so far, so we're getting pretty lucky here, actually. Not very many zombies at all, so like that's good. Yep, not a single one so far you're clear as well so that's good any more coming in or are we are we good i think we're good right now so that's awesome okay i'll just like deal with my customers that i got right now then that seems like a a good idea i'll just keep an eye on like who's actually entering and stuff like that i don't know who just died did somebody die oh you didn't even die you just got hit and then left i guess it didn't do enough damage that's uh a very strong alien, I have to say. I wasn't expecting him to survive, to be fair, but it's fine. Okay, so let's like just put something in here. This is oh yeah, we need a sauce as well. Let's do a sauce too. So we'll give you a laxative. That will be good. And this is for number 13, I think. And the Mykonanian's like the, the pink thing. So this is for you, I think, yes. And for the for those I got a rudis or one of those turtle things I'll just give you a turtle thing I think that would be good this is for number 10 this one here requires a sauce so I'll give you a laxative there you go for number 12 that's my last laxative as well actually I've just been using them just because they're just easy to, to use he'll probably get himself killed to be honest because I think my trap or my toilet is activated so <laughs> that actually might get him murdered oh that guy's dead don't need to deal with that guy then we'll just leave him then did his body go in here like where where's his body i don't know because he has like little ghost patties then it's not really that bad if people see them but i was just kind of wondering where they were i think i'll turn this motion sensor off because that one can cause problems sometimes so i think it might be best to just leave it for now oh we got a zombie incoming i gotta wait for him to turn though so i can't do anything about that guy because he's impervious to physicals but i can get rid of you because you are one too did you just turn you just turned hello hello dude and once they turn into the zombie they aren't like they're not impervious to damage anymore so it's like really easy to take them down once they turn but before they turn you can't deal damage to them so <laughs> you have to like wait for that moment if that makes sense i was just lucky because he the like the dude actually went for me instead of trying to affect infect other customers so i was pretty lucky there actually generally if you're standing near a zombie they do try to go for you instead of like going for the customers so so that does make things a little bit easier sometimes as well so I do like it when they do that because then I don't have to worry about them infecting the whole restaurant because that's when things get really bad like <laughs> I know that from first-hand experience <laughs> it gets it gets really really bad <laughs> you don't want that to happen like no matter what are you leaving okay you've been satisfied that's good some people weren't entirely satisfied looks like i messed up on a couple of them so that's annoying i don't seem to be making too much progress with my reputation am i <laughs> i need some like critic levels and then like i need to ace some critic levels or something oh because they're criminals of course you're supposed to kill the criminals that's why yeah that's why um but it's not always easy to do so okay hello i don't know you're aggressive today aren't you sir do you want to do you want to die sir oh you died okay never mind it didn't do enough damage i should upgrade this one so this seems to yeah like not working i lost a thousand reputation on that level that sucks so, so much <laughs> oh no i'm gonna have to build up that rep i think i'm probably gonna be a little bit behind for this like last planet i reckon but it's it's okay it's all good 
Okay, do I have any? I don't even have anything for upgrades or anything. We should get rid of the police attention, pay the bills, and yeah, I'm gonna do another day. Let's go. Let's keep cracking on the days. I might get that new effect as well. Nothing just yet. Meteor showers. Okay, I'm just gonna cook some stuff up here. So yeah, nothing too crazy today, but meteor showers can mess you up sometimes. They can be a bit annoying, but like, as far as effects go, I would say, I would still say that the zombie one is the worst. Like, especially if you don't know how to deal with it. That is definitely the worst variation that you can get. I really hate it because you can very easily get overwhelmed if you're not careful. That one's the worst. And then I'd say meteors is the second worst because you can get blamed for the meteors attacking the customers, which I think is really unfair. But <laughs> I think what I found is that on meteors, if you just stay in your kitchen like nine times out of ten they like can't blame you as long as you're not in the vicinity if that makes sense so if you're like in the kitchen then like you don't really have like anything to really worry about unless somebody actually dies because if there is if there's a dead body unless you're quick enough to go and pick that up before people see it they're gonna ring the police and you're gonna have a police raid so usually i just let that police raid happen because otherwise like if you're next to the dead body and like there's witnesses they'll instantly start attacking you and if there's like loads of people there like you'll have a lot of people on you attacking you and it can be very dangerous <laughs> so more often than not it's actually safer to just let the police raid to come and just hide by the fridge <laughs> That's what I do anyway, and I haven't died to a to anything like that in quite some time using that strategy actually. So there's there's work around for getting through these things. I would say that's a lot of meteors in my kitchen. My God, <laughs> it's all right though. I'll just hide in this corner. I think it'll be fine. Okay, we need a sauce for you. I'll give you a flavoring sauce. You can have that one today. There you go. And an egg. Let's get one of these little eggs over here as well. That'll be good. Let's quickly put that in my fridge. Meteors are coming again. They're just trying to like slow down my progress here, aren't they? What a pain in the butt. Okay, we got the pink meat for you. I'm really hoping that I can just get a little bit more reputation here actually. I don't know what the reputation is needed for the next planet. We need 6,500 so we're literally just on that like threshold for that. Like we're actually not like that far onto it. So <laughs> yeah, if we lose even just a little bit, we won't be able to go to the next planet anymore. So I gotta be really careful about what I'm doing here for sure, but that's okay. It can be a bit of a pain because like if the meteors damage the customers to a certain point, they will actually run out and panic in fear. Like you see that blonde dude is possible. I'm actually surprised he hasn't run out in fear at being at that low life. Actually, they usually do. So I'm actually really shocked at that. Um, I'm gonna kind of, I think he's gonna die. I think that guy's gonna die. Pretty sure, yep, yep. I'm just gonna get rid of that body quick before somebody spots it, because that's gonna lead to a tricky situation that I don't wanna deal with. <laughs> I'm actually glad. If you keep an eye on the health bars as well, it's always a good idea to do that because if you can see someone who's just about to die just get in there quick and get rid of that body <laughs> it just is really useful for sure are you dead you're not dead. Oh, i thought he was dead i was literally about to like pick up his body but he's fine i accidentally kicked him because of that <laughs> but never mind i think if he doesn't leave by the next meteor thing he's probably gonna die so i'm just kind of watching him a second He's about to leave, so he's fine, but his life is literally on zero, so I just want to make sure he makes it out. All right, good, good, good stuff. All right, now I don't need to worry about that dude. <laughs> it's always a worry when there's, like, somebody in your place that's got really low life, you know? So just to be on the safe side, it's always good. Oh, there you go. Someone's running out in panic because... I'm just going to put this motion sensor on. Oh, I can't even. Dang it. It's going to get rid of my... I hate it when that happens because there's not really much you can do to stop them either and it's like it wasn't even my fault it was the meteor fault <laughs> i wish there was a way of like giving them life back but you literally like as far as i am aware there's no way of you stopping that so yeah it's super annoying if anybody knows a way of stopping them like from stopping that from happening happening please let me know because like i would love to actually stop that from happening on meteors i just lost a whole 100 reputation for that that's like two customers worth it's like really annoying okay that d dude died but it's fine because he's oh i gave that to the wrong person oh no 
Number four. Wait, he died anyway. It's fine. He died. <laughs> it's not a big deal. I won't lose a reputation for that. Those are ghosts. So if ghosts die, it's not that actually that bad. So that's good. Though I don't know if I'm gonna get this in time now because that customer's like really angry and he's just about to leave. I don't think I'm gonna get seven in time. Nope. I'm gonna have to kill seven because I don't, I really, I'm losing rep. No, I'm not doing really that well with my reputation recently. It sucks. It really sucks. Um, I don't know where that customer went if I'm being honest. I have no idea. And no clue. Okay, it's really hard to get your rep back on meteor showers. Really, really can be challenging. I'm gonna lose a lot of rep here as well. No, I'm gonna go below the, the thing. I'm not gonna be able to go to the next planet because of this. <laughs> but it's fine, I can just build it back up again, I think, so it'll be okay. But I'm gonna lose 100 there. Oh, 75, so I'm just under now. I need 6,500 rep at least for the next planet. So <laughs> yeah, that's not gonna work too well. I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill this guy guy because he's gonna yeah he's just gonna give me bad rep oh the acid forgot about the acid <laughs> that's all right though okay let's clean up or something i think that would be a good idea but man this is not going so well is it <laughs> it's really not going so well it's fine all right so salmon and this and some rat meat all right there you go we really need to build this stuff up oh somebody else oh somebody just left because they got hit by the meteor again see what i mean about building rep on like this world it's just really like at least not not in this world but like for the meteor it's just it's just painful it's just very painful there's like so many things that are just out of your control and it's just like it's super annoying it's really annoying okay so we need some sauce i'm just uh, no that's toxin we don't want to give him toxin <laughs> i'll murder him i want him to survive if possible right we're gonna go and just like clear up these patties i think there's a few patties around here that could do with a clear up because they do annoy your customers or they can annoy your customers so i just want to get rid of that one there i think that's the only one in my establishment right now so i don't need to worry about anyone else at least i don't think so i think it might be bad is it bad for these guys not really sure no it's police officer of course okay i have to wait for that meteor now but that's okay did somebody just die yeah someone just died <laughs> it's only a ghost it's fine i'm just get rid of his patty all right there you go um so can't do that one anymore that sucks okay we're gonna do this one over here the the like olive um one so we can do we could do a a bird let's do the the little turtle thing actually hopefully i can get this to him in time i don't know he's really close to leaving i might have to I might have to kill him if I can't get this in time. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Ah, oh, it was gone. Dang it. <laughs> I was hoping to get that in time, but it didn't quite work out for me, did it? <laughs> Doll, I'll have to kill him before he leaves. So, so hopefully I can sort of like get rid of that. Oh God, hello. That didn't go according to plan. Oh no, I ended up losing reputation anyway. I shouldn't have been standing here. If I wasn't standing here, I wouldn't have lose, lost that rep, but never mind, these things happen. Mistakes have been made. <laughs> it's fine, it's all good. At least we're like still alive and like, I've actually only got three hearts left, but like we're, we're okay. We're all good. Okay, so you want salmon as well. And I forget what the poltergeists like to eat. Okay, the the um, the um police. There's just so many different meats to remember at this point. It's really hard to remember sometimes. Okay, so you want the salmon, the egg, the pineapple, and also the rat. Let's see if we can get a few orders out here and hopefully get some of that rep back at the very least. If I could just get a couple hundred, that would be really awesome but it's all just gonna depend it's all just gonna depend how lucky we are right so we will see at least that guy managed to get home so that was great it's like a rare occurrence at this point isn't it okay so we want this stuff in there as well okay we got one of these patties to get rid of let's get rid of that all right now we don't have to worry about that there's so much meteor in my kitchen today usually they don't focus too much on the kitchen there's really a lot in the kitchen today i'm really surprised at that look at all this meat <laughs> There's so many people have like died in my restaurant. It's <laughs> like crazy. A crazy amount of people. Okay, well, I think we're finally like out of the meteor day, thank God, because it's really hard, like I said, to build reputation on this day. So 
Hopefully in the next state. Look, is the someone's leaving in panic. Like I can't stop him. There's nothing I can do. So frustrating. Why? Why does this game torture me so? I'm just gonna hide in the doorway. Can I get hit in the doorway? Probably not, right? I'll probably be safe here. I'm just being no, I'm not. I'm not safe there. I thought I was. Never mind. Oh god, I got one health left. Let's not fast forward anymore. <laughs> I'm gonna die right on the last bit of the day. That would be like really sad, wouldn't it? So let's not do that. It's bad to fast forward on a meteor shower. I was just pushing my luck a little bit. All right, dude, come on, let's go home so we can end the day. That would be fantastic. Are you, are you going? All right, I think he's going. Oh, he's just clowning around over there. What a pain. Oh, he's gonna get hit, isn't he? Don't blame it on me. I swear it's not me. Ah. Uh... <laughs> So annoying. So annoying. This is why I hate meteors. <laughs> Just the worst. I gotta try and build back that reputation now. At least I didn't die though. So like that was good. I was pretty low but even if I had have died I got a second chance anyway so I would have been alright. I would have just had to replay the day so it's not too bad I suppose. Alright let's see here. I think that's all my stuff replenished. Let's go and get rid of that police badge as well. All right, we're going to do another day and hopefully we can get a little bit of reputation here. Still haven't seen the new effect yet, which is annoying. We got short circuits, circuits this time. We actually get three prestige though for this like round. So perhaps we will be able to build that back. I don't know, but it's like my traps will automatically go off and attack the customer so it's like whoever like actually survives will give me lots of prestige so this is perfect actually like prestige day is just perfect for me right now I'm really hoping to build that back that would be so so nice I'm so glad it gave me like that kind of effect today to be honest I just hope that like people don't get killed by the traps because I think that you lose a lot of prestige otherwise does someone just die Trap activated, but it doesn't say anybody died. So I think we're safe at least for a, for a second. So that's good. Okay, so we need some pink meat over here and we need some fries over here for the blonde one. Let's have a look. Yes, we need the, the slimy stuff. There you go. Let's make sure we feed all our customers. Did someone die? No, it's just every time the trap activates, I'm like someone's died because it activated. But because usually it activates when there's somebody there, right? But it's just activating on its own that keeps making me think that someone's died every time. But it's actually fine. <laughs> it's all good. Okay, let's fast forward because we've got no more customers to deal with now. So I'm just gonna fast forward so I can have some more patience. Someone just died. I don't know if they died from the trap, but like they die once they eat anyway. I think he just died from eating, so... I don't think I, sh I shouldn't have lost reputation for that, but I don't 100% know to be fair, so I'm not sure about that one. I have no idea. All right, got to get some more customers in here, man. I don't have enough customers today. What's going on? I don't know. All right, let's cook up some more of this stuff. There you go. Hello, customers, please. I would like some customers. That would be great. Okay, I got some customers to deal with now, so let's do that. Lots of traps are activating, but luckily nobody is like in the room at that time. This is definitely like a luck based one, I would say. Okay, avocado and you want this one as well. And what meat do you want? Okay, what was it again? <laughs> I've forgotten already. <laughs> oh my god. I'm just like, my brain is fried from all these burger orders. <laughs> so many burger orders all right and we can do this one so egg whoa what was that that was just a trap <laughs> that looked like a really huge area of effect actually i don't think i ever used that trap okay so this is number four i don't think a single person has died yet so that's fantastic actually so i actually don't want people to die on this level because i want the prestige okay so that's done for number five so that's great let's get some tomato you want a sauce i'll just i'm gonna give you nicotine sauce actually i got a lot of it anyway so like you can have that like why not and you also want this pink thing here what happened okay we're fine 
we're fine, everything is good. Bacon and I always forget the poltergeists for some weird reason. What was the poltergeist again? The poltergeist was the police one. I always forget it. It's just so much to remember. I wish there was like an easier way to like remember like all the different meats for all the different like customers because it really gets overwhelming sometimes. All right, there you go. I think all those people have been served. So that's excellent. We're getting close to that 6,500 reputation. So hopefully we'll still be able to go to the next planet in the next episode. That would be great, but we shall see how it goes, of course. Okay, let's get some more meat on the go here as well. That'd be great. Sauce has been eaten. Good. Well, enjoy. Enjoy your sauce. I can't kill you though. Like, I kind of wish I could kill that guy up there, but I can't. <laughs> if I could, I might have been able to get my last quest, but he's impervious to physicals. I just fed him it just because... Just because he wanted sauce and I just had a lot of that sauce, that particular sauce. So that's the only reason why I really fed him that, to be fair. Okay, so salmon, pineapple, and rat. Let's do that. I just lost rep. What happened? I don't know why I lost rep, to be fair. I'm not really sure, but it's fine. Okay, let me just grab that meat there. I don't think anybody died, so I really have no idea. Did, I, did somebody go hungry or something? I'm not really sure what happened there. I didn't really see, so I'm not sure. But it's fine. Okay, there's those orders done. We're going to... Oh, I didn't get anyone. <laughs> he, <laughs> The trap went off, but I guess uh, the... People were lucky today, very lucky for sure. All right, so that's that one. And we want another sauce, this one here, an egg. Let's get an egg as well. Is it the pink one for these? I think it is. I'll double check in a second. This one is 13. Let me check, is it the right one? I did put the right one in. Okay, good, okay. All right, where did that guy go? Someone just left, I think. I don't know why. I wasn't even finished with your order, man. You're so impatient. Some of these customers are so impatient like I swear okay now we're just gonna fast forward it a little bit because I got no one to serve at the moment I don't know if anyone's gonna come in because we're really close to closing now so I'm not sure we might be done no there's still a few more patients to to serve so that's good all right this guy down here has been wiped out but they always die anyway so like that is just natural for that type of customer anyways so it's fine okay so some pepper some salmon and if i remember what do they like again that's the question police i think it's police i'm pretty sure okay we actually do have a policeman in here as well so that's interesting i think they like a rat don't they yeah i think they like rats i don't think i even had to look at that one so that's fine this is number 14 this one here is gonna be for number 15 so let's send that one off i got a couple of orders but nothing too crazy i can handle it at least i think so this one is cheese and tomato let's put that one over there it's kind of fast paced like at this point but i'm handling it it's all good it's number 16 and we got the the blonde one which requires the slime let's get the slime for this dude and the mickinanian which i think is the yeah the pink stuff so we'll do that as well there you go it just helps me to remember it <laughs> when i like do it like that all right it says number 17 we're nearly done oh oh did somebody did somebody get killed there i did lose a lot of rep there so i'm thinking somebody must have got attacked with that one i don't know i'm not even sure like what happened i don't even know where his body is there should be a ghostly like patty around here somewhere but it's not really like it's not really like marked <gasps> that was so close that nearly got that police op officer i'm so glad that he was like just not there at that time because <laughs> that would have been painful that would have been very painful indeed yeah i don't know what happened to that ghost patty i literally have no idea where that thing died it's a shame because i can't get his meat so yeah, not sure about that one, but we got up to like nearly 7,500 with the rep now, so a very good level for building our reputation. Actually, I'm quite happy with that, so that's really cool. Look at all those traps, <laughs> oh my god. All right, there you go, 8,000 rep, good, good stuff. Hopefully we can build that last 2,000 on the next planet, like that would be really awesome, but we will have to see. We didn't even get to see the, the effect for this planet actually, but like it's not that 
big of a deal because it will be on the next planet as well so hopefully we'll like we'll make sure to see it on the next planet if not this one i will double check though just to make sure it is on the next planet but usually they are so we will see let's see a second i can increase my stove speed why not let's see if we've got any bills or anything like that to do that's about it okay let's see so the one was like the new effect was like the dustbin thing and it is also on the next planet as well as well as that fire symbol so we could just do the next planet and then just see them on the next planet i think that would be cool there's actually like no new aliens on the next planet either so like the only new things we've got is the the effects it's really just like running out of new content now so just the way it is i suppose we're going to be moving on to this one which is the second to last planet there's only this one left that's the the last planet of the game so nearly there now but we need the rep before we can go there so need a little bit of um a little bit of reputation so i'm sure we'll get that so there is two new different effects one that looks like a fire so maybe the restaurant gets put on fire or something it wasn't meteors enough <laughs> like i don't know and then there's the little little like dustbin looking thing i don't know what that is i'm not too sure it's not the mold one it's something else it's something different but yeah this planet looks really weird it looks like an alien itself, doesn't it? Like, what is that? I don't know. All right, finally, you have reached the cultural capital of the galaxy. Here are the best public places, the best drinks, the famous great theater of Darmandoria and mesmerizing, and mesmerizing views. Yes, there's no nature like at all, but someone's sick mind did a good job of all these moving structures. Maybe it was mine. Okay, <laughs> I think it's the god person that's talking to us like through this thing, right? At least I think so, but I'm not 100% sure. I got 19 more days to get the last skin. Look at all these skins. We got every single one so far, the default, the criminal. I have to wait for him to turn around. I wish I could actually like make him turn around faster, but you can't. Then you have the Halloween one. Very cool. The lumberjack. I really like the lumberjack one, actually. I like the little, like, played kind of, like, pattern. It's nice. The zombie one. I, I like how it changes, like, not only the outfit, but also, like, the weapon as well. It looks pretty cool. I like he's got, like, drool coming down. And I've been using this one, the Christmas one. So, yeah, just 19 more days for that one as well. All right. Here we go. I'm excited to see what lies in store for us on this planet. What is that thing in the middle? It looks like, like a health thing, right? Maybe you just like keep getting health back or something. I don't know. Hey, fireworks. <laughs> the Naboots are partying. <laughs> They're having a show. Oh, look at all the aliens having a great time. <laughs> awesome. Oh my, I got some lady Mickenanians. <laughs> We're, like my dude is having a great time over there. <laughs> He's having a fantastic day. Good stuff. All right. We're on day 82. My God. <laughs> All right. Let's see if we can get some awesome reputation today. That would be fantastic. All right. We got these dudes back again as well. We've had these ones before, but that's cool. So they can't be hurt with physicals. Okay. I'm just trying to find a candidate because I do have one quest to do here. I know it's a bit weird because you've already like seen this planet like at this point but i'm still working on it i still gotta do that one it's something it's something for me to do whilst we go through these levels like you know so that will be really cool as well okay i'm gonna do it on this like teeth dude that comes in we're gonna try and do that quest as well so like that's gonna be awesome and then all the quests are gonna be done so that's gonna be great so yeah i'm looking forward to to that as well all right okay so we're gonna do his order first so he wants this and this and does he eat rats i can't really remember what exactly he eats he does he eats rats okay i thought so but wasn't sure i feel like they're just kind of like putting all the aliens that like we have seen like towards these last couple of planets so we can like see them all again if that makes sense i haven't seen the robot dog in like time i haven't seen him in absolutely forever it feels like so it's interesting that he's like back again he's back for some action so like that's pretty cool actually okay we want some egg over here for you i'm just gonna wait for this one this is for um wait what just happened the person I was going to serve disappeared. What just happened? Number three? Wait. What? I'm confused. Did they leave? I don't know what happened to that order. 
That's very bizarre. <laughs> I don't know. I have no idea. Unless it was like a Nabu in disguise or something. I really don't know what happened to that order, but it's fine. We'll just work on someone else. It's all good. Okay, that dude is going out for a smoke, so I'm going to deal with that situation like in a second i think i could probably get this order out first though i'm just going to let's see this one here we want this one oh he's at the top as well so that's actually perfect we want the bacon and this one and we're just gonna let this one heat up i don't know like I might have to wait for- I'm just gonna wait for him to leave a second. And now we're gonna deal with him. Alright, hopefully this works. There you go. Quest completed. Hey! So now we've officially completed the quest for every single planet. I just had a little bit of a problem with this planet because it did not want to work. So it kind of messed up like my progress a little bit. But I finally got it to work. So I'm happy. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, I'm sorry. Don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. I don't exist. <laughs> you didn't see anything. I don't have suspicious blood on me. Like, there's nothing weird happening. Oh, I got a police raid because of that now as well. So that sucks. And all my customers are getting impatient. So I messed up a bit there, but I was more like... I was focusing on getting that quest done and now it's done. So I don't have to worry about any quests anymore. I've done every single one. So we're good. So <laughs> I'm happy about that. So that's really awesome. All right, I'm just going to kind of wait for them to go before I, like, get stuck on any orders. I think that like, I'm gonna get some more people leaving because I like, probably left it a bit. I don't really like doing stuff when there's like police here because it's just a bit risky, you know? So I'd rather just like try and avoid it if I can. But yeah, some people are gonna leave, I think. I really wanna get rid of this blood as well just to make my life easier, but we should be able to get rid of those police badges like pretty easily um, soon. So that's good. Let's quickly put this in. Did I get it in? I did. Oh, that was close. <laughs> that was really close actually. So like that was a, a pain in the butt. Okay, so olives and this is for, let's see. Yes, so the, the turtle thing. I'll put that in for the turtle thing. But yeah, I lost a bit of rep there, but it's fine. It's not that bad. All right, we're just going to build it up from this moment on. So that will be okay. Do you mind, sir? What's your problem? Hey, that's not nice. Go listen to some music. Why are you attacking me so? I even played music. What about if I go invisible? All right, we'll just go invisible instead. He'll just get off my butt if I do that. So that'll be good. <laughs> I want him to go back to what he was doing. I want him to eat his meal and give me reputation and be a good Naboot, okay? Stop being a bad Nabu, okay? Stop that. <laughs> it's not cool. Not cool at all. Okay, so for this guy, we want rats, I think. And for this dude, I don't remember because these, I haven't served them that often, actually. Um, okay, so we want this one here. So we'll feed that one. So this is 13's order. Just get a little bit, uh, just like fast forward a little bit for that one. Okay, so this is 14. There you go. And cheese. Oh. Oh, what were these guys again? I feel like it's on the tip of my tongue. <laughs> I feel like it's the slime. I think it's the slime. We'll double check, but I think it's the slime. Um, The robot dogs, I don't remember. Let me see. Yeah, that was the slime, and the robot dogs is also the slime. Um, Well, different slime, but <laughs> it's still a slime. <laughs> it still looks like a slime to me anyway. And this one is... Did I? I did something wrong here. I did something wrong on that order. Yes, I did. Oh, no. I made a mistake. I put cheese in it instead of lettuce. That was totally my bad. So it was meant to be lettuce. I didn't even realize I did that, to be honest. But it's fine. I fixed it before it went out. So, like, that's, that's one good thing, I would say. Just wait for this one to come through. That was number 15. Okay, so we're doing this one here. And we need the, the bird thing. Let's put that in there. We need some sauce as well. Let's just go for nicotine. I don't even need this nicotine sauce anymore. I got so much of it that I could just use it. Like, just why not? <laughs> it's a non-lethal sauce. So it's just like pretty easy to use up and stuff okay so we just need this dude and i think i might t feed him the the teeth alien let's go with that one i just call him the teeth aliens so i don't really know what they're called so i just go with that because it's like his most prominent feature so that's like why i call him that <laughs> basically it helps me anyway it helps me to know what i'm talking about <laughs> I don't know if it helps you, but it helps me. <laughs> okay, let's speed up a little bit. All right, there you go. Just going to put this away. Let's just cook up all of these guys as well. Just fast forward because kind of did my orders a little bit too quick here. 
We're on the last wave, so I think that's the day over as well. I nearly got back up to 8k, so like, that's good. I feel like I kind of like didn't make much progress with the reputation today, because I think I was on 8,000, wasn't I? I think I was, so, so not, I didn't make that much progress there, but I did finish all my quests, so like, I don't have to worry about that anymore, so that's... That's really good. We're gonna keep going though because I want to see if I can get some like extra effects and stuff like that popping up because that would be really awesome to do as well and I just want to get a little bit more playability out of it too so I feel like I've only spent like two seconds on this planet. I like to spend a bit more time you know. Uh, I need a bit of health as well. Grab some health. There we go. Don't think there's anything else I need to do. I did my bills and everything. Yeah I did all that. Don't think there's anything else. Let's just keep going. Let's see what happens on this planet here. All right, we're on day 83 today and we have a zombie epidemic. Fantastic. I'm probably going to lose reputation on this one. So I absolutely hate the zombie epidemic. It's such a pain in the butt. So we'll see. I'm going to try and like not activate my traps and just kind of like deal with it like myself maybe and just see like how it goes. As usually I always just let my traps do the talking, but I really want the rep. So I'm hoping that I can just kind of just deal with it so we shall see one of those though number two is the naboot so i'm gonna keep that in mind actually that would be good i'm just gonna quickly just put a mushroom in there so i know that that's the naboot one are you okay you're a zombie i'm oh god you don't okay i can't hurt you with physical attacks it's okay he's turned we're fine. We're good. <laughs> I just wanted to get rid of him ASAP. Okay, so we got a pepper in there. What do Naboots like again? We need to do the Nabu order. Okay, the pink thing. So let's just whack that in there quickly. We got this one here. And I know that you like the slime. Oh, wait. That's number two. Yeah, that's number two. Number two. That's fine. I know that you're a Nabu, so it's all good. Okay, now we want some some peppers some chorizo okay are you coming over sir okay come and grab your meal oh i haven't served you yet have i no i have not this is no 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 please leave me alone <laughs> the invisibility thing is so so useful it's such a pain in the butt when they do that i'm just trying to get my order i'm just trying to give this to order number one stop it leave me alone <laughs> Go away, you fiend. What's wrong with you? <laughs> he won't leave me alone. What's, what's, what's his problem? Like, geez. It's probably because I hit that zombie because he wasn't turned when I hit him. So obviously that's just like seen as an act of aggression instead of like me trying to get rid of a zombie which is what i was trying to do but like they they don't know that they don't they don't know <laughs> they don't know these things they're silly oh man this guy's annoying he just doesn't want to leave me alone look man i know you're hungry i'll give you your order in a second just you need to bear with me a sec all right there you just take your order all right just take your order and just go and be happy and just leave me alone all right <laughs> god What's your problem? All right, I'm gonna wait here because like I'm sure zombies are gonna come through and everybody's been served and everything. I'm gonna speed it up just a tiny bit and we're gonna keep an eye out what comes through our portal just so that we can be aware <laughs> of what's happening here. I probably should move because I think something something yeah that like that guy is suspicious and he's probably gonna come through. Okay, we got a robot. Um, it's actually good to have robots on a zombie epidemic because they can't be turned to into zombies So it's useful for sure. Not any no zombies just yet So we're in the clear at the moment. Oh, there you go. We got a zombie here I'm just gonna like stick around him. Oh god, <laughs> leave me alone <laughs> That guy the amount of times so seriously has been so many times Didn't you just have the zombie infection? It seems to have disappeared that's weird. Well, this guy's got the zombie epidemic as well, so we're just gonna keep an eye on him. There he goes. He just turned, but I got him, so we're fine. We're fine. Don't need to worry about that. Okay, we're getting some reputation together. That that's awesome. But yes, I I actually I swear I saw he was infected, but now it's gone. It's making me a bit nervous, but I think we'll be okay. <laughs> so that's good. Okay, let's serve up some more customers. That would be really good. Let's do that one. And this one, I'm just gonna like set their burgers up and then like we'll do the meat in a second because I don't know, I just kind of kind of like doing it like that. Number five number six number six yeah number six <laughs> don't worry i thought he was a naboo for a second i like was questioning my my choices 
<laughs> I was questioning what was happening here, but it's okay. Okay, we've got the the birds for this order. Oh man, I need to give you this pronto, pronto. Get that order in. Didn't realize that like he was that impatient. Like my god. All right, we're gonna do a either a rudest or we'll just do this one. Actually, it doesn't really matter too much. This is number eight, and this is our last order here. And then I'm just gonna like. Go and watch the um, the portals to see what's like coming into my establishment. That would be good. <laughs> and hopefully no nasty pasties. But you never know what's going to pop into your establishment for sure. Okay, you're a Nabu. So like that was good to see, I guess. So now we know. But I don't think any of these are infected. So I think we're okay at the moment. Yep, we're all good. So number 10 is a Nabu, which is good to know. Any more infected people coming in? No, I feel quite, quite lucky. It's quite tame at the moment, which I'm really shocked at. Number 10 is a Naboot, so I'm gonna keep that in mind. So let's see what you like, the pink stuff. Let's feed you the pink stuff over there. That would be good. I don't think we had a single infected there, so we got super lucky, definitely. All right, so this is number 10, let's feed that one. Okay, let's see, we got one here. All right, let me just quickly survey the area. I think we're okay. I'm really shocked because there's usually way more like zombies that come in, so I'm really, really shocked about that. Okay, so we're gonna feed this one to you and we got, what, what does the dog like? Okay, we got uh, this pink thing, let's do that as well. Okay, so those two are pretty much done. We just need the fries, the chorizo, and the rat. So we're gonna do that as well. Okay, which one was which? This is the slime, this is number 12. This one here was number 11, and this one here is number nine. Okay, that's the first row done. We should focus on that bottom one, because he's getting a bit impatient. So this one, and we need some cheese. I don't actually know what that thing likes, so let's have a look. Okay, those, those things. We can feed you one of those. Okay, is that everything in your bun? Let's see, bacon, the pepper, the cheese. Yeah, I think everything is good. Wait, number 15. Number 15 is a Naboot, which I didn't realize. This is for number 13. So number 15 is a Naboot. I literally just saw him change it, like, the corner of my eye. So I was just, like, lucky there, I guess. So this one, the pink thing, and number 15. What are you doing, number 15? You're freaking me out. I don't know what's happening. Okay, uh, this thing here. Okay, and I think we might have somebody leaving, so I don't know if I'm going to get this out fast enough but i'll try just need to get this here i don't think we're gonna get that one fast enough that's number 15 yeah number 14 i think is gonna leave i don't think i'm gonna get this out so i'll try but i don't think it's gonna happen quick get it in did i get it did he leave i don't know what happened i have no idea i think he might have left but i'm not 100 percent sure to be honest with you i don't know it all happened too fast i swear i got that order in but it was like this last split second so i think it like just didn't count i think it was just a tad too slow but that's it like there was literally like two zombies i'm really shocked at that because usually they do throw a lot more at you and that was super easy as zombie epidemics go so <laughs> i didn't have too much to worry about there oh i got an order oh i thought i did them all oh i, I didn't do this guy we're just gonna which i think we should just kill him let's see how can i kill him that's the question. I don't think we can. <laughs> I actually don't know. Oh god, I don't think I'm gonna get this order out to him though. I'll try, but I don't think it's gonna happen. Definitely don't think it's gonna happen. I'm not gonna get that out. Nope. Okay, we're gonna have to find a way to kill him because like, I don't wanna lose the rep. So I'm just gonna put some motion sensors on here. He is impervious to physical, so the only way I'm gonna kill him is if he gets hit by that, but it didn't kill him, which sucks. I ended up losing the rep anyway. It's not that much rep, so it's not like really bad or anything, but I was hoping to avoid it, <laughs> but never mind. It's fine, okay. I'm just gonna get some cucumber and stuff like that. That would be really awesome. All right, there we go. All right, we need some more ingredients. The more ingredients, the better, I would say. All right, there you go. Can we get this one too? Very nice, very nice indeed. I don't think there's anything I really need to... I don't think there's anything I really need to do, actually. Do I need to pay my bills? 
Oh, I don't have enough to pay my bills because <laughs> I got the upgrade. It's fine. I can just take out a few hundred to just pay that bill because otherwise the debt collector is going to come. Not that it's really like bad if the debt collector comes. It's just like inconvenient, I guess. It's just annoying, you know? So yeah, we just need to keep going with our reputation I would say just gonna keep serving customers it's gonna be as little killing as possible at the moment day 84 we got system crashes today we've had system crashes before so this is not a new one sadly I'm really hoping to bump into a new like um event as well because like the next planet has a completely different event that is like unique to the last planet of the game so if we're gonna see these events like these new events for like this planet we're gonna have to do it like now we can't see it on the next one so i'm gonna definitely try and trigger those it's just when they just decide to like pop up because they can be a little just a pain in the butt to get them to actually pop up sometimes so there is that Let's just fast forward a little bit I need some customers up in here. You are a thing, aren't you? I hope you're not a Nabu. I don't think you are. <laughs> we got these stupid Naboots on this level as well that I kind of like gotta be aware of too. So it's a bit annoying. Okay, let's see. We've got the pink dude over here and he wants the slime. So let's do that. Have some slime. Enjoy your slime surprise. <laughs> okay, I just like gotta remember to really look at the symbols of these orders here. I think it's this one. All right, it's actually not that bad though. I don't mind it too much. All right, what was this one for? This one was for, okay, I got you. This is for the the rat one. So we'll do that as well. Can we just kind of do some cooking? That would be good. And some some egg here. Gonna do that one as well. What do you, what do you like again? I always forget. <laughs> it's fine. Okay, this one here, just gonna send this one off. And wait, what was this one again? This one was... Wait a second. Are you a Naboot? I feel like you were different before. Am I wrong? I put... You're a Naboot, aren't you? I don't know, I swear. Yeah, he's a Naboot. That like really took me off guard for a second. <laughs> I was like, wait a minute. Because I put a different meat for him. And I was like, wait, that's not the right meat. And then like, because his like picture was different and I was like wait what's going on here so yeah I like caught that oh man the robots are really impatient I should really focus on doing the robots first because like that's super annoying um actually so yeah one just left that's super annoying never mind it's only one it shouldn't affect us that much cheese and what do I need for these guys quick 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 the teeth dude let's get a teeth dude in there all right, quick. I don't know if I'm going to make it. I'm not going to make it. It's going up so quick. I'm not going to make it. Oh, <laughs> I was literally like right there with his order. No, I lost two peoples. I don't know. I don't think I can take those out either. The people that left were like impervious to damage. So not too much I could have done about that, unfortunately. But that's how it goes. I really should focus definitely on the the robots that come in but I know now because I didn't realize that their pa their patience was like less than other types so I didn't know that before but I know now so I'm gonna definitely focus on the those guys when they come in anyway okay so let's do the pink dude for a second and we need some sauce and uh I forget what this guy likes actually uh let's see the bird thing let's do the bird thing as well and so we're going to fulfill the dog one as well so I got that one there for the dog this one is for you and this one here is for you <laughs> okay got you okay and now the pink one so we're gonna serve this robot see look how far his thing is up already like that's kind of insane i just saw a nabu but i don't know who it was who was the nabu i don't know i wasn't really looking was it the dog i don't know <laughs> i'm just going to like put everything in for a second and then i will like have a look to see if i can like work it out i definitely saw a nabu in the corner of my eye but i don't know who it was so i'm just gonna keep my eyes peeled oh it's the bottom one it's the bottom one got you okay i know who it is now all right good <laughs> i wasn't sure for a second okay so let's put order this order in and then 
this one here, which is this one, oh my god, and then this one here, which is the bottom one, I think, yes. And I haven't done the top one, so I kind of didn't realise you were up there. He was he was hiding. <laughs> it was a hidden order that I couldn't even see. But yeah, you really have to think about these orders sometimes. <laughs> They're a real pain in the butt, but it's fine. Okay, let's put this one in as well. Alright, let's fast forward a little bit. There's nothing else happening right now, so just gonna wait a bit. I think there will be some more customers that come in, so I'm just gonna wait for my first order to come in. And there we go. I'm gonna have bacon and egg. I think I know I saw a Nabu a second ago. I don't know who it was. Oh my god. It's just a constant like it's a constant like thing like who are you? Who is the Nabu? <laughs> it's like Cluedo or something. <laughs> like what what's happening? I don't even know. Alright, the dog. Let's see the pink stuff. Alright, I'm just gonna do what I did last time and just put all the orders in and then just look. 17? 17. I think 17 is Naboot. Wait, who is 17? The orders are all messed up though. So I have no idea who's, who that even is. It was one of the teeth dudes, but I don't know which one. I'm just, I'm wasting time here. So I'm just gonna have to put some orders in, I think, cause I don't know. Oh, that one. Yeah, that I saw, I saw it. Th this one is this one. You are a Nabu, the one with the, the mushrooms. So this one and the mushrooms, you are Naboot. So we'll make sure to give you one of these. I'm actually like running out of meat for that, which I'm surprised at. Been a while since I like, you know, have been low on something. Not low, but like I remember when I was at like a really like high amount for those for that meat, for the pink meat, and now it's like getting a bit low. But getting a bit lower than before anyway. All right, so this is this one. We need to do, yeah, I need to do that pink one next. Oh, no, I did the wrong order. Oh, no, I gave you the wrong thing. Dang it, that guy's going to be mad. That sucks. That meat is like, I'm running out of that meat too. I don't even have that much, so that's annoying. Ugh, that's painful. That's really painful. Oh, I know, the, the rat one. Let's do that one as well. So this is for... Uh, this one and this one is for I got you I got you this one is for this one and <laughs> oh my god this is like so much to remember but it's fine uh, what was I doing for this one the teeth one let's get quick 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 because he's gonna leave I don't think I'm gonna make it I'm not gonna make it he's gonna leave <laughs> I can't get like a perfect day there's always one or two customers that leave <laughs> it's just so hard to get a perfect day I thought I was doing really well but I think it's like the nab boots that just keep making me question myself you know that I just like keep messing up a little bit but it's okay all right so yeah that dude's going to unfortunately leave and I'm not gonna get anything good coming out of that I need to upgrade that thing I keep forgetting to upgrade it and then hopefully next time I could get him down or something I messed up my order with this dude as well so I kind of like want to get, get kill him if I can get the opportunity to I don't know where he's going he's going to wash his hands this is perfect I can now take him down because he's not he's not satisfied so I want to definitely kill him before he leaves because that wouldn't be good I don't want to lose my rep <laughs> I want as much as possible but that wasn't too bad I think I definitely gained more than what I lost today so like that was good I would say so pretty good day pretty decent day we're on 8.7 right now so that's good I gained 425 prestige so that's not bad I'm really hoping for like critics or something like that to like pop up I really want something like that to pop up but it's just being a little bit stingy with like the variations that it's giving me at the moment so it's an absolute nightmare but it's okay all right let's get some more bacon and stuff all right anything else or are we good anything to upgrade or anything uh 4.9 not quite enough there so i have to guess i have to just store up a bit more then i suppose okay i think i'm ready for the next day 16 more days for that skin too but that's fine all right let's see what is going on today i got hungry visitors i think it gives you more money i'm not sure if it gives you more prestige as well 
maybe it does i don't really know but this can be a very tough one to deal with with so many like meats coming in so it can be a pain in the butt but i'll do my best i'm gonna keep cooking as well like whilst we're going through this day because we're gonna need so much meat for this double meat with like seven minutes of doing double meat is gonna really take a toll on like my my storage i feel like because i'm already like starting to run out so i haven't really killed customers in ages because i've just been trying to build up my prestige so yeah i haven't really done that in a while okay so you want a bun a chorizo some fries and you would want two tarots so that's fine we got another one with some fries with two tarots that's not too bad so we'll just leave that there for a second and then this one wants two slimes i'm just gonna leave that there there's some of the meat i've just got like 200 of it <laughs> it's like super crazy i'm just kind of paying attention to now boots at the moment but i don't think we oh number two number two is a now boot okay all right that's good to know so number one can have this and number three number two i've got to change your order because i didn't realize you were a nabu good job i was watching and seeing what was going on so this time is fries and that means it's two of these instead so that's good to good to know um so that's number two is anyone who else is next i think i should do number five next so we're going to do this and then two more of these so that'll be good so this is number two Let's get that one done let's see i think i'll do number four next because number four is looking quite impatient so i think we should do that one so let's do the bacon and this one why did some people just run out did something something happen <laughs> i don't know i have no idea so two of those for this one is there anything else no that's it for that one okay cool and so for the thingy we need two of these two of these so we'll just whack those in there as well so this is for number four number six is nearly done but he's also getting very impatient so hopefully that heats up in time okay we're good oh my god <laughs> we did it i think so everybody in here is happy for now so that's good and i'm hoping that this will just boost us with the rep so that'll be really awesome all right there you go that's like nearly we've still got a lot to cook but like we're getting through a lot <laughs> okay just go through all this i remember i had 300 tarots to cook at one point and we're down to like 100 and like 60 161 i was on like 300 at one point <laughs> so i've actually managed to cook up so much of this stuff which is pretty impressive i have to say <laughs> actually so that's cool but you can really like when you get a hungry variation you can make so much money like look at my money i'm on 6k i guarantee you will end up finishing at about 10k at the very least like you can earn so much so much money let's keep an eye see if there's any of these are naboos so i just want to see sometimes they show themselves at the order 11 okay number 11 is a naboot good to know i think that's the only one so let's get that one done first so then i don't like mess it up later because that would be annoying and we'll do this one as well so this one is number 11 let's get that one done just gonna wait for this one to heat up so then i can give this one out too so number 12 okay so we're gonna start with who is the most annoyed i think this one here so we're gonna do number eight i think so bacon and this one and was it two of these i think it was two birds right yeah two birds good to know let's make sure we send that one off to number eight. Oh, it's not not like you know heated up properly just yet and so we are soon to do this one which is also another two birds so i'll do that one too so it's the bacon one so this is number eight this one here is number 10 and we're gonna do this one as well so let's do that one too so this one is what am i doing number 10 <laughs> so many orders to fulfill <laughs> so much so many orders oh and just God. not enough time all right there's number nine okay so now i think we should do the dog because the dog gets annoyed pretty quickly so this and bacon and what was it again i looked at it now i've forgotten okay it's the the pink one it's just like so much to remember right 
Um, I'm just gonna put some egg in there quickly and that's that order done. We just need to send it off and some egg in this one as well. Okay, send this off to number 13. Okay, now we have to do this one really quick as well because they're getting impatient too. So two of these, send that. Oh God, I need a sauce in there as well. Put that in too, a sauce in there too. I don't think I'm gonna make this one. It's been a bit too, been a bit too slow. Not gonna make it so close, so very close, but just didn't quite cut it. So that's annoying. Maybe I can kill them so I don't lose the rep though. Like let's see where are you going are you going up here oh hold on turn the motion sensor on um well that didn't work out too well did it <laughs> but never mind please leave me alone like seriously <laughs> so evil man i need to upgrade that vending machine i keep saying that and i keep forgetting <laughs> so oops ah please leave me alone i don't think i'm gonna get that guy out am i if i kill him they're gonna see me and i'm gonna lose rep anyway so i think i should just leave it at this point um oh no we need to deal with this dude as well i was so like focused on trying to stop my rep from going that i might actually lose rep from this dude as well oh no what am i like i'm so like kicking myself here <laughs> oh god i got another person wait i wonder if i can get him out in time I'm not really sure. I don't think I'm going to be able to. Super annoying. No one's looking. Maybe I can just quickly take him down. No, they saw me. That was a bad move. That was not a good idea, I don't think. <laughs> Oopsie. Okay, okay. I was just trying not to lose a rep at the time. But yeah, sometimes just make this worse for myself, don't I? Oh man, that guy's getting super suspicious. Did he see something? I don't know what he saw, but yeah, he's getting real suspicious right now. Let's put that in there. And oh man, I can't even go in there because there's a policeman and he'll see me real quick, real quick. Okay, this is number 16. Get that out quick. There you go. All right, that's that done. Now I just get rid of this blood and then I'll continue with my orders. That would be really good. So I don't know if we've got any nab boots here or anything. I'm not too sure. I don't think so, but I don't know for sure. So I'm just, I'm just going to go with the assumption that we don't. All right, let's just put that there a second. We got some olives and let's have a look. Let's see some, some birds. Let's get two of those. Put that over there actually. Okay, so there's number 17. We're good there. Such chaotic orders. <laughs> it's so chaotic. Send help. <laughs> oh no. Okay, number 19. Uh, the two, the teeth dudes send those over over there as well um i forgot to turn that trap off didn't i oopsie there's a very unhappy customer over there let's turn that off before i forget because it's probably not going to do me any favors to be honest it's number 19 okay and we got this one i think this guy likes debt collectors i'm just gonna shove that over there and we got some cheese some mushrooms and two of these let's quickly whack that over there that was kind of close actually <laughs> i have to say hurry up please hurry up because i got an order to send off like right now number 20 quick oh that was close okay what was this one did, did they leave i think they might have left yeah i think they left i don't know what happened there but they clearly left so that's annoying never mind okay let's get that one warmed up and we got egg and i don't know exactly what this one wants okay two birds let's do the two birds should be fine here oh i guess not i guess we're not okay we're not okay quick i had the patties in my hand i couldn't do anything <laughs> that was super annoying okay i'm just gonna hide up here oh i got a police raid now because of that that's annoying why i didn't even do anything super annoying but never mind okay so number 21 i'm gonna keep going with my orders even if there is a police raid here i'm just gonna keep trying okay so we got the peppers i don't think they're actually suspicious we got a police raid but they're not suspicious so like that's not as bad so we should be fine to just continue with like what we're doing actually so that'll be good okay yeah like reputation has gone up at least like a thousand like we've gone up to nine thousand now so like that's super good as well we're on the last wave so i'm just gonna speed up now i think we're done 
Like, I'm pretty sure that we're finished with this level now. We just have to wait for the police to leave because they're just a bit of a nuisance, aren't they? I got an F, but yeah, I definitely, like, gained more rep. So I would say that that was a success in some way. <laughs> so that's good. Okay, let's get some, like, buns and stuff like that over here. That would be really cool. All right, there we go. Very nice and i don't know but yeah it's like a bit annoying that like we still haven't got a new effect popping up yet i was kind of hoping that we would have had one by now but it's being very stingy right extremely stingy but we'll try a like a, another day or two so hopefully like one will pop up then i'm really hoping so this might be my last upgrade what do you think no it's not oh it is oh good there you go we got every single upgrade that exists every single one <laughs> so we're pretty op at this point i would say <laughs> okay time to get rid of that we don't have all of the like upgrades for the traps so i guess that's the next thing for me to do i was gonna upgrade the vending machine wasn't i the damage isn't enough on this vending machine cool down as well that's probably what i'm just gonna pour the rest of my money into so i don't really have anything else to pour it into so that's what we're gonna do still no new effect man we got devourers and evil robots okay like i haven't actually had devourers in ages so that's a nice one the evil robots isn't really going to affect me because i'm focusing on feeding my customers at this point anyway so it's really like not going to affect me that much so it doesn't really matter to be honest so they don't really mean anything so it's fine okay anyway let's see what orders we got we got a naboot there so let's make sure to do something about those guys okay we got some pink uh, things it's only one meat this time i need to remember that so many times i've like forgotten because we just did like a double meat and then i've given them double meat and then they get like unhappy and you don't want that you don't want that because <laughs> that would be super bad all right and this one here is number two and we got this dude which is the teeth dude so we got the bacon the thing and the cheese and we'll feed you this stuff there you go robot is breaking a trap how dare you it'll be cool to see the devourers again i feel like i haven't seen them in such a long time so that'll be actually like really interesting i think uh so this is number three and we got an order over here to do as well okay this one here and a pink guy over on this one. Oh, i think i put something something wrong i just kind of are doing it too quick so i didn't like i misclicked i didn't mean to do that but it's fine it's fine everything is good all right there you go all right so what are we doing here let's just shove this one into number four and i got the robot dogs to do and i couldn't remember exactly what he wanted so i didn't put the the meat in there nope that's the wrong one i was looking for that one actually all right there's that one and so we also have one of those to do so that's that order done that's five and seven done so let's put this into five this one here is number seven wait why are you suspicious like oh it's a devourer that's why <laughs> i was like i was like why is there someone suspicious i haven't done anything but that would be why they are constantly suspicious no matter what you do so <laughs> there is that we'll actually be able to serve our first devourers i think the first time that we had this devourer coming up we didn't have any info on it so we didn't know how to serve it but now we do have info on this thing so we will be able to serve him so like that's pretty cool at least i think so anyway unless i just guessed but i don't really remember to be fair so i'm not sure we will see okay let's put this one in number eight very nice all right so anybody else else popping up here let's have a look so some yeah some peppers i just like had a moment there for a second i was like what am i doing <laughs> it's just like it's so overwhelming it's so overwhelming sometimes all right let's just speed up and i'm gonna give this out to number nine there we go perfect i just got a couple more of these things to do oh i messed up on one of my orders but never mind we'll just let them leave it's fine it's not worth the risk of like trying to attack them because then someone might see it and then i might lose even more reputation and it just doesn't seem worthwhile right it like, doesn't seem doesn't seem worth it so yeah it's fine okay do we have any orders in yet yep we got an order over here to deal with so i'll make sure to tackle that one so we got bacon and cheese so i'm just gonna set that one aside for a second all right let's do the pink one over here too so that's cool and this one here bacon 
Let's do bacon. Where's the bacon at? The bacon is here. And the cheese. There we go. Very nice. Oh, 13 is a Naboot. Good to know, actually. Good to know. So I was just about to serve that one. So <laughs> that's good. Okay, we'll put that one in there. What am I doing? The orders are just like so massive right now. This is number 10, I think. And we got, oh God, Devourer is incoming. Don't, don't attack me, Devourer. This one was number th 13? Was it 13? I don't remember. Wasn't it? Which one was the Nabu? Was it 13 or 11? 13. I got this mixed up, I think. Yeah, I got this mixed up. So this one, fries over here and uh, the pink thing, I think. So we'll put that over there. I definitely got that mixed up, I think. And then the bacon and the cheese and whatever this thing likes so oh the teeth dude okay we'll give him that as well hopefully i can get that in in time but this is this was 13 yeah this was 13 put that in oh my god i got so many orders this is 11 oh my good lord <laughs> we can do it though we can do it we can do all these orders i got this okay so bacon and what was it? What did I just looked and I just like I was just overwhelmed so much so many orders to to deal with here and this guy likes the slime so that's good to know okay dude come on just just hurry up man just hurry up <laughs> I got orders to fulfill all right this one here is number 14 so we'll send this one off and this one here is 16 yeah 16 send that one off Okay, oh my god. <laughs> I'm getting there. I'm getting through them slowly. Okay, this one is fries and I think rats. I think. I don't know. It's fine. This one is 15. I think this one is right. Let me just double check. Yeah, it's rat. It's fine. I'm, I'm doing good. I'm doing fine. <laughs> I'm just like worried that I'm doing the wrong meat, but I think we're good. Okay, this one... Um. Okay, I might do the blonde dude. I haven't done one of those blonde dudes in a while. Okay, and nicotine. I'm just going to chug that there so it's heating. But I think I might miss that one, actually. I don't think I'm going to get that in time somehow. Definitely don't think so. Nope, he's left. Yeah, I kind of thought that might be the case. Okay, so we got chorizo and we need the pepper. What does the devourer like again? Oh yeah, the slime, the slime. Let's give that to the devourer as well. There's a lot of devourers in my store right now, I have to say. They wiped out all the humans. I feel like we should wipe them out too, but I gotta be, I gotta be on my best behavior right now. <laughs> Look how good our reputation is going. I know I just lost a bit there, but it's doing... It's doing really well. It's doing great. Uh, what was that? Number 21 is a Naboot. So let's make sure that we do something about that. I just had one of those moments. Okay. <laughs> Pink one. Okay. We got this and you want a pepper. Okay. There's your order like ready. We got another ton of like guests coming in now. So I got to deal with these guys too. God, so many devourers. They look so cool though, don't they? They look so awesome. Um, oh man, it just got cold. Okay, this is number 21. There you go. We got some mushrooms, some fries, and a rat. Let's do that one. My finger's hurting from just scrolling through all this stuff. It's just like a little bit intense, don't you think? <laughs> it's an intense game sometimes. Okay, so this is the slime, and this one is 22. All right, we're getting there. We're getting there. It's got to have like full focus on these levels. This one's 24. At least I think so. <laughs> I hope I did that right. Bacon and egg. And this is for the dog, which likes the pink stuff. So we'll do that as well. Can't believe how like low that's gotten now compared to like what it was at. That's like so crazy. And let's see the teeth dude. Let's do the teeth dude as well. Let's shove that in there. Okay, so this one was for... This one was for 23. Ah! He just saw me. Yeah, he just saw me. He's coming. Oh no. I mean, I did go invisible. So I think it just like threw him off guard, I think. But he was coming for me. <laughs> but I managed to sort of save it. All right, this one must be 28. Is that the right meat? Really? For this one? Yeah, it is. I'm just... No, I was right. It is a Nabu. Oh my god, I nearly gave that to him as well. I'm so glad. I like thought something was off. I thought something was like really weird. And I'm so glad that I like hesitated a little bit there. <laughs> so I literally nearly gave that over. Okay, so this one here is 28. 
Okay, we got some bacon in here and we need this one and we also need, uh, yeah, the pink meat as well. Let's put that in. Okay, good. And okay, I know we're doing the pink guy, but that's okay because he's really easy to remember that once I do them a lot and I've done them a lot throughout this game as well. Okay, this has got egg in it. It's got egg in it? I don't know who that was for. This one's for 25. I think that, yeah, I had a couple of people leave. Number 27's gonna leave. I, you know, I'm not perfect. <laughs> I missed a couple of people there, but never mind. I think I did pretty well considering. I think that's the day done right now. So just wait for them all to leave now. But not as much money as I was thinking that we would make, but it's actually okay though, considering. Like, I don't really need money anyway, so we're fine. But lots of lovely reputation. Look how close we are to maxing out our reputation now. So that's really awesome. Still a bit sad that I haven't seen those two different variations. I really thought I would have seen them. <laughs> it's taking forever. Hopefully we'll see them soon though. So I really do want to see them. Okay, let's finish up just getting our stuff here. That would be awesome. Do I got I got some more chorizo, some more jalapenos, some more bacon. Very nice. And yeah, all my upgrades are done there as well. I'll do my bills. And then, I don't know, what's my money like in my safe? It's always nice to have backups in there. It's only like 5k. It's actually okay though. I don't think I need to put any in there at the moment. Let's do some upgrades or something. I think that would be good. I'm just going to keep upgrading my vending machine, I guess. I'm going to like put some motion sensors and stuff like that on some of these things. Max out some of our stuff because like, why not, right? Let's max it all out. It's gonna be great. We're gonna have uber amazing, like, just like traps. It's gonna be super cool. Motion sensor on this one too. That one's maxed out. I got a lot of maxed out traps here, which is really awesome. So it's some kind of like hovercraft or something. I don't really know. Is that a wizard? <laughs> I don't know what's happening here. Has he got magic or something? What on earth is happening here? I don't know. <laughs> I'm always like this every time. Every time it just looks so interesting to me. Oh, I have a collector's visit. I must have forgot my bills. Never mind. <laughs> so trash fall. We are witnessing an unprecedented prank. Someone throws trash out of the portal straight to the Good Burger Diner. Of course, all that garbage will probably annoy any customers. So the chef will have to do a lot of cleaning today. Will we support him on social networks if he solves the problem and quickly removes all of the trash okay so loads of trash is just falling from the sky and it's gonna annoy my customers let me just deal with my collector real quick because i didn't actually like mean to i didn't mean for that to happen actually oh it automatically got rid of the body i guess that's handy we're really close on the prestige as well as you can see but it's really tough keeping it at exactly ten thousand. so like i actually got really close at one point and then i ended up having a few customers leaving and then like losing it again it's kind of gonna be a bit challenging to actually keep it like at that exact number but i'm sure we can like at some point i suppose so yeah i'm gonna like hopefully get it up to what i need it to be at and then i'm just gonna like start like i'm gonna start like putting my traps on and like getting rid of them oh yeah i got random traps today as well i forgot about that it looks like someone's already angry and already leaving <laughs> I don't think that was the trash either. Trash portal has opened. Oh, is that? Oh, okay. And then I just get rid of it like this. Oh, there's a lot of it too. Man, it takes a while to actually like clean this up. But I don't think it's gonna like pop up that often. So there is that. But some some people have already got mad and left. <laughs> that's annoying because that's gonna affect my reputation as well so that sucks okay what are we doing now let's see uh number five i got a nabu here on number five so let's deal with that guy first so i need the peppers i need the mushrooms so many people are leaving i had such good rep as well not like amazing but like i was doing okay and now it's just all gonna go down the pan i think so that's gonna be so annoying i'm running out of meat as well oh trash portal at least it's in my kitchen like i don't think people are gonna see that because it's in my kitchen so it's not as bad i don't think um so Oh god, okay, this was for number five. I'm having so many people leave, no! And this is for number four. I think that dog's gonna leave, sadly. So, 
Yeah, that sucks. I'm not even gonna try because that, that one's just gonna leave. Oh my god. <laughs> I lost like nearly a K. Seriously, it's so hard to get ref on these planets. Like maybe the best way to do it would be go to like an easy planet and then just like build up my reputation on that planet because it would be so much easier, right? But just like for this one, it's just like incredibly challenging for sure. It's really hard to keep your rep up on these planets, especially with just like how many customers you get as well. It's so many customers and it's so easy for them to leave too um so we're doing yes i know what i'm doing i think if that is oh he left everybody left <laughs> like every single person <laughs> oh my god <laughs> i'm really sad what is happening that sucks so bad so my traps keep activating and annoying them as well so that's not helping either i literally lost every single customer like what <laughs> No, I lost so much rep. That's gonna take a few days to take that to get that back as well. That's so painful. These things happen though. At least we got to see like the new effect because I was really curious about what it was gonna be. Oh, I got some more trash down here as well. Oh man, it's put his annoyance up so far. That would be why so many people left. It really puts their annoyance bar up like really quick just from this tiny bit of trash. Like seriously, you guys are really sensitive. <laughs> They are super sensitive. That's why I lost like every single customer. Oh my god, there was so much trash that I like missed and I just didn't realize it was like, you know, in my in my restaurant. I'm really gonna have to keep an eye on that because it really affects it big time. So I'm gonna have to be wary of that for sure. I can't believe how much rep I lost, lost because of that. Like that was insane. Okay, so let's see if we can actually do some serving today like that would be nice i'm actually yeah running out of supplies as well a trap a trash portal was opened where here okay let's get rid of get rid of this quick someone just died as well so like that's unfortunate but these things happen sometimes so what order was i doing that's a short circuit that's okay um okay this was 13 i think so we're gonna do that one i was doing this egg one which was the dog so let's like feed that one that would be good and we're going to do the avocado one as well that would be good okay so this one is number 11 there you go someone else just died rest in peace it just you know is the way it goes sometimes maybe it was just like your destiny or something i don't know <laughs> okay some fries and i think i need to put some rats in there is there not been a trash portal for this time this amount of time it's been a while what happened to that guy oh no maybe there is one and i just don't didn't see it or something okay this is number nine all right let's up there is there's more trash here i didn't realize there was some over here causing people to leave <laughs> Whoa, what a pain that's so painful all right let's get rid of that is there any more there's some in my kitchen but i don't think that's gonna affect people that badly so that's okay all right let's get this order in here that would be good but yeah sometimes like i didn't even notice that there was like trash there i didn't even notice that like there had been a trash portal very easy to miss them definitely so like that sucks a lot i'm gonna have to be careful trash portal has opened where 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 let's find out where that is oh i see some trash up there i don't know if that's like the same that if that's that the one that just happened i don't know i should probably have a little check around the restaurant just to check that there isn't like anything more happening around here somewhere because maybe one trash portal just does like the whole area or something i don't know at least there's nothing in the vip room so like that's nice yeah i think we're trash free right now so that's good <laughs> oh trash portal again where did that go let's check see if we can find it oh it's down here quickly get rid of all that before anybody notices it there's nothing here i swear you didn't see nothing <laughs> everything's fine we're trash free for now anyway so that's good that's good okay oops i didn't mean to do that that's a now boot number 15 is a now boot so let's deal with that first before i forget because i am definitely liable to forget actually okay there's that one number 17 is also a now boot um number 15 and number 17 okay we got some more trash up here just rolling in <laughs> what a pain let's get rid of that nobody's actually coming up here so it's fine but just to be on the safe side i'm just gonna check over there i think we're safe i think we're okay so that's good um 
what was I doing? <laughs> it just gets me so distracted. Oh my gosh. Okay, so this is the pink stuff. And number 17 as well is also a Naboot. So we're going to get, do that one as well before I forget. So that would be good. Okay, so this is 14. This one here is number 17. Okay, that's not anything that I need to worry about. Number 17 over there. Okay. All right. Uh, trash portal somewhere. Let's go sort that out because it does make people angry and leave. Oh, look at them all being angry. Look, I don't even have time to get rid of it. Like, he left and I didn't even get a chance to, like, get rid of it. And I went there immediately as soon as I possibly could. Like, that's really unfair, in my opinion. Like, that really sucks. There's no nothing I can do about that. I just think that some of these levels were just made to just make you lose reputation like on purpose you know and it's just really frustrating <laughs> like really frustrating but hey it's just the way it goes i guess so gonna lose like more people here as well oh so annoying okay so we got no that's not right let's see um so this one and we want pepper and bacon i'm gonna put that in as well so this one here is for number 19 oh i don't know what happened to that guy he got mad i think oh i think there's more trash or something i don't know i'm just gonna leave that in there for now we'll get rid of this stuff here just to make sure that nobody sees this but it's, it's only like if i lose like a k it's not that bad because i can make that back so it's like it's not that bad it's just a bit of an annoyance you know because i'm gonna have to work towards it again <laughs> i was so close as well oh everything's just falling apart <laughs> this is an awful effect i don't like it if you're trying to get rep it's an awful effect it really is is there any more is this the last i think this is the last wave actually all right i'm just gonna go on like trash duty i think try and get rid of some of this stuff he didn't even like pay attention to it there so like that was good i guess all right, get rid of this. There we go. Where's the rest of the trash? It's up there. Okay, that went into an okay position. So that's okay. It's just when it puts it right in front of a customer and you literally like have no like chance to get rid of it. Like it's really annoying when that happens, but hey, not much I can do about it. At least I've like seen, look, that's not fair. Come on, you just dumped it right in front of him. I literally, I literally had good rep from that and it instantly turned bad. I didn't even have a chance. That's so mean. That's really evil. That's so horrible. I don't like this one. <laughs> I mean, I still think the zombie epidemic is the worst, but this one is just equally as annoying as well. This is an annoying one. I, at least I ended up, I lost 580 rep from that mission. <laughs> That's just mean, but it could have been worse. I could have lost a lot more than that and I ended up with just losing a little bit So it's okay, actually, but yeah, like there's just some of the levels are just designed to Like hinder you aren't they like come on that was so designed to hinder you like my god Oh, yeah, I need to pay my bills because I actually had a debt collector. I completely forgot. Oh, man I got quite a lot of bills here. It's okay, though Okay, then I'm gonna like see if I can find the next effect. We still got like this fire effect to do and then we'll move on to the next planet. Hopefully I'll have enough reputation by that time as well. So I will be back with the next effect. <laughs> Hopefully it doesn't take me too long. And here we go. I finally got the last effect. So uh, that's really cool. I'm looking forward to seeing what it is. It has a symbol with fire on and it looks like the rivals are giving hot sauce away or something it doesn't it doesn't seem to be what i thought it was i thought it was gonna be like my restaurant was on fire it's more like they're maybe like taking hot sauce and then some of my customers will set on fire i thought it was just random parts of my burger joint would set on fire but i don't really know i guess we'll find out right so that would be pretty fun to see all right let's see oh, i got mold as well oh what a pain spontaneous combustion oh no okay two times per prestige for it though emergency all kinds of creatures in the galaxy started violently catching on fire throughout the day the largest concentration of explosive citizen citizens is observed in the good bug of restaurant if you are now if you are there now be careful not to approach any burning and flailing individuals it is extremely dangerous oh boy <laughs> I don't know what to think about this, but all right. <laughs> oh God, here we go. Let's see what happens here, I suppose. 
gonna be interesting. I got some mold appearing as well, so I could probably get rid of that. I don't need to like be that worried about it though, so I don't have a quest or anything like that for it. Customer is on fire. Oh God. And do you set other people on fire too? Um, I don't know, like, I can't even do anything about that thing because that robot is like immortal and you can't deal damage to that. So like, what is going on? I just got people on fire just running around my restaurant. Do they, oh, this guy died. Okay. All right. So I guess that is like something that's bad. Why are you calling the police, man? What's going on here? Don't call the police. I didn't do anything. Are you for real? Okay, okay. Can you stop that, please? Ow! I'm taking so much damage here. Did you call the police? Okay, the police weren't called. I got out of that, but I probably shouldn't take that risk again because that actually took quite a lot of, like, my hearts and stuff. So that's probably not a good idea. But I think this is kind of similar to the zombie apocalypse where that, like, you should, like, really... If you see someone on fire, you should, like, really nip that in the bud so then it doesn't, like, spread to all your other customers. It's very, very similar to that from the looks of it. So, like, that's a bit of a pain, especially when it, like, gets the robots because there's literally nothing you can do about the robots, like, being on fire so like that's really annoying I don't know how I'm going to deal with it if the robots get it again in the future I don't know I'm guess I'm just gonna have to hide somewhere and just like let it all play out and just let the police come I guess because I don't really know uh, the, a good way of dealing with it at the moment so what was I doing um yeah I was feeding customer number four but there wasn't any there wasn't any pink stuff, so I'm just gonna feed you this stuff actually. Mold appeared, uh, that's fine. Okay, and we need some tarot over here as well. And this, I don't know what this is for. Okay, so that's fine, mold is spreading. The mold is coming back. No, leave me alone, mold. Okay, so this is number four. This one here is number five. I don't have that many customers now, so like half of them like ran out screaming. <laughs> So rest in peace. <laughs> that wasn't meant to happen. I lost a bit of rep as well, which is super annoying, but hey, it's fine. All right, let's put all this away over here. That will be good. Let's cook up some things. That'll be awesome. All right, guys, be happy in my restaurant, please. I don't want anybody self-combusting or anything like that. This is like Fire Force, isn't it? Have you guys watched the anime? Uh, what's it called? Uh, Fire Force or something? It's really good, actually. I really like it. Let's put those mold things away. I was actually watching... Uh, the last season they did, I think it came out a while ago, but I actually quite like it. It's pretty decent, actually. Why are you unhappy? Did I did I do something wrong? I probably should set up some traps, to be honest with you. Especially with a... Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Especially with, like, a, um, you know, one like this where, you know, it's easy for the, the thing to spread. I'm going to take this guy down because he doesn't seem happy and I don't want unhappy customers in my in my place right because like that would be really bad all right is there anybody who's on fire right now i hope not okay the policeman is not on fire all right we're just gonna have to like do a check and make sure that people who are entering are not just like causing chaos <laughs> so <laughs> i'm just gonna have to keep an eye on people right oh it looks like you will so like let's get rid of this guy he's got acid i need to watch out for that so i don't want to get attacked by that ah no you saw nothing nothing is happening see the policeman catch on to you extremely quickly in this game it's annoying do you mind i'm trying to wash my hands here <laughs> what do you think you're doing <laughs> like geez okay we got another one up here who's ready to like turn so obviously we don't want that to happen so i'm just gonna get rid of him he exploded as well oh god there's one happening over here oh no <gasps> I died. Oh my gosh. I got second chance though. So like we're fine. But now I have to be like really careful. Oh my god. That was that was scary. I haven't died in ages. That was scary. That was really scary. Okay, I'm gonna have to be careful. They like hit you. Like they actually hurt you when they run into you. So actually maybe this is worse than the zombie virus. I don't really I don't know. But like this is dangerous. 
This is extremely dangerous. I don't like this. I think I'm just gonna stay out of the way and just let them die. And if the police come, then the police come. I'd rather lose the prestige than lose my health and my life, you know? So yeah, it's just not, it's not worth the risk, especially with like how far into the game I currently am. It's really just not, it's not worth it. It's just not worth it. I'd rather not. I am gonna go and put my traps on though, so we can just kill as many as possible and hopefully lose as little prestige as possible, but it's fine because I'll just build it back up so it's okay are you all done running around on fire or like are you still going like i don't, I don't know i'm just gonna leave them to it <laughs> i think that's the best option right now i don't want to die again so yeah it's just not it's not worth it i don't know if they're still running around like crazy people <laughs> why does this happen it doesn't look like it actually like kills everyone from what i'm seeing they hurt people when they walk past though did that guy die like what happened to him i don't know did he just stop combusting like i don't know <laughs> i don't know what just happened but it's fine so strange what a strange game all right let's put this stuff in here i don't know if this is like getting rid of like my food or anything like that i'm not really sure all right number 10 is a thing okay we just need to get as many people out of here as possible i think that would be um a wise idea right now <laughs> actually why are you leaving that one just randomly left i don't know why but okay fair enough i see how it is my burger joint is not good enough for you whatever <laughs> i don't care all right uh someone is dead all right that's okay i'm probably gonna i think i'm definitely gonna lose my prestige here but like it's fine it's okay all right so let's make sure to just make sure to get some stuff here ah uh, that guy's gonna leave it's fine i'll just let him leave it's, it's okay it's not a big deal i can just get the prestige back anyway okay so this is this dude i'm just gonna feed you a rat but at least we've kind of seen the effect now and yeah you need to be careful of this effect <laughs> don't like you know if you're this far into the game don't like push it like just just stay safe <laughs> Stay safe, guys. That's <laughs> the only advice I can offer, you know? Okay, let's see. I'm just gonna put this bacon in here. But yeah, I'm gonna get loss of prestige. I'm kind of expecting this, but it's okay. Okay, got some torizo over here. This is a naboot. So I'm going to give you this stuff, actually. The mold is spreading. Let's get rid of that nasty mold. Damn mold don't want to leave me alone <laughs> that's okay though so this is number 10 there we go i don't think i got any more mold so that's okay let's just cook all this up that would be good i got somebody is like suspicious of me i don't know why i did but it's okay it's fine okay let's just put this stuff away oh got some more mold there damn mold get out my fridge <laughs> how dare you <laughs> what is going on here oh i think i'm safe in the corner we're fine is there more mold here Okay, we're fine, we're fine. <laughs> All right, let's put this stuff away as well. Okay, do we have any more customers incoming? I've only lost 200 prestige, that's not that bad. It's possible for me to build that back up, but we're probably gonna get more people that are like gonna go and combust and I'm probably gonna get the police on me on this like level, I would assume. I'd be very surprised if I didn't get the police on me because somebody will die eventually because i'm not doing anything about it either because it's just like not worth the risk so i'm just gonna just let it play out and if the police come on to me then they do <laughs> it's just inevitable probably but i do have the traps active to kind of help me out so i'm hoping that that does help me a little bit to maybe just not have quite as many <laughs> but i don't know all right there's number 12 uh, i just really don't want to risk anything on this one <laughs> i really don't it's scary okay there you go all right what's going on customers on fire yeah <laughs> there's customers on fire everywhere thank god they don't come into the kitchen i'm nice and safe in here so that's what i that's what i like <laughs> I want to be nice and safe, thank you. You guys can just self-combust out there. Yep, somebody's died, so there's gonna, the police are going to come now. But it's fine, I can just pay them off, so it's not a big deal. Alright, this is number 13, actually. I'm just going to... Okay, never mind, that guy died as well. Ah, everyone's going to leave. I'm going to lose a bit of prestige. Never mind. Okay, I'm going to sort out the number 17 client. 
Let's make sure we do that. There you go. Hello, police. It's nice to see you again. We've been seeing each other too often recently, don't you think? But hey, that's just the way these things go. <laughs> I hope you officers are having a nice day. I could treat you to some nice burgers if you like. But yeah, feel free to just hang about and just enjoy your stay because I'm sure you're going to be visiting me a lot. So enjoy yourself, man. Enjoy yourself. <laughs> I'm just going to put this in the, the bin here. There we go. All right. Okay, nothing going on there. I've got two more minutes to survive. So I don't exactly know what's going to happen here. Did I kill one of the policemen? <laughs> I think I killed one. Like, I wasn't meaning to, but <laughs> apparently I killed one. <laughs> Interesting. Okay, let's see. Yeah, I did. I did kill one. I got their meat as well. <laughs> I got their meat and everything. So let's cook that up as well. See how fast the meat processor is now when it's fully upgraded? It literally, like, gives me the meat in, like, two seconds. Usually, like, I remember when I first, like, started playing this game, and it would take, like, literally, like, the entire day to get, like, one piece of me now it happens like so quick because everything is fully upgraded so i don't really have to worry too much but it just goes to show that even being fully upgraded and even being like pre-op in the game is still possible to die if you're like not careful so <laughs> it just goes to so show that you can still lose everything if you're like not fully paying attention so there is that as well i suppose <laughs> just need to be very careful indeed okay mold appeared oh no don't say that I don't want any mold over here, but that's fine. Okay then, are you officers having a great time? All right, I'm just gonna put this mold in the bin. You don't mind, do you? Okay, good. <laughs> okay, nobody's visiting. Oh, now they are. I was wondering where all the people were. <laughs> I was like, I got loads of police officers, but no like actual people. I was like, what's going on? Maybe I should fast forward it just a little bit. I don't want to go too far because like, um, I don't want the mold to accumulate and then like lose all my stuff. I don't know if it works like that. It might, it might not. I don't know, but I don't want to lose like all my meat and stuff that I've like got because I've definitely managed to get like a lot of meat together and stuff. So yeah, that would suck. That would suck a lot. Do we have any naboots today? I wonder. I don't know. I'm just kind of hiding up here at the fridge because this this is just chaos. <laughs> just I don't want to be involved in this chaos. <laughs> There's somebody dead down there as well. <laughs> you can't call the police because the police are already here. Haha. -ha. <laughs> There's nothing you can do. But they might get called back now if it happens again. So yeah, I might be I might be seeing them very, very soon. <laughs> we'll see though. Okay, well at least they're gone now. It's just definitely much safer to just like let it all just play out like that sometimes i really think so okay so yeah we need to i'll feed you deck collector actually because i got a lot of deck collector because i was killing a lot of those guys okay let's do this i just like chaos is about to ensue ensue i just know it <laughs> things are about to get hectic i know something's bound to happen at some point i got a lot of orders here now my god there's a lot of people in here so let's hope that people don't start combusting because <laughs> there's gonna be pure chaos otherwise and i don't want any parts of it trap activated okay that's all right. All right, there you go. Do we have any more mold? Yeah, we got some mold here. Let's put this away. Excuse me. What did I do? I didn't even do anything. What do you think you're doing? <laughs> Why are you suspicious of me? I'm so confused. I literally have no idea what I did, but whatever. It's fine. I don't care that much. <laughs> it's all good. All right, so we got some bacon here, and this is for the dog. So, uh, oh yeah, I've completely run out of that meat, haven't I? I'm gonna have to use this um this blonde stuff. So I'm just going to set that up for an order, actually. And number 25 is, uh, what would be best to use? Actually, I'm going to use this stuff as well. So they're both getting this stuff right now. Uh, this is the bacon. So this is for number 24. If I can get that in without being spotted, I cannot. I put it on wrong, no, wrong number. I put it on 25 by accident. <laughs> Oops. Well, that's what you get for being suspicious. You get the wrong burger. <laughs> You you made me panic and I had like no option. I'm gonna lose definitely gonna lose some prestige here, so that's unfortunate, but never mind. I'm just gonna let those two leave because like I'm not gonna have time to like really do anything about it anyway, so they're just gonna leave unfortunately. 
so it is what it is it's fine <laughs> it's all good this is the last wave so after this like yeah we're not gonna need to worry too much there goes my precious prestige no <laughs> what a pain it's fine though let's just finish this day i'm just gonna speed it up and just let this day finish actually we're basically done now so like that's good i really want to get my second chance back so i'm just kind of sweating over here worried <laughs> but there you go okay awesome i'm just gonna take out some some money we just need like another thousand so that i can pay this off and get everything back to how it should be so that would be really good but that was the other effect it was chaotic i did not like it i did not appreciate it <laughs> but it exists <laughs> so there you go now you've seen it <laughs> and now you know what happens when people self-combust in your restaurant <laughs> it's actually i do think that's worse than the zombie because they hurt you when they walk past you as well it's just the worst tenotanium we got three new aliens that we have never seen before so that's going to be interesting and let's read the description only few remember but once the gods waged war with the titans for the right to run things we won as you can see but not without losses these beautiful bones once belonged to my beloved what <laughs> the patroness of proof profligacy i think and luck i believe she would be proud that the best casino in the galaxy was built on her remains it is a pity i am always unlucky here why is that so the last planet is on a casino okay interesting all right i'm really intrigued as to what like we are going to be doing on this planet and also there is only one effect yeah everything's ready let's go <laughs> let's see what happens all righty oh my gosh oh so those are his angels and he's the god and we're in his casino and we gotta make him a good burger man this is what this has all been for to make god a good burger so he doesn't decide to kill me <laughs> i gotta please him otherwise i might i might end up dead <laughs> is that like his like his like children or something the prince and the princess i have no idea look he's so hungry he's gotta have that burger he's gotta have a crown on his burger <laughs> what <laughs> what's happening what is that does that mean you can't kill him okay wait look at all these traps <laughs> i wonder if he's gonna be able to outsmart all these tra traps here he washing is washing his hands with poison oh my gosh is the poison hurting him i don't know i feel a bit scared all right let's see what's going on here i've made it man this is the end of the journey final times 50 tips all day so this is the effect it actually happens on day one as well unbelievable the creator was spotted outside the good burger diner with his bodyguard angels scientists say that his halo as seen in many pa many paparazzi photos is actually a rare piece of technology that pr protects the wearer from various ailments and hazards okay is there a way to get rid of it i don't know <laughs> rumors have surfaced that it's first prototype was malfunctioning after being subjected to even slight vibrations a design flaw an oversight we can only wonder how and why okay so one day 101 so so far look there's angels they look more like demons there's weird people all right let's let's check out their data i'm really curious actually okay so we got a guardian angel that looks like really disturbing ah yes these delightful obscurantists were cute angels once and responsible for spreading love among all people but that was kind of boring also not very practical so i decided to change the concept a little to how with bows and use boxing gloves that's the stuff all you need is love i don't think so what most people need is a fist to the face <laughs> by the way these guys are also great drinking buddies okay i mean i'm it looks like you can kill them and get parts from them but we don't know anything about them so it's probably not a good idea like right now there's also parts from this guy as well don't be these are called royals don't be fooled by their embellished attire underneath they are as rotten as their luxurious outfits are elegant it is these two who are responsible for the near extermination of your species and the enslavement of almost the entire galaxy is on their conscience too if they actually had one i don't know what's on your mind right now but i would keep that cleaver sharp and handy just in case 
Okay. <laughs> Am I supposed to murder them or something? I don't know. Let's set our traps up because there's no harm in getting them with traps because like it won't affect us. If they if it doesn't if it, if they are impervious to it, it just won't do anything. I think I had a spike there for some reason, but that's all right. It's fine. It was only a second. I don't know why that happens sometimes, but yeah, like, I don't know what's gonna hurt them and what isn't, so, like, he just completely walked past my trap and it did absolutely nothing to him, so, not sure about that. Why are you waiting in the bathroom with him? Okay, I don't know what meat they like or anything. Oh, so the trap went off, but, like, it didn't do anything to him. <laughs> So I have no idea. Do I get a data for, for the creator? Oh my god, we got the creator in our, in our club. He's got 12 life. And this is me. The same dude who wrote you all these descriptions, constantly resurrects you and is still waiting for his godlike burger. Some say I've created the entire universe and that I am responsible for all the lame miracles happening across the galaxy and beautiful catalysms of this world. Honestly, I don't know anything about that. Even if it's true, I was probably too drunk at the time to remember anything. <laughs> okay. Oh well, this is gonna be a challenge. I have no idea what to feed them. Like, no idea whatsoever. So I'm just going to try anything and just see what happens because, yeah, I don't know how we're going to kill them. I don't want to risk it right now. I want to grab the information on them first before I try to kill them because I don't want to lose all my progress. It's just not a good idea, right? If any of my traps kill them, then like that's perfect. If not, then I don't know. I'll have to just figure out another way of doing it, I suppose. I don't know. Look, that guy wants double patties as well. The creator's greedy. <laughs> Why do you want double patties, man? That's <laughs> just greedy. Okay, okay, whatever. It's not even double patty day today, but fine. Uh, I'm just gonna go with two of these. It's probably not what he's gonna like, but I'm gonna attempt it regardless and just like see what he says. So just go with a cigarette sauce or something. There you go. This is the last wave. There's literally hardly any customers here as well. I'm probably gonna lose prestige, but it doesn't matter too much. All right, so debt collector did not work. They did not like the debt collector, sadly. <laughs> so that is unfortunate. That guy also did not like the debt collector either. So that sucks. Um, um, the other guy, I mean, he didn't like the mushroom thing that I fed him, not the debt collector. I don't know what I'm talking about, but that's okay. All right, well, we'll find out next time, I'm sure. But yeah, we're definitely gonna lose prestige, but it doesn't matter because we're already on this planet. So like, we're not gonna need prestige for any other planet anyway. So. I don't think it matters if we lose them. The creator's eating my burger. He's not gonna like it, but hey, he's eating my burger. What do you think, man? Nah, he didn't like it. Oh my! He just murdered me. Like one shot. He killed me in one shot. What? That is insane. So if I mess up his burger, he's just gonna kill me? Like, really? Uh, I don't know what to do about that. <laughs> I have no idea. I've got one more chance to do it. But like, oh my god. Uh, this is making me very nervous. I wish he gave me some kind of clue so I knew what to feed him. But I have no idea where, what to even, to even do here. I don't know if like these guys are immune or what. I'm gonna try and it's I need to do something so I'm going to attempt to kill something if it doesn't work then it doesn't work and um I don't know like I think I should probably try and stun this thing over here if I can get one of these angels stun them if it doesn't work I could just use the jukebox on them so that's what I'm going to gonna try okay oh my god oh my god they all come after you okay this was not a good idea I don't know if I'm gonna win this nope I'm dead oh my god I made it so far and now I'm completely dead. I made it right to the end of the game and died. I didn't know what to do. I don't know if like this is what the game intended you to do. Let me have a look a second. <laughs> See if I can get some info. Like there must be some info on it now, right? Like at least I can get some info on it. I didn't know what to do. So like that really sucks. I think maybe like you're probably meant to die here because like how are you meant to know what to feed them like i don't understand what it wanted me to do so all right ten thousand are you kidding me oh my god all right this guy likes to eat debt collector and this guy likes to eat these i could i guess i could have like guessed but like i needed to 
Make the creator happy, right? I don't know. That's a lot of money. My God. I'm so glad I gla grabbed that skin beforehand because all I've really lost is like the mission progress and it is going to take me a while to like get back to that and my prestige as well. But like, you know, it's not as bad as I was like, you know, it could have been worse. I could have lost a lot more. So it's um not as bad but yeah i was i was so far i was like 108 days <laughs> i was doing so well i'm so glad i did like did that i kind of got the feeling that i might die on the last planet like i kind of like maybe thought that it might happen but yeah we need to get that info on that creator so that we can we can do that again man i have to start all over again <laughs> oh <laughs> so painful we are back and i finally gone through and i did every single quest again i could have just like done the last objectives and then just like got the money and the prestige and just gone straight back to the last planet but i was kind of thinking that maybe i'd get like a different ending if i had everything done probably not but like i don't know <laughs> i don't want to miss anything so that's why i decided to do them all over again and again i i don't know why this game hates this planet tara roti I had a quest on this planet that I really suffered with which was the apply toxin source to three different customers and kill them was not working for me there are loads of quests like this and if they don't work for you if you're also struggling with like certain quests I would just suggest to try it again on like a further ahead planet but <laughs> hopefully we're gonna be able to do the final planet I'm just gonna buy the uh, the funds to go there and we're also I got 12,000 left because I also want to buy the information on the creator so we know what this guy likes like Jesus <laughs> hopefully this guy doesn't one shot me this time wait what is that oh no wait what is that meat I don't know what that meat is what is that royal meat yeah so I was right he wants this royal dude oh god that's gonna be hard <laughs> I'm just gonna put my money away um I don't know if I'm gonna like necessarily need it or not I don't know but I'm just gonna put this away for now just in case something bad does happen I got 8,000 in there right now how am I gonna feed this guy royal I need to feed it these but the angels oh this is gonna be this is gonna be hell isn't it okay I'm ready I think <laughs> let's do this <laughs> Oh god. All right, let's go. Today's special. Okay, 50 times tips all day. Not that we need it, but okay, so it's day 51, so I'm a f I'm a fair bit into the days here. I like went through it all over again. Of course I did. <laughs> okay, so we need to kill this royal guy, but we need to be careful that like is he is he imp he's impervious as well how am i gonna kill him the only way i think is through traps right how else am i gonna do it like that okay that worked all right i got some royal stuff now now i just need to wait for it to to like come through let's turn off that motion sensor just in case like i I'm scared. I'm really scared. But I got the stuff for the creator now. I got the royal meat. That's what he wanted. So as long as we just feed them and just make sure they're happy, then like we should technically do this, right? At least I think so. All right. What does the royal guy want? Okay. He will just wants this this stuff here so i'll just give him some of this i just need to be careful because everyone is suspicious now but we should be okay we should be fine i'm just a bit nervous <laughs> i really don't want to die again <laughs> like i really don't want to it's just hell all right there's an order number one the creators put in his order okay lettuce tomato he wants a sauce i'll just give you a smoking sauce wait do you like to smoke the creator what do you like to do he likes to go toilet let's give him a laxative so this one we're gonna give him a laxative and the royal meat is it even i don't even think i've cooked it yet have i i think it's gone through all right here it is let's put this oh he wants two yeah he wants two. Oh no um <laughs> he just had to he just had to be a pain in the butt didn't he okay wait how do i kill this other one i gotta kill this other one somehow okay i just gotta get him with a trap somehow where's he going he's going to get his food oh boy i'm gonna have to wait for another opportunity to get this guy because i need two of them and i didn't I didn't realize. God damn. <laughs> we'll have to see how it goes. I don't think the angels give. No, the angels. I don't think they give, like. 
I'm pretty sure they don't give like uh, royal meat. They're immune to traps as well. And attacking them's a bad idea. I found that out the hard way. <laughs> it's not it's not a good idea. Not at all. Okay, okay. Let's just go up here. What if um I'm not sure if I want to make them suspicious though. These guys don't even order anything, do they? They don't order a thing. Okay, all right. Are you done? Where are you going? All right. Oh man, I wish he went to a location where I could actually like do some damage to him. It looks like the creator's gonna wait uh, quite a while though, so hopefully I'll get this opportunity before this guy leaves or something. I didn't realize he wanted two patties. Why do you have to be so awkward, the creator? Why can't you just want one patty? Like, dear lord, <laughs> why is this a thing? I don't know. All right, where are you going now, royal dude? Let's see. He's gonna go look in the mirror. Okay, it might be possible for me to... I'm gonna motion sensor this. See if he like comes into it. Maybe you will be able to kill him with that if he gets close enough. It's really close to the creator. I don't like that. I don't want to. I don't think you can kill the creator even if you wanted to though. So I don't think that's the thing. Oh man, he, he didn't even come close to it. Okay, I don't want to annoy the creator, so we're not gonna like worry too much um, about that. Okay, this this is getting a little tricky now. <laughs> I'm getting a little nervous here. <laughs> I don't like where this is going, like at all. Okay, I don't know if that thing's gonna get hit by the vending machine. He's getting a bit close. All right, it's fine. Oh man, oh no, I'm not gonna be able to kill this thing. Oh, why are you impervious to physicals too? That's just evil. It's just really evil. What if I like, hmm. What if I like hit something in front of him and then went invisible? Hmm, he's gonna leave. No, he's leaving. Dang it. <laughs> Maybe I should just let this day end and then just try on the next day. It's like, this is not a good burger. This burger's not good enough. And his highness is not going to be pleased. Um, I don't know if he's gonna like straight try and attack me though. So I'm not too sure. This is just like absolutely terrifying. I don't like, I don't like this like at all. This guy is scary. He's super scary indeed. I'm just gonna fast forward. Like he's gonna be mad. Let's just hope he doesn't try and murder me. Let's just hope he killed me last time because I was like next to him. Yeah, he's going home. He's going home. We're fine. We're fine. We'll just we'll just let the day end. Oh no, his goons are coming after me. What are they doing? Are they not going home? Oh no, I think I have to kill them so I can leave the level. This is gonna be awkward. Let's try it though. Okay, okay, this is fine. We'll go invisible. All right, I'm just gonna murder all of these angels. These angels ain't angels anyway, so we're gonna have to murder them because I don't think it's gonna let me end the level without killing them. So we're gonna have to do something. You didn't see nothing, nothing's happening. This is such an easier way of doing it. I think the first time this happened, I was just like, I, I was so like, I panicked, didn't know what to do and everything just went disastrous. I think I could have done it though if I was like calm and collected but like <laughs> we go for a day but like I didn't feed the creator so I don't think we have quite succeeded just yet <laughs> at least I don't think so anyway all right let's just feed let's just get some more stuff here okay we're gonna go kill some of those royal peoples so let's try that again whoa I just got so much money did you see that how did I get so much money I got 19,000 where did that come from? I don't know. I had like barely any money and then all of a sudden, I guess like just like feeding people on the final level just gets you a ridiculous amount of money. Like that's insane. I only fed like one person. <laughs> they gave me like 20K for a burger. It must have really been a godlike burger, you know? <laughs> So yeah, hopefully we're gonna be able to make the best good like burger for the creator and he is gonna go away super happy. That's the plan, right? Okay, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna try and take this slow, right? We don't wanna like mess this up. Okay, let's try again. Let's go, let's try this. We got this, man, we got this. Alright, who's incoming? Let's see. Alright, we're gonna put some traps on. 
so I don't think I think it's only the royal person that really um, gets affected by these traps anyway so this should work out all right there you go I should have two patties this time right so that's super awesome I'm also gonna put some traps on here and here just so that we have another chance to get the royal dude as well I don't know if it's going to help or not I have no idea but we shall see like none of these traps are gonna affect the angels or anything anyway so I think we're fine with that and yeah I just got another royal so that was perfect they're Mykonanians in disguise <laughs> Mik royal Mykonanians I guess um okay let's feed the creator I think I'm ready now I think I'm totally ready to feed the creator all right so you want two royal meat I can do that for you do you think it tastes different from like normal meat or anything I don't know <laughs> I guess we'll have to see all right let's cook this up i got these angels as well i can cook these angels like what do you think the purpose of these angels are like who even eats them like that's what i want to know right it's so so strange all right we got two royal meats in there perfect we got our sauce our two royal meats our tomato our lettuce this should be it the creator should be satisfied hopefully <laughs> i made you your godlike burger the creator i hope you enjoy it i hope you enjoy that man but yeah like i'm really wondering who like benefits from this angel meat like I, I don't know what like the purpose of it is for they like to eat the debt collector but they don't come up for order so maybe like you just have to keep playing a little bit before they come up like i don't i don't really know to be honest what was that about i was completely like glitched out there that was weird <laughs> I got a bit scared. <laughs> I think it was like my computer or something. I don't know what it was, but the game decided that it was um going to um go a bit crazy. Are you are you satisfied, Mr. Creator Sir? Do you like your burger? Please say you do. Please say you like this burger. Let's see. Does he like it? He liked it. Hey! Oh my god, I got a hundred thousand money and S rank. Holy smokes. So have I completed the game? Is that it? I think I did it. I think we completed the game, guys. Oh my gosh, so we finally made it. <laughs> I'm like so excited. <laughs> it was such a hard journey. Like I had so many hard moments with this game. So many frustrating moments that made me want to tear my hair out. But also some really funny and unforgettable moments as well that I think I'm going to remember for a long time. <laughs> okay, there he goes eating his burger. He looks like, well, hopefully he's satisfied with it. Okay, my dude is terrified. I would be terrified too, like seriously. <laughs> this is the guy that said, if you make me a good burger, I'll let you live. So he's just, he's gonna murder me if I feed him a bad burger. So no wonder he's so terrified, like geez. <laughs> oh my God. So what did you think? Did you like it? His eyes are gonna pop out in a minute. He's so scared. He's looking at me like, hmm, <laughs> trying to work me out. <laughs> yeah, we got a thumbs up, guys. That's all we need to know, right? Hey, <laughs> we did it. <laughs> Woohoo, look how happy my dude is. Do I get my leg back? I want you to fix my leg, man. Come on, fix my leg. Oh, and he goes away happy with all his creepy angels. Perfect. Oh, look, he's dancing. He's so happy. We made someone very happy today, guys. Look how happy our dude is. So cool. All right. So now, now what, dude? Let's see. He's reading the newspaper by the looks of it. At least I think so. Why are you sad? Oh, is it because everybody like lost their family because we like cooked them up and stuff? So he's feeling like really bad about it. Oh, no, I think he feels bad about feeding these burgers to people. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> he should be, <laughs> but I, I guess, like, we had to make ends meet, man. We had to do what we had to do to survive, you know? So, uh, oh, he's, he's hanging up his cleaver. He's done for the day. That's it. Good burger is done. Like, we've done what we came to do. What's that yellow thing there? Maybe that's his conscience. He's just like... He regrets killing all of these people. Look at all those dead aliens. Oh man, he's gonna like go through depression and everything, isn't he? Oh no. Oh God, what's he doing? He's going up to clean. Maybe he's gonna make an actual proper burger establishment without like killing customers this time. I don't know. Oh, God is back. Hello, what do you want? Wait, what? Did you just kill me? Wait a second. What is go- what did you do to me? 
I think I think I just died. Are you gonna make me a god? Is that what's going on? <laughs> I don't know. I have no idea what just happened there. But okay. What is happening? He wants more burgers. He's saying, no, nah, you can't stop. You gotta keep making me burgers, man. What do you think you're doing? Oh. Are we going to hell? I'm kind of a bit lost here. I don't actually know what's happening. <laughs> If anyone knows, tell me, because I'm a bit lost. I don't know what's happening. It looked like we died if we back up a little bit. Doesn't it look like we died here? Or maybe he just opened the door and he, like, scared me or something. Maybe that's what it was. I think that might be what it was. He scared me or something. And then, like, I think I'm still alive. I think I just passed out. I think. <laughs> I don't know. I have no idea. Okay, but yeah, then there's like these creepy aliens. He's gonna let more aliens in or something. We've got different aliens to please. I don't know. Ah, <laughs> he doesn't want to do it anymore, I don't think. <laughs> Wait, am I being abducted? Wait, what's happening? That's the end. I don't think there's any more. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he's saying, I want you to feed me more burgers. And then he like maybe abducted him or something and then like he's got to like continue on I think that the dude wanted to give up because he like regretted killing all these aliens but now he has to continue because the gods liked his burger so much that he's gonna make him keep doing it for the rest of his life <laughs> poor dude maybe you should have just made a bad burger and just accepted defeat and just you know accepted death <laughs> I don't know if this is any better. I have no idea. But we did it. Yay. That was such a fun game. I had so much fun with that game. I had so many stressful times, but also a lot of fun as well. I had a great time. So yeah, it was awesome. Awesome game. I'm pretty sure I did everything possible in the game as well. It was a great time. I hope you guys enjoyed it as well. I hope you enjoyed my experience with the game as well. Hopefully more people play this game because I did notice that there hasn't been very much content produced on this game. So I don't think very many people know about it. All right, let's hit continue and see if anything happens after you continue. I don't think anything is gonna happen. <laughs> Look at all the money. <laughs> That's just an insane amount of money. I got 100,000 <laughs> for doing that. I got nothing nothing to spend it on really but hey I got a hundred thousand I suppose so like that's cool but yeah everything's unlocked there's nothing to do all my quests are done everything is good I lost a tiny bit of prestige but it doesn't really matter that much I guess like I could just upgrade all my stuff if I wanted to but I don't know because like, if they make like a DLC or something like that or some extra content, there's actually like some quests where you have to upgrade some of your stuff and like if you've already upgraded stuff, then like you would have to actually go over here and restart your entire session, which means you'd have to start from literally zero. So I'm gonna just not like, you know, <laughs> I'm not gonna like spend all my money on traps in case something like that happens in the future but I'm not really expecting it but it's possible so I spent like 50 hours on this game probably more most of that was me like restarting and like <laughs> learning and like that kind of stuff it would take me absolutely forever to put all this in my stash wouldn't it why is there not like a stash all button if you have like a hundred K do you know how long this is gonna take to put in my safe <laughs> What if I wanted to put 100,000 in here, man? Oh my gosh, I'm going to be here all night. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I don't think you're supposed to store 100k in here. <laughs> Somehow. <laughs> just because it's just going to take forever to take it out again as well. Maybe I'll just store like half of it and then just like, yeah, just let's just store half of it. Half is probably fine. But yeah, that's it. I hope you enjoyed this playthrough. Thank you so much, everyone, for watching. I just want to say a huge thank you to all of my Patreons and members for supporting the channel. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. And if you are interested in donating, there will be a link in the description box below to my Patreon page. I'll send 
Alternatively, you can also click the big join button underneath every video that I create to become a member of the channel. I also have a dedicated live streaming channel that you can find in the description box below or on my channel homepage. I regularly live stream over on that channel and it'll be super cool if you could stop by sometime and say hello. I would really love that. Thank you so much for watching this episode. Please comment, rate and subscribe and I hope I'll see you next time.